We used to be thorough in Egypt, now we're emotional, paraplegics. The whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings. The whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings. Symptoms of humanities unraveling helix. Calamities and tragedies that happen in sequence. The whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings. The whole world's numb. Need a hat, glove, boots, and a fur jacket. It's cold, all that make you turn savage. Smoke a whole herd package for the nerve damage. Ghetto was replaced by the term ratchet And the queens rock a perm with their sperm addicts They wanna twerk and the boys wanna burst matics They want you satirically paralyzed King trying to limit your ability to analyze things So they advertise a pantomime paradise paradigm Look at all the fuckeries they're glamorizing Forced like rituals and sacrificing Mold the gravity and sort of my things Geoengineering The Large Hadron Collider They want a microchip under my skin But when I look around Everybody's turning up The buildings of the governments are burning up Everybody's fighting for the rights of a black man A couple hashtags Some cool t-shirts And a logo and a snapback On the head of a rapper in a backpack Then it's back to the snapchat Double tap IG pic of a chick with a fat cat we used to be pharaohs in Egypt, now we're emotional paraplegics. The whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings. The whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings. Symptoms of humanities unraveling helix. Calamities and tragedies that happen in sequence. The whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings. The whole world's numb. Need a hat, gloves, boots, and a fur jacket. It's cold, all that make you turn savage. Smoke a whole herd package for the nerve damage. Ghetto was replaced by the term ratchet And the queens rock a perm with their sperm addicts They wanna twerk and the boys wanna burst matics We used to be pharaohs in Egypt, now um, we're emotional, paraplegic, the whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings. Symptoms of humanities unraveling helix, calamities and tragedies that happen in sequence, the whole world's numb, nobody has any feelings, the whole world's numb. Need a hat, gloves, boots and a fur jacket. It's cold, all that make you turn savage, smoke a whole herd package for the nerve damage. Ghetto was replaced by the term ratchet And the queens rock a perm with their sperm addicts They wanna twerk and the boys wanna burst matics Ah uh, It's your boy Jedi for Jedi Online Trillium and Lighty Red Pill True Trillium and Clicks like, comment, share, subscribe Hit the notification bell so you know when we go live And please put the number of your like in the chat Shout out to my boy Southside Kept banging at stars P and ransom in my head So much I had to jump on it myself Yo RBRC Yo, it's the Vivas, aka Vivas Shakur. Down no matter. Straight away, T. The boy is seven in the building. Listen, huh? Another sleepless night. Visions of my mother running through my weaving mind. Now, whatever she can see, my life. The weed and strap, beef and crime, and he sees a mind. The G's are nine, eating guys for a piece of pie. The weekly grind, playing dirty, so I cheat and lie. How I treat the mind, what deliveries like a pizza bite. Sitting in the streets alive, the constant need to fight. Squeeze on side, freezing through life. It's too seat around, they're trying to keep alive. They want to see me die, make me reach the sky the same way they made you leave my side. I leave a weeping wife, but I'm a leave a guy, it's stink the Reaper twice, my soul cold squeezing right. Sometimes I feel like giving up and you do too When rich you and your baby needs new shoes I can't even get a hundred pounds of YouTube views Two chances, quit or release new tunes But if I wasn't in the booth I'll be your jailbird Can't see the truth, this new lease been well earned In the school of hard knocks, many lessons were well learned That time is forever, women leave, shells burn Eggs become demons when the tables in hell turn Meaning besties become enemies, I nearly fell turn I'll probably get the best grades in the history of niggas An A-star student, but who says the curriculum? If the world's a classroom, then I guess I'm that cool crook Daydreaming, ripping ropes at the back of my school book Break time, catch me smoking weed with a gang Down to taking lunch money and cheating exams And you ain't never met a nigga as grinding a seven 
Take months to calm Ivy's intention. Give me laughing and tension. Of course they wanna see Jets fell. Get you back and back reports to my next spell. I'm trying to graduate and tell the poor to an next spell. I ain't trying to go back to court or the next jail. Cause I can court with three, four, five. Like I'm fair and fell with Nat. Give it a real man cry in the next cell. Right into my son, it's been in up, it ain't get bell. I'd rather use my chest set neck to catch 10 shells to say the things are hell or hotter than 80 degrees. But South London in the summer feels like Hades to me. No one gives a fuck about my son, it's plain to see. I'm sure my niggas in New Orleans and Haiti agree. Being poor and ignored is a crazy disease. I lost some feeding in my heart, like it's saving your feet. Now I'm spitting in my palm, I'm reaching into the fire, grabbing my dreams and the objects of my desire. Blitzes on my fingers, but the world's in my palm, bro. Everybody's got an opinion, like our soul. Don't listen when they're farting, keep fighting like a Spartan. For copper Aston Martin, the twin marks of your Largo. The star flow, with a heart darker than charcoal. These blood clots when I tap my soul with a barcode. I'd rather let the star go than be cargo. A full clip to leave that bullshit in Chicago. I'm on the plane from Spain to Monte Carlo. On the phone to RV, like, yeah, brother, walk now. Yo, yo. If God was one of us and he didn't even know it, would he be a musician, artist or poet? Would he drink dragon stout? Hennessy or mow it? If he made mad dough, would he stack it or blow it on fast cars and gold? I wanna know, would he smoke crack, high grade or hydro? Would he be your outlaw, running from the five O? Would he listen to rap? Would he fill my flow? Would he walk past if he saw cops arresting me? If he was brass, would he look up shots that make cash with me? And if I went jail, would he pay my bill? Send me mail, or would he try to sex my girl? Would he cry get the loss of lives on 9-11? Would he believe he could achieve eternal life in heaven? If he was one of us and someone else was in charge, would he look up at the stars wondering if there's life on Mars? Would he dream of leaving the atmosphere in a space shuttle? Would he still love his mum if she beat him with a belt buckle? If he was just a fun and life was a struggle, would he work nights and fight for life or would he hustle? I'm trying to find a new direction, so I stare at my reflection. I need an answer to this question. What we gotta do with me? It's one of us. And he bled like me, and he was hungry, but he said he didn't get fed like me. Take that nympho to bed like me. Refuse to give info to the feds like me. If I was his son, would he let my enemies harm me? Support the war and terror and join the army. Buckle at the pressure that turns black men balmy. Buy a gap for self-defense or learn karate. Spend his spare time studying or love to party. Be a vegetarian or eat salami. Listen to mixtapes, take chicks on dates. Would he believe that we all evolved from apes? If all you wanted was a slice, would he share his pie? Live in fear and hide or be prepared to write? I stare at my own reflection through teary eyes. I know the answer to my questions because he's here in sight. I'm trying to find a new direction. So I stare at my reflection. I need an answer to this question. What we gotta do with me? It's one of us. There's a black light. One of us. How it feels on the real side. I'm looking for how it feels. How it feels on the real side. I'm looking for way junkie. It's how it feels on the real side. The real eyes start realizing real lies. Real guys ain't that common in real life. That's true. There's a war on the real in real time. It's how it feels. On the real side, the real eyes start realizing real lives. Real guys ain't that common in real life. And that's the truth. There's a war on the real in real time. Is it true, son? Is it really true, son? Show me that it's true, son. If it's really true, not so many real ones. Sometimes I got a spill rum. My black heart is still numb. Cause I ain't trying to feel. It's like I'm addicted to real and allergic to fake. A night I dream I lift in the still. I'm murdering snakes. So many frenemies knock at my gates in disguise. It's hard to realize when you got serpents for mates. The beast real like a burger and steak. 
when you gotta take the burner to wait. Some of the realists eating meals off the surgery plates. It's like fortune favors the fake. It's a war against the real to all the nerds of his place. There's a war on the real. There's a war on the real. On the real. There's a war 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 on the real. Come take a walk on the real side with some real guys. No games played, the wrong move will catch you real bind. These youths ain't sane. I blame the space in which they can't find out. See, man, David Blaine. With something that they can't sign, the real side is the real side. That don't mean the right side. Enough man play the wrong side. How they got a provide, dog, I guarantee they go right. For any little violation, how any Ellie feels it's from his pitney's plate is taken. I'm just saying, the struggle's real and they ain't playing. And to dodge this hunger young and keep that pistol packed He bout to get this money, he ain't in the dribs and drabs, no, no This how it feels, yeah. on the real side The real eyes are realizing real life Real guys ain't that common in real life That's true, there's a war in the real, in real time This how it feels, on the real side The real eyes are realizing real life Real guys ain't that common in real life there's a war on the real in real time. There's a war on the real. There's a war on the real. There's a war on the real. On the real. There's a war 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 on the real. There's a we begin the process of building a greater economic base. And at the same time, we are putting pressure where it really hurts. I ask you to follow through here. Now let me say as I move to my con- I've run through religions trying to find peace. Pirates living sinnerism, digging, trying to find peace. Wicked little white Jesus. It could be one in a second if my clock you with your timepiece, I'm good with the hold of the curb. So with all else spells, I've got my rules and my word. All I need to hold up meds is a flame of my herbs. Free the man doing noodles on the arms of an iron bird. Streets to me hustle, life to me loyalty. I'm good with life and all adversity. She hit me with love, sat with killers, her man justify her wickedness. And I felt it, it was genuine. The hood's anti, anti establishment, anti bullshit, and anti virus. Like, fuck Corona, man's a soldier. I'm more worried about what normal's gonna look like when this lockdown's over. I had a dream that we could be free. Car fears, they only weapon, and they don't scare me. I'm a warrior. For the warfare, spiritual or physical, I'm good for all attacks. Cause I know who I am and that's facts. And I know who to dodge and that's rats. So it's minimal talking. Gotta watch you on with when I'm laughing. And there's no more marching to the man, them avenge Martin. Still we have it forward. Clear vision of who we are at war with. I pray for no more soakings in the name of the drip. And more riots over vaccines and microchips. Let's take the power from the government and give it to the streets. Let's food for the greedy, more power to the peace. It's definitely war, dog, it's definitely peak. So put your boots on walls, no place for the weak. Rise up, rise up. They can't tell you they must be rise up. We are exploited. We are downtrodden. We are denied not only civil rights but even human rights. So the only way we're going to get some of this oppression and exploitation away from us or aside from us is come together against the common enemy. 
taught you to hate the texture of your hair. I was raised in government built housing, not know what's up. God doesn't love us, we're still drowning, baby. We never rid on the brothers that killed Malcolm. Fuck it, all our leaders are masons, keep it a thousand. They're just here to rock you to sleep and keep you from rousing. Cast the net, trap you with webs and keep you rousing. Conflicting thoughts collide inside of my dome. The only time that I am home is when my eyes closed in my zone. Slide my iPhone, I'm flying home. Bring down the bar for Black the Ripper, bigger than the Georgia Guidestones. How can we? Heal the earth. You're looking for another black man to fill the hearse. The bloods and crypts should be beefing with the builder birds. Should be trying to fund no revolution, they just build a church. Wish I could travel back in time and kill Bill McBurn. And I ain't getting vaccinated, have to kill me first. They say we have to reincarnate until we learn. So try to court a leap from a star game with a city bird. My little bro got killed. I had to sit with his pop. Yeah. He made you want to walk for law. When would he speak in this stop? Um, Way before there was a virus, he was sick on his block. Wait. Don't try and stunt around his kids. You get hit with a block. That ran it down your watch like hickory. Hickory dock. I seen the roads turn into prison. I was literally shot. No. I'm only allowed to exercise and go I visit the shops. shops. While they take away your freedoms, we just sit there and watch. Doing nothing. And I was raised in government built houses. Uh-huh. Not know us up. God does not love us, we're still drowning. We never read on the brothers that killed Mal and fuck it, all our leaders and mazes keep it a thousand. We are just here to rock it, we need to keep it from rousing. Fast the deck, cut to the rent, and keep it from rousing. Rise up, rise up. Big X on your bed, I'll be rise up. Yes, family. Oh, well, go on, family. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a big tune there still. Big tune. Don't get enough spins. It's like, go. Yo, Shaq, you got the whole verse back to front, bro. Man said, the only time my eyes close is when I am home. So I said the only time... The only time I'm home is when my eyes closed in my zone. Put my fi- put my iPhone on flight mode. Yeah, you got it backwards. A hundred percent backwards. Big up Empress Janet. Empress Janet's Wonderland. Big yourself. Yes. <laughs> Shit, you got the whole bar backwards. What the fuck, man? Huh? Big up yourself, though. Where have you there? What's going on, though, people? Hmm? What are you lot saying? Smash that like button like Silverside said. We got 21 people in the building, man. You're just warming up, man. Just turning this heater on. Cause it's cold out here. Fucking Ada. Yeah? Can't make up its mind, mate. Let's get this heater over here. Right. You see what I hate about heaters, yeah? They warm you up and then they dry you out. Like they dry out your mouth. I hate that dry mouth feeling. Uh, 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 uh. Ah, Mr. On Code, Ross Clark, Barber, up to no good. Yeah, the winter's been long. Trust me, man. Trust me. It's dragging its feet. Doesn't want to give man them the fucking the, the rays that we're looking for, you know? I want that good bacon in the sun. Mm, so, what's going on with you lot, though, man? Really, as you can see, I'm in the Ross Clark Koch. Chilling like one gorilla in the jungle, not making love. You know what I mean? But yeah, hopefully, you look on fuck with me today. We're gonna have a live little vibration, please. A little vibrations. Ah, what did I not put the link out there? You got snipes, no link. How is that possible, man? I thought I did my I thought I did the admin already. Let me go back to that. Let me go back. Let me go back to the YouTube. No, admin was not completed. Mission failed. Hold on. Did I not type it in the chat before? No. Sniper who needs a key now and that stranger. Let's interrogate him. Let's see what he's on. Join the show. Let's interrogate the brother. He ain't even got a key. He's turned up, come back from the war, turned up. Things have changed. 
get me his girlfriend's moved on. One of his homies have passed away. Bear shit you don't know. You hear me? Bear shit you don't know. Smartphones, all that is out now. <laughs> yeah? You, you don't know you don't know nothing. Yeah? You gotta teach him about Instagram and TikTok and shit. So yeah, where's 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 this fucking thing man? Alright, cool. Yeah, you gotta teach him about Instagram. What has he missed? Nothing. I know he did a show on Sunday, but yeah, I wasn't able to pre. I wasn't able to pre. I just see it afterwards. I see that the snap has been live. Uh, oh, one second, one second. Give me a minute, brother. Mm. He's probably working out how to work the internet. You know what I mean? What do I do? What server do I use? There you go. Boom. Boom. Yeah, look, what server, what internet do I use? You don't know. How do I turn my camera off? Mad thing. But what are you lot saying, though, man? Pick up yourself, Rika. Music. Silver side. What's going on? Is there anything new for me? Any, anything I should know? Can't tell you what I've been up to today, boy. Can't tell you, man. I'll take that to my grave. No, you're slacking, Jets, but I'll let you off if you're fasting. Get me. <sighs> fasting from some things, definitely. Fasting from some things. Let me delete some of these links. So, yeah, you lot, tell me about your day. What, what's been going on? What's new? I'm, there's, is there something I need to know? You lot, you lot supposed to be updating me. No? Just deleting a couple things. See, it's a, it's a real bad habit. I've got loads of tabs open on my YouTube. I mean, open on my browser. And I wonder why my thing moves slow. It's a real bad habit. My light. My light snipes. What are you saying, Cuzzy? Yo, walk, walk, walk. yeah, man. What are you saying to me? Hey, but not much, mate. Oh, man. Huh? Your surrounding sounds. Your acoustic yeah. sounds different. Your acoustic sounds different, bro. A little bit better. I hope. What's going on, though, man? Where you been, man? Bro, I, was, uh, I, I told you, man. I took an excursion. I was, I was dealing with Project um, Mumra. <laughs> project Mumra, and the first part of the project's finished now. So, yeah, man, I'm about. Yeah, is Mumsy good, yeah? Yeah, she's good. Man. It's cantankerous as ever. But, yeah, man, I love it to bits. But, um, yeah, so, yeah, the first part's done. So yeah, she's she's well happy. Yeah, so what exactly what exactly you been doing? The people want to know, man. I've kept I've kept tight lipped. I ain't said I ain't said shit. I was like, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know where Piper is. You you oh, don't tell me. I don't know. Someone missed it. I'll say someone text Sniper, tell me that like, where is he? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, apart from the few times out, you get me seeing us out in the real world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I told him something. Mm. Like, uh, oh, you know what? I'm really bad. Gregory, Gregory. Oh like, yeah, Yo. yeah. Even my sister yeah. texted me yesterday, telling me, um, yeah, sending me, yeah, this guy is messaged me and said he's looking for you and all of that. I'll get back to it, but yeah, Gregory. You know what it is because you man don't have the um, you know, the YouTube Messenger. I mean, the Facebook Messenger. Open a month. On man's phone, in it, uh, you have to go through Facebook. So the next time I go on Facebook, I'm probably gonna see a missed call. You know what I mean? On that, on that thing there. So 
Sabah Ting but yeah man we did about man. we did about yeah, yeah. Yeah, but yeah, it was doing yeah, decorating man. I decorated my mum's whole house basically with all their stuff in there. <laughs> yeah, what, what, hey, a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff, bros. A lot of stuff. You get we had to work around it and that, you know what I mean? And it, uh, it was a struggle still because yeah, it took a little while before she realized I wasn't there for beef. <laughs> yeah, okay. I wasn't trying to disrespect her in that. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I just come there to work, so man. You know what I mean? Saw the place, I didn't like what I saw. I was like, nah, nah, nah. My mom, nah, nah, can't run. Get me. Took her to Wix, and then, yeah, just proceeded to do the works. Bit by bit, bit by bit, room by room, and all of that. And then, yeah, got it done, man. Took me three weeks, though. <laughs> yeah. What were you doing? What, was you working on your own? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, mm. yeah. Beefy would have come and helped me, but he was musher. I think he went country, yeah. came back, yeah. and then yeah, he's had this stomach bug or something that's had him incapacitated, can't even go work. Because even before that, I was working with Beefy still. So. Yeah, oh, you doing some work with him, yeah? Yeah, yeah. yeah it's light work. You know what I mean? I'm not doing that at the moment. I thought, yeah, let me get some peace as well. <laughs> you get me? But yeah, man, it was good to be at mom's, man. Good home cooking, all of that. You know what I mean? Yeah, on tap. A goosey, pounded yam. What do you want, son? Like, oh, shit. This yeah, reminds yeah. me of when I was young. Like, yeah, it was nice, man, to get a recharge. Yeah. What do you want to eat? What do you want to eat? And that's, <laughs> yeah, um, I know, well, bro. I know. What a beautiful thing, bro. I know. I cherish sure it. Yeah, man. You got it, man. Do mm. anything for mommy, man. Yeah. Well, my mom's a joker, blood. She's on TikTok. She's got her own TikTok account. Blood. I'm the one who's behind. Do you get me? Like, oh, yeah, I'm going to open one soon. I hope one soon. My daughter's on to me. Like, Dad, come on, man. You're fucking up, bro. Do you get me? I've got things to do. I've got a TikTok shop to open up and all sorts. Like, come on, man, get to grips. You get me? But mom's there on her thing. Oh, yeah, I've got to review this. Uh, this uh, Mobad. You heard about this guy, Mobad, the artist. Yeah, he yeah. Died in a yeah mysterious circumstances and that. Yeah. That. Yeah. What's been going on recently? Anything? For they're looking for. Uh, Last time I saw was a couple it's months a ago. There was like, a oh. couple months ago. They was looking for. Naira Mali and that. Where is he? He's not in the country. Just, but I don't know yeah. what happened. After that. Yeah, yeah, no, he came back. He's been questioned. Uh, the next guy who was who went to the concert with him and blah blah blah. But the main thing is the gal, the gal, and the people in the yards. Because like man, they tried to bury man under the stairs and that. Like now it cuts. Like what the hell's going on? Real judge. They talk about Makeje, which is like a blade. My older cousins used to have that shit on the mantelpiece. It's a blade that's got poison on it, basically. So yeah. all you do is just one slice and you get me, you're infected. You know, with yeah. poison frog or whatever business brought back from night. I was like, ah, you man on some gangster shit. They only fighting with the yard man then. You know what I mean? Back in the day. But yeah, um, they're saying that might have been involved, all sorts. They're waiting for autopsy. Da, da, da. But the funny thing is, Jids, my mom's on this channel called uh, the guy's called Paparano, right? And um, on the TikTok, right? And perhaps he has little panels and that. And da, 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 da. But my mom's playing this thing 24 7 on loudspeaker. You get me on her phone. <laughs> all through the night these people going in yeah talking about we need evidence yes because we think Wumi did it and did it and um um, um Mobaz dad and this one and that one and as he said the yeah, night of mali uh whatever mali and whatever i was like rah, rah, this is deep stuff how come i didn't know about this then i looked into it and it was like yeah it's a little bit interesting but i'm saying if we put our mind um our uh, Colombo mind to it, we could probably work out what work, work still. I mean, yeah, everyone, yeah, everyone's like, yo, Naira Mali's done this and he's done that and he's mm. he's got 
He's moving like the Nigerian nature boy. <laughs> there was bad stories going on. There's bad stories going on with the team. Yeah, but some of the explanation from our people, they didn't let they didn't let man down, I tell you that. You get me? They they went full well NSI. <laughs> they went full NSI on it, boy. All sorts, judge, black magic, everything's involved, bro. As well as science, toxicology, also. <laughs> Hey, my people will never stop to 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 show me new things, bro. Because I'm at this. But yeah, what else? Puffy, geek for Puffy. Yeah, mm. but we've been ah, bros. These are like recycled things or things that man gave predictions on long time ago that have now come full circle. Mad tip. Now you got uh, Putin talking about problem. Jesus Black and that. Yeah, but we'll get to that. Yeah, go on, bro. Yeah, um, yeah. Like the thing with the puffy thing is, I don't know, man. Because it's a celebrity, celebrity thing. Yeah, it's hard yeah. to get like, you know, like I've been trying to, like, I, I, I brought it up last couple of days on the, on right. the stream, but it's like I'm talking about something that I'm fully past. I can't lie to you, bro. Yeah, like, I know. It was oh, years ago, right? Uh, yeah, right, puffy. Yeah, it's like, bro. So Emmanuel jumped on this today and said. Yo, you lot are chatting about P. Diddy. You try yeah. to shame because he's like, yo, like basically, Jets, you shouldn't be chatting about P. Diddy. Like, you know better. But I'm just like, yo, give the people what they want, innit? Like, yeah, you, you know, give the people what you want. Yeah. You're going to be ahead of the curve. Like, we were. It's not so like now, man, man you started done it about before. Diddy, but he's like, yo, listen, you know, second person to have tried to come online and school me, like, yo, you know, it's a, um, it's a distraction. I'm like, yeah, I know it's a distraction. Mm -hmm. But from what? So yes. his uh, his thing was, it's a distraction from the red heifers in 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 Israel that are ready to be slaughtered. Like Israel declared, like in their news, oh we've made the altar, we made the altar. So they show one altar, one walkway where the thing will go into this hole. The the, the cows are going to this hole and get burnt. Yeah. Um, in front of where the temple used to be, yada yada yada. Then people are talking about, yeah, this is the reason why um, Hamas attacked uh, Israel right. because they, they saw that the cows are getting brought over. So rare, rare, they're gonna usher in the new, the, the uh, usher in the Messiah, rare, rare. So apparently, that's what we're getting distracted against. I don't know, man. I mean. It sounds like a okay. thing. Did did he say Messiah? No, because he's he in his belief, oh. he believes that it's the Antichrist. Oh, that he believes in Antichrist now. No, no, no. He believes that it's the Antichrist. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he's a, as a Jehovah's Witness, you have to believe in that anyway. But right? I felt, I felt no. As a Mason, though, when we were trying to explain to him that, you know, you're going to get to a level and they're going to bring Lucifer right through the front door. You he's not gone there. <laughs> he, he, he reckons he's not gone there yet. Okay. But what he's but saying is, we're on the periphery. Once we're in the Bible and that, you're on the periphery, bro. Like, I, I told man from time, like, they're going to bring it to you and they're going to pack it for you in a nice way. If I wasn't there at the interview you had in the park with the Masonic guy, yeah, I wouldn't be saying what I'm saying. I kind of know things anyway, but I'm just saying, because of that actual situation, do you get what I'm saying? What he's saying is, yeah, we know what level he's on. He's at. He hasn't obtained that type of uh, level of information. But I told him right, it's coming. But, but the the big, um, not biggie, the Diddy thing and uh, Ridge. Yeah. It is a bit like shallow, though, isn't it? There's not really much to it. Like yeah, it's no. just like it looks like a proper distraction. So it's I am one. Like R Kelly's. It's it's basically a. It's like an R Kelly remix. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like yeah. the kind of thing they did with R. Kelly is what they're going to do with Puffy. And, um, you know, they're going to find uh, some way of, of of getting him, basically. They're onto him, you know what I mean? But for me, it's just really peeling back the layer of the industry and another world that a lot of people are not privy to. Do you get what I'm saying? Where things go on that are, are normal. You get what I'm saying? And some people are above what we're calling the so-called law until they're not or until they're publicly embarrassed or do you get what I'm saying? 
whatever punished in some type of way yeah because they've obtained mastery of of certain certain levels it's not it's not just a free thing it's not just the chance thing it's not just a i positioned myself it's more than that as you said there's there's forces beyond forces there's forces in the background that we can't even describe or thing or entities that these men are dealing with do you know what i'm saying and then the whole industry itself and everything around it oozes that type of energy so you know it's a lot so where's it all headed then? Everyone's getting everyone's getting exposed to. Well, so, I feel as you said <laughs> from a year ago, it's mainly towards black brothers right now. In entertainment, whether it be a Bill Cosby, blah blah blah. You get what I'm saying? It's not like it's not because it's been from way back, as you know, with Dr. Yorks and uh um Clarence 13 X and all of these type of people. They've been what's that again? What's that? that? What's that? What's that? Clarence yeah. 13X, what's that? Yeah, Clarence 13 X. What's that again? Um, that's a like Hebrew Israelite. He was like the daddy for he was the Dr. York of Hebrew Israelite. But his <laughs> thing is <laughs> his thing was a madness. People's lost their lives. Da, 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 da. That man ended up in jail. He's in jail now. Mad. If you put it up in your computer, you get me, you'll see better information on Clarence 30 next. Mm. Yeah, mad. He's got that baked turban that you see my man wearing. Man. <laughs> well, the yeah. Drew Ali turban. Yeah, kind of. Yeah, you're oh, right. Yeah, the founder, the founder of the Five Percenters. Right. Five Percent Nation also. Yeah. So all of these different groups um, in America, as you know, yeah, the, some of the, most of the founders, obviously, are, are demanding. Some were government agents. Others just got character assassination or outright assassination, whether you be Malcolm X or whatever. So it's all the part of the same thing. Do you get what I'm saying? Because if you wasn't of the five percent nation, you was a, a, a nation of Islam, or you was uh, whatever, you know, Moorish Science Temple. Yeah, there were all these different groups you could you could join in it. And I think the new Albion thing is a, is a, a, a culmination of all of it. Do you get it? A little bit like that. A little bit. But yeah, the information is all the same within all the groups. Do you get it? So it's easy to like, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. You look at this from the 5% nation information kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. You could work it out for yourself quickly. Just a, just a quick mm. bit of advance here. Mm. I'm, like, I don't know why this has come up, but do you know, you know Dave Courtney? Yeah, 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 yeah. Passed away, innit? Yeah. You ever seen his wife? Yeah. Black thing with Barley. Barley, is that what you're saying, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I'm just saying, I'll say Barley because she was like, kind of like a skinhead kind of girl. Black chick. Car. You know what I mean? Back in the day. Brother, so she's a... <laughs> Wow. What is that? What's that on the top of her head? Is that hair? Relaxed, you see, you see, you can see, you can see she was doing violin before. Now it's she's not got hair. hair now. It's what not hair, it's not hair. Cuz look at that. What is that? I... <laughs> I'm trying to look properly. <laughs> Let me blow this up. Oh, 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 oh. This is at 15. <laughs> I started seeing some bloke called Roland. Told you, man. That's hair, man. Flattened, relaxed. What? And um, he was fair. No, what's no, going on? Affairs. None, no fears. I mean, I'm partial to me, but definitely no fears. Absolutely <laughs> not. Trust me, listen to me. Men used to throw their women at us. Was there like things what? hanging from the ceiling and everything? Everything you can imagine that's in the dungeon, we had it. Dave had a fight. What? Mad, mad dungeon. What in the Randy Bennett is going on here? Is that what she's on? <laughs> the dungeon, when the goddess business is going on here, yeah. she's a dungeon, man. Jellybean, her name is. In um, Thomas Beckett on Old Kent Road with some bloke, a straight enough, and he got his nose bitten off. And the people go, Look back, Dave called his aguas. Don't fuck it, don't, don't come to me with that. I just run over to him, I was a fucking give him a combination. I was like, <laughs> It's one of the heaviest things I've ever heard, if I'm honest with you. Yeah, you know, it was after Jensen died, after she got shot, my son. 
Are you happy to talk about that? Yeah, I don't mind. Yeah, because my brother's actually inside for doing it. He got 31 years, but I don't believe that my brother did it. As far as I was concerned, whoever done it is still out there. Did you know that was coming? Well, that Dave was going to end his own life. Mm. Oh. I stumbled right. across a little juicy. Tell me I'm straight. This is how you do a trailer, bro. This is how you do a trailer. Yeah, property. Yeah. <laughs> straight away. All right. Mm. Just a quick one. I want to thank our main sponsor, stop, stop. Um, my own site. Stop it, stop. Two stop, and it, those... stop it, Grant. How do you look more like Grant Mitchell <laughs> and Grant Mitchell? Wait, wait, yeah, wait. that's my a young Grant Mitchell at that. Oh my days. Fully Grant Mitchell there. I How? thought it was him. I thought you flipped it to Grant Mitchell. <laughs> I bought these exact shorts. Wow. The exact socks, the exact <laughs> trainers. And I've just switched into the exact shirt I wore. Oh, yeah. So the last time I saw and spoke to Dave, I was wearing the exact same outfit. And I thought oh, I thought it was appropriate <laughs> to do that. How do you know what you tramp. Tramp. how do you know what socks and shorts she was wearing? No, nah, that's the tramp. That's the tramp. Just... Nasty is that what? You saved them. This ain't a football game. How do you, you know wear the socks? same shorts and that? Like, you know, what what, what are you talking about? What kind of judge is this? You're all judge. respect for both of you. I know, I appreciate that. And thank you for coming on. Yeah, and thank you for letting me see your lovely legs. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm glad you like them. <laughs> how are you? I'm okay. You feeling all right? All right, yeah, I'm feeling cool. When I sat opposite to Dave, and we was chat. We obviously spoke off camera, as well as on the camera, mm. and the love and respect he had for you, and the lovely words he used to describe you off camera was touching and heartwarming. But also, it's a, a, anyone can see and hear it for their for themselves because he also said it during the podcast. Mm. But he still loved you and how special you were. And I thought at the time, as I'm talking to Dave, I'm thinking a woman that can play that part and that role in a man like Dave's life and the way he still holds you in such a tremendous light. I even thought there, I would love to sit down and talk to Jennifer. And so I'm really glad you're here and that you're, you're trusting me to share your story with me because I don't just want to, mm. I don't just want to talk about that. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. You I know. Your ups, your downs, and anything going to be tougher. Uh, what a long fanny lick he's know, doing, man. <laughs> That's wow. a running lick. A running lick. <laughs> like a run <laughs> yeah, deeply entrenched, as they say. Yeah, I mean, what the hell? <laughs> hey, he Honda. E Honda with the tongue out. Yeah, was... yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 100 tongues split. Matt. <laughs> I'm one of 14, 14 children. Um, 14. My mum's my mom from Barbados. My dad is from Jamaica. Uh oh. Jamaica, oh, Jamaica. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I was going to say it, but I wasn't going to say it. Yeah. If she man. was related to Auntie Jenny or something. Because, like. Oh, hold, I... hold this. Huh? Hold this. Huh? Hold this. Let me. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, like Janisha or something, mate. Like, yo, looking like Zion. Be. Zion, as she grew up in East London. <laughs> <laughs> You're so wrong. <laughs> looking like Hackney's like, like, like Bow Bow Road wow. Zion. Yeah, wow. man, what's getting on there, man? Where's this huh? like with the flat cap? What? She's got her own Donald Trump going on. Mad too. You know she's straight bilid. She's been straight bilid for days, for years, fam. She's that's Jermaine how I know ja her and Dave. Courtney. This is Jermaine Jackson right now. This is it. Yeah, that's what she's doing right right now. It rains. Her whole face, her whole face is getting black. I'm telling you yeah. right now. Definitely, <laughs> she probably couldn't see through her eyes because of the because of the um, chemicals, mad activator that you have to put in there to stiffen it like that, and then do a finger wave of your own, like yo. That's Matt. Who thought of that? <laughs> that's not, that's and at your thing. age, how is her hair so black? That's like, a thing. On, that's, a, that's a finger tsunami. That's not a finger. <laughs> <way>. <laughs> <laughs> hey, yo, yo. <laughs> she, didn't want, 
do it with a fade nothing in. She, nah. She's like, it's out. Let's place yeah, it on, yeah. man. Yeah? It's like a little swimming cap. It's mud. She's like Betty B. Not even <laughs> Betty B, man. But it's just... Beauty. That is nah, crazy. I don't know what's going on, bro. It's mm, a mixture of Grace Jones. It's all happening. 702. I'm right. not even lying. And she's slightly sexy still. I don't even know why. Why? I mean, she she looks like she knows how to do a blowjob. You know what it is. You know what it is. I can't. <laughs> I've been there, yeah. No, 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 no. I've been there, Jets, and you know who I'm talking about, right? And I'm saying I can't stand a woman with a Cockney accent. I just really can't take it. I, there's many things I can put up with, many accents, many tones, many things, Scottish, Irish, whatever. It doesn't matter. Italian, did it, did it, but... There's something about that's East London. Uh, you get me? Uh, how the man them talk when it comes from a woman, it just uh it's just not sexy at all to me. Oh, I love it. You are you are <laughs> love it. you are babes. You are no. babes. Huh? Fancy. <laughs> fancy. <laughs> yeah. some, oh, I fancy some Nando's, babe. <laughs> mm. It's just too much. They can't help it, it's not their fault. That you grew up in that particular part of London, let me, and you be, talk like that. Let me be controversial. Yeah. Mm. I think I might like it still. Mm. I think that, yeah, yeah, I think I might slightly like it. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know about. Doing, I don't know about doing like fifty years with it or ten years. Of it, you know what I mean? But mm -hmm. right, baby. Right. For, yeah, for a short time. For a short yeah, time, we, yeah, we yeah. can talk about that a little bit. Mm, a little bit, it? but it's. It's more, I don't know, it's different. It's just different. I know, it's, it's not cockney it's, like this. This uh, is this is if you close your eyes, you might think it's a bloke talking. This is you slag. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just any slag. Yeah. I'm a uh, real slag. Real. What did she say? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, I can't remember, but yeah. Slag. When I was in the SIA training. This guy yeah. made it a thing, bro. Just kept on saying, yeah. you slag, you slag. You slag. <laughs> you slag. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I thought the drag out. No, it's mad. I put slag, you know. Mad mm. thing. Slag is one of my favorite words. We got slag. <laughs> God bless us. We <laughs> <laughs> got the slags, man. Yeah, hey. up still. Oh, man. Mm. Fucking community service. Mm -hmm. Listen, they don't get enough ratings. <laughs> Um, she had her first child at 32, my mum did. She was an only child, and but she had 10 children with my dad. Oh. And I'm one of a one of a twin, I've got a twin sister, Julia. Um, and we all grew up in on an estate in um Woolwich Common, Woolwich Common Estate. Ah, oh, she's south. Um, she's that company. My mum was church, used to take her to church every Sunday. <laughs> my dad was in the church car, he was a mechanic. And just uh, there was loads of us. Like I got a big, like I say, big family. Never had much. But we had loads of love. Was your dad into villainy? No, not at all. My not dad was all. a mechanic. Yeah, and like like I say, my dad. So my mum had her first child at thirty-two. She was older than my dad by six years, and um, so she had in seventeen years she had ten children. She made so, up for lost time. She made up for lost time. But my dad was always he always worked. He was a mechanic. He worked Ford's. Um, Ford Motor Company, and my mum was just like a house mum, you know. House mum, church going. House mum, church going, God fearing. She was just a lovely woman. So, was there strict rules within the house? Of course, there was, yeah. Like, everyone had their thing to do. <laughs> oi, oi, Jets. Um, oi, Jets. I just realised who she looks like. It's Matt. Don't say that. Huh? Who? Nah, because if, if she got older. Yeah, if she wasn't, you take away the Cockney accent, you put some proper hair on her, do you get what I'm saying, or whatever she's trying to do, twist now, or whatever. And yeah, man, it's like a older, oh, unique diamond or something. Let's <laughs> <laughs> move forward. Can we move forward, please? <laughs> Where's he gone? <laughs> Where's he gone? <laughs> we got the unique anyway, wherever she is, but yeah, yeah man. Uh, no. <laughs> anyway, let's move on. Because uh, what is sweetness and yeah? <laughs> um, couldn't play out a lot. 
Because mm-hmm. my mum used to go, can we go and play with my friends, mum? <laughs> go like, there's 10 of you, we play with each other, like. Mm, no need. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And we never used to have, like, oh, parties, you know, birthday parties, things like that, because there's loads of us. They never had, really had loads of money and that. But me and my twin sister, I remember being in the park one day, on the estate, like as children. No. Nah. I was nine. I was nine. I swear down. I checked the gym. Nah, I was staying out of it. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Might be related to that. Might be related. <laughs> this to me. You know what I mean? Nah. Wetsy. 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 And um, <laughs> we're in the park and began to people. I said, you need Courtney. I'm not done this to me. No. Well, then you're not coming to my birthday party. <laughs> oh, Diamond. Is that? <laughs> <laughs> nah, antique diamond. I said, nah. vintage diamond, you know. Oh, nah. <laughs> <laughs> a unique pebble. You not taking? Why are you not taking the piss? Uh, big up sneets. <laughs> Come on, yeah, big up sneets, man. He's seen sneet before. Sneety, sneety. Oh, yeah, here's the swing. We've been doing that all day long till we got to get out of your mind now. Sudden, just me and my sister in the park. No people. Then we see all our mates walking past us, going to our house with their parents dressed in party outfits and gifts. <laughs> like, there was no party. <laughs> but then we saw their parents leaving without the child. I was thinking, so I went to Julia, come on, we better go Rush, in there. Then. <laughs> Right in the door, my dad's running out to go and go and get party stuff. My mum's making cakes, going to us, get upstairs and get dressed. Like, so they've done this party because they was forced to do it because we told people we were having a party that wasn't no party ever even existed. But we had this wicked party, nine years old, didn't enjoy it because we thought we were going to get beaten because <laughs> we used to get beaten from your parents, yeah. Like, you know, that's smack, you know, like the belt, <laughs> just get the belt. Like, was you naughty? Yeah, yeah, I was, I was terrible. Who, who was the strict one, your mum or your dad? It was the what strict one. Yeah. My dad. My mum was beautiful. My mum was just the closest thing to a saint that I could ever. Mm. And did you enjoy? This is what I'm saying, man. You don't get no reward oh, for being the beating dad, you know. I know. You, 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 you get me? Be the mm. big bad wolf. And now you don't even hardly get mentioned in there. Ah, oh, my mum, my mum, my mum, my mum. Mm. You get me? Yeah. But your fucking dad that worked. Your mum was just breeding. Yeah. She didn't have no hustle, no job, no nothing. She's just breeding. Yeah, me and your dad worked for Ford the whole fucking time. Ten fucking picnic, yeah. yeah, and and he can't even get a special honourable mention. Talk about my mum was the closest thing to a saint. Pussy clap, man. It's mad. And goddamn enough of this shit. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, no, nah, it's a bit of a violation still. Really. Dads get undermined. It's just, it's true. It's a lot. I mean, because she knows she's about to talk about some fuckery. How you get, yeah, from your mum being a saint, your dad being a hard worker, to being with an East End gangster it doesn't even make no sense. Do you know what I mean? These are decisions you made. Do you know what I mean? I can't blame no parents for this. Yeah, they sound like they were doing what they were supposed to be doing. Like. Woolwich as well. Better not be Nigerian or something. But... Uh, stop that, man. Why do you even bring that into the... <laughs> it's Woolwich. It's... Yo, the ladies and gentlemen of the jury will mm. disregard that last comment, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's too, it's too, it's too. Hell. Mm. Got people wanting to go do research now. <laughs> <laughs> nah, she's fully Jamaican. I can tell. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna argue with that. If, if, if I said, no, she said, said yeah, Jamaican, I said, Yeah, you need damage, Jamaican. So, yeah, but wow. what? Old Neek. Sorry, Old Neek Diamond. Wow, wow. Mm. I said, Us Neek Diamond. <laughs> Scott Diamond. Enjoy going to church. No, I didn't. I didn't. I liked church, but it was all day. All day, like oh. from 11 o'clock in Sunday morning to like 10.30 at night. <laughs> so, so your mum was religiously religious? Yeah, she was religious, yeah. And your dad not at all? No. Oh. He only ever come to church for the christenings of the babies. 
That sounds like quite a nice balance. Yeah, well, it was all right. Normally, they, um, they don't really get on because they say Jamaicans and Asians don't get on. Right. But they, you know, they call us bad mm. breed children because of right. the breed, because of the mix. Why, why don't they get on? I don't know. No. A bit like Irish, Scottish. I don't know. I don't know. And what about wow. the trouble you were getting? Did you did you fight when you were younger? Yeah, I used to be, uh, like, I've got a twin, like I say. And my mum used to say, like, um, she never wanted any girls. She never wanted girls. But like, oh, then you had four boys. And then, so then you would stop there, wouldn't you? Mm. If you didn't want any girls. And then she had twins, us two. And she went, if you two were boys, I don't know where I'd be. Because we were, I swear, we'd fight on the way to school, like on the bus. Anyway, people used to go, like, are you after me? I'd go, like, what? They'd go, yeah, so and so said he was after me. Because people used to just threaten people with us and things like that. We'd have fights that we didn't even, mm. for other people, like, just, yeah, but my brothers used to come home from school and go, stop beating people right. up. Like, it's, not, it's embarrassing. <laughs> like, you know, like, beating up boys from my school. Like, my, you know, my little sisters, stop it. It's not, boys don't like that. So you, you'd it. fight men? Boys, mm. yeah, big boys. Definitely like, didn't care. Yeah. yeah. But, yeah, it was not nice. Did you right. get kicked out of schools? I got kicked out of a lot of schools, yeah. Expe- in the end, yeah, expelled. Like, in the end, what, um, my sister Julia, I'm, I'm my twin, like, she's so, she's, like, I was a tomboy and she was, She'd just done everything she was meant to do. And anything she's done naughty, I made her do. And I can promise you that I did. Obviously, the sister. Mm. But um, so, like, I got kicked out of, out of school. I got expelled. And because I got expelled, my mum just took us both out of there. And then she went to another school and I went to her, another school, got kicked out of that. Got kicked out of another one. In the end, they made me pick a school. <laughs> and was it for the same kind of thing you was getting fighting. kicked out? Just always fighting? I'll tell you what it was. I'd go to the school. And someone would go, well, get kicked out of your last school for I'd go having a fight. So then the bully of that school or the mm-hmm. best fighter of that school would want to have a fight with me. Then I learned not to say that anymore. Don't say mm. it was a fight. Just go, look, I just didn't like it. And then, that, you know, I just stopped saying that and I didn't have to fight anymore. <laughs> like, it was like, I ended up saying it at the school that I picked. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then what happened after you left school? Did you go for a career? Or I did ran you... away from home. <laughs> I ran away. Street girl. I ran away, yeah. But I was at this, I oh, don't. Go on. I said Zion goddess, mm. unique, unique yeah. Zion goddess, but thing. <laughs> Man, I thought I thought to come and collect this L, but yeah, since you put it that way, <laughs> Jamaica and Barbados, man, hold that. Yeah, man, this is your L, man. Nothing to do with us still, but we're gonna listen in anyway. So I ran away from home, yeah. What I- because. I was 13. Right. The reason why I'm on the way, I swear, it's just such a stupid reason now, because we wasn't allowed out all the time, yeah? My mum used to go to church. My dad would be out with his mates and so on a Sunday. So I just snuck out. And then it got really late. <laughs> oh, God, I should be alive. Like, my mum and dad's home now. My like, mum's home from church. Dad's home. Oh, God, I'm not going to get smacked when I get in. So I'm not going to go home. And then when they do see me, they're going to be so pleased to see me because I've been, I've been away. That's how it started like that. I just didn't, didn't want to go home because I didn't want to get beaten. <laughs> Mm. And um, I was seeing some boy called Speedy, what his name was. Um, I told him I was 19. <laughs> and he was like, he was about 18, 19 himself. And I told him I was 19, I was 13. And I was hanging Max. around with these, like, just with these boys, was just like robbing people, nicking things out of shops, just doing shit things, really. It's things impo- that I'm not proud of. No, it's important I mentioned when I when I said when I said street girl, yeah. I'm talking about like on the streets up to villainy. Yeah, up to villainy, yeah. Yeah, up not, 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 not the up other to kind. No good, yeah. Just to clear that up. Yeah, yeah. Not prostitution. <laughs> no. I was giving it away, don't worry. Other than that wise. But, um, <laughs> she was giving it away. Mad. Mad. Man didn't have to pay. That's, that's it was, crazy. Okay. It was getting given away, man. Well I got family, hit that like button. Where you look at, man? Jump on the jump on the panel, man. Come well, say what? Thirteen, yeah. Mad. Thirteen, man. Just do the mazza. Just dash it out home. Yeah. But you know, them days, the thirteen, like you could pretend you was nineteen. Them days. Mad. You know I mean? Especially if you look like Grace Jones a little bit. Pretty Grace Jones, but. So do you think Unique Diamond looks like Grace Jones? Though? No, this one definitely looks like Unique Diamond, but I, I yeah. I'm just saying more there with the hairstyles and that because I just know her to be barlid. This is all new, gents. I can't lie. I've seen her pictures of her professional photos, her and Dave Courtney, and they both got barlid. 
So this is all new for me. I don't know when she started doing this. But she's growing her, hair, growing her hair out. Like, can't we grow? We're not allowed to grow. No, her she's hair allowed. Out. She's allowed. But I'm just saying, like, you can see from the sides, this woman is accustomed to having her hair bald at some stage. You know what I mean? So I'm not. I'm not too upset. You know what I mean? It's a mad thing, though. I, I can't really tell you what that is on the top, but I mean, maybe Zelini can tell us. This oh. might be Missy. <laughs> Right. This is what Missy looks like. <laughs> They're still full of denial on Missy. Missy is still... Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Inquiry, yeah, there's a whole public no inquiry. No disclosure. Mm. Yo, no uh, yeah, Lini, up here so I can go shop, man. I want to buy some chips, bro. bro. Mm. Yeah, I'm hungry, man. Yeah, I tried them um, Cheetos, hot Cheetos, man. Perhaps. What's the problem, man? It was the next day was the problem, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm <laughs> I didn't have yeah. no problem eating them. I was like, these yeah. ain't hot. Like, hot. You get me? I'm like, yeah, oh, yeah, hot ones, yeah. No, I don't eat the hot ones, bro. Like, yeah. I don't eat them because yeah, they just fuck up my belly, bro. Bro, yeah, fucked up my belly. I was going tight. I was, bro, what's going on here? Yeah. And then it was burning at the same time. It was just like, nah. Nah. nah, yeah, no, because they're hot though. But yeah, no, I don't eat, yeah. I don't eat them no more. I look at them like, mmm, fun. Yeah, fun I know, they're nice though. They are if nice, I'm in, yeah. I don't give a fuck mood. I might draw for them still. Right, but uh, it's the repercussions. Everything is about repercussions with these cheetos. And and, and and also, there's two things that help me not get them. One, mash up my belly. Two, in my ends, they're six pound, cause seven pound. Mm. Six ninety nine, bro. I feel yeah. like a dick. like an absolute dickhead. I didn't yeah, know why them. I just saw them on the side there and I was like, oh, let me try yeah. these. You get me? Yeah. And I said, oh, they're meant to be hot. And I licked them back. And then, yeah, someone warned me, like, yo, listen, the next day it's going to be peak. I said, yeah, whatever, man. My bad, man. And then, yeah, by the morning I was on the toilet. Yeah. Talk about mama. <laughs> That's about right, still. Yeah, man. It was just like my belly was gone and yeah. End result was peak. It's like, bro, what is this? Big up John BBBBB. Big up, big, big up. Big up. Yeah. Like number 30. I can't pay no more for than three pounds out of principle. I hear you self sad and um, uh, 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 silver side, but you know, sometimes, yeah, mm. sometimes, especially like me, so I'll, I'll be real with you, yeah. I don't spend money on nothing. I don't really buy nothing. I don't really, do you know what I mean? Yeah. And, 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 I, and I was short lift. As well, so on top of that, I really don't. I really try not to spend money on things. So sometimes when I'm feeling cheeky, I'm like, you know what? You hear me? Let me get a cheeky pack of crisps because they bang. I love the crisp. I can't lie. I bought a pack the other day. You know, I got paid and like I treated myself to some six pound crisp. I know it sounds dumb, but bro, I don't pay for nothing, bro. I don't pay for nothing as much as I can try not to trains, whatever. I try not to pay for anything. You know what I mean? Yeah. I'm going to peak out here, but everything's trying to deduct. Yeah, six pounds for cheetos. It's fucking it's mad. Those are the, the proper American ones, though. Yeah, yeah. At some yeah. point, at some point, I was like doing five finger discount, but the packet's so big, I'm like, yeah, you're going to get caught mm. stealing a local off license. Yeah. Cheetos. Are you going to look like a dickhead, bro? Stop doing it. Mm. You have to go further out, man. <laughs> <laughs> it's cold out there, isn't it? It's cold. Yeah, yeah that's not shit. You know, you're on doorstep and that. Yeah, like, go cold. further out, man. Just go further out down the road. You know, you take a trip on the bike and that. And just, yeah, just go further. Like, yeah, they, these men ain't seen me before. You get me? Go with the that's special puffer and that. You know what I mean? One of the special puffers. Just tuck it in. Boom, boom, zoom, zip. You get me? Carry on shopping. Just buy one thing. You know what I mean? And, and skedaddle. I mean, I said you can't eat blue food. Though. What's that blue food? What are you talking about? Oh, that, that blue, bite? that blue kind of cone thing that they got in there. I don't know. I, what? I don't bother with that. They got some blue kind of cone, um, like Cheetos, but it's it's not Cheetos. It's some other thing. But it's blue. Yeah, I've seen blue. It. Yeah, blue. It's dye. It's obviously, it's dyed blue. Oh, the, oh, well, yeah, no, tackies. Yeah, I know tackies. Mm. And tackies, they're fucking hot as fuck, fam. You think mm. the Cheetos are hot? <laughs> get, get the, get the hot tackies, bro. Mm. They're a motherfucker. 
No, nah, they're not. They're not even a joke. They're not even mm. nice. They're so hot. They're not nice. Man, we right. eat the whole pack. Right. I think why? Why did I do that? I ain't seen the blue ones though. Mm. They're blue ones, bros. Yeah, I've seen them. Yeah, I want the right. chips. Looking at them, my like, bros. That is Zellini. dangerous. Zellini, you, you're back, man. I need to, I need to get the chips. I don't know. I had to get some Doritos and, and the dip the other day, man. And I just felt like it's something different. Like, oh, shit, man. Yeah, man. I ain't had that in a while. The dip's shit, man. The dip, that, that dip's shit. Why they, why they got a cheese dip? What, the salsa one? No, why yeah, have they got a cheese one? Yeah, I've got a cheese one. Have they? Yeah. Okay. I just see the salsa and I'm like, well, that's shit, man. Yeah, the salsa one's all right, man. I, I, like, I, I, I wasn't going to risk the cheese. Dip, no, it's going to be cheese, man. Fuck. Mm. Fuck. No, I did. It, it was there, though. It was still there. I was like, yeah, yeah. should I get this as well? Oh, you get me? Put, add it on the shopping list and that. I'm going to get it next time. To see what it's like. I don't know if it's like the cinema or whatever. You know what I mean? People will be getting that. Chicks in that. Yeah, can we I got my uh, Doritos with nachos and, and jalapenos, please? And uh, you get I was like this? the cinema, cinema mm, thing. Yeah, yeah, man. I, I just take a handful of yours and I'm good, man. It's yeah, yeah, right. that's me too. That's me too. Let me get some of that and then I'm out, man. But the tea, I do like the cheese sauce, even though I know it's fuckeries. I do like yeah. the cheese sauce. The last time I went to cinema, I think the girl said to me, "You should have told me you wanted one." That's it. Bro, that's true. Bro, that's that's true. That's true. You see me, man. I got my popcorn, man. I'm good, man. So yeah, but I'll have a couple since you were offering. You get me? Like you, you offered, like you didn't want to offer. That's what you're basically yeah. saying to me. My thing is pick and mix. If you go mm. to the pot cinema, I got yeah. a little bit of burger. There was a cinema I was rinsing, and there's like chicken burgers and that in there. So mm -hmm. you know, yeah, yeah. yeah. food and stuff, beer and that. Expensive wine, all sorts. There. Mm -hmm. There's one. I think the closest one, um, the lounge in Shepherd's Bush. Yeah. That one there. Press a little button, they come over and say, like you know, me come over and serve you. Right, you know, right, right, yeah, right. Well, that's gang. You know them. Let me get the. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Let me think you're bad. Listen, yeah. mm. this is mad expensive. I don't have money. A bill, though. You can run up a bill. Mm. I'm Wish you even if you just got normal. Just got kind of thing normal, and they're like, yeah, what do you want? You get me? We've got hot food, we've got all sorts, we've got alcohol, we've got and you're looking and you're like, rah, rah, rah. Scrumpy Jack, yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, all sorts of flavored alcohol drinks, a Budweiser, like, nah. Yeah, cinema's changed, bro. Yeah, man. It's like from the like I see lots of people going to cinema with the whole KFC bucket. I think that's yeah, the veggies name. with the nice hot wings and no, shit. no, 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 no. Oh. Man's walking into the cinema with KFC. With yeah, man. Um, yeah. And I think you know what? I could fuck with that. Yeah, I could fuck with that. I, could fuck with that. I yeah. only used to do it with crisps and stuff like and and sweets and that. I used to go to the shop before. And Everything changed. Since, yeah. Since Black Panther, a man was bringing fufu. <laughs> I know, yes. I know, I saw that. Uh, I know. But since I was coming with Eba, so yeah. I was like, yo, listen, yeah. yeah. Levels. It's changed yeah, now. Yeah, 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 it's true. Yeah. Come with your own packed lunch and picnic basket. Bring a like whole food. Like, mm. It's the one that makes sense. Took me to cinema the other day. They're just looking at me like, yo, you're a different you. Yeah, man. Mm. It's how we, how we go to cinema, boys. Yeah. You know no what I mean? Yeah, you know I mean? Well, at least the only thing we're paying for is the tickets, mate. My yeah. kids. So you're going to be nice. My, my kids stole from from London Aquarium yesterday. You know, I don't oh, have to see for my I took a, <laughs> I, took, I took them on a daddy day out. Uh, yeah, we went all around. You know, looking mm. at the fishes and that. Took some pictures, yeah. videos. Like nice. Had a good time. Had a little pat lunch in there with the little bits and bobs that I brought. Right. And then on the way out, you know, it leads you through the gift shop. I like yeah, they, gift shop, everywhere has the technique in it. Like everywhere yeah. has this, the gift shop is the exit. I don't know yeah. who told you to do that. Near the I, exit as well. Mm. I can't just, vibration just shifted. I could feel it in the air. Mm -hmm. I could I could preempt that something like this was gonna happen. Mm. I'm like, yeah, no, 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 no. We ain't buying that. I, oh dad, look, a stingray. Mm. Like, no, 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 no. I want we're not buying none of this. Mm. Very rare. Mm. They had empty hands. 
bopping, bopping. I turn around again, there's like this bargain bucket full of toys kind of thing. I see yeah. them ramming in. I said, boys, let's go. I bop it. I can just feel the energy's changed. I can, yeah. They're walking, walking behind me. I'm looking behind. They're walking, walking. Get out, turn around. They've got two toys each. They've got toys each. I just opened my bag and just said, yeah, put it in the bag. Yeah. I didn't even ask no question. I didn't say that. <laughs> I've done wrong. I've done wrong, man. I've done wrong. I didn't even say like, yo, where'd you get that from? Because yeah, before yeah. I pretend, I pretend like, hey, mm. what are you doing? Put that back. Mm. What are you doing? Yeah, get me? Yeah, yeah. This time, I just was like, hey, we got to go, you know, like, and mm. they understood the assignment. Yeah. <laughs> On point. <laughs> you wrong, man. You wrong. Man. It felt so good. It felt so right. Bear. Nah, mm. it, was, it felt right and wrong. Yeah. It's like, yo, I don't know. You get me? Their mom would probably be pissed. I don't know, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah. I, yeah, so it's like, boy, when you bring them back and whatever, mm. when you show them to your mom and that, mm. and she asks, oh, you're, you're that, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you get me? I see where this is going. I see where this is going. This is... Yeah, okay, it's like, yeah. Mm. Uh -huh. You get me? Welcome, welcome. Welcome to the wow. family. Wow. <laughs> they just yeah. got busy, bro. Right? Yeah, me? it's like it, it, it bees like that sometimes. Get me? Some, Plus, some, some, some stuff ain't got no prices in the gift shop. Get me? They got no price on it. How are they supposed to know? And you put bargain. You get me? That means you're giving it away. You get Trust. me? That's, a, that's how we interpret it. Like it, it's obvious. I you know, said, you like the hot dogs at the cinema? Oh man. Yeah. Silence. <laughs> yeah, he mentioned everything but the hot dogs. Oh. He said, yeah, the slushies bang, the this, that, mm -hmm. yo. Mm -hmm. And now said, let me get two hot dogs. Man well, said, they allowing there. Yeah, they allowing certain cinema. Ghost, Ghostbuster slushy, you know. Mm -hmm. Them slushies there, yeah, I tell you, them slushies made my son have, mm. have a seizure. I tell you, man. Yeah, I see it on the yeah. news as well. Kids getting... Kids hallucinating off the slushy. They got, they got um, a colorant and a food agent mm -hmm. in there that's known to give people like hallucinations and that like, give certain it's kids. Like, yeah, I see it so on the news. I <laughs> <laughs> I'm re <laughs> rechasing my steps. I was thinking, you know what? Mm. The time when my son had this funny turn, where they were, mm. where his mom told me, "Run, come to the, come to her house." Yeah, I'm over. Mm. It's like, yo, I think he's just had a slushy. I was in the live stream. Mm. I think he just had a, um, I think he just had a seizure. That day, earlier mm. that day, I'd been with him and I'd taken him cinema. Yeah. And he'd had a slushy, mixed colours. Yeah. And whatever. So I didn't even play no cor correlation to that at all. Yeah, 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 yeah. A month ago, there was some news article that came up and a woman was blaming a slushy for her son having a seizure. When I was reading it, about this ingredient in it, yeah, I was like, "Oh, listen, this make this this actually this adds makes up. perfect sense." Yeah, I get yeah. It. yeah. So it's some it's banned nice. ingredient that shouldn't be there, or somehow it's in the slushy, and it's then it's like some I don't know some net sugar thing, glucose, mm. gly yeah. glycogenium. I don't yeah, know what. Something, something, something. Yeah, yeah. but yeah, it's fake. Fuck fake shit. Oh, that's nice. Right. It's like fucking crystal meth. Yeah, <laughs> it makes sense now. Makes sense. Yeah. Kids will be acting up once they drank it. Yeah, you know, moving so, um, kid, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We were like, ah, look, 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 they had loads of sugar. We even know. We even say dumb stuff like that. Yeah. You can tell when you see the kids had bad yeah. sugar. Yeah, sugar. Sugar. So What's wrong with you, bro? Well, crazy. You know what I mean? Zipping all around the yard or out on the road, and it's like, rah. Do I need to get one of them pitney chain? You know the one that drags you back when you press the button. <laughs> Like, do I have to do that? Because you're acting up. Like, what did I give you? I swear I only gave you ice cream and a... Oh, yeah, that fizzy pop too. Mad tea. That's crazy. But the colouring and that. Yeah, man. Messing up kids and that. Causing seizures and that. What does it do for adults, though? Yeah. I know, it man. Induce some special type of high and that. You know what I mean? Get you addicted in that. Keep going back for more, but they they put benzene in in fizzy drinks, so nothing surprises me anyway. 
Oh, you know, that benzene ain't, ain't something that should be in the fizzy drink, put it that way. Bigger Axum, tell the people not to bring food to the cinema. You're so stiff. Well, you do oh, you're going to pack your sandwich. Yeah, <laughs> sandwich cake to the cinema. <laughs> or they sell sandwich cake at the cinema. Whichever right. way you're holding an L, it's just a travesty. No sandwich cake, no strumming. You know what I mean? Opening strumming in the cinema and that. It was stinking out the whole place. That's just her uncrossing her legs. <laughs> <laughs> and um, one day we went to this thing. I don't know if you know about Vegas Sunsplash. No. There was this thing called Vegas Sunsplash we used okay. to go to. And um, mm. we'd gone to this on a Sunday. And this is when you were 13? Mm. No, but no, I'd been away for a couple of years. Oh, you no, ran no, away no, for I a long away. time? I was running away, yeah. But mm. I did go... I did, actually go on in between then as well and then just run away again like that kind mm -hmm. of thing yeah and be away for months and months you know what i mean too. this time i was away for a long time and um it was coming back from this sun splash thing you know when someone in your family gets a car and you just see that car all the time don't you yeah my brother just passed his test my older brother mark and he had a green ford cortina and i remember seeing this we were walking up the road me and my mates with this case of this this bloke that I was seeing, Speedy, and all these brothers and sisters and all their mates. And I'm proper mouthy, I was as well, proper mouthy. So I'm walking up the road and I see this car, I didn't think nothing of it. I just get to the door, my brother, my dad. And like two of my brothers and my dad are at their door, like, fucking come to get me. I was like, I don't know. Nah. <laughs> my brother went, go and get your things. Go and get your things. So then I've gone in, I was like walking up the stairs, go and get my thing. My brother went, oh, by the way, let them know how old you are as well. <laughs> So you kept your age a secret for a what while. I did. That boy, like I'm seeing some boy, like I was only 15, like by then. He's 21, 22 now. That's a nicking mm -hmm. for him. Of course it is, like. And I went 15, and uh, because you know no one made a loud noise, but just the gasps <laughs> it sounded mm. so loud. And I was just wanting to jump out the bloody window, and I got upstairs. I was embarrassed. I died, and my brother John grabbed hold of me, and like and just. He went to me like, fucking hell, Jen, like, you're going to jump out the fucking window. Like, I'm the last, I'm the, like, it looked like you jumped out there because you're running from me. And I, it's not that deep. Come on, man. You know what mm. I mean? Like, did you, anyway. did you move back home after that? So I went home, yeah. Did you and see like, Speedy away again. No, I did see him as mates, but like, yeah. Did, he, it was embarrassing, don't. He obviously saw that if he was to continue, it'd be. Of course, yeah. Yeah. Young of course. Mate. But like, you know, I apologised. Mm. <laughs> so then I stayed home. So it's like there's no crime. If, if yeah, I know. Friend, that's a big crime you've done, though. Mm. Yeah, if a 13 year old tricks you into, into sexing her, mm -hmm. there's no punishment for her. No. It's yeah. She's just keeping your secret, but it's not even your secret because you don't even yeah. know. Yeah. She just hit you with a story, you know. Mm. Sorry, so, sorry, mate. Yeah, I uh, know it's a bit liberty. I'm a sorry, friend. geez. See, that's my what friend, I'm He's with a 13 year old and with a foot with a 15 year old, he's been with her for a couple of years. Man. Mm. And you're baiting that his name Speedy. Mm. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> you are speedy. Literally, he was too speedy, yeah. man. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Too he's too fast. He's too yeah. fast. <laughs> I started working up at the West End. Man. And I started seeing some bloke called um this is at 15. <laughs> I started seeing some bloke called Roland. And um he was 30 odd. Yeah. And this is this is how normal it was back in the mm -hmm. days. I don't know how old she is, but yeah, this is how this is how normal yeah, it was. It was normal still. You know? Fucking proper normal. Big up Salini. Big up. Big up Snacks. Big up Jenna. Big up Snacks. Sorry, I mean oh. Dave Courtney's ex. <laughs> People yeah. like somebody said that it's like an older, unique diamond. So <laughs> I, I, I'm I'm seeing a mashup still, but I don't want to say no names. So nah, I'm already <laughs> saying, nah, don't worry. I've, I I I called I called her um uh unique Zion Diamond. Yeah, that, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. no, 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 no. I lied. I said <laughs> unique Zion Goddess. Okay, no. man yeah. said two. Man said two of the top five answers we were looking for. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, big up the sister, man. Uh, big up the sister, man. Come on, man. 
Yeah, yeah but what you see, you see what my girl just said about the aid conceding thing, bruv? Like, mm-hmm. That's a yeah, it's dangerous, man. You get me? My man should have still done a bit more due diligence, but yeah, that's a that's a dangerous game still. I don't, I don't know what's going on there still. Mm. I've been on the bus yeah. and, and seen it at like young days back yeah. in the day, and yeah. um, I turn around to the girl and he says, How do you block? She said, uh, 18. I said, you are not 18. And I turned around and I looked and I said, nah, they're trying it. You get me? Like, yeah, it's blatantly school uniform running or whatever. I was like, you girls are dangerous though, man. Yeah, rolled up jail bait. You call them jailbait, innit? Like, well, uh, uh, that's uh, a man jail in that. Like, that, went, man. that was mad. Yeah, now for these guys in the chat, Rebo, really, used to have big man looking them when they were in the school guys as well. Yeah. Now, bare girls in school had older men. That was facts. You, me. you know what I mean? Like, in my year, Girls co- didn't go out with us. Young girl you know with the cock pants on that sounded like Rika X. Fuck no, you man, fuck man you is, no, man's got car parking in the car park, bros. The teacher's car you park. Me, like, yeah, like what? Like, what the fuck? Is, 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 that, is that a put or Yeah, my man's before? coming up to school for you. You're man. You said man. Key word being man. Nah, you're taking a piss. I'm 14. Yeah, and your, your man's 18 or 19 or 21 plus or like, nah. It was very normal though. That's what I was gonna Someone's, say. Um, secret as well. Secret. Yeah. So like yeah. one of my girl best girlfriends, when she told me she was going out with this guy a year above, he kept it on the D Do you get me? Because he weren't even a fifth year yet. So like, you know what I mean? We were like, uh, what? He was a fourth year. We were third years. Yeah. It's mad. Quick Very question, mm. ladies in in the chat because they're not on the panel. Have you ever lied to a guy about your age? Bear <laughs> them. Bear them. Never ask that question, bro. That's why they say don't ask a woman her age. Watch them that follow up. What, what, what's the answer to the lie with a lie? You don't make me mm-hmm. sick, man. They all, have, they all have done it, bro. Bro, see eyes from Axum. Mm. I was good. Yeah. Too, Rico. <laughs> yeah. Now, yeah. remember, Rika, Rika told us that she was in a, in a club from early. Whatever, a sister. Every time she wants to make this, my sister brought me there. But from she was young, she was there. Get me? Mm, I hear that. So, story. so you, so uh, you, in, so you was in the club, and what yeah. you didn't speak to no, no, no man. No, you, you would have got moved to. You would have got I'm moved to. Trying to get man killed and that. All right. Yeah, no, you would have no. got man moved. But yeah, as soon as she would have said her age, yeah, it would have been like, but why are you yeah. even in it? But it's These happened guys, a lot. Look, they don't care about lying. Look, look, look never. No, nope, nope. That was like, um, as I said, I was like Kelly LaRock. Let me see how much more ways you lock a fire to say the word no. She was in the rave and her people left her and she was 15. And I was thinking, what the fuck are you doing in the rave at 15? Like, what what, what kind of fuckery is this? We had to escort her back to her yard. But she was 15. And I know she weren't telling man in the rave she was 15. It's only because she was, we was just like asking her questions. Like, yo, she didn't look 15. Tell you that, but. Yeah, Bro, which, 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 oh wait, which underage mm. person is going to get in a rave and then expose that they're underage nine times out of ten? No, it was after, but, it was after, yeah, it was, a, it was a madness. But her people had gone. If you know you've got a 15 year old with you, you how are you going to leave her? It was just dark. That's wild. You know what I'm saying? Bro, yeah, Rika X, mm. Rika X, big up yourself. Fight the power. Rika X. Big up. 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 Big um, told you it was no, I was, no, I know, was, no I know, one was allowed to approach me in the club. Like, I on. remember there was a point, there was a time where someone did try to approach me, and my sister pushed them away. Yeah, there's been that. I've been, in, try, I've, been in yeah. a, I've been in a club where someone was trying to dance behind me, and mm. my cousin kicked the person in the bum. Mm, so that's mm, that's mm. always. I've been in another, I've been in another place, and I was about to do bend over and start dancing, mm, and then my cousin mm. come and whispered in my ear, and he goes, "Don't bother with it." So that's three separate occasions where someone just managed to do the superhero yeah. thing and say, say, Rico. Mm. 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 I, I have PTSD. So when I go out, yeah, mm-hmm. I just stay, even now as an adult, when I go out, I just stay by the wall. So what happens if you need to, to, to go toilet or go get a drink? That's different, isn't it? But like, I don't try. <laughs> wait, because wait, I've wait, got Rika, a there. Do you know how much girl I've got? Do you know how much girl I've got moved to on, on, on the walk to the bar? Yeah, the wall is the worst place to be. Yeah, like, but at least it, at least it's a side move. It's not like a behind move. <laughs> nah, <laughs> nah, 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 nah. <laughs> what the fuck? 
You're getting full frontal on the wall. <laughs> <laughs> Your back's against the wall. Trust me. The wall is the last place. It's like prime real estate. You get me? Prime real estate. You want? You think man want to be doing dirty rub up in the middle of the dance floor? Yeah, that's wild. Well, that's wild. Well. There's no job security in that. Yeah, <laughs> man. <laughs> yeah, me. Let's just Find eat you in the side office. Yeah, you, you know can be bossy. Yeah. You get me? <laughs> man like Jake can lift up a gal and, and put her back against the wall and that. Mad you get me? And show her Mad one because we got support. You need it. Manzo, if you get on wall, Manzo you baby get boy in the gal in the rave, you know. Mad I know. Showing off. Because he's got wall. He's got wall space. I just, I just want to say I'm not guilty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Melvin. <laughs> 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 yeah, you gotta be baby boy in the gallon, you know? Yeah, 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 yes, yeah, yeah, too. Yeah, <laughs> so what Rika, do you did you used to know of mm. gal that used to do this 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 same procedure here? Uh like lie about the age. Yeah. Yeah. I don't I actually have my group. <clears throat> There's about two of us two. So we I don't know yeah. what they used to do, you know. I had one obviously person that I used to hang around with, but she was just a dirty girl anyway. <laughs> She was really dead. Like, she was dirty. I just don't know what her issue was. Yeah, she was dirty. But I don't know. I but they also make the best friends, you know, still. I can't lie. They make no, the like, it friends. was just like, you know, you're trying to, you're trying to break her out of the dirtiness because she just couldn't go nowhere yeah. without... Are without you going to break her out? Up. Hold on, are you going to break her out of the dirtiness? I just don't, you know, I ended up having to hit her, you know. Because yeah. what I remember one time, yeah, mm. back in, do you remember back in the day you used to have three yards? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, so the free yards thing for us was we come it's round, a free yard, man. we'll have a little smoke. <laughs> yeah, we on. have smoke here, but if you tried it, we'll bash up your house. That was that was that was our cue, yeah. Yes. That was your cue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we still. just used to literally just chill, chill like. and smoke. Like, <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, we went to one, and we got a phone call. Like, like, yeah. No, but no, it used to work. We used to actually just be able to chill for hours and hours and just leave, boom, that's it. We just literally, it's not about yeah. that. But anyway, There's always we went a to one though. house. Just like, <laughs> go we on, went go to on. one house, yeah. Yeah, yeah. And I got a phone call. Mm-hmm. Um, So I had to come out the house, come out the house. And when I came back, so they pushed me out of the house, actually, because they were like, our kids, but I was so engrossed in this phone call, I had to sort it something out. I said, Sam, Sam, it told me, go back in the house. I went back in the house. When I opened the door, there was all these men lying up on the wall. Um, yeah. And then at the end of the corridor, the door was shut. And then I had one of my friends and her man were like laughing, giggling behind the door. So I'd like literally had to push my way through, open the door. And I, lo and behold, I could see her laying on the bed. She's yeah. underneath. He's on top. Her knickers is down. to me, get the fuck, get the fuck up. No, why are you being a cop block though, man? Because she, like, she was my cousin. She was my cousin. Oh, man. I, I hear it, but yeah. she's still a cop block. But you're still a cop block, but I hear it though. No, no. And then, this, and then she was like, then she tried to say to me, I didn't do anything. I didn't you did. I don't know. I just had to attack her because she lied. She was a... <laughs> so hold on. Wait, 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 wait. What so a your joke. cousin... That was about to do whatever she was about to do. Yeah, she, she was enjoying it. it. Yeah. She was in it. She was ready to have enjoy herself. I don't you, care. Like, the thing is, yeah, I actually hold on, hold on. helped her because Wait. you know what? She would have got gang banged. All, all these there was about maybe, ten maybe, bands, maybe. And, and no woman wants that, did it? So That's obviously true. we heard that. But what, what I will say, yeah, is that it? it's not bad enough that you cop blocked her. On top of that, you then brought her up. Yeah, because she lied to me. Oh, see, this is what she I'm told saying, me, she, t- she tried to tell me she didn't have her knickers down by her ankle. I saw what I saw. You had green knickers mm. on, bro. You no, had green what, what, on. Do, you, do you mean do you mean green, green is in color or, or uh, green, no, green, the color. Green, <laughs> yeah, green, yeah. green in the gusset. Yeah, like <laughs> green in the slit. Like what sort of what sort of yeah, what kind of green. green like, was it brown? I, like, I went. I yeah, and I cried because like, I had because obviously I've never hit. Like, I've never beaten yeah. up my cousin because obviously that's not permitted to hit your cousin. Mm-hmm. And I went home and I talked to him. Mama beat up. She goes, "Why?" And I told her. She goes, "Oh, it's whatever." Like, no, man, you see, snitching as well, man. Rico, I swear to God. Yeah. So you messed up the gal show, then you brought her up, then you snitched on the gal after you brought her up. Because I had to. Because she's my family. Just love her, man. Wow. Yeah. Awesome. But no, no, but no, I helped I, her because she probably, she probably, she probably, she probably would have got. Uh, and do you know what was the oh, interesting part? The person that was on top of her. Take off your panties. Let me do your panties. It's just because your cousin is lonely. No, but you know what the interesting part was? The person that was on top of her 
was my cousin from my dad's side. And she was my mom. Yes. No, 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 no. See, no, see, 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 no, 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 no. Yes. Rico, Rico, Rico. Yes. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. Yes. <laughs> Yo, listen. Yes. That, was, that, was, that was the key. But he was like, 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 Wait a cotton picking minute. <laughs> yeah, man. Plot twist. What the fuck? <laughs> Wait a goddamn yes, he's minute. He's from my mum's side and he's from my dad's side, but like a distant, we don't even really respect him, but he's still cousin. But when I was, I would, I literally yeah. was going, I said, get off my when I was saying, crazy. get off my crazy. cousin, get off my ethnic cousin. Because she was more my cousin than him. But I, I, she, because I was still from my mom. You should have said, yeah. that's your brother. <laughs> yeah. Man, say what in the incestuous activities was about to happen? No, I, I hear you, Rico. I hear you, Rico. Still, yeah, it was. Yeah. It was. Yeah, it was your brother. Brother. Yeah. That's your brother. <laughs> I did. You know what with her? Yeah, because she used to always do dirty things. Like that, but I just think she. I think she was abused. But the last yeah. straw, because every time she used to do dirty things, I used to always try and help her. But the last time I had to kind of step back because she said to me, mm. she went and linked a guy mm. after she's come out. Mm. Got ready, to come out, and then the, another guy said, "What? Where you going? It's my turn." No, no, so I goes, no, "What no. did you do?" So what did no. How did you feel about that? She goes, "It feel good." To me. Why did you not feel like you could leave? She goes, "Ah, oh, because his grandma was in the house." So that's thinking what? you're just a different person. No, no, sorry, sorry, no. sorry. Yeah. Not to, um, like, uh, it's a disaster. Uh, uh, yeah, on, on your cousin's story, but mm. what kind of bullshit is she trying to? Did she think you're born like? Trying to say, because she, because his grandma was in the house, she didn't want to. She didn't want to make up so, noise. So, I would have so, made up. So her, so the grandma being in the house would be more reason why I, I think it would be easier for her to cut. Exactly. Be, if she really she just, liked, she just liked it. Yeah. She just liked it. Man. She just was a dirty girl, man. Oh, you know what? She yeah, not... right. You know what? Dirty. Bring her to one of the motives. Let me chat. To yeah, her. man. No, I'm but she's paying yeah, that. She's, to, it. Yeah. she's in a long term relate. Someone's wifey'd her. Uh -oh. She's, she's wifey'd uh -oh. off. So the most, uh, um, got it. Yeah, yeah, like I said, that's fuckery, man. <laughs> yeah, just bring her in it. Like, come on, <laughs> <laughs> uh, let me, we, we, we know what we're that talking about. Here. Just, just bring her. Yeah. <laughs> We love that situation, you see? Nah, do you know what? It's all loved up. I did love her. She was my cousin, isn't it? I loved her. She's yeah. still my cousin now. I yeah, think huh? she, she, she was my cousin. She just, was, yeah, she just had some dirty ways. And people say, why are you hanging out with her? Why are you hanging out with her? Yeah, she's my cousin. Hey, Rico, do, do you know what? Yeah, Some people are just like that, innit? Do you get what I'm trying to yeah. say? That, yeah. They just they just like, so, certain women, they're just sexually active, very. You get yeah. what I'm trying to say? Like, now, how, how they go about it, determines what they get called or how they get looked on but I ain't trying to shame you because you got a high sex drive uh, you get me for doing certain wild things it's a bit different but you get me but she's the part, I think she's, do you know there was one time we went to we, we, um there was this thing my friend went on this thing this chat thing and she she goes, she goes what's, what's the what are we doing today she goes oh let's go meet these guys it's me listen I'm not doing no nothing you know went all the way to Peckham Mm -hmm. we're not doing we're not doing <clears throat> and I said, I said, that I, I actually said, we're not doing nothing. I'm letting you know, guys, no, do nothing, yeah. No. We're out there, and this guy had like a piece of face. I just got to ask, and it's done. Go on, <laughs> this guy had a piece of face looking, yeah. Mm -hmm. And there was yeah, some this. other, he had an other friend. Mm -hmm. And I just went into the phone box and I just, all I could do was laugh. I just was in hysterics. I couldn't stop laughing. I couldn't stop laughing because it took us time to get there because we got on the bus. Let's go central, everything. I was in the, I was in the phone box laughing my ass off and here my dirty cousin. We, we can't come up here and not do nothing. I just started switching. I just, I literally went from 0 to 100 <coughs> and we just got back on the bus and we just turned it. We just literally just done a U turn. I don't know what. I started feeling panicky, like because I knew yeah. that I was out of the area. Yeah. I don't know what could happen to us, and I've got this dirty girl telling me that we, we can't come up here for nothing. <laughs> oh, your cousin sounds like a good person. Yeah, sounds like a good. I person. felt panicky. Yeah, we literally just. I just. They, I think I did ruin their vibe because we actually <laughs> literally just left. As quick as we arrived, we left. Where I was just like, no, 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 yeah. no, 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 no. Hey, sniper, you hear that though? She said, we can't no, come no. all the way here and not do it. It's a hair, it's a wasted trip. Yeah. I, I hear yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. It's mad. <laughs> she done she knew what she was there, on. got herself ready. You yeah, get me? She, she knew, knew what she was on when she was leaving. You know I mean, she I mean, knew what she was on. But I think I told her from the, I told both of them when we were not, I told them what the plan is. We're not doing nothing. And if I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. You can't speak for other people. You have to speak for yourself, definitely. Mm. As soon as we got there, the girl's talking about we can't come up here for nothing. I was like, what the? 
the way I started cussing her out, man, I just went mad. Because I, I just, I felt scared because I felt, obviously, like I said, I was out of the area. Big don't man. really know these people. Anything can happen to us. And you're talking about, we we should go with them. Go with them where? Mm-mm. And this, and that guy had a pizza face. <laughs> mad. Yeah, that was that was. That was <laughs> <laughs> wow, that, that your cousin is a liability, mate. She's, she was, she was. Yeah, no, she all jokes are saying. She's, she's calmed down now. She's, she's yeah. in a settled relationship. That's what they do. That's what they do. They they pretend to be someone else afterwards. You know what I mean? You can exactly. start brand new. There's always that hope yeah. in life yeah. and in society. There's gonna be yeah. some some. I don't want to call him a sucker. You get me? Yeah. Like some, there's gonna be some. Yeah. Yeah, I, I'll love you. Let's just call him I'll, a guy. Yeah, I'll look after you. Yeah, you know what yeah. I mean? Right yeah. Off. Yeah. Yeah, like some man will be spilling their um, uh, was it called? Not, smoothie yeah. when they walk past. Do you get what yeah. I'm saying? Like, some, and I'm not going to let... Fuck, sorry, mm. that's fine. Go on. Well, I was gonna say I'm very thankful of of, of them, them 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 suckers that will let me take mm-hmm. on that real quick. It allows yeah. me to just pam them gal and she doesn't bug me. You know what I mean? So mm-hmm. yeah, <laughs> man. Straight up. It's just uh they do me, they do yeah, me. Yeah, you know what I mean? They help yeah. me out. I know all the players. It's mad. Different levels to this. Different. But you can't you can't stop a lot of them. That's the reality. That's why yeah. I have a, a lot of them as girlfriends and that. I mean, I mean, not girlfriend, girlfriend, but you know what I mean? As my friends. You know friends, I mean? yeah. They're basically like, yeah, because they're trustworthy. Like, they'll put planting and all sorts and you know what I mean? Like, in your yard. They'll like, put planting. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> in the morning and beans and egg and that. And the, you know what I mean? They'll do stuffs. The yeah. pretty ones, they don't usually do that. They just, yeah, being pretty in it. Like uh, who's, who's, who's that in the private chat? And then, uh, uh who was that? Delaney. Who the fuck is that? Oh. I don't know. One second. Let me see. Take off your panties. Now listen what you can say. Mm-hmm. Come on. <laughs> Yo, oh, keep Hello, yo, 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 can you hear me? Oh, it's Mag. Yeah, yeah. Is it Mag? Is that Mag? Yo, Mag, is that you? Yes, it is, man. It's definitely me. Ah. Oh, it's weird, man. Ah. I know it's a weirdo, man. It's a fucking weirdo, man. I'm not going to do nothing weird. Oh. Hey. Big up, man. Come on. Big up, big up, big up. Big up. Yeah, so Rika, I can't lie, man. You sound hella blockish, hella blockish, but it's cool. It's cool. It's your cousin. You know, it's your cousin. I get it. If it weren't your cousin, for even whatever, man, do the right thing. Do you know what I mean? But I know some of them guys that was keeping up with fuckery, you you like them. Yeah, don't let her lie to you. No, but the thing is, that was the thing, yeah. Throughout all that time, I had a bad. Yeah, yeah the man. Bit. So, whoa, oh, so, whoa, yeah. hold on. What? So, why? What? He was, he was going to yeah. chill at people's yard, and you had man. Yeah, because I, I know obviously you guys, are, nah. you guys have a different view, but listen, I literally, when I, when I was going up there, danger, I had, danger. Yeah, this sounds. Like I voted. Listen, I had to, I had to chill with the man. Like we had our little old group of them. Mad mm-hmm. thing. So chilling with guys with that is not a problem. Red flag, mm. red flag. Yeah, man. Yeah, I got a flag. Flag. <laughs> yeah. It wasn't a problem. Like, literally, we can literally just chill with, like, who advice the guys that we can chill with. And, it's and not your a, man it's not a problem, but you only had... What used to be wrong was you had people like my cousin that mm. didn't know, like, don't know, don't, don't, don't know boundaries. When you're chilling, you're chilling. You don't do all that nasty behaviour. So, wait, Rika. So, did, so no, did your man... Happen. Happen. Did, That's did, why did, there's wait, always wait, a bedroom. So, so, did your man used to know that you... Did your man used to know that you were chilling with his dad? Mud. Yes, he, he used to be with the guy. Lies. He used to be with the guy. Oh, wow. You explain stories. Okay. Proper, like, back Inside like, out. It's, it's, it's my man's brethren. Like, my man's brethren. Yeah. Fucking no, up my cousin. Was, he was, he wasn't. Mm. Like, he knew them. No, my he cousin. Knew cousin. Them. Huh? Fucking up he my knew them. cousin. <laughs> yeah. So he, he my man's friends, which was my cousin. My cousin. Beat my cousin. Yeah. Yeah. It's smart. Yeah, but anyway. 
Everyone had their fun. Yeah, yeah, okay. Nuts were busted. Nuts were busted. You know, it's, it's, no one was harmed. Well, she done her thing. Busy, you might need to turn the camera off. So. That's right. Oh. Then she took you on a excursion to, to pet no, but... Yeah. Yeah, I just felt really scared though. I felt vulnerable. Fever the cop really shit. <laughs> <laughs> In a whole new light, you know. Diabetes. Feeding for chocolate. Mmm! <laughs> 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 oh, poor Ego. <laughs> <laughs> that's mad yeah, that is mad. And that, it's mad how Rika so basically Rika went to Peckham there was a mad thing going on mm. in Peckham Giggs, Giggs is from Peckham mm. Giggs did a song with Diddy mm. Rika's linked to Diddy so Rico, was you at the Miami or the New York man? Man, <laughs> surviving, surviving <laughs> the free cops. Rico was at the free cops. Who did you see? <laughs> <you call him? laughs> some guy, some guy was on top of my cousin. Some what? guy. Does he have? <laughs> you didn't mention he was a, a CEO. Nah. Mad. Uh, nah. Take that. Take that. that. She saw a man in your pool there. You know. Mad like that. <laughs> 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 Our man in your pool was on yesterday. He, he told us. He told us that he said, um, "Did he's a distraction from Israel?" No shit, bro. Uh, well, I don't know about from Israel, uh, but you get me, but no shit. Uh, yeah, from the from the red heifers. Oh, it's, 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 <laughs> yeah, he's not saying, no, no, Man. can't tell the truth. Yet. He wanted, and when he was saying they, I knew he wanted to say Diddy, Rika, and Gig. But. <laughs> <laughs> Mad. You are so good, yeah. Man said Rika, Diddy, you know. What's going on? Rika, <laughs> Man said, nah. man said, did Rika. <laughs> yeah, she, was, she was so close to signing to Bad Boy and you had to fuck it up. Uh, hey. yeah. Rika, come and intervene. And, uh, I, I heard she was in the second season of Making the Band. Making the Band. Making the Band was fucked. Making the Band, man. That was fucked Rika in the new light. That's fucked. Don't join that program. Mm. What do you think I should have done, Rika? I think it's harder to do what you do. No, nah, not really, not really, not really. That, from from one person's perspective, you know, from from the person getting sucked or fucked, then yeah. But obviously, from a family perspective, there's no way that's good advice. And even from a friend perspective or whatever, as a big adult, he's got no shit. You know, if you can save a sister, you can save a sister isn't it? from going through that. But she's just gonna, she's just gonna do it behind your back, you obviously. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. at least she knows she can't do it with you and say, like, yeah, you never... Because now she's a big woman. Mm. You can look her in the face and they'll say, you never promoted her to, like, self-destruct. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Just like yeah, you, I can yeah. look at a certain man and say, yo, I never sold you no drugs or I never... Mm. You know what I mean? Certain man mm. that was desperate to smoke, I never gave you no splits because yeah, yeah. I could see something was up with you. Mm. <clears throat> yeah, no, obviously you, sh you, sh you shouldn't have left your cousin. 100%. But, yeah, I couldn't leave it. Yeah, I couldn't care about it. But you get me? At the same time, like you said, people are going to do what they're going to do. Okay, However, so you, just, you, just, you, just, you just should have told her at that time, listen, stop doing that shit around me because you're making But I used to say it all the time to her. Though, I, I used to say it all the time. I say it. But you know, because I, the, I used to be me, her, and my friend that was my co yeah, and I, what I found that, that particular day is that she set it up. She tried to set up my cousin yeah. to get whatever. And that's, that's when me and her relationship kind of 
like what? separated because what? it was her it was her baby father's even though she didn't have the child at the time, it was her baby father's friend. Yeah. Mm. So she orchestrated this thing for us to meet up. Obviously, she knows I'm, you know, they tried to be pushed back the house. Line a man up in it, yeah. So that's when we kind of stopped. But do you, know what, being do you know why they probably good, good tried friend. to push you out? And, and again, because they, they can probably sense you're not on that. And then it's so in their eyes, you're just going to fuck up what they're trying to get me or what she's got yeah. going on. So that's probably why they were quick to try and ease you out of the house. But however, good family will tell you, I've done. Don't leave that yard about your fucking cousin, you know. You're gonna be. You no, know, because I was in the, it was because I was on the yeah. phone, you know, because I was trying to deal with um um I'll bring our house to your mum's house, so I was trying to deal mm. with that on the phone, mm. and um you trying to deal with demon. So I ah uh, uh? you trying to deal with demon? No, I I'll bring our house to your mum's house. Yeah, yeah, demon. Yeah. Right, but well, you're threatening someone. No, 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 no. It was just like I was just trying to. They were trying to ask me to squash something, so I was trying to sort it out. Why are you always involved in gangsterism, man? Why are you always got gangsters around you and always, that was the same always involved some gangster story? story. What's the other tag life thing, man? It was the same thing I said on the street before. Not, not every day do you roll with the kiddie, then, man. Uh, my yeah. God. Did you ever do anything girly? I <laughs> mean, <laughs> yeah, tell us a girly story about, about when you were shopping in Zara or something like that. Um, no, uh, Morgan. And you went and got a top from Morgan. Tell us about that. Uh, how about now? It's pure gunman story and kick down people, mother in their yard and. Clears it, sis. Brings ours, I'll steal mum's ass and all sorts. But hey, no, I, 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 I want to say, there, there's more pressing, man. Shout easy. out Aero. He says, he says he, know, he knew a girl that used to come from Nani and just to get battery. Used to come from where? Where's Nani. that? I, I don't know. Nani is a, yeah. And he, he also, he also I, 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 said, Aero is so cute. Really? She used to get dropped off by her dad. <laughs> no <laughs> <That's> way! <hell. laughs> Oh, that's yeah, 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 yeah
things live forever, bro. You know what true, I mean? Yeah, true. Just put down, mate. Just check it out. Know I mean? Put down like a dog. Straight mm -hmm. up. One, two, phone call. Oh, yeah, I found my brother in it. Yeah, then you get two twos. me? You get me? Yeah. Something popped up. Because you see, you see, you see, like back in the day, a gal from south could go to north, and a gal from yeah. north could come to south. And nine yeah. times out of ten, she would probably cut through. You get me? Yeah, unless yeah. if she was super bait or it just yeah. something fucked up and two something something messed up and you get me. But other than that, yeah. there was a bag of it, dime a dozen. But now yeah. it's like. Yeah, you that, 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 that. Eating. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you could talk to yeah. a girl on 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 Cold Harbor Lane, and she's from Nuneaton. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No, yeah. but to, to be to be fair, like this, I think it's not even the whole country, almost at least. Like you know, it's the whole around. country. The country's these worse. youngsters are running around. You know, like doing a lot of motorway stuff and a lot of internet stuff. So the country is hundred percent. A hundred percent, hundred times. Remember, worse. Yeah, because you, yeah, you're right, sniper. Country's mm. worse because they all come to the city to get their free country. Yeah, yep. because yep. everyone through, knows they gone through the deals already. Yeah, yeah, remember this uni like thing as well. Like, remember, there's only a certain group of people went to uni like 40 years ago. Now right. everyone can go uni. Yeah, yeah, everyone just going yeah. going Wolverhampton for three years, yeah, going yeah, London yeah. for three years, mm, yeah, going up yeah. north for three years, like acting out. And once they get experience to certain things, it's it's yeah, it's that's what they. You know what I mean? Yeah. If they're taking that shit back to Wolverhampton or wherever the fuck they come from, bro. That's nice true. Is he speaking? Yeah. So I can't hear him. Huh? Is he trying I to speak? Just speak it. Oh. Yeah, I was. Can't hear me. Low. Low. Yeah, it's just low still. Mad low. Nice. Non-existent. Yeah, boy. Mm. Uh, your cousin is terrible. Am I better? Am I better? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I've got one percent anyway. Now, what I'm saying is, when you go country, though, it's like they're so bored and that. It's just sex and drugs, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yes, yeah. yes. Facts. Just sex and drugs, drugs, man. That's all. That's all. Drugs and rock and roll, they say. But. No, they're super bored, man. Sex, mm. drugs, and alcohol. Man. That's all it is. Yeah, yeah that's that's all it is. Molly and. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Rich comes under drugs. <laughs> Rich comes <laughs> under drugs. <laughs> that means. Yeah, no, but it's like it's real mad crystal meth. All sorts of yeah, all of these. Nah, out. nah, 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 nah. Nah, listen. I was just standing outside the train station the other day, and a man was casually doing crystal meth. Casually. I, I, I filmed him. He didn't even flinch. You get me? Yeah. Mama said. I said, "Why meth?" I said, "What is that, bro?" He said, "Yeah, man. It's fucking. It's peanut." Oh my! I said, "What? The fuck? What the fuck is Tina, bro?" I said, "What the fuck is Tina?" He said, "Tina is meth." Yeah, meth. meth. Another name for meth, isn't it? I'm like, no way, cuz. But just out there, me and the me and the shopkeepers, they just he was leaned up against their shop, and they're just watching him like, "Yo, what the fuck are you doing, bro?" Do you know what? Though, yeah. <laughs> I swear that that meth thing is becoming a lot more prevalent, fam. I don't know what's going on, there, but yeah, 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 it's, it's coming, coming like it's starting to become a bit more. Mainstream. Someone messaged, um, someone uh, left a comment and said, "I thought that um, I thought meth was just a gay drug, because apparently it's that in the UK just gays gays do meth." <clears throat> nah, that's not true. It's a it's a it's a um, it's a party drug, isn't it? Yeah, well, there's this. I thought crystal meth was a fucking like, uh, a, I want to say a trailer part drug, but of that kind of ilk. Get me? Yeah, but yeah, it, it is, is though. So it's like, it, it is though. It is. Like but apparently, drug. apparently, gays use it. It's a gay thing. Yeah. No, the, the ammo nitrate is a gay thing. Poppers. That, that, that is a gay thing. They run, they, they run a few stuff still. Yeah, what's that? What's that? <laughs> And then the cocktail. Pause. Oh, what's, what's, yeah, what's yeah. The other one, um, not, not, not B. G? G? So is that G, some liquid thing or something? Yeah, GHB. Yeah. Is that, the one, is it, is is that the one that, that robs you of your memory? Exactly. Yeah. I don't even know. I just know that it's... Yeah. Yeah. Well, I know if it sounds like GBH. Like, come on, man. What we do? <laughs> GBH? Eh? Yeah. <laughs> Get me. Manslaughter. What the fuck is this you lot taking? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you get me? So can they eat in that? No, it's a strong no. amphetamine. Okay. Mm. Yeah, they need to know it, bro. Amphetamine. So that yeah, keeps you, you know, up, innit? You see one time in fucking on, uh, in Selens, White Rose Road, they had some advert of a woman that, that died meth. Like, <laughs> I don't know, oh, like, yeah, two yeah, years yeah, later, yeah. they showed her face again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
I was just like, gotcha. brother. That, 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 yeah. that, 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 Don't you remember the artist with the green eyes? It's a vicious drug. Not artist, you know the actor. Actor, yeah, actor. Yeah, man. The CSI guy. CSI guy. Oh, 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 the CSI guy. Oh, yeah, yeah. The yeah. 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 That shit yeah. ravaged him. Like, yo. Yeah. Yeah. Ravaged him. Old person, quick. And I, I don't know if this woman is taking it, but she's taking Turned him into seal. Turned him into seal, bro. <laughs> Let's no, scab it right. Yeah. And you're never no, gonna survive that's unless <laughs> that's <laughs> solitary <laughs> brother. Yeah, like he had mark, but he did it. Like, that's a that's a pizza face right there. Yeah, yeah. The thing, like, like seal looks like a meth, a healthy method. Yeah, healthy. Like, one that's bounced back. A counsellor, a drug counsellor. No. If, if you've done drugs and <laughs> went gym at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> if you've done mess in the gym, yeah. that's what you look like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come on, look at that self. It looks like a healthy, healthy fiend. Yeah, yeah, healthy fiend. <laughs> Air, it looks like an airbrushed fiend. Photoshopped. <laughs> Photoshopped fiend. Mad thing. Mm -mm, filter. Man's a filter. Fiend with a filter on. Oh, Man. You can see. Oh, where these look good? No, things can see still. All right, I'm right. Big up, Rion, every time, fam. Yes, Rion. Salute. They all look the same. Big up, Rion. Never gonna survive. Oi, I can't understand um, this. Um, what is it? Jabajan. Jabajan? Oh shit! Oh shit! Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I soon <laughs> soon return to press play yeah. on this yeah. sister. Yes, Skunk and Nancy can fuck off, bro. That's what Skin. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Jamaican invasion, yeah. Man, look, looking like some older Michaela. What's the, what's, the, what's the guy's name? Michaela, what? Strachan. Oh no, no, no. no. Is, is that a Who's name? Who? The Skunk and Nancy thing? Nah, yeah, the, the fucking bulls, yeah. the bulls. Skin. I just know her name. Skin. I don't know. Uh, Oh, name is. I swear her name is Michaela something. I can't remember the name. Michaela. I'd rather do her than Grace Phil. Yeah. yeah. Rather, ugh, it's something about the gel and the forwardness. You know, remember? You I'm definitely getting though. strong, unique diamond vibes. Bro. I can't. Oh, no, no, I, I don't know. Like, where are you not getting older. this from? Like, older. How older. are you not getting your that now? Look, look at her now. You, you don't see unique in that, bro. Yeah, that's I weird, you know, because yeah. Sniper said it and I couldn't argue, yeah. but then bro, you said it too. Her, bro. Like, she look, I'm not even joking, all back to the side, I swear to God, I'm mm. being dead serious. The manner she has is elements of scary. unique diamonds. Mm. Yeah. Like, if, if, mm. some, if someone said this is unique auntie or something, I wouldn't, yeah. I wouldn't argue. Man. Unique first place, girl. Unique, first place. Yeah. unique yeah. Zion, you know, I'm not <laughs> <laughs> Zion Unique. <laughs> no, no. Unique MC. Unique no. MC. Man. <laughs> no filter. No. Zionique, Zion. Yeah. Zion. <laughs> Union. What are you talking about Union? <laughs> That's the ultimate fusion by a union. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you you started it. Is that she, <laughs> she looks like she's jelly pills, I can't lie to you. She looks like one of them sort of like she's definitely been yeah. to the to the pie of Yeah, hundred percent. Mm -mm. The hairstyles are just hell. It's mad. See that now I think that comes with, with Maybe moving to East London or something, or being with yeah. East yeah. London gangster, all this stuff. Okay. Like, she looks like she, she could have been in This Is England. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, I know. The yeah, craze. you know about the craze. <laughs> she looks like a lot of people. wear DMs and that. You know what I mean? DMs and that. All sorts. Yeah, it doesn't look like yes. vinyl, though. It looks like a vinyl thing that you can peel off. I know, it's mad, isn't it? You don't want to see what's underneath it. It's probably all grey and that. No. Talk about her, her, her ringtone is doing the Lambeth walk. Oi! Pearly <laughs> <laughs> kings and queens and that mud. Yeah, what in the smiley culture is going yeah, on? Cat Pennant was my cousin. <laughs> <laughs> Cockney slang. Like. <sighs> and her knuckles, her knuckles, she definitely was a fighter. I can't lie. I saw her knuckles and I said, oh, shit. 
and stuff still. That's the reason that's the reason they deserve a bunch of days to be able to do that. Yeah. Yeah, man. That was his wife feeling. Not you want some. Hmm. Right. You're never gonna survive. All right, so oh, get a little lacquer. Oh, crazy. No, it's proper jet black and it's proper like I don't even know. The science of it is mad. I just I don't know what she's trying to achieve. Is it, is it a hairstyle yeah. or is it a treatment? <laughs> <laughs> no, it looks like something that the woman's gonna come with the white coat and then just take it off in a bit. Yeah, it's like a it's like a yeah, a like, brand new skull underneath. Like. You know, what a healing plaster or something. I'm kind of here. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, man. <laughs> Japanese <laughs> healing plaster. Chinese yeah, healing that's, that's, plaster. I just think this woman, the white white gloves, the white coat, she's going to come back, peel it back and say, yeah, your treatment's done. Spray it with a couple serums and then... I'm getting I'm getting barber spray on vibes. I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. I don't Jermaine, know. Yeah. Jermaine Jackson. Jermaine Jackson, man. Well, it's you know not it. barber, it's hairdresser or something. Because like, that shit's mm. relaxed. But you can do that at home. So that's what I'm saying, like, you know, nah, man. Women have become expert you got, in you got, I am pressed, bro. I am pressed. Like, this yeah. is that fucking, um, uh, that white babaloo by my wham bam boom type <laughs> fucking. <laughs> 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 what is this? Give me the tuna through there. It's them times as well. No, but then, if it was them times, it'd be the more boom, high. Boom, boom. If there was, it would be more high if it was all that. You get yeah. me? They would have height and, and 3D element. This is flat. This is flat completely. Yeah, yeah. This is, this is it's like twenty. It's like a wave. Do you yeah, know what I mean? man. This is, this is June, it's like a wave, and then at the end, it just goes completely. Oh, well, like, it's, it's Terminator. Know. It's all of that. It's looking like a cul-de-sac. Uh, I don't know. Uh, no, Max no, trying to say it's like a mud Max, flood. Max trying to say it looks dystopian and that. Max <laughs> <laughs> dystopian. <laughs> yeah. Max from the year twenty seventy four. Looking like a day gas <laughs> in it. You're yeah. fucking. Demolition man business. Thank you, yeah. demolition man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah, yeah, I, I can kind of get, get that. Vibe melted this, melted right. clock. Melted clock business. Yeah. That's it. Hey, what's That's that it. film called? Um, <laughs> what's that film called with the, with the cyborgs and that in it? With um, I Am Legend. Nah, 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 nah. nah. Blade Runner. Blade, Blade Runner uh, business. Blade Runner. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, cool cat. Man said Nat King Cockney. <laughs> <laughs> There's an element of that. Stay oh, off. Oh, fool. Nice <laughs> this is England 2095. Yeah. yeah. I'm hard with him. Yeah. Uh, um, se uh, 17. I had Who? Jensen, son. What? And um, he was a bit of a handy. Like, he was bully. He was a bully. Roland was. He was like, a man, wasn't he? Mm. And I was a child, <laughs> but obviously I didn't feel like I was a child, did I? But what was what did he do for a living? He was a drug dealer, <laughs> thief. That's what he done. He didn't have a job. And mm. what were you doing at the West End? What work were you doing? I worked in a souvenir shop. Oh, so you, so you... yeah, I was work. Well, I had to pop. I found a job in the standard in the standard paper. That's when you could just look in the paper, find a job, yeah. ring them up. CFX Jewels, I worked for, yeah. It, was, um, it wasn't a jewelry shop, it was a souvenir shop, like I said, on Oxford Street. And how did you meet Jensen's dad? So I used to go to this thing called the Simba, Simba Project, like a black people's community thing in Woolwich, mm. and I met him up there. I used to go and really? just hang around up there. Yeah, just yeah. loaf and have a, have a joint, whatever. So you just be able to smoke in there and all that. And how long were you two together for? <sighs> Till I met Dave. <laughs> so you met Dave when you was 19. Four years of mm, big yeah. old stint of your life, innit? Yeah. And how did that all come to an end? Because I had another, I had another child, um, Drew, and she was four months old. And I wasn't with Roland then. I wasn't living with him. He'd never, I never lived with him. But we were still seeing each other, and he was still in my life, still trying to threaten me and shit like that. And um, me and my sister, we used to MC, we used to rap. Like I was mm -hmm. called Jenny Bean. I no. still am called Jenny Bean because I DJ as well. And she was called Sugar Baby, but together we were right. called the um, Courtney Twins, yeah? Well, That's just after we got to know Dave, this is. But we'd, um, we went to, we were just called Jenny Bean and Sugar Baby. We used to rap. Yeah. And we got hired to um, rap at Dave, to do a thing at Dave's club called the Fitness Centre. Right. So we'd gone there and um, we'd do it like MCing on the mic. Welcome to and um, I went to the cloakroom to have a look at my He's just standing at the bar. Right. 
with the steps on on a cowboy hat, blue eyes, I was like, and he was smoking a joint. And I tried to skin up before that, and I thought, oh, I couldn't because it was too hot in there. And I see him smoking this joint, and I went, I didn't know he, he ran the place. I didn't know, you know, I mean, I wasn't going to send nothing to him. <laughs> he said, I went, how did, how did you manage to do that? I said, I've been trying to skin up for ages, I said. And he went, he didn't say nothing to me, he just went and gave it to me. So I put my coat away and I was smoking this joint. I went to give it back and he went, no, I have it. He was standing there dancing and he just went to me. Tap me, he goes, I don't know if you're married or if you've got a boyfriend or anything like that. He goes, but I'm going to marry you. And I went, what? <laughs> I goes, what? And he went, I'm going to marry you. And I went, Okay. Well, if the truth be known, I've already had you three times already <laughs> from when you was at the bar, you know what I mean? Like, Boy, in my head, like, it was so sick. Like, his eyes was like, Pwah! like, blue, like, you know, those mm. eyes are... I don't, yeah. And I was like, I've already had you, like, I've already had you three Pause. times since I've seen you at the bar. You're talking about, it, like, he said, I'm gonna, he goes, no, I don't just mean as a shag. He goes, I mean, I'm going to marry you. Mm. I'm going to have kids with you. And I was like, all right, <laughs> okay. And we just danced that night. He dropped me home, and no, no, was, uh, on the way home, we, sat, we um, sat on Academy Road in Woolwich in his car, just chatting, and then he dropped me home. And then about three weeks later, I just saw this thing on the telly, like um, Wimps to Warriors, it was called, yeah, documentary. And I saw this bloke on there, and I thought, God, I recognise that ring, and like, them eyes, hold on, is that him? And it was Dave, like, he was doing deck collecting, I thought... I'm sure that's that blow. But I didn't say, I didn't think nothing of it. And I just like, I just moved into a flat as well at the time. And um, Roland in my life, and he just fucking took all my fucking things out of my house, like bullying me, threw paint all over my stuff, Roland had, chucked all my things, like, like ripped up all my furniture. And I was waiting for beds to be, um, be delivered to my flat. <laughs> and um, I was at college at the time. So my sister Sam was there waiting for these beds to be delivered and Dave must have passed by and put this note in the door with his number, like, give me a ring. And she, she, my sister gave me this thing and I rung it, rung, his, rung the number and it was Dave. And um, we, just, and he, we just started seeing each other ever since then. Like, we just, like, he went to me about Roland. He went, have you got anyone in your life? And I went, yeah, he's a bit of a fucking bully. And he went, if I could make him go away, would you like me to? And I went... Yeah, I'd like you to, but don't kill him. Like, I don't want you to do that. And he goes, no, no, I mean, I'll make him stop fucking putting his... Like, I'll make him go away. He goes, like, would you like me to do that? I was like, please. And so he did. <laughs> like, I had a chat with him, you know, one of those. Did he meet Did he meet him personally? Yeah, I had a word with him. Yeah, he met him personally, like, you know. How did it go, how did it go yeah, down? Yeah, don't put your hands on her anymore. You fucking, if you see her, you smile. Or you, if you can't smile, just stay the fuck away from her. Mm. You know what I mean? I'll be raising the children, you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> I'm saying you can't see them, but I'm here mm. with her. We're together. That's it. Done. He, he hit the rocks that gave in the end. Yeah. Man say, I'll, I'll be raising the children life. so you can't Still. see them. So he just took them. He just yeah. took it's, everything. He just, just took just a man's life. His life man. I don't know. Just... Control yeah. X, control mm. V in your yeah. own life. Yeah, mm. so I'm bringing up your youths. You're a waste man. Innit? Yeah, 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 yeah. I've got this. I've got this full back in it. Yeah. But hold on, she said he's under rocks. Does he mean like by Crack. sea or or the, the substance? <laughs> by sea <substance>. or <laughs> the substance? Bro. The substance. <laughs> yeah. He's moved to Dover. Yeah, he was man stranded and and yeah. that. Or he's on the white yeah. cliffs, mate. He's on the white cliffs. On that chunk. On that chunk. <laughs> hey, rubble. You've never dabbled up. You've never dabbled. <laughs> limestone, dabbled limestone up? business in my deal with now. <laughs> hey, listen. Anyone that said um, 2002 R9 Ronaldo, yeah, give yourself 10 points as well. Yeah? <laughs> bad, bad, bad. <laughs> to do with that, just like he was just, he was always a druggy anyway. He was destined to, and he was a bit mm. not well anyway, yeah. Mm. Do you still speak to him? Yeah, baby. Well, if I see him, I'll, I'll talk to him. But like, yeah, I don't. So, I don't seek him out. No, no. So you're not friends. No, we're not friends. No, 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 no. We're not friends. So you, mm. so you and Dave, pretty much love at first sight, wasn't it? Absolutely, like. Mm. like but it, like I say, I, I always say he raised my children, but he didn't just raise them; he raised me as well. So I remember oh, the first day I swear I was like to him, oh, I, mean, I just, I was just so in love with him. I was like, I don't ever want to fall out with him. I don't want to have an argument with him. I just went to him. I swear, I was went. And I was young. I just went. 
I said, oh, just, I'm going to be plasticine for you, yeah? Like, just mould me into whatever you want me to be, whatever you want me to be. Just mould me into that, yes. and I'll That's be nice. that. And you know what I mean? And everything will be, be great. And then I want to cry. <laughs> and um, and we had it, honestly, it was, it was like, he did it. Like, if they went to me, walk, keep walking, off the end of that, I'd fucking walk, you know what I mean? Because that, that I just... He never ever put me wrong, you know what I mean? He was just, it, it was always good for me, always good for me and my kids. Just. The way, the way the media portrayed Dave. I know. Com compared to what Dave was really like. Yeah. What's the, I mean, night and day. So, and that night and day, like, I could, like, they would never say about the nice things that he's done, you know what I mean? It's always like the whole nasty things, like. Or... How safe did Dave make you feel? More than safe, like. Hold on uh, a minute, you see this Dave guy? Mm. Is it Dave from Woolwich? Dave Courtney? Yeah. I don't know where he's from, bro. But is that who she's on about, Dave Courtney? Yeah. 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 I see. Okay. Suicide, it? Suppose it. Well, see, you yeah, got to yeah, watch yeah. what you say now, yeah? You've got to watch what you say. It's in the manner. <laughs> <laughs> No, it's true. He's local. He's up. No, he's dead. He's dead. It's fine. No, it's fine. No, she's fine. She's local. She's from Woolwich. You get me? She's from Woolwich, bro. No, that means. Yeah, I was getting bad. the impression because you kept mentioning it still. Yeah, yeah. She's from Woolwich. No, she's from yeah, you know, it, it, it sounds like she was um, a bit broken and vulnerable when my man uh, yeah. met her and. Yeah. She, he, she he's um, then gangster, yeah, he, he, he probably made her feel a, a little level of security and reassurance, she probably hadn't felt, and and mm -hmm. she felt that she had to return that favor by, like, like she said, making yeah, herself make, making herself moldable. You get me, proper, yeah, proper yeah, woman, yeah. Yeah. proper woman, but it's a waste. You went with Dave, mm -hmm. yeah. why was it a waste? You went with Dave, yeah, I'm gonna say, huh. You know, like some sisters, you would say it's not a waste. You know, what I mean, you can have her, but yeah, this uh, that seems like a bit of a waste, man. You know, what I mean, she could have done that for a brother, man, and you know, it would have been nice if he was the right person to come along. I don't know, you know, what I mean, it's just like, it? so yeah, it's a loss, but we'll take well, it. You need to chat to Ronaldo about that. <laughs> Ronald or whatever his name was, he was dash. If he, if yeah, he was a brother, he he up, he was right, Ronald, uh, Ronald. Roland, 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 Roland. <laughs> that's a Ronaldo, you know. That's yeah. a <laughs> <laughs> hey, you all remember when he had the little, fried, the little fried trick about that this year. Yeah, I thought he was looking about the trim, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah I was still <laughs> no, because you mentioned Ronaldo before, and it just, yeah, I forgot the other game, but yeah, mm -hmm. Roland, didn't it? Chat to Roland. Mm. He seemed to start Mentally. his journey. Yeah, she he caught her, he caught her uh, in, in a vulnerable situation. Yeah, mm -hmm. and oh, and, yeah, and as well, she she was nineteen, what nineteen twenty at this time, still yeah. young, isn't it? A young and pregnant, or she 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 was with child. So yeah, yeah still young. young. Yeah. It's a madness. It's quite predatory when you think about it. Mm. Yeah, no, it is. Yeah, it's, it's, it's it's woman, grooming. It's grooming. Definitely Big grooming. Yeah, yeah, just smoke it, man. I've had it a few times. Do you better, you got to come and explain this, man. What was Dave dealing with, man? Huh? Another Dave and some neat stuff. Mm -hmm. How old was big he? Up, hmm? Big up, Jed. Big up, Jeds. Big, big, big up, 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 How old was he? I don't even know, man. He must Listen, man. Hey, hey, wait, wait. wait. Right, wait. Man. We can't be calling a man. Wait. We can't be calling a man that, that moves to a 19 year old girl a predator, man. I'm not having it. Why is it no, predator? Groomer. It's grooming. I said grooming. Oh. I didn't say predator. I don't know grooming how? Predator. Huh? To mold he her in the, club. the way he wants her. That's what she said. But she's she 19. Allowed for the grooming. No, she's she 19. Allowed. It's not like. No, no, no. Wait. No, no. 19. That... No. That's no. Come on, bro. 19. In them days as well. Yeah, he can change her. Yeah, he can change No, no, no. What I'm saying is. 19 back in them days, yeah. Yeah, you meet a 19 year old, don't matter how old you are, that ain't that ain't grooming, like make that like... no, not not meeting her, no, 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 or interacting with her. No. I, we, we saying, keep saying the, them the, days. at the point where she said, Yeah, I will be anything you want me to be. So, if yeah. you told me to go forward and think, I'm saying that's grooming, yeah, no, nah, that's not grooming. grooming, that's not grooming, that's training. 
That's okay, development. Training. All right, cool. Yeah, grooming is a bad word, man. That's development. No, I don't think so. I don't think it's that bad. No, it is a bad word. No, no, grooming is a bad word. For, for an older guy with a younger girl, now. hold on. For an older guy with a younger girl, grooming comes with too much connotations, brother. Come no, on. No, we don't even know about the age. I just saying, I know he was old. Yeah, before we start saying all this, yeah, I think, I think we need to find out how old yeah, Dave was and, and yeah, yeah. could have been 21. Yeah. could have been 21, but it's still. You know how the man they stay. They're the man who do it the most. Yeah, whether it's good or bad, they still do it. It's like, yeah, it's not that bad to say that he groomed her. You know what I mean? Because that's what it's going to lead to after giving your all and saying, "Listen, I will do anything that you say." It can't be just training. That's grooming, man. But it's not that bad to say it's grooming. I feel. You know what I mean? It's not that other way. Like, yeah, ladies, ladies. Um, I think, I think he could have taken advantage in some way, but I won't say it's grooming. Kind of along the lines of what Zadini was saying, she, she was um, vulnerable, and and whether or not he meant it for good or, well, in her right. case, good. Good, yeah. Good he grooming. saw someone vulnerable, <laughs> and he felt like he could help her. Mm -hmm. And in other ways, he was still getting something out of it, obviously. If he That's slightly it. predatory, because... Yeah. yeah, I'm yeah, not saying it's not. I'm not saying it's not. I'm just saying that I won't call it grooming, because she is of age... Where she yeah, can but that's what decision. your interpretation of grooming might be slightly different to mine. So hold on, wait, 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 wait. So wait, wait, wait. So if she was eighteen months younger and this exact same situation happened, you would call it mm -hmm. grooming, then Shiva. Um, you see what I'm trying to say? It gets a mm -hmm. bit technical. I hear it, but I don't know. Um, these gangsters. Yeah, he, 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 he took advantage. I'm not taking mm, that away from it. I mm. just can't. Because right, right. imagine... so, if someone's asking you yeah. to essentially mold them or whatever, yeah. Yeah. and in your head you think you're doing something right for that person, yes. yeah, you're not really seeing it as grooming, are you? But, you're just seeing but, it as but, raw. But, but, I like but, this. Hold on. hold on, hold on. You're just seeing but, it as raw. I like this woman. Yeah, she may be a bit younger than me. She's had a hard yes. life. Yeah, I've got more wisdom. I can guide her a little bit. I'm going to yeah. mold her. Into the woman, well, I she was. said that, but she, that was out of her mouth, though. Her mouth. You yeah, can't, yeah, you can't I, put I, that I, on. I, I, what I, I'm wait, saying wait. is that you can't put that on him. If I she's come you. to him at 19 and said, Oh, listen, I need you to mold me, like mold me into anything you want me to be for you, then that's out of her. Obviously, him doing it now is, yeah. So, Chevelle, okay. can, can I, can so, I, can I, so can I, wait, so, so. So if, if if a woman that may or may not had uh, been through certain hardships in her previous relationship asks the next man to mould her, you don't think that there could be some yeah. issues in why she's even saying that to man in the first place? Yeah, that's. I'm not saying she's not vulnerable. She's vulnerable enough to be saying that anyway. So I'm not. I'm not denying that she's not. What does that, what does that mean? That's just how she is now. You look, you look crack me up because it's like. We're just in the era where where women got no accountability, no responsibility. No, no you're one's saying 19. that. You're fucking no 19 in 1986 or yeah. some shit. Bro, get me? Listen, right. listen, that's, listen, that's, listen, a, that's a big deal, you know. That's no one's one saying that, cuz. No one's saying yeah, that. What, man's saying woman, it, what man is saying is that yeah. how she explained it herself, how she yes. was, where she came from, her mind state, yeah. everything she had yeah. been through in the previous three, four years to when my man had met her and how the situation panned out. Many, I'm, I'm not saying it's 100% agreement. I'm saying it's, there's predatory aspects to how my man went about it, innit? People can wait, argue that. Much. Wait, wait, no, because he had to have, he had to have planned this out. And sought her out and seen her and been running her down. She was onto him. And he and the only thing he, he asked was you, have you got a man? She's like, Yeah, I've got this brother and he's on bullshit. She's like, Do you want me to make him go away? Where's the predator? Where's, where, where's the predator in? Let me tell you what the predator is. She never gave him her address and he came and posted his phone number. <laughs> he's a gangster. You don't take liberties. You know, he found out where she is. He's taking liberties. He left to know. He left to know and said, call me. Yeah. No. no, but that was in their yard, though. How is he getting in, 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 in their yard? We're in their yard. We're in their yard. It was at a workplace, No, it wasn't. It was at a yard, Jen. 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 It was at a yard, Jen.
He jumped it through the mailbox. He jumped the, um, the number yeah. through the mailbox. Hold on. No, no. That's the, that's the equivalent of finding her on Insta or Facebook. No. No, oh, no, 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 this is 1997. You know what he's doing, bro? He waited a certain amount. You know, some dad do that. Some dad will make you think that it was you that seek them out, you know, but they have been plotting you from time. (laughs) (laughs) He saw Skunk and and said, yes, this is me. Great violin chick. I'm okay for mine. You get me? All right, cool. No problem. (laughs) Dave Dave said, listen, yeah, I ain't going to lie. Fancy a bit of that dark stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah, Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Fucking, I'm sick and tired of fit sizing over. Can we go? Can we go? Hold on. Can we go to his employer now? Yeah. Which were the the, the crazy? Don't do it. Don't do that, man. <laughs> and then hold on. Wait, 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 wait. One of them, one of them, <laughs> ruined his chick so much here that she committed suicide. Yeah, 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 yeah. So I'm saying this is a habit amongst these men. Mm. Yeah, this is very mm. standard. Yeah. She's all mine. No one can have her. If I can't Ever have her, again. it's not only yeah. Asian. Man. <laughs> yeah, I've got, Sorry, I've got Asian something man, that you lot ain't got. I've got a black yeah. one. Yeah, yeah. Like, you know what I mean. Like, yeah, oh, and he's gonna man. clear up all the problems around her. Grips up the baby father. You know what I mean? Bad him up so he don't come back. You know who I am, in it. You know I could just bury you in cement. Right, yeah, it's all it true. You know what I mean? I'm taking a jacket. Yeah, what do you call you? Would you guys call it a jacket? Yeah, I'm mm-hmm. fucking wearing it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can't. Yeah. You so fucking can't. Fuck it, you can. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see your face around this manner again, cunt. Right. Uh, you know what yeah. I Vicious. Fucking vicious when he said. Cunt, yeah. cunt. Like, oh. <laughs> wait, wait, relax, man. With no, the words, but you got to do it how they do it, Chevelle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, yeah, I think yeah. you've achieved it. You don't need you to continue. Oh, no, 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 no,
Cool. And can we please find out how old she's Dave rapper, was bro. at this time? Please? She's a rapper. Oh, yeah, yeah. She's, she's, she's yeah? a rapper. You know what she was on? And you remember, you need to remember that she does lie about her age. So she could have been younger than 19, to be fair. You know she's not running. Ooh. No, don't you look nothing. Like don't you look nothing. Yeah. Ooh. Crazy. Speak on it, Rico. Speak on it. You look, you look just waiting for MA to jump on and then it's a rap. Love it, man. I'll pick up MA. No, MA was fully. I think he's fully kicked for it. I know, I know. Yeah, you're not trying to shack around. Talking about getting around. a number and all that. You wouldn't mind and all of them type of stuff. Yeah. <laughs> I'll give her, I'll give her a session. Man was playing. So you don't want to see Dave with 10 E for. Allow it, man. Dave, allow it, man. Dave's out here playing Escape Slave in the market. That's what Dave's playing, bro. Yeah. But you know what? Yeah. She is just a bitch. How did I end up backstage? I don't know. Mm-hmm. I she's giving me a t- she's giving me cracker vibes that she takes she mm. takes drugs. The way about is no, she looks she looks like she's done a fair bit of cat in her life. I can't lie to 100%. you. But... Yeah. yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like she ain't yeah. double. She's talking about baby farmers on crack. She definitely she looked like she was on the razor seat. Man, she was definitely on the razor seat. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. What? Okay, <laughs> Say nothing, man. Say nothing. Remember, leave. leave Chef, that love is heavy. Matthew, you know what I mean? Just because you went on a world trip with Matthew, nah. it means nothing, man. Matthew, Matthew. We leave that alone. Matthew. Matthew's skin, Matthew skin fade business. No, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. <laughs> 0.5 on the sides. Yeah, yeah, uh, oh. nah, it looks like a piece of tarmac to me. Just Great like hot, you know. it's a slab hot, of tarmac. You know. I I reckon I reckon it smells it smells like Timothy and 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 fucking Marlboro. what's Timothy? What's Timothy? <laughs> Mar- 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 <laughs> Camel shit. Yeah. What's Timothy? She said, "What's Timothy?" You know, my uh, uh, is that? Uh, <laughs> no, he said it smells like Rothmans and Grabber. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> flying fish. Me, yeah. <laughs> hey, nothing. No, this is how safe used to make me feel. I'll be driving along, I haven't been having a license for my. I didn't. They told me to drive in a week. Got me a car. I was driving around. Grooming. If I was in traffic, I'd go away. <laughs> 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 Hello, 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 yeah, he was on some, he was on some, you're up, babe. He was on some, he was on some, you're up, babe. Let me upgrade you. Let me, yeah. let me upgrade you, babe. He was upgrading you. driving a week. Nah, that's grooming, man. Yeah, upgrade you there. I'll, no. I'll, Get away, driver. I'll tell you what. Play, I'm yeah. upgrading you there. You know what I mean? You're at, she's driving around. I said getaway driver, get you know. Driver. I'm uh, done. He, he, was, he was his little token. He was his girlfriend. Come on, fam. He loved her. He loved her. He loved her. She was his little yeah. token, man. Yeah. He loved that, man. He loved oh, that. He loved she's, going to, she's going to he learn things. Her, Hold on. She's going to yeah, learn things that no comment. You, you know what? You black fellas could learn how to treat a black woman. Yeah, I think Com- that's what you're angry about. Because you don't know how to treat a black woman, and this one's managed to get away. Of course. Safe by a shining white knight. You know what's better? I hate you, bro. I hate you. The truth is, the truth is, hold on. Snap let him speak. Hold on, hold on. The truth is, none of you lot want her, but you don't want her to be happy with Dave. You no, no, but you're doing, yeah, we're giving too much away. We're going to get into oh, that. Sorry, sorry. Big up, V. Yeah, okay. The football yeah. wasn't that great. Wasn't that great? Yeah. You don't give me jokes, man. Average and Nancy. 
<laughs> she looks like she used to set up black people back in the day. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> no, can I take liberties, you girl? Like, yeah, go on then. <laughs> I just got taking liberties. Like, that's how safety made me feel like that. Yeah. Oh, like, safe. Like, I could really? do what I wanted. So, although you said to him, mold me, mold me he didn't, a, he didn't yeah. control you. He didn't control me. No, no, no. Supported you. Mm-hmm. He supported me. Baby, it's because I'm a landerer. <laughs> That's how you groom. Yes, lady. Yeah, smooth people. grooming. Like right. Jenny's fifty-one percent of me. You know what I mean, like, mm. like. But I, like, I think we were both a force to be reckoned with. Just the two of us together, we were both like a hundred percent. You know, the first year of Thanks most grooming. relationships, they're explosive. The honey is an extended honeymoon period, and everything's mm. just like being mm. in a film. How did your life change from not being with Dave to all of a sudden being with Dave Courtney? Oh, it was a massive change like because mm. like it was just it just been on that thing with um james wells and james Wells tried to like this him on on screen like he went on an, he to, to do an interview with james well because dave had a fight in um the thomas a beckett on old kent road with some bloke a straight and and he got his nose bitten off right dave did and um james well had him on his show that day like remember james well yeah so he had him on his show and he was like wooing him all day, going like, yeah, we're gonna be there, he's gonna be nice to him. And he goes, when he got him on fucking set, like sat him down, and he went, like, right, he goes, um, in your quest for fame, he goes, like, like, you think like no, look at the state of your nose now. He goes, Do you think it was all like worth it? And Dave was like, You take it all crap. He went, mm. he went, listen, mate, he goes, you've got nothing fucking nice to say to me. I'll fucking leave you. He goes, I don't fucking think you're going to mug me off like that. He goes, I don't give a fuck about all them money in the main. He goes, I'll come over there and smash, smack you right in the fucking mouth. He goes, and James is looking at him. He goes, have you got anything else to say? And he goes, no. He goes, well, I'll fucking leave then. He just got up and left. Lined him up for a hatchet job. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's what he's done. Yeah, he's done that to him. And um, so then, so Dave wasn't actually in the media. Like, like when I first met him, like, I'd seen him on the TV, but he, was, he, he wasn't actually in the media and as known as he was, like as he became. So you was part of the whole journey. All of it. Well, I don't remember, and I said this to Dave, I said, yeah. I can't remember yeah. you or even even think about you without Jenny. Yeah. So how old were you? I was I 19 when I met Dave. You were 19 and he was... 29. 29. He's 10 years older than me. That's a minor. He's in the clear. No, it's not. No, it's no, not. I'm sorry. No, no, 20, no 29 year old should be looking for someone under that under 20. Yeah, no, that, yeah. Yeah. Well, he was under 24. One second, says who? Says who? Says who? Says who? Says I'm moral code, bruv. What moral code? 10 years difference. You think there's some moral code? Listen, when what? I was 19, if there was any type of man that would come up to me and he's not around my age range, I don't want to know. It, it, it made me feel <laughs> disgusting. Right. So I don't know. How did, how did that work out for you? Because this woman got her driving lessons, her family. Her whole life. Funny. <laughs> <You're hilarious. laughs> me. No, I'm saying. No, but she, she ended up with a man that was about his business and wanted her, and claimed her, and was there for her until he died. So I'm not really sure what we're going on. I'm being deadly serious now. You're 29. You're 29, and the woman 19, and you're like, that's that's a minor. Love that. Well, they do life. say the average age of seven years a groomer is 26. Oh, well, yeah, European youth, yeah, 26. So, you know, it's, it's I don't, that's I, what I'm saying. I feel like you're not saying it's like, bad what? grooming. No, I'm not saying it's bad grooming. I'm just saying it's grooming, though. You know what I mean? You have to groom so, someone so. like that who is not in that world or lifestyle into your world and lifestyle. That's facts. Yeah, it's gonna, um, it's gonna be, it's gonna be. Yeah, you, you, you see the way you're, tra- you're trying to make this this guy to seem like some sort of hero, brother. Just no, let no, me finish. No, no. just, just let me finish before you say anything. This is a man that also had an argument with with his stepson over mortgage payments, and next thing you know, the youth was dead. So shot through the left eye. So I'm not saying you get me it's anything to do with Dave or nothing, but <laughs> this guy has also been accused of killing his own stepson, bro. So mm, yeah, I, know what I mean, no, what no, no. You know, wait, wait. You got a movie like News of the World. Hold He's on. been convicted. Hold on, man. Hold on. You want to bring up, bring up his previous convictions because what? It's not a conviction. I said, the youth Whoa! uncle. Listen, listen, bruv. Listen before you start. Just listen. The youth's uncle or step uncle, which was a, uh, related to Dave Courtney, is the person who shot my, my woman's son, killed my woman's son. Yeah? 
He, he, the, you had an argument with Dave Courtney about mortgage payments for a yard, and a couple hours later, a couple of days later, he was dead, bro. I'm not saying it was Dave Courtney, because, like I just said, yeah, but I'm saying it's just convenient, isn't it? Mm-hmm. I don't get what that's got to do. The thing is, I think, because yeah, lot, bro, in the lot, bro, what does that mean? That's the world she's going into. That's the world she's yeah, groomed like, into. The, the same guy that's supposed to have saved her, bro, is also probably like, do you know what I mean? Caused her some turmoil later down the line, bro. So, oh. uh, yeah, you, you, you're done great when she was 19, cuz, but you also may have been linked to the death of her son, your stepson. Right. So, right. Like, what are we doing? And all the other stuff, because she's not, she's not going to tell you about the grim stuff that went in the house. He busts oh, her. Oh, he's such a good like, guy. He, 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 he would have a fly. He loves everyone. Like, shut up, man. Yeah. Yeah, we know what Dave Courtney was about, bro. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, let alone the but snitching. It, but I don't, I don't think the age is wrong. I don't think the age is that much of a bad thing because I, I think people have there's bigger age gaps. No, no, it's not that, but that is definitely a contender for grooming. You know what I mean? A vulnerable okay. 19 year old, you know what I mean? She's smart and not so smart. I, you know, she's had a kid already, she's had she's got another one on the way, or just had another one. Are we not, are we not gonna try and so, act like yeah. this guy wasn't she's racist? Not gonna make out like she's innocent or not. No, yeah, I'm saying she's innocent or anything like that, but again, to be her lifestyle compared to his lifestyle is two completely different things. Two different and for her to survive in that environment, yeah, it's going to be a lot of you're staying in the house or you walk in front, yeah, or all of that. You type hold this, yeah. Yeah. yeah, and she's confessed to it. So you know what I mean? It was a it was a grooming session, man. Right? You know what I mean? For her to be. I would not gonna act like he didn't now. call her a black bastard. He must have called her a black <laughs> bastard. <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I can you prove that? Can you prove that? <laughs> yeah. He did, he definitely did. I'm not doing that, I'm not doing that, I'm not saying that. I'm not involved. <laughs> you black uh, whore. I, even, uh, I, I shouldn't even lie. He called her all the, he all the black stuff. <laughs> you get me? Maybe a black Oi, Sambo, where's my dinner? He called her effing monkey. You poor effing monkey. I picked you up from fucking nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I think I've, your fam, he went in oh, yeah, when he touched down. I've won, I've won. I've won. Go you like making up stories? I've won. Go on. Go on. Go on. I'm not even involved. I'm just saying he was grooming. Go on. I'm just saying he was grooming. But the other stories sound good as well. I can't lie. You get what you don't know is what is what you don't know is he had that time when she was calling herself a nigger and she was like he was like don't don't you ever let me hear you call me a nigger. Yeah. Oh, I love you. Listen, I love you too much. No, wait, wait, wait. You don't understand. The time, wait, wait. The time when he grabbed her and I mm. put the flannel down her face and took the foundation off and said, You love your brown skin. Do you understand? You are a Nubian Empress, right? Right? He taught her, you don't know about the black history lessons he taught her, but yeah, you don't you don't stay. Get me, he taught her. I yeah? definitely believe he taught her a lesson or two. I didn't know, but like I'm, I'm not gonna lie, yeah. I didn't know anything about Africa before Dave. Dave taught me about Africa. Yeah, right, yeah. He taught he taught her how to fuck. Know, he, he let me know. Like he, roots he let, and all know, he let me know. I, I was I was a maroon from Jamaica. Hey, yeah, hey, 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 Dave had a piece of cotton in, a, in an allotment in Greenwich, bro. Don't listen to what I'm saying, bro. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 My, my first mechanic. my first Kinte cloth, mm. my first rapper. Dave <laughs> got it for me. <laughs> hey, Dave had a friend. Dave, Dave had a mate called Tunde. A lot of people don't know this. He had a mate called Tunde. And every time he'd go to Nigeria, David would make him bring me back stuff, clothes, wear it around, wear it around the house. I never used to like it, but I started to after a while. Mm. No, yeah. no, we're not interested. I ain't hearing that. I ain't hearing he none called, of that. He called me his, his lovely brown girl. Can anyone you know confirm that Dave did or did not say this to her? <laughs> That's all I want to know. No That's all one. I want to know, because... No <laughs> How does that work with the suicide pack? Kemo said, Kemo said he was the animal in her life. You don't think he's a piss. <laughs> think he's a piss. I'm not white. I'm not white. Gotham <laughs> City Crypto. Look at Gotham Crypto. Um, Gotham City Crypto says, my dad was 30, my mum was 19. No problem. Like, get me. I would say 29, 19, it ain't that. It, nah, I'm not going to. What's wrong with you lot? It's only because it's nowadays these 19 year olds are so fucking stupid, you lot forgot. Night like 19 year olds was ruling she countries to learn like this, man. Uh, how to, to be make fair, English like, breakfast. I don't think I would want to learn how to make an English breakfast properly. To be yeah, fair, at 19, I don't eggs, think I would have wanted chips. to do a 30 year old. That, that is a bit of it is, that is a big it is a big gap. Listen, I don't think I would have wanted to do it. It's who's who's but it's doing not it. bad. 
a yeah, it's true. Year old white gangster, yeah, and a ninety-year-old black chick, yeah, poor black yeah, girl that's got ten and siblings. Saying, and I'm saying they've been around together for a long time. To me, that's grooming. He groomed her. He, he definitely uh, changed. You can't the groom that in your own, man. You like what are you doing? Yeah, I was saying it, bro. You can't grow yeah, you're, you're not in your adult. Yeah, okay. You're getting groomed, bro. You can still get groomed, though. So, so, oh, wait, wait, wait. So, no, nah, do, do you know what it is? Yeah, I kind of do both. Of you. So, 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 wait, wait, wait. So, so, it's the words not grooming. What is it? Co- coercion? Like, like, what, like, what do we change the words for? Like, he said training. He said training. Because, yeah, because, 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 about them talking about seventeen year olds getting groomed, I'm like, nah, we gotta, we gotta fix up. We gotta start um, letting our children, uh, you know, have that responsibility and understanding. The age of understanding is is um, seven. When we're now at seventeen and we're still treating seventeen year olds as pitney, and that's why society's fuck up because you, you're not getting that kind of luxury. Um, no, but to home. be fair though, Jack, yeah, I mean, some of them girls were getting groomed in their twenties in the Tommy. No, and, 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 and I reckon that was some. And I and I said each time when they mentioned twenty one year olds and that mm. we skip forward. I want to try to hear about no big people. Mm. You know no, but my nephew, my nephew's seventeen. I can't imagine him with a fat young woman. The is still there. That, that's what I'm trying to say. What, what would be my, my little nephew that's still like he's still jokey, jokey mm. with some big crusty fat? You would cuss her out. But there's some nineteen year olds. Yeah. Seventeen. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, your cousin seventeen, but I'm saying there's some there's nephew, 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 nephew. Yeah, but this girl was nineteen, so like we're not gonna go to seventeen. I'm saying at nineteen. Yeah, if you was with a 29 year old woman, like, or whatever, or 20, the, the balance could be whatever the balance is. The fact is that if the man's older, he's supposed to come in and have that kind of uh, dominant role, um, and, and you know, and be guiding the, the, the young woman and they, they grow together. Because 30 is he's supposed to have got certain things uh, under belt, got himself <laughs> a certain uh, platform, and then he's ready to take care of my daughter. Get me. Mm-hmm. I, I'm more confident in a 29 year old being with my with my 19 year old daughter than another 19 year old, and them talking about they're getting married. I'd be more confident in a in a man that's establishing himself or established himself and knows what he's doing and is serious about my daughter. Yeah, you like go on and do your thing. A 10 year difference. What the hell is that? Nothing. It doesn't seem that. It's huge at that age. Yeah, um, at that age. I'm just going to see myself being a fat told you. Hold on one second. Because when I watched the Jeffrey Epstein thing, they said you could be groomed up to the age of 30. So I don't know. Yeah, but that's silly, though, it's bro. Mind, no, it's not. No, we're going to listen to them. Actually we're going to listen to them. <laughs> no, that's yeah. dumb, though. Yeah, no, no. I hear the case. I hear the case. That's yeah. dumb. 30 year olds getting groomed. This is just a la- this is just society with a lack of accountability. What the mm-hmm. hell are we doing? 30 years old. These these that were barely living to 30 years old a hundred fucking two hundred years ago. Now we're talking about that. That's your what are we classifying them as. Okay. Then they come out with and all these with and adults and that. Bro, not, <laughs> like, it's, this is getting silly. No, it's same with Bar Kelly though. Grown women are saying they were groomed or they were... Yeah, stupidness. Yeah, do you get what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's, it's a madness, but... I know it depends on what, you, know depends what you've gone through, though. Now, at 19, though, like sorry, sorry. At 19, though, you definitely in the realms. With her two pitney. With her two yes. pitney. Man, move. With her two pitney. Yeah, yeah, but you know, you, you, uh, nah, do you know what though? You see yeah. that picky thing though, like brother, we, mm. we all come across like females that have picky, and you're like, you shouldn't have no children. Nah, I don't even mean either. nothing, bro, because you're still yeah. an airhead and you don't know fuck all. Yeah, exactly. like, just because yeah. you, you bred a picky, that don't really mean nothing. Uh, you've had two long term relationship, lived on your own. <laughs> this ain't no joke, I, and and I'm, and I'm saying I because re- I remember my age. I remember me growing up. So when I was young on the roads. Like I, I hear it, yeah. I make dumb decisions, just that very rare. But I also know that there was a, there's a level of accountability that I always had in my brain, and I, I used it when I got arre- arrested at 13, 14. I used it to my advantage. I was already using it to manipulate the system, and I'm just saying that there's there's a lot of there's a lot of accountability in that in people's brains. And a 19 year old gal, where yeah. girls are already more um. Uh, girls are already more mature and whatnot. I just feel like, yeah, you're an adult, isn't it? So, yeah, so we've, uh, had, uh, we've uh, had, uh, had cases, we've had so many cases with people older than 19. 
and they've been involved in grooming gangs and all of this type of stuff. So we're not going to do all that. I understand what you're saying, but it's semantics. But uh, if, if, because in reality, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. According to the law, yeah, they're going to still say it was grooming or he was trying to abuse the girl or did it do or she was a minor or did it. They're still going to say these things. Do you get what I'm saying? Because it's only, it's only, 19 from 18 is not that far. Is that, brothers, like, it's like a couple you know months, I mean? like, bro. What are we doing? I don't care about 18-year-old. Like, because, okay. you, you know, you, we, we're dealing with 16 as the age of consent, right? <laughs> I mean, just the age where, a, where yeah. a woman or a man, a woman or a man can decide that they want to have sexual contact with somebody yeah. else. Yeah? yeah? That's at, yeah. That's at 16. So yeah. when we're dealing with a whole 19, I don't want to yeah. hear about no grooming. I don't want to hear about the law. Fuck the law. Yeah. If the law is saying a 30 year old got groomed, you're supposed yeah. to laugh at that, my brother. We're not supposed to take that on board as being something realistic. I'm just saying, know. yes, it's realistic because that's how they made their case. It wasn't when the women were 19 that they were making these accusations. I don't care about their case, though. Yeah. Like, I'm just saying, I'm just saying, like, the different things I've watched, whether it's R. Kelly or it's Jeffrey Epstein. Do you get me? It's the same type of thing. It's just like, right, yeah, got, okay. I, I, always thought, no, in there. I was I was of the mind, sorry, I was of the mind of what you were saying. Do you get what I'm saying? Until I was told otherwise. No, 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 no. Law, according to the statutes, according yeah, they to whatever they're dealing with. One yeah, second. And according to what he did, yeah. All right, cool, cool. One second, was, though, yeah. yeah. Uh, it's like, people out here, if you're listening, you don't got to have a mind of your own. You got to have a brain of your own, yeah? And when we're having these conversations about society, about what happens out here, I don't want you lot telling me like there's one. If you're telling me in the eyes of the law, this is what they say. That's one thing, but we got to differentiate between the eyes of the law and what's real and what's right and what's wrong. Yeah, the eyes of the law are saying a thirty year old is a vulnerable adult and is being groomed. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, I'm not here to tell you that the law is right. What the law there is doing is is further. Employing this tactic of of no of robbing you of your ad, huh? no of robbing you ro ro robbing you of your adult status, right? And the accountability of men and women right now is at all time low. And when we play this game of oh, you can be twenty and groomed, you can be twenty five and groomed. Oh, this girl was twenty seven. Oh, this girl was thirty and groomed by a big man. And what we're doing is we we're, we're actually giving these women uh, uh, ability to hide under some victim status rather than take account. If this, if they didn't have fucking down syndrome, yeah, ain't nothing wrong with their fucking learning f faculties. You're not getting groomed. What happens is just like these women that say, Oh, I said no. And then I said, yes. And then I said, no, or I did say yes, but I felt scared to do it. But did he say anything to you? No. Nah, right, and you got to arrest. This guy's going to get done for pressuring or look in, in one of the cases, it was like, Oh, um, Someone pressured, yeah. uh, uh, P. Diddy pressured yeah. his assistant to have sex with a prostitute. The yeah. fuck is that? Yeah. He pressured you to have a hard on, yeah. like so. It's like this accountability so that we can put down the big bad guy who is going to be a male, yeah, adult male. Is is we're, we're we're attacking masculinity, we're attacking game, we're attacking a woman's ability to say no, I don't want to, or yes, I'm into that, and all of a sudden. Every man that's in, in in this kind of scenario is a big bad wolf. Uh, me per, me personally, I'm not putting that rhetoric out there. No, if I'm, I'm, if, I'm, if, if you're of a certain age, especially of 19, bearing that some of the men them on the panel, uh, we got girl childs of this age. Yeah, you're on your own, my G. Yeah, I'm gonna be there for you, but I'm not gonna be like, oh, this guy was some some um, magician that fucking tapped into your mind. And mm -hmm. no, nah, you have to see right and wrong. You you've been raised to know right and wrong. When I was 19. They weren't trying to give me no leeway. They were trying me as an as a adult in the old Bailey. They weren't trying to give me no leeway. They didn't give a fuck. You get me? And I was trying to, yeah, I was trying to appeal to the to the, to the the system about, well, look at my childhood. Look at my upbringing. Look what I've been through. Look at my record. Look at this. Look at that, yeah? But ultimately, they look you in the eye and say, you're an adult. You made choices. And as much as you're going to try and diminish your own responsibility and base it on your age, you know what you're doing. And this girl at 19, who met Dave um, Courtney in a club, and he was like, right, I want to marry you and whatever. And she was on it, drove back home and did God knows what, and then got her baby father warned off. Like, she's fully long in the tooth. She used to go robbing and stealing. She's with man that was shotters and whatnot. She knows what I want. 
at this age, whether she was groomed in or not, she was lying to to to, to nineteen year old youths. She when she, she was when she was thirteen, she's lying to nineteen year olds. When she was thirteen, she's lying to nineteen year olds saying she's nineteen. So that's how hard her face looked. So when she was nineteen, imagine. No, <laughs> 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 well, real talk though. This is a story. A life slapper. It's a story. <laughs> so it's like. Nah, when she's 19 and she bunks into Dave Courtney in the middle of a fucking rave, knowing that when I was 13, 14, I was going to raves in West End where man smoking crack and, mm. and, and, and rare, rare, rare. I'm like, no, times are different. And we're not going to call this grooming when you're 19 and the brother's 29. We're not going to call that grooming. Like, yeah, you're inner. Right? Oh, you like young things, maybe. Okay, cool. Yeah, is she impressionable? Yeah. I don't think there's nothing wrong with one of the impressionable woman when you're at i don't years. even i listen i don't even think that uh good quality grooming is is wrong because i feel <laughs> good that, quality no i just feel that <laughs> like many a person's parents hold on, or, or grandparents or uh, was definitely submitted in the same type of way now depending on the individual's thing it might have been church that they were into so now yeah. grandma's into church do you get what I'm saying? It just depends. And this is a fucking UK fucking gangster piece of shit. Yeah. And you're telling me he never fucking groomed them. Like, I don't get what you don't understand about fucking grooming. Wait, wait, how, wait, 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 about wait, child. Wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You're thinking about child grooming and da da No, I'm saying she's already confessed. You can't you can't take that away from her. Do you get what I'm saying? She's already said, I submitted. And that's it. That's all you need to know. Because the rest you do know. You know what it's like on the gangster side. Do you get what I'm saying? And she also knows. That's grooming. Someone's going to have to teach you that. Yeah? Like nah. you said, training. And that training nah. is grooming. Nah, nah. Sorry. 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 Yeah? And you're getting pulled out of it. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. Getting... What was the grooming? Oh, no, she was already on the gangster thing. Who was grooming her? She was he already was, out there. Rock... Her gangster ain't the same. Yeah, yeah she nah, was out there. Rock... Yeah. Nah, nah, nah. nah. <laughs> she was out there robbing. She was out there robbing. Jamaican. And she went in no Bayesian Jamaican gang. You get what I'm saying? She, 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 she said, she said naughty, 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 naughty kid. Yeah, no, no, no. But she's rock 19, naive. naughty kid. Dumb. Naughty kid. He's, 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 well, he's, he's on a different level. He's rubbing, he's rubbing areas. He's a mother already. Right? She's already had two kids. He's on a whole different level, Jed. She's, she's a 19-year-old mother yeah, of two. Yeah, but she's troubled. She's a person. Remember, she's troubled, isn't it? She's not going to She's not going to let us know what really went in that went on in the house with her 10 siblings obviously wow. something's wrong why you want to go out and fight everyone you want to um think about your age you want to run away something was going on she's not gonna let us know that part no 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 when we no car obviously yeah, sure. you're, you're speaking like some young thing like you, you was up in the club. At how old was you when? With my, went, with, my with, with family, it's a whole different situation. Wasn't vulnerable. I wasn't getting. How old was you? Uh oh. The youngest one that I've been to rave. Eighteen mm. with my with my big sister and my cousins nah, and family. You're in there. You're no one. You're lying. You're lying because what? you were too young to be in the rave. You already told us that it was like yeah, you were too young to be in the rave, but it's different because when you're at, when you're partying with right, family members, you, you, nothing is happening. I am forget not going you. into no one's car. I'm not going to no one's wait, house. Wait, wait, I'm literally wait, wait, going wait, out, wait, having a good time. Wait, wait, wait. Let me just say, yeah, to make yeah. this up, all right, I, I feel like because we're thinking with our Netflix and, and, and Instagram heads on, we're thinking that there was bare stuff to do in, the, in the, our fucking yard. Back in the days, every youth was out on road doing some adult shit. As far, the further back you go, the more adult shit youths yeah, were doing. Yeah. No, no, no. Wait, 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 about yeah. running away. She's not, when, yes. when kids run away, there's some reason why they run away yeah. from home. She so she's right. to, went, she wanted to be out. No, no, she said no. She's a vulnerable kid, man. She's a vulnerable kid. One second. Everyone go stop on. for a minute. Stop chatting. Stop fucking chatting for a minute. Because I will rewind this fucking video. This mm -hmm. girl has sat here and told her life story, and we're just trying to make up shit now. She you said, her mother between, oh, right, Stop, it. man. You, you're reading between the lines, is making shit up against what the woman stood here and said about her life. <laughs> you lot are lying on her. She said, Yeah, that um, she's, she ran away from home because she didn't want to go home because she was late. Yeah, and she knew her dad was strict. He was a mechanic. There was nothing but love in her yard, she said. Yeah, her dad was a mechanic. He worked all the time, and her mum was at church, right? A strict mm -hmm. church woman. 
who wouldn't who wouldn't take no shit. They had rows in the yard, very rare. She ran away because she wanted to be on the roadsides. Yeah. And this is what happens. It happened when we was growing up. We had friends that would run away because they just wanted to be out. Mm -hmm. Not because there was some... It's not all every day this new narrative of everyone's getting bummed in their yard and, oh, no, that's not the truth. The truth is the world was appealing to youngsters. So now when we have youngsters and they don't want to go out in the world, we're like, we don't understand. Because all we wanted to do was be out in that fucking world and experience and investigate shit and go and do shit that we had no business, no business doing. She's well older than all of us here, you know. So her generation must have been even worse. And like you lot are acting like you're like there has to be something wrong for you to lie about your age. No, that's not true. That's be something wrong for you to be out on the roadsides or wanting to be on the roads. No, that's not true. Sometimes people come from a blessed yard, but the roads are exciting, the streets are exciting. Do you know what I mean? So like the narrative we're painting is like you were giving her no chance to have made a choice to just. It's like she's getting. It's like we're robbing her of all her choice, and we're just saying, "Yeah, you were groomed into this, and you groomed into that." And it's no, like I'm saying that. I'm that saying can't that. be right. I don't think everybody's saying that. I think I'm saying that. You know what I mean? I definitely feel, according to what she said, yeah, she was definitely groomed into that lifestyle. That's facts. You know what I mean? And there, and as Zelini said, there was a little bit of sorry, man. You know, sorry, premeditation. You know, sorry, no, nah, sorry. When she's lying to the to the to the drug dealer brother that she's mm -hmm. nineteen, and nobody knows. Who's grooming who? No, she, Who's she's grooming who? She's definitely doing something that women do. Uh, never. Where's you know, the grooming? I gave an example of, the grooming of, of, now. The grooming. When a man's grooming a woman, putting yourself in dangerous like, situations. Certain, right? When a man's grooming a woman into certain mm -hmm. activities, then he's set out with the intention to get her into something that she's not already into. Right. Yeah. Now that's yeah. the grooming with the plan of yeah I got this agenda where I'm gonna get you into this and I, and it's like a, like you know mm -hmm. you use different techniques to get somebody acclimatized to some shit you won't want to do. However, yeah. this brother's doing her thing, doing his thing, and she's lying to keep up with his age. It's not like he's sort her out and said yeah I'm gonna get this young thing, I'm gonna get this young thing, and I'm gonna fucking groom her. He's thinking this is his age, mate, and he's doing what he's doing. And we're calling it grooming. It's like, no, it can't be grooming. No, he said he wanted intention? to marry her, that's all. No, no, no not Dave Courtney. He's her baby oh. father. And oh, the, her and baby the, father, yeah. No, baby he father, never groomed and before, her. And before the baby father, it was Speedy. They were both shotters, um, yeah, yeah, drug yeah. dealers, into crime. That's what yeah. she said with her own breath. So she has yeah. been introduced to crime from at least 13. Yeah. She's been into it. So... Like, I don't see how any... Do you know what I mean? All of a sudden, now she's with Dave Courtney, mm -hmm. and now he's the groomer. Why? Because the levels are different. You can't tell those petty criminals compared to someone like Dave Courtney, who's been in organised crime, organised organisations, well-known gangsters and all of that. Their histories have been documented and all of that. And he was the young guy in the situation. You have to know the history of Dave Courtney anyway. Do you know what yeah. I'm saying? And that... The, the the most they're saying is like, boy, he might have snitched. Do you get what I'm saying? So that's that's Dave Courtney's thing. He wasn't full gangster like how some people would make him out to be. He was just one day were grooming in a, in a sense. Do you get what I'm saying? He was the young boy amongst them, uh, plus other young boys. You know what I mean? Someone fruity stuff with uh, uh, Reggie. You know what I mean? And he was more with Ronnie and certain other ones. Who, yeah, we just on stroke. Yeah, not, not 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 to get hooked up on this grooming work. For me, like mm -hmm. I said, I wouldn't necessarily say it's grooming, but it, there's definitely elements of predatory behavior. Because you mm -hmm. get me for me personally. But what, yeah. what, what what I will say is that um, the, the, the whole aspect of the fact that she's she she's nineteen, she's she's not impressionable, or just because she's done X, Y, and Z. I get what yeah. Sniper is saying, I, and I also yeah. get what you're saying, Jed. But for me personally, bro, it's like D Dave Courtney is is big time to like these little idiots she was dealing with because the way he's probably going to approach situations, think about things, and and move to certain things is going to be totally different. And but also, and, oh, wait, 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 why wait, are we man, doing all this wait. hypothetical properly? No, wait, man, wait, bro. Yeah, and as well, Rubai, I feel like the, the 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 people that are skilled at this this behavior, Rubai, they do it to such a level that people don't even understand they're being manipulated or they're being grouped. Quote, yeah, unquote. We're, just yeah, randomly applying, we're just randomly applying that to this situation. No, I just told you that I said I don't think it's that because I'm, I'm just talking yeah, about grooming yeah. in general. Chris. Okay, yeah. grooming, yeah, even even grooming, we're just randomly applying that to this with no evidence. Yeah, she said she wanted to be molded. Yeah, and I feel like 
if you any man that's got a girl and if you don't mold your girl then that's up to you you're gonna you're gonna find out like that's what men do is mold their woman women are dead don't care if she's 19 or 98 she's feeling a dude and he's a leader he's gonna mold her she's gonna and she should be willing to be molded this is why men go for younger women rather than these old hardback women who've been molded by Zelini and, and Jedi and fucking uh, 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 snipes and, and they're all stiff and mag and they're all stiff in some uh, some next man's shape. Pause. You get me? This is why. It's not grooming yeah, though. It's normal. It's that's male and female interaction and it's wise man and a wise woman. A wise woman will pick a strong man that she can follow and lead and learn from and a wise man will pick a, a, a intelligent woman with a good foundation Good family foundation, which she had, ten kids, um, ten kids with the same mum and dad. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. and, <laughs> and like, yeah, all right, cool. You you want to be under my wing? You could be under my wing. That's normal. This is how it's supposed to be. But now we're using some new, some new terminology of grooming, and it's like we got a mind out in our car right about now. Every aspect of masculinity and a man picking a, a partner is being turned inside out. You can't chirp the girl on road. You can't move to a this. You can't do this. You can't do that. Now, now there's an age gap that you that you can't pass. If you if you go no, for a girl, not, young, not even doing that. But that's what yeah. no. But it is each point each time we're talking. These are the points that I'm highlighting. You that are saying whether you realize you're, no you're doing that. it or not. You are. You are. You you actually have been for the last hour. So no I don't one know said what, that. So yeah, you have been. You made those points. No, you've made them. No, hold on. How did you I make guys, a point about her age? I didn't you, make no point about Okay, her age. but has I'm anyone made a point? Has anyone made on. a point about hold on. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Has it's anybody not, one second sniper? One second sniper. Mm. Can you just keep the I'm saying hold on, you keep talking. Has anybody else on the panel made any assertions about the age gap between Dave Courtney and 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 this woman? Because you're saying I haven't, but has yeah, anyone have have, have yeah, you sat here and have, but at least three different people make 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 a say something? Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, cool. So let's not play the game. When I say yeah, you, lot, you lot, you yeah, lot. Yeah, but you is, is... you lot are, are, are you lot are <laughs> you on one accord. You lot yeah. are on one accord about most of what you're saying. So you no you like... no 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 no. Remember, I'm saying grooming. Yeah, uh, Zelini's saying yeah. There's some deviant or thing behavior. He's saying right? it's grooming, bro. Chips. Hold on, Shevs is saying yeah, it's grooming. Is... No, she's not saying it's grooming either. She no, is. No, she's saying, she's saying, she said, I see that grooming, grooming element. Grooming. As soon as you say a grooming element, you're saying it's grooming. It's These grooming, are trying yeah. to do diet grooming, right? Yeah, yeah. What and that's the, re the only reason why they're doing this old oh, diet grooming because they know it's not actually grooming, cuz. But it's instead of them saying it's not grooming, you know they're doing oh, yeah, everyone's doing oh, it's light grooming. Very nah. rasty, predatory behavior. It all amounts to the same yeah, thing. Yeah, I get you. But I'm not saying that. I'm saying that for her to be what she is now is Shut based up, on man. Dave Courtney. You know what I'm saying? It's based on it's based on Dave Courtney. And her confessions in this conversation is what led me to say grooming. That's it. I didn't say about her age. Her, her, or the her, age confession, or, her confession, her confession about me. saying mold me. Yes, yes, yes. So he groomed her because she wanted to be molded. Yes. And and you think that's grooming? Yes. It's not like it's not like the, his intention to go out there and and mold a woman is different from a woman saying she wanted to be molded. Now if you is he, is he, if you, is he having if you sex set up her? if you if you set up elaborate plots and ways mm -hmm. to get this woman to come into your way of thinking da, 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 and rare, 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 then this is on the line of grooming. If there's a woman that wants to be taught, then you're just teaching her. If there's a woman that wants to be molded, you're just molding her. You're not grooming. I feel, I feel, I feel and, problem. And if she asks for it, because mm -hmm. the, the one thing about grooming is at least it's like his idea, isn't it? It's what he wants. But this is kind of like what she wanted. Yeah, but she wants him to express himself as in come with his ideas of what he wants a woman to be. That's grooming, bro. It's not grooming. You know I, mean? I don't think it's grooming in the sense that we're talking about uh, grooming gangs, for example. We're not. It's not that what I'm saying, bro. I'm just saying grooming. Grooming is something looking after yourself. Do you get what I'm saying? Making yourself look presentable. Da -da -da -da. Men, men groom themselves, they say. When we use, so when we use, when we use grooming in this context, we've got to be beware 
that it's an age sensitive right. topic. So we know what we're saying right. when we say grooming. I d otherwise, why are we not using it? Why is it not a different word? Because grooming sounds like an older guy and a younger gal, and he's manipulating her. And did, I don't know. I didn't. I didn't see. I just didn't get that. Yeah, I get, get it. That get it. As in, if someone says, oh, "Mold me into what you want," yeah. From my point of view, that that is a form of grooming. Yeah, you're going to train someone. You're going to oh. mold them into what you want. And the only way that, uh, to do that is to groom them. And it doesn't necessarily mean you sexually abuse or you, you know what I mean. Like some of the things you're saying, because that is more with grooming gangs. I would say. Do you get what I'm saying? Yes, it is an action, but in the old days, it would have been kind of considered normal. How are you going to be with a woman and she's not going to express what you want? Do you get what I'm saying? Because she's already been like the old day women submissive. You know what I mean? And saying, listen, just mold me the way you want to mold me. Yeah, when you There's find us, man them, but man them at home. He just when happens to be gangster. Youngsters, whether you're a gangster, whether you're a nerd, whatever, if you're out there and you find a younger sister or younger woman, who's submissive and willing to learn from you or to be led by you, don't feel like you're grooming her, yeah? If anything, you're, you're, you lot are growing together and you're teaching her what you like or what you would expect, yeah? But don't ever look at it as grooming because this word grooming out here in 2024, you tell your brethren that you're it's grooming at like one thing or you tell or you tell your, your lady friends, yeah, I got one girl. I'm just yeah, just grooming her at the moment, you know. Like yeah, she wants to be teach, she wants to be molded, and that it ain't gonna go well because this terminology we can't play around with it because people are actually going to jail behind these type of words. So like, just know what you're standing for. Like, it, yeah, I feel, yeah. I feel, I feel, like, anytime I, feel, I hear that you're, anytime yeah. I hear you're grooming a woman, I yeah. I ain't expect it to be nothing good because unless you're brushing her hair, right, <laughs> right. it could be that. Yeah. It could be that you could be a stylist and whatever. So you be the one grooming her. Got one. That's what he does. He grooms women and and makes them look presentable. And doesn't matter what size they are. <laughs> 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 yeah. Yeah, is, grooming is nothing wrong. There's nothing wrong actually with the word. As I said, you're right. In 2024, the interpretation of grooming is only one way. It seems. Do you get what I'm saying? When it's not necessarily true. Do you get what I'm saying? So I wouldn't attach all them other neaky stuff to the situation I'm talking about with Dave Courtney and this. I'm more talking to come into that lifestyle, yeah, because her lifestyle, you consider it gangster. Now I just consider it road. Yeah, she was on the roads, blah, 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 for her ends and, you know, what was going on there. But compared to an East End gangster or whatever, this is completely different. You know what I mean? This man's come from organized crime. To do, do, he's come to your house without you giving him your address. These are just actions I know a gangster can do, you know what I mean? Someone who's known in the streets. Yeah, do you know this girl? Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, can you find out her address? Da, da, da. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. It goes around there, puts a note in. Da, da, da. So it's all premeditated. Yeah, and once there's some premeditation there, yeah, well, you know what it is. He knows what he wants, isn't it? And he got it in the end. So I feel like Dave Courtney's the winner. Trino, Trino Katza said he's a, he's a sexual deviant, but if everyone is over age, and sound mm. of mind, then it is yeah. what it is. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I'm not. I'm not even addressing that. I'm just. I didn't even see the sexual. Like, why are we saying he's a yeah. sexual deviant now? I don't know. Some people what? said some other stuff that he's done, but that's in not what, what I'm saying. This is this is someone he supposedly loved. So he's telling you, man, you like mine out, man. Then mine out because this is yeah. Uh, this is the language that's going on out, out there, bro. And you could mm -hmm. just be in a relationship and Gala telling. Gala being told by their big brother or their uncle or, or their brethren that you groomed her. You get me? Just mind out, bro. Like, I feel, you got, you I feel, me? I feel no, even... no women are... Like, it's like women are... It's scary. Listen, there's different levels to grooming and I, I've definitely seen it around me. Yeah? Some of my friends definitely uh, were talking to girls who, even though they weren't... They were of age, yeah? It's still a bit sneaky. I was just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Every minute, man's pulling up to this girl, and da -da, they were all in the car. I'm like, bros, can we go and do what we're doing? Hi, 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 how you doing? My man's like, yeah, what are you doing later? Like, oh, that's grooming, bros. You know what I'm saying? So when it comes to the conversation of man them sitting down, we know the difference. Yeah, we can say, yeah, certain man was grooming certain girl. What what age did he link her? Da -da -da -da. Boy, 14, yeah? Mad tick. 
Yeah. So these things have been in the ends and man them have these discussions because yeah, there's some real niggas doing some real shady shit. So for us, it has a different connotation and interpretation, but yeah, we definitely know it when we see it. Oh, he's a sexy, sexual deviant because he's got in his house, he's got a sex room and that. No, uh, well, that can't be it. Yeah, I mean, there has to be more than that. If he's in the sex room, I mean, it's not really a secret. I, I, sexual deviant. I, I suppose you can give him that title. I mean, yeah, I suppose so. What else is a sexual deviant? So, yeah, so, so yeah, you're right. But again, the way language uses, the way we use language nowadays, mm. when we say, oh, man's a sexual deviant, makes it seem like he's different from your auntie or your cousin or your, or your uncle or your dad. You don't know what the fuck they're doing in their bedroom, whether they go to sex parties or, or whether they wear leather or spank, you get me, or whatever. You, mm. like, it's sex, isn't it? But we yeah. can stand over on our side and call other people sexual deviants. Oh, you're a sexual deviant because you got a sex room in your yard. Uh, that's yeah, that's mad. That is mad. You, but it's like, yeah, he is a sexual deviant, but does it make him a different type of human than the man down the road or then whatever? I don't know. No, I think he's more in touch with, you know, like because this is a repressed nation, remember, sexually. Like, they're European cousins. They they not have such inhibitions about sex and stuff like that. So, yeah, it's only in this country where they do it privately. The man are wearing nappy, but it's private. Man love toes, but it's private. Do you get what I'm saying? Like, fetish stuff and all that kind of stuff. So, yeah, for me, there's nothing wrong in that. I wouldn't call him a sexual deviant for that reason. No. I wouldn't call him for a sexual deviant full stop, to be honest. Like, there's no evidence to support that. And well, there's a story where... You well, it, well, well, like, there's... Like, I'm playing, you know, I'm playing the... I'm playing the advocate, but yeah, there's definitely stories, and I think she's gonna oh, yeah. even talk about stories in this interview. Okay, right? okay. Right, this so... <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So there was, def there was definitely on some freak shit, and there was stuff going on in the yard so like even though yeah. you know i'm saying okay yeah he is a, he probably is a sexual deviant as in his uh vanilla sex mi missionary with his missus is probably not all he's into you know yeah but that for me that doesn't make you a deviant if you have sex different ways or if you're you do some gay shit and da -da -da -da, that's your business and it you got what i'm saying like and these english man they can do all that so what makes you deviant can, then huh I wouldn't, I wouldn't say he's a sexual deviant. I don't I said, what makes someone a deviant then in your book? Oh, uh, I think if, it, if it's with, a, with an underage child or, you know, someone underage, under the age of consent, that, that, that's what makes a deviant. But to have sex toys and a dungeon and da -da 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 -da, for me, make you a sexual deviant. That's crazy. Isn't the deviant side bringing it in public? Who knows, man? I just feel it's more sneaky, is it? like you're sneaky or you're, you're, you're not doing things for, well, you're yeah. doing things for sexual gratification, but it's for yourself and that person is vulnerable or whatever. I don't know. That's part of it. As opposed to... Yeah. Well, so he's he's referring so. to something deviating from the norm. So it's whatever you say the norm is, and obviously the norm in mm. the sex department is different for a lot of people nowadays right it's everything you know it could I mean? be all so of the above so even, so even that understand. type of terminology you're getting yeah. into the the, the 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 grounds of like prejudice and all that and small-minded yeah. and da, 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 da. But obviously there's things that deviate from all of our norms i mean I, I, a sexual deviant to me is someone say like oh he only likes women who look like young boys or something <laughs> that's it <what> I mean. <laughs> you, know, you, know, you know like I, things like i, I know what I know what deviant means, um, Vic, and as you can see, I've already said quite frankly, yeah, he probably is classed as a sexual deviant. Yeah. But it's interesting that uh, nowadays everyone just got their own opinion on what a word means, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And what a word true. means to them. Definitely so true. just like Sniper thinks that it was grooming is a correct word, he thinks yes. deviant yeah. isn't a correct word. So it's like, well, to, to, yeah, for yeah, exactly, exactly. That that is a fair point. Still, to go saying because we all have our own interpretations. Like, as we know, like gay, you know what I mean? Gay means happy, but you know, <laughs> in this day and age, no, it doesn't. So, you know, things change and have different definitions. But I think the grooming is definitely com compartmentalized in the sense that it has different levels to it. You know what I mean? The one we're mainly talking about is grooming guys type behavior. You know what I mean? 
and attaching it to just somebody who's you know what I mean he's 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 the older guy he's the smarter guy you know what I mean and you're coming into a world that you're unfamiliar with and he's going to show you the ropes and that showing you the ropes is called grooming whether it's nice or whether it's do you get what I'm saying and there's definitely sex involved there's definitely kids involved there's definitely marriage involved from the off so yeah it could be perceived that, that way but not in a completely horrible way like yeah some other people are talking about. That one. but yeah as far as she got groomed yeah into that lifestyle she would have been groomed to say things like no comment don't you know what i mean don't snitch don't do certain things don't say certain things don't yeah it's a lot more complex than just i don't know like yeah what some people might be thinking you know i mean it's a whole lifestyle isn't it so if someone's gonna have to teach you you're gonna need a guide and who better than your, your partner so so, so you don't think that homosexuality is deviance of course it is it's deviant oh, okay it's, it's, I thought you said it was, I, thought, I thought you said it was just just um underage stuff that was deviant. No, underage, and I said having a dungeon in your yard is not deviant. You know what I'm saying? Like having sex toys and all of that type of stuff. No, that's not deviant. But it's who you're using it on or who you <laughs> have interest in, yeah, that can be deviant. That's why Randy's one is a bit mm, that's a bit deviant, cuz because yeah, you're going to Thailand and them type of places and chat to young girls. Stuff, you know what I mean? Taking their photos and not letting them know, and then following them on Insta. It's a little bit of stalking and stuff. <laughs> fucking he's hell! He's, he's different. Fucking you know I mean? hell! She's a yeah. proper. You know when she says she's a twin? Yeah, brother. <laughs> oh my days! That's the sister. Yeah, which one is she? Deviated. <laughs> for the lower one I think probably how's my saying deviated <laughs> so good mm -hmm. is it the smaller one uh, uh, no hold on the one that's higher up I can't even tell bro so I'm lost lost for words one looks like she's got a softer face than the other though slightly yeah, man would be on them back in the day still. I would I would uh, feel that the one that's higher up is is Dave's is Dave's girl. Maybe. Yeah. These girls are soft. And it, so what is this them at 19? This is these are the girl that's this is the girl that's getting groomed or whatever. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm a Look bad girl that. that. Bad yeah, girl that. Yeah, me. Looking Road, bad. Yeah. Looking like escape, yeah. man. Um, what's the not escape? What's the other one? Uh, total, total, it's the total look. And remember, one of them's from Tottenham, yes. Yeah, so I've had to grooming, you get me? <laughs> Puffy go, Puffy groomed a whole fucking industry. He I'm not having that. People. I'm not having that. <laughs> yeah, Puffy groomed the whole industry, bro. What are we talking about? Out here? You know what I mean? Like, no problem, Elia, no problem, all sorts, no problem. Like, yo, listen. Yeah, there was a lot, a lot of uh, uh, involvement and allowance by the the parents. So uh, yeah, some of those some of those situations are definitely techy, but it was allowed. It's crazy. I've been marrying my daughter and that, and she ain't covered up like that. What is this? Who set this up? Huh. Mad thing. Rika, are you there? What's happening? Hey, I'm here. Mm. Yeah, poor thing, man. I feel, I feel, um, and she seems a bit nervous. I don't know if that's drugs or whatever. She just seems a little bit timid and, you know what I mean, a little bit. Yeah, it's a bit weird still. I don't know if that's drugs or whatever, but something. Something ain't right. Maybe if I was there, I could smell the crystal meth or something. Rose, we got Vic. We got Vic. Why, why say all this when he's dead? Who are you talking about, Chilo? 
you just it's just a statement. Who are you asking and who are you talking about? This is four years after Dave's tutoring. You look, man. You look, <laughs> it's scary to watch people build narrative. You look building a proper narrative, boy. And it sounds believable as well. Big up to you, man. I like that. <laughs> that. That was a bar still. <laughs> four years after Dave's tutoring, you know, the red thing. Because <laughs> he burst into fame, didn't he? And was it the Ronnie Cray funeral that done that? That's exactly it. Because we used to mm -hmm. go and see Ronnie and Reg. Yeah. yeah. Go and visit of course them. you did. Of right. course. Same, me and my sister. Yeah, birds of a what? Feather. And um, what we've done. Get groomed done, together. We... Right. All yeah. blocking each other and that. How are you going to take her to see Ronnie and Reggie Cray and tell me? You're not bringing her into another world. You're bringing her into another world. She never knew about that. She knew about Tyrone or whatever his name was. Was it Roland and that? You know what I mean? There's petty uh, criminals and that. Do you know what, Mac? Actually, you're trying it still. <laughs> you, you like that. <laughs> petty <laughs> criminals and that. No, well, compared no, to, no, no. to Ronnie and Reggie that. and that. Not even that. It's I told you what it is. I remember, remember the boss man is an expert in this. This, but He's done this already. He's done it to his own oh. chick. Do you get what I'm saying? He was far player. older than 19. I think she Why was, was she 19 or like that, 20 or whatever. Yeah, it doesn't even matter about the age, but it's the intimidation, it's the gangsterism, it's the, oh, you got to wear this yeah. dress and you got to do all that. We saw all of it, man. How many uh, Cray films have they put out that we know that your boss, yeah, done that to his own woman till she took her own, own life? <clears throat> you know what I mean? So it's a bit weird that, isn't it? A bit coincidence. No, there's no such thing as coincidence, bro. Yeah. He was groomed and he's also a groomer. Right? Yeah. That should be grooming into a gang, you know. It's mad. Into that lifestyle, cutting man's throat, being giving him Chelsea smiles and all sorts of things, not snitching, knowing what's going on, who said what, who did this, who did that. Then, you know, it's mad. That's a lot, bro. <laughs> The so whole pantheon of English gangsterism and just applying it to this, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Just, to this already flattened hairstyle. <laughs> I'm like laying, the it, on, I'm laying it on like the lacquer she used <laughs> to hold that thing down. <laughs> I don't know what's going on, but once you go into the Ronnie and Reggie, it's game over. I, I rest yeah. my case, I'll pull back. <laughs> mm. You get me. That's the type I'm dealing with. I'm not dealing with the other stuff, the Tommy Robinson type. You know what I mean? Even though at that age, he would have been fully fitted into the category for the grooming gangs thing. Yeah, yeah, that's not, that's not, you know, young white males or age, they're 80% of grooming. You know what I mean? In this country. So I don't know. It's not like he's not going to be unfamiliar <laughs> with, the, with the circumstances. Yeah, I'm sure he had a few holes in that, Soho and that, these men working and doing their thing. Right. Well, let's see what um I'm seeing mad words in the chat. Take advantage, manipulate. I know they all mean the like, same thing. No. You are funny, man. You look funny. But I don't yeah, think in, take advantage, manipulate. Uh mm. man, man. it's like fuck, you know. It's like we're we're dealing with a six-year-old with, 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 with Down syndrome. <laughs> nah, I wouldn't you say, that. I wouldn't say that. I just feel big yeah. ass woman. Yeah, with her twin sister, Brock you up. You know what I mean? Brock up. Yeah, yeah. yeah but you only, once you're with Dave, it's different. It's different. It works different. Look right? at her fists. Remember the fists? Yeah, saw. yeah, the fist. The, the knuckles, fist. bro. She's, yeah. she's, even she's, Dave she's definitely fought. Even Dave was prank. Yeah. I heard they, they had a couple of fights themselves in that. She's yeah, she's like, me. <laughs> Let me, she's like, mold me. He's like, all right, then. Mm. Yeah. You're not going to have it. You know what I mean? If I fucking pissed you off, you're gonna smash a bottle on me head. You know what I mean? You can. Black can. <laughs> <Those laughs> you know go I mean? for it. Like, go Chill out, bad man. Chill out, bad man. Chill out, bad man. Code. I like that. <laughs> it's true though. You know what I mean? Anything you're telling me. Uh, it's gonna be a myth from now on. This is gonna be like yeah, crazy. Oh yeah, we went to see Ronnie and Reggie, and then he went to the funeral, and then ah, you're in another world now. You've left. You've left. Uh, what's the guy's name? Rosalind behind now. All of that is, is in the past now. 
You know what I mean? He done he done good fellas on their baby father. <laughs> yeah, made a hold the strap, took the strap out and gone. Yeah, it's the standard. I've heard that. I've heard that. Where well, guys had to go around a new boyfriend had to go around and just bust out the, the baby father's face. Yeah. But yeah, yeah. Right. I know yeah. many a man who's done that all weird ritual still. He's he's done it reverse intimidation tactics. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, I'm here now. You get me? If you want to come around on some arms house, yeah, it's gonna can't be come again. Deep. You can't even see your child again. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, man, I put down the gauntlet. I know, I know. We've yeah. got family yeah. members who've done that. So I'm acting. You know what I mean? But I sometimes it's needed because some of these women they're in some real domestic relationship. Really, right. they get back to right. right. So sometimes, it's true. yeah, mm. yeah. I mean, especially you like when I used to back in the day, young days, I used to check bear girl from South. And yeah, yeah their, their exes, a lot of them didn't want to let it go, man. Man, I in jail, but man still had hold over a gal and all of these yeah. type of things, you know what I mean? Like, no, 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 no. He rang me the other day, what, from jail? So, to get me? She's like, no, no, but he's in there for do da 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 and he stabbed up this man, and I'm like, Rah. do I really want this situation in my situation? You get what I'm saying? Because sometimes you feel like you're the third wheel. You know what I mean? Yeah. You just come true to get a little little something, something, you know what I mean? The girl's nice, did it, did it's got potential to be your girlfriend or whatever. But mm. bruvs, a lot of them was disturbed. Pretty girl, you know, yeah, like yeah. disturbed, yeah. like, oh my God. Yeah, yeah. Why are you nervous like that? Oh, my baby father. Oh, my boyfriend. Oh, ex. It's like, yeah, but he's your ex, isn't it? Yeah, but he's in jail and the dude got 10 years and did he should be home soon and rah, 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 he always rings me and I'm like, rah. Yeah. Well, just tell that nigga I'll shoot him in the face anyway. Let's move forward, bro. Well, let's go. <laughs> yeah, you can say any wicked talk. A nigga's in jail. Fuck that nigga. Yeah. <laughs> I need pum <pum-pum> right now. You <laughs> 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 got time for that shit? You get me? I'll just say, uh huh, uh huh. I hear you, man. No, it's fuck you, man. You shouldn't do that, man. Do, 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 do. You know what I mean? And they start thinking, oh, you North guys are so nice and so sweet. We're just as evil as them sad guys, but you know, let's do it in a different way. <laughs> you know the ones there. Once I got the pump on, I'm gone, fam. What are you talking about? Yeah, so this nigga can come out and murder me. For what? For you? Nah, nah, nah. It's not that deep. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, your pump weren't that good, man. It's like, what are we doing here? <laughs> I can't do with you. <laughs> No, it's true. So even in relationship kind of thing, it's it's a survival thing as well. Yeah. In the world of chirping and, you know, checking mm-hmm. gal and all of that, it's, it's treacherous. You know what I mean? Jumping over fences, doing Olympic stuff sometimes. You know what I mean? Just to get out of the situation. Just like, rah, rah. I'm staying. No, no, you can't stay. <laughs> yeah. The baby father's come to the door with goons and that. Yeah, a man stayed. Man was with man's brethren, and I was like, "Look at this setup." Man just phoned their bre- our brethren to come and pick us up, and that. But it, it all went kind of well, you know what I mean? Because we try to play it off. But yeah, the baby father knew what time it was, bros. You know what I mean? And we was clear in West London, so it was like, perhaps it, it was a, it was a sticky one, but we got out of that situation, no problems. But yeah, man, shit. I just don't want to be the baby father who's doing all that. And I think I learned from that 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 would never be me. And you, and you don't want to be the baby father that gets beat up. <laughs> no, I'm not going to get beat up. Trust me. You, know, you, you just don't want to be that one, boy. That's just no, crazy. No, I'm just not going to jail for a girl. In it, yeah. You yeah. don't do that. You don't do that. Because no. I'm definitely going to jail because it's just a matter These no type of girls, they just, they, they, they're just problem anyway. They are problem. Those are the ones, yeah. the ones that make the new boyfriend beat up the old. It just, yeah. Well, yeah. I mean, yeah, many a situation was based on that. Yeah. Someone said something to man's ex and did it do it, and man know that it's man's baby mother and man's trying to diss man. And it was nothing direct, yeah. but it just sometimes can end up as a mess. Yeah. You know what I mean? And then everybody's got to show how strong they are. Well, wow. they're diverting in the conversation. <laughs> I was going to say, that's not her. She ain't twerked a day in her life. Not since she was young. Boing, boing, boing.
Mm. Why you going quiet for? <laughs> Let's get What? Damn. <laughs> That's a very small treadmill. Tiny treadmill. That's a house. Tiny, isn't it? <laughs> really tiny. Mm. <laughs> Yeah. So let's see what the no tits woman has to say, man. Let's do it. Let's go Petition for because I think it was it coming up to their twenty five years. They was inside the two of them. See. Up to their twenty five year mark, mm -hmm. and we started. We done a petition. We led a we led, led a march. That's right. There was campaigns to free them. Exactly. Wasn't there? And so we marched from um, Hyde Park to Downing Street, handed in this petition and all that. Hyde Park to Downing Street. And yeah. Because mm -hmm. we were doing this petition, this, um, march. This march. Then mm -hmm. um, people that we was getting radio interviews, like people's are like interviewing us, asking us if we could like come and do like talk about the craze and what we were doing because we were saying like they're 25, they've done 25 years, we were 25 at the time. Mm -hmm. So we said they've been inside as long as we've been alive. People have actually killed their wives, got 15 years, like killed their wives, buried them, dug them up, shaked them, dug, like buried them again, got 15 years, come out. Mm -hmm. And they're still inside. They didn't actually do anything as horrendous as that, you know. Oh, like, mate. oh, mate. why should oh, why wouldn't you let them out? This is the grooming. Like, this is the brainwashing. And um, then yeah. like you say, to um, make a statement like that. Ronnie died. Right. Nah, man. And, Listen, I can't even hear you because there's too much people screaming "free vibes cartel." I want to hear nothing, bro. <laughs> Don't lie. All right. Really? Yeah. So for me, you got good church going people talking about free mm. world boss. We're not going to yeah. call this grooming because they because she felt like the craze should have come out of jail. Bear people felt like the craze, um, uh, the other dude, the great train robber, Ronnie Biggs, all these men should have got let out. No, Ronnie uh, Biggs should have got let out, definitely. And he got switched been... on to get caught anyway, so that's different. You know what I mean? Fucking bastards. You know what I mean? We're not going to have snitching. It's acceptable on one hand and it's not acceptable on the other hand. It doesn't even make no sense. Ronnie Biggs, different story. Craze. What? I, I'm not even invested, but I'm saying the amount of killing and stuff that they did, yeah, that was not put in the media and all of that type of stuff. Yeah, she's talking smack. That's what Dave told her. Do you get it? She's only repeating what Dave told her. She doesn't know any better. So I can't really blame her for what she's saying, but she's talking smack. Okay. Or, or maybe she knows that they've done smack, but she's mm. just on a let's free the man them thing. Like any one of the man them would say, yeah, man, my brother's done his time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's cool, man. She's groomed, isn't it? Or Bredrin. No, but that's why I use the Vibes Cartel thing. Because everyone knows that Vibes Cartel is a shooter. And and it's got shooters underneath him, should I say. They know that he was... They know that he was on badness. Everybody knows Vibes Cartel was on badness. Yeah? But they want to free him because of his talent, because he did good things for his community, yada, 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 all of that. Yeah, so for that reason, we're not like it's just how it goes. Bad man, people love bad man, isn't it? And they think, <laughs> that, you know, it's not, it's not, it's not a new. Yeah, I know what you mean. They groom it, man. But some, yeah, some women, in her some case, women naive, yeah. Yeah. some women are naive and they will believe that he didn't do that. Like I've yeah. heard stories. You, you know the real truth, and then you'll speak to a, someone's woman, and they'll pretend you. So you'd be like, so what's the, you just have to just follow the real truth because her, her version, what he's told her, is a, is is the solicitor's version. And that's, I, I've heard that many a times. They don't tell they don't tell their women the truth. Mm. Sorry, Can't. Doug, like, Sorry, I don't know where you got that Ronnie Biggs never went jail thing. I don't know where you got that from. Hmm? No, Doug, like said Ronnie Biggs stayed out. He never went pen. I don't know where you no, got No, he went pen, bro. Where, he got snitched I don't know where you been, bro. Snitched on bros long time ago. That was that was a whole movie in there. <laughs> they made a movie of that buster. Huh? What are you talking about? Bro? You got me. I was selling um flowers and that near the Thames and that. Yeah, you know I mean, he had a stall and all of that type of stuff. Yeah, they caught him, bro. They thought he was in the south of Spain for ages, which he was. And then when he came back uh, under the, a disguise or whatever, yeah, someone snitched on him and he got got yeah. Yeah, I remember. What's that guy? Um, yeah, he was. He was sick, innit? it? It was no, wait, yeah, true spirit. He was sick, right? And he handed himself in. The guy, the white guy, um, 
the white guy uh, uh, put up a million pounds for him. Um, I've forgotten his name, man. He used to be like a presenter, blonde hair and did it, but he loved the establishment, the queen and that. And he put up a million to get my man caught. Like that. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. Ronnie crazy. Biggs, yeah. yeah, so Ronnie Biggs had a helicopter come get him, right? Yes. Is it him? Is that how he got our ones worth? Helicopter so, um, landed yeah. in the exercise yard? Yeah. That mm -hmm. is the story, I think. <laughs> my thing. Mm. But he was elusive from the start because they didn't catch him straight away, obviously. You know what I mean? That was free for years. And then when they did catch up with him, which I think was like in the 90s or something like that, they didn't speak for him. Was he in this country when they found him? Yes. As I said, he was working and selling fruit and veg oh flowers, sorry, like a mm -mm, florist mm -mm. store up by the embankment somewhere. So yeah, it's romantic. But yeah, haters will hate, man. Fuck these guys, man. And they and Reggie asked Dave if he'd do the security for Ronnie's funeral. And that's where it started with Dave. Like he done like he got, all them people just all them the dormant that he had mm. and all the big I'll take up at the house that morning. I've done all sandwiches. <laughs> Off they went to this funeral, and um, that was it. He just catapulted from there. Yeah, he really did. He really did rock it into into yeah. fame from there. Yeah. Was there any? Didn't so, he look wicked on that? Though, yeah, right? he, he looked, looked great. Looked wicked. He looked great. I mean, he always looked like a movie star. Yeah, he always had that Hollywood. Yeah, but look. he always used to do extra work and all that because he was in the Cray Twins film and all that. He used to do extra work. He signed me and my sister up to do it as well, like with an agency. We've done the bill and things like that with him, like a couple of sets we done, we was on with him. But um, he used to do a lot of the acting thing as well. So he was going into that anyway, you know, like... Hell to pay. Mm. Hell to pay. Well, no, hell to pay. Was... I done a music video with him. Did you? The bill, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I got some friends who did the music video. I, I did some acting. But it was like, when I say music video, it was like a, it was like an acting... It was like a mini film, bruv. It was so mm -hmm. mad. Okay. We was like on opposing, opposing gangs. That was like a ringleader for one gang. Can't mm -hmm. remember who was the ringleader for our other. It might have even been him. And we had to act like we was like gonna fight each other. But basically, yeah. we did. But we was there all day. Got paid nice, whatever. Mm -hmm. I don't remember chatting to him though. I think I just mind my own business. Mm -hmm. But I know a lot of people did know him. Like I said, yeah. man, them like yeah, they know yeah, him. And, yeah. then, and then obviously, older years, I got a lot of brethren that would go to his yard for these <coughs> after parties. These yeah, exactly. House yeah. after parties and whatnot. And then it was <laughs> it was at his yard that Fox got killed, didn't it? Is it okay? Is it? Oh, oh Westwood, Westwood, yeah. No, no. Who's could have been Dave Courtney's before? It could have been Dave Courtney's before. Who knows? I don't know. No, 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 no. I just, oh. I just thought that that, match, that mansion party when they yeah. were talking about the mansion party, I thought it was um, yeah. Dave, Dave Courtney. Courtney. I thought I heard the rumor it was his. Could I don't have been. know. Could have been still. Oh, that would make a little sense. Yeah, I heard. I heard yeah. it was it was his party because it would make sense. I've been, I've been invited bare times to come with him. Oh yeah, we're gonna go here. Then we're gonna go to Dave Courtney's thing. But Dave Courtney's yeah. thing, I won't be. Really, I was like, mm. I don't know. Just sat in the back. I just said I'm not on it. But he probably loved it. I think oh. um, because like when, when my brethren came back, he was just telling me about the different types of people that was there and. Yeah, okay. rare, rare, and there was this you and oh, just you, some youth said he knows you, and oh, rare, rare, and there was man from here, and I was thinking, right, oh, it's, it's a bit mm. mixed up here. And you know, mansion party gives me the heebie jeebies anyway. Don't yes. know if them things are cursed or something. It was always a madness. Is it? Is it? Huh? Does madness always happen at those parties? Seems seems to be from what I know. Uh, there's always mm. some kind of shooting gone down at these mansion parties at the end. Do you know what I mean? Oh, yeah, yeah. Just like at Batchwoods in um, St. Albert. I don't know. If someone was to hold a party. Like that, yeah. The Kiss Mansion. Yeah. And yeah, yeah. Every time we came out of there, there was some drama or something. Do you know, know what? I think to hold parties like that, everyone has to hand in their phone. Because what it is, is when they've been people that are not obviously from that lifestyle, they like yeah. to upload where they are. And it's yes. just, it's, you know, before you enter this house, just everyone put their phone away. And then maybe it might so. be safer. Yeah, it might be, uh, yeah. Exactly. But again, people can still do what they want to do, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. But I, I feel that would make more sense. Yeah. Like take their phones from them. 
Yeah, because it's uploaded every five minutes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Only yeah. people will find you because they know where you are. Yeah. I mean, but... Then you look with you in it. There's some, yeah. there's some nice mansion yeah. there in Hertfordshire. I looked, it was, it was nice. I think there was, I think I think it was a couple nights. But if you were to hold a party there, you could get your money back easily. Right. Easily. Mm. Mansion party is risky though, isn't it? Because the more people, the more you need them to like be gentle with, like you know, the building and. I think you have to. Like, obviously, you got to, you got to be, you got to be aware of your crowd, isn't it? I think, I don't know, you just have to just be aware of who you're inviting. I've never, I never been to a mansion party, man. It was, you know, sounds good, but yeah, the right, yeah. The right one. Yeah, don't try to invite me to Sutton and that, bro. It's just around the corner from the ends, bro. Don't try it, man. Do you know what I mean? It's true, it's true. Woolage and that, like, I'm not falling for it. We, need, let's, we all got to be quay out. All of us got to be quay. Mm -hmm. Bath, you get me? Then, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Don't want people to just start their nonsense. Right? Yeah, yeah. It's, I wouldn't. Yeah, I wouldn't mind a mansion party though. Still, I'm not gonna lie. I like the idea of lots of rooms. As long as there's music and there's lots of yeah. yeah I, I, I wouldn't mind that. Saying, it was like an outside pool. It was in the summertime. You know, if you sell food, tickets, blah blah blah, you'd you'd make your money back easy, quick, easy. Yeah, that'd be easy. Yeah. But you have yeah, to I, make sure yeah. the crowd that you've got is. Oh my minimum. god! Oh, I did. I didn't see her leg though. In the what leg? <laughs> huh? I see one bend down. I see the other one, the one that's holding onto the side. Look, why is her legs like that? What's she doing? <laughs> What's going on? No, that's scary. Well, what's wrong with her leg? Going in the background. Hmm? What's wrong with her leg? It's the way the pose or the stance. What's that? What's the reasoning? I, I don't get it. Yeah, they used to do all that, you know, that little bad girl. The, the, the knee, yeah, ready, the one ready, leg. Ready for action, boy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's mad. It's mad. Boy, that was normal, man. Yeah, I think that's his girl. Okay, yeah. Good clothes for everybody. Does it, it doesn't match his attire. Obviously, he's a gangster, suited, booted, and she's wet. So, she's looking like... outside the outside like blind beggar. Feet. Hold on, wait. They're outside the blind beggar where next man shot next man. <laughs> yeah. She's, she's looking like that's all his life. I don't, it, doesn't, it doesn't really match. So I yeah. would have thought that he wanted his woman to be a bit more... I don't know. Chavy. I don't know. Chavy. Maybe that's, that's, maybe that's what happens when you... You know, like when your man's white and... Maybe that's what he thinks. Black. That's how black men and women are meant to be. Mm. Like just dancing. You know, just chat bare shit, man. I did say no. I don't <laughs> know. If you never met a black woman, maybe he thinks that's what black women are meant to be. You not just chat. That's the exception. That's what they did. Wear shorts. Stop making up narratives, man. He fired. He ran a club. Like, I ran a whole man. club. No, no, no. He ran a whole club in South London. Yeah, mm. let's not act like he don't know what black women are and the different. I'm just saying, it doesn't match his attire. Either. He's a suited boot gangster that pays money for his clothes, and he's got someone next to him that looks like dance or queen for life. It doesn't yeah, match. That's facts. That's facts. Still, no, it does match. It's a bit it's weird. Okay. The guy in the background is looking gangster bad, as well. Bad man, bad man, and bad gal. You get me? It does match. If a if a it white if a black woman, you can you yeah, can still be bad in a in a, a black woman a, is going to go. For a white guy, she's gonna go. She's gonna go for a gangster. He looks one. like the first M. Dot R. Yeah, but you can still be bad <laughs> in a tailored dress. She's been with drug <laughs> dealers. Yeah. She's been with drug dealers and tugs. She likes bad boys. She's this been is M. Dot R. Yeah, it's, it's all great right, what she she's likes, but I'm just saying for him, you can still be a bad girl in a tailored dress and heels. Don't get it twisted. People can still do that. that? So what's that got with him though? I'm just what I'm trying to say is that it doesn't match what he's. I don't know. If you can't get it, don't get it. Yeah, I, I get it. Yeah. The matches, Cockney gangster, mm. yeah, with a with a gangster gal, road gal. It's a good. It's a match. They're on crud. Mm -hmm. they, they got the aggression. They understand the streets. It's a good match. It's actually a good <laughs> match. You say no, it's John B business. Yeah, I just, I yeah, just, John I just. B, if he, yeah. if he, if he was, if he was molding her, like obviously she said he he's meant to be. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if he would allow her to be. I don't know if it's, it's, it's what it is, not my, it's my, it's my opinion in that. Yeah. 
It's the dancehall queen for life. You're right, though. That's what it does look like. Mixed with, hey, oh, love, your name's not Dan, you're not getting in. It's, it's madness. But it is what it is, man. Right. I know he's been with her for a long time. That's all I need. Mean. You know what I'm saying? Long well, time. Well, hmm. let, let, let's have it right. 1989. Yeah. Hmm? 1989. Young it's black women, you... young black women like her, coming from mm -hmm. all the way in, in Woolwich, would have been, would have grown up in a very whiteified area. Definitely. And and obviously, you can hear from her accent, will have a strong English mm -hmm. culture installed in her. Yeah, she's from, uh, she's got her background. But, you know, these times, black people were wearing Chelsea boots and doing mm -hmm. all kinds of white behavior. We loved it. We fucking loved it, man. It was either pa it was either Patois or Cockney. We was doing it. We was doing it proper. Mm -hmm. Now, man, now we've all fallen off, and we're just doing. We got road, get me, which is just our own little culture that we've made over the last 30, 40 years. We got road. Mm -hmm. Then we've got the whole Patois. Now we got the the African bad boy thing, the Somali bad boy thing. So now we've got a little bit more that we can work with. But at, at that time, it was it was you were yardy or you're fucking gangster. Do you know what I mean? And the man then would go from patois to, to rhyming slang. Mm. You know what I mean? In, in 1989. Yeah. Apple and Bomber Clark pairs. <laughs> I was I was uh, I was leaving school. I was leaving school in 89. Nah. Yeah. yeah. Just about so to touch know. these roads. And so you, them so up. So, mm. so you know, yeah, it was, it was either, yeah, it was either. Uh, Taxi ride. No, nah, it was, it was, no, nah, no, nah, I'm saying it was either, uh, like, yardy, you know, Caribbean yeah. gangsterism, yeah, in terms of a style or whatever bars you're selecting, your little clothes or whatever, or it's gonna be chippy, chippy and da da da, and the UK road man, but then the language, the language. Mm -hmm. There's going to be a lot of Cockney. Obviously, we start slowing down on the Cockney as we get into the 90s. But she's this is 89. Obviously, she's going to... I, I don't see... You don't, don't understand. They're actually right next to each other. White gangsterism mm. and yeah. the road thing was... They was they were like that. More connected yeah, than the now. They are I'm not the saying other, I'm yeah, saying No, no, no. I'm, just, I'm, I'm trying to give you the background of London. Of what it yeah, was I'm, not saying anything wrong. I'm not saying anything wrong with the, 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 the togetherness, but I'm just saying if he's gonna take her in as a mold in like a like she's a plasticine, yeah. then he should he should really take her to a tailored uh, get me. This is how you dress. <laughs> this is how you dress. You get me. I don't mind paying for you for you to get your tailored suit. Mm. Do it no, properly. I hear you, I hear you, I hear you. So Even I'm though saying, it was it was a thing for the time, it was a thing in some areas. As in dressing like and doing all of that. For us, yeah. 89, yeah, would be kind of right where people were dressing like that, click suits and all of that type of stuff. And okay. you know, Paco and all of this type of stuff. We still we were still having all dayers and shit. Them times there. Yeah. It was about to get lock off though, but yeah. As soon as we reached uh 1990, it all went left. Mm -hmm. I was fully on road then, so I know what was going on, you know what I mean? And yeah, the Yardman thing kind of came a little bit like that influence of Yardies was came a little bit after that time. So I don't know what she's doing there. You know what I mean? It's definitely more R and B. You know what I mean? That type. Oh um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's more uh, yeah, funk there, yeah, soul to soul kind of. You know what I mean? Those type of yeah, funky dread and all of them type of women with barlet, jane business. You get me? It's a groove thing. All of that. <laughs> yeah, that's the only other time I see girl with barlet or, or low cut, and they had the same type of hairstyle. That's the last place I saw it when jane had hair. The group. Yeah, when they had was she was she was she proper married to him or she just is this wife just there for I token? Think he was married, proper married. I don't know. Um I wonder when. Mm. 
probably took years or something. And had kids. Probably, he probably took kids two years before he died. Did they have kids together? Uh, she, I think, yeah, she, she did have kids, didn't it? With him. I think she did. She not say she they had kids. I thought I'm assuming so. Did she say it in the beginning? I'm, I'm not sure. No, she didn't say that. Um, she said he he took on her kids. I don't know if they I had kids. Yeah. Okay. He said he was going to have kids with her. He, she he had say two, it. He, she had two kids. Right, already. Some okay. other, something else. So I don't know whether they had they got their own. Yeah. Um, I'm sure it will come out soon if, if that happens. But if, 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 if they, not, they then yeah, she's gangster chick, man. If, you, if they don't have kids and they were together that long, that's, that's saying yeah. something. That's grooming, mate. Groom there. Perfect. <laughs> perfect chick. You know what I mean? Like, perfect cockney. She's being, she's a gangster's mole now. I said it from the beginning. You know what I mean? He's going to teach her the ways of the force as far as he knows it. You know what I mean? It's romantic. But, yeah, it's not all evil and, yeah, like, thing, obviously, but it has a, is a, is a, is a, is a dark underbelly. As they would say, yeah. I mean, to the to what she's gone into. You know what I mean, a couple of years in, you're still doing poses, but after a couple of years, you'd be holding gun, keeping food in your yard, doing all of these type of things. You know what I mean? She's not going to mention it, but she, you know she what was that she was that chick, you know, that held everything like an idiot. Yeah, I know that well, type of guy. Idiot, yeah. mm. That guy has a preference. I know what type of preference a woman he likes, and that's. Or the yeah. woman that, yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know. I could be wrong. Okay. Okay. Well, I thought yeah. she was his preference and that was it. But, yeah. Uh, but if he didn't have any choice for it, that means he must have... Come on, he must he's have a gangster. Him. He must have girl out there and, you know... Yeah, he's got, yeah, he's got his... Yeah. But this is the main wife, you know. That's what she thinks, guys. If he had... Because where's his kids? <laughs> Has Dave Courtney got kids? I don't know. I don't, I don't really... That's the question we must be asking still, yeah. Yeah. It's, Maybe we can do more research. Mm. Yeah, boy. Okay. Interesting. It's got a funny shape head shape, though. Yeah. It's from the side view, isn't it? Or is it just the camera angle or something? I don't know. Hit the like button, family. Slap that PayPal. You're done now. Where you look at, man? Jump on, jump on. Please. That means the head is really flat on top, like, like it's showing. But that hair is like it down in it so much. But look at that. That's like a head, half of a head looks like the Superman sign. I can't with you. <laughs> diamond, shit like a diamond. Literally. Nah, this is bad. You get me on the back side, it looks like a diamond, isn't it? Just get that little angle there, mm -hmm. then it goes down. It's a very, it's, it's a very odd style. Mm. It's very odd, yeah. An odd shape as well, it's mad. Do you, do you yeah. not think she was groomed into the hairstyle as well? You look too much, man. Yeah. Yeah. I, I think she was, uh, yes, yeah, I bet. You I, I bet she having was hairstyle, you know? I bet she was NFB and P. I bet she was all of them things. <laughs> You're there caping for it. I'm just saying, no, 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 no. This girl's BMP and shit. Nah, she worked, man. She... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, dear. Grant Mitchell and, and Russ Clark. It was different. I, I watched it recently. Yeah. I watched it. I bought it off uh, Amazon Prime. If yeah, anyone wants to. tell you how that started. Yeah, go on. This, these, these students come around to do this film. I can't remember the name of the film, but I was meant to be um, playing someone called Bethany in it. And... Um, Dave was another character, and they were filming this thing, and Dave went, this is shit. <laughs> he went, this is shit, he goes, yeah, let, me, uh, let me direct something. And he's got these cameramen, and just took over this thing, and this hell to pay was born. No script on nothing. Dave went, no, oh, no, come on, this would be better. And that's what he's done. He's just done this thing with no money, no nothing, and just done hell to pay. And he put Terry Stone in the film. And yeah, then Terry Turbo, that, yeah. Yeah, that was Terry's that, that, entrance. The, yeah, that's the thing, yeah, because Terry Turbo used to do a thing called Arid Nation, One Nation, a promotion called One Nation. And um, how Dave was involved was when they was cashing up at the end of the night, Dave used to go or have a couple of his security there with them, take the money from the door to the where the office, you know what I mean, so no one gets robbed. And keep the money so, safe. Yeah, yeah, and that's how Dave was linked with Terry Turbo. And Terry was just one of, loads of Dave's mates was in the film. Terry was one of them. And mm. that's how, that's, 
Toby as Toby's first acting role ever. And how did you get on with all of Dave's team, all the doormen? Loved them. All Loved respectful? Them all. all of them. All respectful, yeah. Was there was there any occasions where you felt not unsafe around Dave, but unsafe around the situations Dave would get himself into? Many, many a time. There's times when, listen, I've been in, I've been in quick save, yeah. I don't know if you remember the shop, quick save. I do. I was shop anyway, but I was shopping. One minute, my kids were at school. I was shopping. Dave rings me. I've got to go and come home. We used to drive a Rolls Royce at the time as well. And um, he's going, someone's been stabbed. Yeah, and I had to drive this person that had been stabbed. I don't know that I didn't know the ins and outs of it, but like I've got to drive this person to some doctor that's in Birmingham. Hold on. I had like getting on driving up this fucking motorway with this person in the back of my car, like thinking, I can't drive too fast. If I get stopped, oh, I've got to explain this. But I can't drive too fast. I don't want to die in my car. Like, uh, how have I got into this? Like, how have I, I was shopping a minute ago? I've got to ring people to go and get my kids, and I'm doing, why am I doing this? Or People are on the run, I've got to go and take them, go and get their clothes, clean them, take them back. Just just in what the situations, just stupid situations, like very hairy and like scary. Oh, it didn't put you off. Because like, you know, like when you're in it, hmm. it's, you know what I mean? It's not, you're not, you don't look at it like that, do you? There are times when I've gone, like, how have I got hair? Or like, what the hell? Like, what about any times where you saw David mm-hmm. in a. Has he been shot, stabbed? He got shot, but not while, not while I was with him. Oh, okay. He'd been stabbed, yeah, before, like, yeah, on the door, doing things on the door and things like that. But, like, so he never come back home covered in blood and you had to deal with it? None of that, no. Right, okay, so you never, no. had to, you never had to nurse his wounds? No, I never had to nurse his wounds. No. Was you fearful that one day you might nurse his wounds? Mm, yeah, like, to be honest with you, like, listen, Dave, when, whatever Dave used to do, yeah, however, however it might be, to someone else like I, I, he could always justify it to me mm. or I'd always be able to justify it I'd be like mm. you know like, I'd be always a, I, you know I don't never think he was never a bully you know what I mean and I, I'd always be I'd never think well that was a bit nasty I, there was nothing I don't think Dave ever did anything not you know what I mean disgustingly horrible I don't think he ever done anything like that he wasn't that way he's always been doing something for someone helping somebody uh, that's what I got from Dave. To, to me, I just thought this guy seems like a loyal bloke. Because anyone that knows Dave. Oh, poor Dave, man. You let out this slander. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck Dave Courtney, man. Shame Fuck on you, look, man. Mm-hmm. Nah, but, nah, it, it, yeah, no, nah, it's all right. It's all right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No one cares about Dave Courtney, really, though, apart from that. What was he like? Was it a muscle man, then? Yeah. yeah. Was he a muscle man? What was I don't know, he just looked like Phil and Grant Mitchell. I'd be like his role, like, what did he do? Like, just he done protection work? Security, all sorts, been a okay. gangster, and um, acting, obviously. Okay. Yeah. He's, like, early on this podcast yeah. kind of thing as well. Okay. Yeah, one of the early people who did it was Dave Courtney. You know what I mean? He's been with my friends. Doing like Black the Ripper and that, doing um, weed ones. And um, he's uh, another white boy who's come to my barbershop. He's like, a, he made music or whatever. He did a video of Dave Courtney, I think it's at his yard, in a snooker, playing, they're playing pool around the table. And he did okay. that interview. So, yeah, there's the bad times that Dave Courtney's, um, let's come across Dave Courtney's. Works or what he's been doing he's since he's been, you know, I mean, come off the television, he's come on to jumped onto the internet, and he's taken to it like a duck to water. So, yeah, Yeah, Dave's not gangster. Dave, gangster. Or he's got a relationship yeah, Dave's with Dave. He's speaking very well of him. Yeah. The people that don't know him too well, they, the they've that, got something to that, say. Yeah, they're the people that read in the paper. That they're talking about someone they know from out of the paper. They don't know Dave himself, yeah. Describe Dave Courtney mm. as exactly the man he was. Caring. All he wanted to do was... Make, Dave used to say this. From the minute you get up to the minute you go to bed, yeah, I'm going to make you fucking laugh. 
Well, it doesn't matter how bad the situation was, how heavy it was, he'd always find something to perk you up, like, che- you know what I mean, cheer you up. It's a walk away from everyone, leaving them smiling. So if anyone, anyone goes, oh, do you know that, Dave? Yeah, nice geezer. Mm. So just be nice, and nice will follow you. And that's how, that's how he was. And throughout your relation, I mean, you've done mm. a lot of partying, didn't you? Mm. We used to vape all the time. Like, we used to go out, like, like say, we'd go out Thursday, and we didn't go home until, like, Monday. Like, we did, he used to do a rave on a Monday morning. It's used to start on Monday morning at Futures in Deptford. Do you remember Cheeks? It used to be called Cheeks. Vaguely. In Deptford, Harry Edward used to run it. And it became Futures. But Dave used to do a rave there. Like, it started on a Monday morning. Mm. And it was called Crazy Mondays. And we'd go there, and, like, DJs and all the security used to be there. Like, we'd just, just party central all the time, just party in Monday all the time. Monday morning like, rave, you know. Every rave, the boogie barge. People used to want to turn that? up at the rave. Just, like, no, when you really... That's real crafty. When you really got nothing better to be doing, boy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah Monday that morning. That's yeah, that's there's a select, few, there's a select few that you're going to be seeing there, you know. There's a that select, is a next time. Select. You know, like a special type of person. Special clientele, bro. Yeah. Bro. Self-employed, self-employed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Self-employed. You see all the people you have to work all weekend. No, they just they work. They probably just work five in the morning till I don't know. Twelve. That's it. Monday morning, you know. Monday morning. I could I could only imagine who was in there. Mm. Monday fucking morning. Like, how are you gonna feel on the way to that? Especially if you had to come from far. But they, they're all drug addicts, isn't it? So I come, out, I come out a rave. I come out a rave on a Sunday morning before, and it was it was scary. I had to run yeah. back in the rave. I came out to smoke a cigarette, <laughs> and the sun was beating me down. Yeah, the sun was beating. It was Sunday morning, and there was like aunties and the at the bus stop, which was right outside. Uh-huh. The yes, the church. Too, aunties out there. I'm trying to burn a zoo. There's art is out there, and I'm like, nah, I, I think the night is officially ended now, you know. Yeah, and when you go back in there, it's just zombies on, on whatever drug, just zombie down. Yeah. Like. yeah, that was a that was the first and last time I went there, man. I said I'm not going there. I'm not going there again. I've never no, I haven't. Everyone's always asking me, come uh come uh what's it uh what's it what was it called? Fridge or something like that. Come fridge bar, or whatever, man. Yeah, man, we'll go fridge out. I'm like, what? Uh, you know what? Fuck it. Go in there. You see every ex Brixton ting man. Like, <laughs> no, man, it's the, the, the gal, them just so rough around the edges, you know, like, ugh. Uh, yeah. Proper trampy. Trampy. Man, them will go there, like, brother, I go, what, like, go home, man. It's really not that deep. Yeah. Oh, but there are some man. people that love raving. Like they just, I don't know, if, I don't know if it's because they're like they're on the drug scene, but they just yeah. love raving like that. They would rave midweek. Yeah, <laughs> ten o'clock <laughs> in the morning. Man, don't want to go home. I'm like, this ain't yeah. even fun anymore. It's not. You got you got responsibilities. <laughs> yeah, crazy Mondays would have all them DTs and all of them guys. Um, you know, uh, I don't even know the garage guys basically. Oh, um, okay. It was, yeah, it was like an after party. After, after, we after, East, after party. Uh, yeah, yeah, it was the after, after, after party. Yeah, once we were in Farringdon or one of them other clubs, EC One or whatever, then we would go crazy Monday. Someone would find the address, and then we'd go to the the thing. Yeah, you know I mean, it'd be a house somewhere. Do you get what I'm saying? But mostly in East London. So, yeah, coming out on a Monday morning and seeing an Indian auntie taking the picnic to school is a madness. In your silk shirt and all of that, sweat it out. It's like oh, it's horrible. It's just like, yeah, you feel like scum. <laughs> like, look at me, dirty stop out, man. I need to. Yeah. So if this is if this is Crazy Mondays, they're on the mm. way to work, and you're on the way to Crazy Mondays. Nah, nah. The way it works is, it, it, is, is it's it called Crazy Mondays because is it when it finishes? After? Yeah, no, because it's Sunday. Night, night, yeah, it Sunday starts, night, yeah. So it's Monday, basically. Wow. So by the time it finish, whenever it finishes in the daytime, yeah, we that. But yeah, usually yeah. about eight o'clock, nine o'clock in the morning. Okay, and yeah, people yeah. on the school run wow. in East London. It could be East Ham or somewhere like that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean, Aussie. Mama Ards and that. 
just walking up the, the road, looking at you funny in your silk shirt and sharp shoes. Like, yo, yeah, it's disgusting. You know I mean? it even feel, it doesn't even feel right. It's nasty. You know what I mean? But yeah, the rave was good though. Can't lie. Yeah, those are the garage days, man. Yeah, boy. Yeah, so what's she saying now? Yeah. Talking about the Raven scene. And how uh, Dave wasn't really that type of person. He's a really lovely guy. He just wanted to make people laugh. He made them laugh. Yeah, you know what? He loved him, nice. though. Mm. He did love him. Is that a trained response or is that genuine? Who knows? We don't know. <laughs> True. Yeah, who knows? Man? You know what I mean? Because that like, you only see it from one perspective. Imagine you've been out with no one else all these years, just dating. Yeah. You know what I mean, I'm not saying there's nothing wrong with it, but I'm just saying yeah. you don't know what it's like since before with uh, Roland and them, man. You know what I mean, with Roland, whoever was it, Speedy and thing, and then, yeah, all of a sudden, bam, Dave, for the rest of your life. I mean, they do. They do employ a lot of intimidation tactics. They do, regardless of. And I've seen. Yeah, I've seen it. Yeah. It's not nice, mm. especially to their women, though. They're, it's not a joke. But I mean, the real gangster thing is to try and separate the life. You know what I mean from your personal life. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because like your your woman and that environment's meant to be pure and do it, do it, but not for these type of. The woman's got to know because anything can pop off at the next minute. Say Dave got arrested, she has to be in the yard getting rid of certain <laughs> stuff. You know yeah. what I mean? She has to know the routine of like what's going on, right? So she's in the loop. And because Dave kind of made it my Bonnie and Clyde kind of thing, he was basically pillow talking as well. So probably she yeah, knew probably a lot more it. than yeah, like a normal woman. If you was really just she's your woman, they put her up on a pedestal and that's it. Yeah. But all this going to the prison and all of that type of stuff to meet the craze and involved in a march and campaign and all of that, you're deeply entrenched, love. It's mad. You know what I mean? Crazy. So, figure out. so what's she saying there? What's she saying there? Can we press play? Will be there how people are going to come so like we just party like non-stop and Jeez. then when the party finished yeah all the time when the party finished back to our house more partying yeah he had a good constitution didn't he he had a really good constitution yeah. <laughs> that's the word yeah very very good yeah he yeah. said he said to me that your relationship yeah. was very not so much open but you were so in tune with each other that you would say to him don't go and embarrass me. Don't cheat on me. If you want to do that, bring them home. Yeah, we do it together. Yeah, that's how we were. That, that we was we, we were open like that. Oh man. Very oh man. mate. Yeah, there it goes. Yeah. So she did so basically she didn't know what other things was about them, didn't she? No, she was into threesomes and all sorts, but they wanted it. That's what they want. So. You know what I mean? Well her. <laughs> you prepared her for, for such a circumstance. So now she thinks it's normal. Well, it was normal. It's crazy. She said she wasn't lesbian, but she don't mind some lesbian stuff. I'm out. Yeah, she does look a bit. She does look a bit lesbian. Um, what you want to <laughs> just a little that's bit. That's a very intense level bit. of honesty mm. that is between mm. couples, which, well, it, it's rare, isn't it? It's very rare. Couples predominantly. Mm. They lie to each other. Listen, trust me, listen to me. Men used to throw their women at us just because of that. Mm. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, men used to, and that's the strangest thing ever. Like, you know what I mean? Like, what? watching a man push his missus over to me, like, I'm going to talk to you. Like, oh, really? Oh, God. So hold yeah, on, for we, what reason? But yeah, we used to exploit that. It was good. <laughs> Oh, she became a groomer now. Oh, no. Yeah. no, no, no. Here we go. 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 Here we go.
<laughs> she was high off her face. She's a crack head. Why are you blaming like, the drugs, man? They like no, it. They like it. They like this stuff. Like she was high off her face. Dave used to supply her with drugs. Never was sober. Yeah. You know what I mean? Never. The best crack. Mad. Best. The mad. best. The best. The best Tina. Is that what man's calling it? Tina. That's the best Tina. Get me. Cells, yeah. If everyone can enjoy themselves, there's no problem. Well, there's no problem at all, exactly. So when we, um, when we first moved into Camelot, like it wasn't a castle at first, he made it into that. Mm. But like it was, in, in time, we got the money together to get that, like, you know, all right, we've got some money, what should we do now next? We didn't uh, even have a kitchen yet. And he goes, well, I've got a bit of money, what do you want? Kitchen or dungeon? I was like, <laughs> no brainer, <Thank you>. dungeon. <laughs> dungeon, of course. We're like, talking about that. I am done. Yeah, I'm dungeon, you asked me for, you should know that. Throw her in the bin, man. She won the dungeon. She won the dungeon. Pizza. Before the kitchen. She, she loved dungeon. She <laughs> loved dungeon. <laughs> <laughs> she loves dungeon. She loves dungeon. <laughs> you're dungeon. You're just having pot noodle and going dungeon. That's all you're doing. Dungeon yeah. vibe. Yeah. Take she away. Like, a bit like Bobby and Whitney. Yeah. Everyone thought she Bobby does was what I was thinking. Like, yeah. you know? <laughs> just... 100%. That's crazy. But she just like, she likes pain. She likes pain and all them things. Mm. You know the look. She probably whips him and stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Describe, yeah. The Describe the dungeon to me. Because oh. yeah, dungeon is business. famous, isn't it? It is famous, yeah. But um, Let me it, was a, it. It, was a, it was a it was like so on the side of the house there was a garage, yeah. So then he decked it out with all carpets. We had all metal equipment in there, little wooden things that you could get, no. you know, like stocks and all that. Yeah. Even though that's where his house is. Some bed. Oh, Camel, you know she's half Jamaican, yeah. yeah. He used to like, like to be nice and brown because he used to look anemic against me. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm walking beside him, he used to like to, like to be tanned. And um, yeah, the dungeon was a really, really busy, busy place and exciting place. Wow. But then people started venting it out as well. Like, you know, like on Wednesday afternoon, we'd have someone like a, a dominatrix down there, like with someone like. Yeah, was there, was there like things hanging from the ceiling and. Everything, everything you can imagine that's in the dungeon, we had it. Mm. And there was even this student, it was doing like um, a metalwork student. And he goes, oh, Can I make you a, a, a hanging cage? So he made this hanging cage, it's still there to this day, it's there. Mm. And he brought this cage around, and he goes, Hey, oh, no, hang it up. And I'm like, I've got in it. it was, we had a photo shoot in it. Oi, 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 oi. She got in the cage. Oh, Bird in a cage, yeah. yeah. Mad. Of her own, of her own back. So who was a sex slave? Him, him or her? Oh, Bayesian, yeah. The Bayesian part messed her up, yeah. It's true. It's true. I can't lie. I can't lie. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> oh, that's it. Oh. Yeah, she just wanted to do limbo on some crack. Right. She Mad don't mind doing a case, though. It's true. It's true. Mm. Tweet a bird. I think I don't bird. know. It sounded like they both just jumped in the cage. Ah. Uh? It sounded like everyone was going in the cage. Like, oh shit, you got a cage. I don't know, bro. Revolving I'll... doors. There. They had revolving I doors. I was like, who the dominant person was. The cage. Yeah. Well, it's gonna have to be. It's gonna have to be him. Since you lot are saying grooming, oh, I, so, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. You lot can't switch it now. And no, I ain't, I ain't changing. You lot can't. This is even more now. confirming. It's more confirming. It. <laughs> this it's is really a reaffirming of the grooming. You get me? It's fully entrenched. Yeah, you got dungeon in your yard. You would never thought of that, huh? From your West Indian Bayesian background, you would never thought of that, Dave. Come on, Jedi. You get with Dave. He's the first Randy. What? 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 Gangster Randy. Yeah, she got with gangsta. Well, if Randy. anyone knows about whips and chains, it's Jamaicans. I don't know what this person's oh, talking about. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what Zep is talking about. <laughs> you got me there. You got me there. Hey, hey, me there. Like, I need to tell you. <laughs> no. Whips and chains, yeah. I just thought they, they would be uncomfortable with it. You know what I mean? Just like the rest I, of us. I, 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 I
Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I need to know he was in chains. Beat him. Put a deal down. Oh, anyway, it's me. Whoa, whoa, whoa there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Well, if he's, if he's the gangster version of Randy, I can only assume that's what was going on in the dungeon. No, but they're fun, and they're fun, they're like that. They're like getting pushed up in their and, and, and goddess type people's reaching there. Nah, 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 nah. She and was doing the most to him. Doing the most. Yeah, she was. Scratching his back and all sorts of weird stuff. She was born as back. She was, oh, that's, I can't imagine. Erika, you love to jump to conclusions, man. Fuck you. But you know, them type of, them type of, man, like them, they're like them, they, ugh. She they're was like, doing like, 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 like they shit pushed him. No, he might, he might be like a newborn baby type. You know, the ones they would just like to dress up as a baby. Yeah. You know, like, like. Cold hearted. All right. We'll see. But it's hanging there to this day, like people, everyone wanted to add bits to the dungeon, now. Like. And how did you, how did the neighbours take all that? Oh, when we first ever moved in there, like it was nice having Dave Courtney in your street, like oh, Dave Courtney lives there, like. Mm. But then, you know, just the uh, activity on the roads and all that. You know, their, their houses were safe because Dave lived there, mm. lived on our street. But like, it's just the, the noise, the activity, the. Like our house was an open house. Like you could just knock on that door. Dave used to say, get to me and I'll help you. you get to my door, knock on my door and ask for help and I will help you. And so they did. They came and they knocked and he helped. Mm. And it was in abundance. Like it was relentless. I'm not even joking. I'm but not how did her children in all this like, then? Like, how did what? How was her children in all this? Madhouse. That's some, a great some point gang, still. That's a great point. Yeah. Some gangsters want peace in their hands. They don't want no all that yeah. activity not away from the yeah. house. Yeah. Yeah. It's not. <sighs> Do you know when he first started doing the like writing the book when he's done his book? He's writing his book and that. Which one? Uh, um, stop the ride. I want to get off. get off the first book. Yeah. So then after that, people started coming, knocking, wanting his autograph and things like that. Then they did not stay in the night. Like I don't even know these fucking people. Like partying. Just because they like you, Dave, don't mean they're not nutters. But you know. Did you spot things that say Dave wouldn't do? Yeah, he'd be asleep. Like I can't go to sleep because the bathroom is opposite my daughter's bedroom. Like these people going to the bathroom, I want to know that they're not going into my, my daughter's room. I've got to stay away because I don't know who the fuck they are. Mm. Just because they like they call me, don't mean they're not fucking long ones. Like fucking hell, like what's doing in my house? Get the autograph and fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I want them to do. We know what you're here for. Yeah. Was there a lot of vampires? A lot of a leeches? Lot of them, yeah, absolutely. Was Dave too kind to see it? Was you the eyes? He was just... He's got a big just heart, so not, Yeah. Do you know what I mean, though, when I say it's, that? That's what I mean, I know. He used to make me cry. I'd see him sleeping, I'd cry. Yeah, he used to make me cry. Just how, how they... How they We're gunning for him. How they roughed him up, yeah. That, that wasn't nice. It wasn't nice. I mean, you've got to tip your act to him for being so resilient. Yeah. He kept moving forward, didn't he? He kept moving forward, yeah. Mm. Don't get me wrong, he did have his days when he'd go like, oh. But yeah, he kept moving forward. Because obviously you saw a side of Dave that nobody was ever privy to seeing. Because yeah. he, ha he had to put the actual yeah. ground like this, yeah, didn't exactly. he? Yeah, exactly. Absolutely. But like, you know, like, like the grass thing. That, like, you know, I was there from the beginning, like I say, the start of that to the end of it. When people go, look back, Dave called me to grass. Don't fuck it, don't, don't come to me with that. Mm. Because I'm telling you now, that was ridiculous. The fact that they arrested him and carried on taking him to court, knowing they heard when it was all plotted. They heard when they fucking plotted to fucking put the cocaine in this woman's car. They heard it all. The police was You're listening. You're definitely not tripping. Um, you know what I mean? Mm. Facts. Uh, what came I talking about? Where we was. Um, sound like Auntie Jenny, or is he tripping? No, no, so you you're not tripping. You know sound like definitely Auntie Jenny. So, 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 it's hard, right? <laughs> Yo, where's the chat gone? Why is it? Why am I just seeing Kemo? What happened? Kemo come like Gurdy. 
What's going on? Are you not disengaged from this story, have you? Uh, they have given up. No. no. no I, I, I reckon they have, bruv. I'm not blaming anyone. I'm just oh, telling you my... Yeah. Answer. It's only Kemo and... What's the view, Sam? It's only Kemo and M and whatever speaking. Yeah. Right, anyway. We're nearly at the end anyway, family. Well, actually... Not really. Halfway. I don't, yeah. Maybe yeah, I'll have yeah, to certain point. Yeah. For, them men, yeah. to, for them to arrest Dave. That was just so, and then to carry on taking him to court. Like, are you joking me? Like, Do you think the police wanted the public to think he was a grass? Of course they did. Of course they did. Because now, to this day, they don't, they don't even mention Austin Warns, who the, the thing is actually about. They mentioned just Dave Courtney, alleged, like, like, um, a police informant, allegedly. Because it was said in open court, they were allowed to just do that. Because they've got the power to squash that. That's, I know. Just like that. I know. Which would be fair for you. Because mm -hmm. you're it's still here. Yeah, exactly. And I'm telling you, like, there's no way on, like, Dave, that, like, that's, that's the furthest thing from him. That, like, he's not, that is not him. Mm. He's not that. An informant. Are you joking me? You know, now Austin used to like, I'm, I'm <laughs> Nick. Like, 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 <laughs> like, like, and they want evidence Nick like, took, taken out, out of the case so they get off it. And I'd meet Austin, give him the money that they've given me to give him. And he'd go and do it. Mm. So I know what he, I know what he was doing around us. But he had to, and, and when he came to us and asked, it said to Dave, they want me to explain why I'm, why I'm hanging around you. And that's how you know, and Dave went, oh, right, do that. And he goes, yeah, like, so I'm going to just say that, like, you, you gave me the names of two two girls in your club that sell cocaine. Like, and Dave went, all right, then, say that then. What names do you want me to say then? He goes, oh, Kim James, which is a real name, and some other girl's name, which was a fake name. But the Kim James was real. Mm. But what it was was they wanted to know what prompted you to go and look in Kim James's car. And he goes, I was acting on the, on the word of my informant. They went, name your informant. He went, I'm not willing to do that. They went, you've got 24 hours. So then he ran around to Dave and went, Dave, they'll ask me to do it, right? That's what he said. But that's why he was asking Dave to do that. Right. The book, listen, it's in this. It's in here. What's this book called? Bank Coppers? Bank Coppers, yeah. It's in this book. Because there's a picture of me, me and Dave in the book as well now. Because they watched us up at Plumpted Common. We went up there, they had lip reading experts up there. That's Dave and Austin. I took that picture. Come have a look, come have a look. Yeah, I took that photograph. And that case, you know where, where they're saying about Dave being the informant, it's all in there. So there's evidence and documentation that can... Documentation, yeah. That can yeah. Clear, clear, all up. clear any questions. Yeah, and it, it, you even ask yourself, why did they even take Dave to court then? Why did they even put him through all of that then if they knew that? Because he could have got another belly button that he didn't want. That's good you brought that in. Down to that. Do you know what I mean? And I just bit things like that used to make me used to break my heart. Like, he's not a grass. Why would you do that to him? Like, what the hell? Like, I suppose they tried <sighs> every way to get oh, him, and that was the yeah. low hanging fruit, wasn't it? That was the low hanging yeah, fruit. Yeah, I just felt it for him, man. It's like, oh no way, man. What about the time that he, he went to court and you ended up punching someone in the face <laughs> a few times? Now that was him. That was Austin. Yeah. So Dave, mm -hmm. Dave told me on and off camera, mm -hmm. and I thought it'd be nice to hear it from you. Right. Because you would have started a show. <laughs> okay. So what happened? So we was going to Bow Street because they said to them, do not put me within punching distance of that fucking of Austin. Because if I see him, anywhere I see him on site, I'm gonna, I'm gonna I'm gonna lay him out. This was the copper. This is Austin Warms, yeah, the bank copper. He said, Don't put me within punching distance of him. And they'd done, they kept him apart all this time. And then one day we've gone to Bow Street Magistrates Court. Dave dressed as a cool jester at the time. Yeah, because he's like, it's, it's a joke. How are you even taking me to court? I'm, I don't care if you find me for dressing like his. Find me, because I think the whole thing's a joke anyway. And we're going through the metal detector, and I just hear this like, load of commotion going on. And, and like, Dave's walking back towards me, because I'm trying to go through with the metal detector thing with the baby and everyone else. And Dave's walking towards me, and he's like, like, I, like I could see he just hit someone. I was like, what's happened? He goes, I was fucking just done Austin. I was like, what? He goes, yeah, he's over here. And I looked, <laughs> I looked. Dave's walking out trying to get all the boys out of the court. And Austin is like, these this two um, court um, security guards are picking him up off the floor, Austin. So he's facing me, he can see us. 
they're not facing me. They've got their back to me. They've got an arm each of him. He's facing that way. Picking him up on the floor, putting him on the chair. I've gone, what? The dad goes, yeah, he's over there. I was like, is he? Oh, yeah, see him. I fucking start running towards him. And I could see him, see me. And he's trying to go because he's trying to, he's still dazed from Dave fucking whacking. And he's trying to get himself out of this because I'm coming towards him, but he ain't said, he ain't, he ain't vocalising it to these two guys. They still got him like that, trying to get him on the chair. I just ran over to him. I was like, fucking give him a combination. I was like, <laughs> like you beating my ass. <laughs> Man, my children. You know what I mean? Broke bread with me, you cheeky cunt, and you're doing this to my... You know what I mean? I just fucking I just pummeled him. Like, I swear, my hands were hurting. I went to town on this geezer because I just thought, how dare you do this? Mm. Do you know what I mean? It's the worst kind. But no one got arrested. Yeah, you know what I mean? He deserved it. Mm. They knew what they were doing. That's why they didn't nick Dave for it. Because they knew what they were doing. They are taking a liberty, taking him to court in the first place. Now, when Dave come around my house... He brought this with him <laughs> and he said he hasn't got too many, so mm-hmm. he was going to take it back. We was going to use it. But then after we spoke for hours, yeah. he said, I want you to keep Dave that. Dave. So, and I will keep it. But I put mm-hmm. this up in the foot of me and Dave. So that's yeah, that's Dave as the court jester, the court jester, the court jester should I yeah. say. And that was the day that Jenny, the day. Jenny done a combo on the copper's face when he was tied up. Combination. Guard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, that's it, that Bow Street magistrate call. Well, yeah. if you have cops in, in your house, if you have policemen in your house and you're having whatever you... Whatever yeah, it's a madness. What is you this? name with dogs, isn't it? You name with dogs, it is what it is. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Do you expect the policemen to be loyal to you? That's crazy. It's true. That's crazy. You think your average black woman could do that? No, no. That's one that's with a gangster, bro. A British gangster, isn't it? Smoke. Even what he done, punching the fed. Like, yeah, we couldn't do that. We could, but you know what I mean? We're going down, bro. Remanded in that. Yeah. Well, she got a good story to tell. Isn't it? You don't, you don't yeah, it's a bit jaded, though. It's a bit, it's a bit one-sided, you know what I mean? Coming from a from a from a from a groomer's perspective, you know what I mean, or being groomed or being yeah into the lifestyle. I mean, like you know what I mean. You you only gonna believe what Dave told you, you know what I mean, or you saw for yourself, yeah, I suppose. Right. But in the main, his explanation of what it is is definitely gonna be what you're taking. You know what I mean. Like, if he says it's this, it was this. You know what I mean. So, I mean, she don't know that like, in the gangster, in the real gang uh, thing, they're calling your man a snitch. It's not only this this guy. You know what I mean? So, and in a book called what? Well, Bent Coppers, yeah. Bent Coppers should be called Bedfellows. <laughs> not good fellows, Bedfellows. Yeah, boy. Mm. So it sounds like she did have a kid for him or something. Yeah, I heard something about a baby. Yeah, taking a baby in court. Yeah, Mighty. lifestyle, isn't it? Yeah. Something she's gonna, she would have had to got used to. She would have had a little bit experience, as I said earlier, with some road stuff, but not yeah. on this level. I mean, I, mean I don't know about the open house. You got strangers coming yet in like, yeah, your house. Dungeon. Dungeon. You got people yeah. waiting at your dungeon. It doesn't sound like a decent place. A normal it sounds place, like a mad yeah. place. Yeah, a bit scary still. I yeah, it'd be interesting to hear what the kids have got to say because they'll tell. They're probably yeah. telling the truth. It's true. Yeah. Uh, they'll probably tell us the truth. Yeah. What? No more. Sunday was in front of the camera. Huh? Mm. No, nah, it's not encouraging enough conversation, Reeks. You know that, that I'm playing it. Like, I'm not getting enough interaction, so it's like only me enjoying it. Even me, I'm, I'm talking less and less. I'm just watching yeah. it. Uh, okay. Well. No, I mean, I mean, that's a good sign of it was actually entertaining, and interesting yeah. that you want yeah, yeah, you know, yeah. to listen to what's being said. You know, you listen. don't want to make no assumptions, but. Yeah, a lot of dry oh, yeah, snitching going on, you know what I mean? That's enough now, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Enough now, man. There's so many other things going I wanna, on. I want to talk to Rika anyway, Rika and Mag. Mm-hmm. Oh, go on, Rika and Mag. I think much. I'm just going to... Hmm? 
Der Name hat schon das her. Das her. Magazine, what are you up to? I'm cooking at the moment, you know, Jess. Okay, what's for dinner? Let's see. No, 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 you're not you're not looking at my food at all. How's that? All right, one sec, one sec. Well, Mag, these type of why are you looking like fucking black man uh, the traveler? Robert, yeah. Why are you looking like Robert Sankara or something? I don't know what you look like. You look like uh, <laughs> I think like black man the traveler in Pakistan Steve, or something. Steve Biko. You look like Steve Biko in this picture. Like, what's going on? Nah, stop all of that. Stop all of that. Joseph Coney. You look like Joseph <laughs> Coney looking. The last king of Congo or something. Yeah. yeah I'm right. telling you, man, you look like a militia man. <laughs> Beast of no nation. <laughs> where's that picture taken? <laughs> On holiday, innit? Yeah, yeah. I said where? When I was away. No, it's in that Kiev. That would be so difficult. Is nice. where? In Kiev. 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 Mm -hmm. Where's Kiev again? Is it <laughs> Ukraine. Russia. Yeah, where the war is right now. I'm going Ukraine, yeah, 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 I thought so. Yeah. What, what are you doing over there? I know you're black man, the traveler, but that was a joke. I didn't actually literally think he was going over to the country. That's it. That's it. Obviously not in the last two years. This was time ago. I went there. Was it really in Kiev? Yeah, it was. Legit. I went to Kiev and Odessa in 2018. Okay, what's the story about the AK? What's the story about the AK? Oh, there's just a shooting. This is just a shooting thing that you can have a go of. Ah, uh, yeah. you look like you're you look like you're entrenched in the underworld in this picture. <laughs> the underworld? No, nah, not at all, mate. Not at all. We yeah, say, right? Mike Courtney. Yeah. Speaking of speaking of Kiev, what are you cooking? Oh, <laughs> not, not Kiev. So I'm just doing some some brown cheese and then yeah, strumming. Uh, literally. Mac, you edited your whole fucking thing. <laughs> and I heard brown cheese and strumming. Stop saying yeah, Rika. Oh, sorry, I'm saying it loud. Sorry. Rika's like, yeah, my thing. Yeah. <laughs> No, she's still thinking about the groomed black woman, man. She's gone. Now. She, do you know what? She is the. I don't know. She was really groomed. <laughs> <laughs> no, but she was yeah. definitely a drug addict. That's for sure. You can't just say that. She, I can. I can well, see. She, drug wouldn't have, she wouldn't have got that way left on her own devices. That's what I. Like. She looks like yeah that. Nah. I don't know. She was. Yeah, she looks like a drug addict. Her mouth, her mouth's very like. You can just tell, man. So that could be the element of grooming. Oh, what's that? You see that? Oh, oh. Well, what, what is it? Very what is healthy. It? <laughs> is Rose Why are you laughing like that, Jessica? It wasn't me. That looks very healthy. Yes, sorry, you said it was roast what? Roasted vegetables. Well, I didn't even know. I was, what do you call it? Innit? It's just vegetables that I put in the oven. Okay. So, uh, and then you do that with some pasta or rice. I haven't even decided yet. Mm. Quick things, man. No gravy in there. Any gravy? No, no gravy, man. Oh, mate. Vegetables in the oven. I'm confused. What do you mean vegetables in the oven? With rice, rice vegetables. With rice. No, I don't put the rice in the oven. I'm still do the rice separately. Yeah, there's no gravy in there. It's, no, there's no, no gravy. Well, it's, it's, it's wet in it. It's not like they're not all separate. You know, if they were like all separate, mm -hmm. then they're gonna dry out. No, they're all together because it's like courgette, mushroom, and yeah. it's like it's gonna be a bit saucy anyway tomorrow. Mm hmm okay big up man big up well what did you want me to cook what did you expect? no 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 you know you know what if they think like dead food yeah that that that, 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 that kind of fits the the criteria of that that's dead food blood yeah, yeah that, that, that's what i mean yeah just vegetables with rice and stuff <laughs> or pasta he's not sure yet 
Rice or pasta? Oh, yeah, it could be pasta. That's even worse, but let's move forward. Oh, no. All right. Man, I'm going now. <laughs> <laughs> You got haters, man. You probably ain't even ate today. If your woman cooked that for you, would you be happy, Rag? Of course I would. Ah. Like what you done it first? We don't know what it tastes like. Second of all, it's like it's Thursday afternoon. Bro, you eat brown cheese, bro. You're nice. Like, it's, it's like I don't get what. Like what? I don't get what it is that I have to make. Like, you like Swedish food. food. <laughs> So like, we know your palate is slightly you different to. You want me, you want me to no, I don't know if I would cook that for anyone. They would cuss me out. <laughs> you want me to be stirring the pot for two Thank fucking you. hours? Like, I don't get it's it. It's got to be some chicken or something and stew chicken yeah, gravy know, or something. You know, you know I don't eat meat, though, so that's, again, not going to... Are you dying? Uh, yeah, so you know what I'm saying? Like yeah, that's good that you don't eat meat, of course. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this veggie's yeah. on its own, man. You've got to buy no, it looks seasoned still. Yeah, it's seasoned. You know, I hate this man. Bear seasoning on the vegetables. It's I'm at it. That's it, spicy and saucy. Vegetables. Right. <laughs> <laughs> would you still like would you do that <laughs> i just i never do what to be at the of the world, but you wouldn't be that happy happened. if you've ever made that forever so i just prefer oh made for me like, oh, oh jets no silverback's on about people he's missed out he made him a quick healthy meal exactly Wow, it's violation. Just <laughs> oh, violation. Has to get kicked out. Man. But it's not a violation when you're making it for yourself. So that's the that's the difference. I, you know I, mean? I still ain't got no ideas though. Like, how am I gonna up my game? And you like mm -hmm. just saying it's a violation. Like, how? Like, what do you want me to be making? I don't know. You just. I don't know what you're doing, but you just got to do more than that, though. Just see the like unfinished got meal. To do more than that. Yeah, just, yeah, it's just an unfinished meal. It's like, okay, I understand the veg. I can understand the rice. I can understand the pasta. But at least there's some chicken or something uh, that you can, or poultry or, or um, uh, chicken fish or poultry or like fish. What? No, man, I, I'm I'm just that guy in it. Like I, I don't mm. eat much red meat. And whatever, but I do eat chicken. Sure, sure. You gotta have you gotta have your protein. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, fair enough. Because you you're gonna do nuts, pause, <laughs> oh. cashews and everything. Allow it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Nut milk and all sorts. Allow it. Yeah. Don't follow them. These lot down that that road, man. It's it's vegany type vegetarian. Mm -hmm. Anyway, vegetarian is not that bad actually. Don't you know what I mean? They move the they move the fence. You can eat dairy. You know what it is, though? Mm. It's what people replace shit with. Yeah, so brown like, cheese. See, you see people are going to say they're, they're vegan and that. But they're eating a bag of soya, mm -hmm. which is defeating the object. And then again, your veggie cool. Great. That means you got that flexibility. You can have your egg. Rare, rare, rare. Yeah, so, that's what it is. But so then get they're cheese stuff. addicts. Yeah. Like, you're just having cheese and chips. Yeah, cheese with everything. You know what I mean? It's cheese and chips and, and all yeah, kinds of yeah, stuff. Yeah. It's like, yeah, it's just, it's, it's just, I'm just thinking about that. It's right. cheating, man. It's like cheating. Man. <laughs> You're going to eat egg, but not chicken. It's just uh, like, what are we doing here? <laughs> what are we doing here, man? You got what I'm saying? Like, it's cheating. You know what I mean? Like, uh, yeah, bombing, man. Man. Vegan definitely was a cult. I'm not involved. Full cult, man. Full cult. It's a full the... cult. You was yeah. a part of it. You was a part of it back here. Yeah, for me to know, innit? You have to be part of something. Get was into it, it. Huh? Was it a proper cult? It's scary. No way. They are. You know what I mean? Don't eat animals. Da -da -da -da. Extinction rebellion. All of these things went with being a vegan. It was mad. You know what I mean? What man to be marching up and down, and you ain't got no sustenance <laughs> in your stomach. <laughs> Don't even make no sense. You don't even eat it properly. So you're not even in, in your right mind. You get me? And then people talk about Illuminati and that stuff. Illuminati don't feed belly, man. Stop that, man. 
Let's get some food up in this bitch. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, they were all into esoterical stuff and all of that. Stuff. Oh, God. Yeah, it's mad. Very cultish, boy. I'm scared. I'm scared, man. Sorry, wow. Tiffany. You know what I mean? It's just like, yeah. So you, you can do this and you can't do this. Yes. You can do this and you can't do this. Okay. When you're in a room full of vegans, Rouse, all they're talking about is conspiracy theories and all of this type of stuff and how they're going on the next march. Like, Rouse. <laughs> it's just so 2019-18. You get me for me? Oh, don't yeah. kill me. You know, I'm too funny. Yeah. You don't need to write a book, you know. I swear down. Well, you are too funny. Not, yeah, what? vegan is not, it's not good looking. Trust me. If it was just the food and that, it would be cool. But it's a whole lifestyle. I mean, you've got to wear dashiki, you've got to do all sorts of stuff. That's right. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. So what are you, um, Mag? Straight veggie or vegan or what? What's going on? Vegetarian? Mag? What's that? What's the question? I said, what, are you straight vegetarian then? Nah, nah. To be fair, I double in all sorts, but just in general, when I'm cooking, I don't use animal product. Right, I get you. All sorts. Hold on, wait. That doesn't even make no sense what you just said. <laughs> no, so basically, so on a, on a standard a weekday, no, on a yeah. standard weekday, yeah, my meals yeah. will consist of some kind of veg, pulse, mm. salad, and then a carb type thing. So whether that's potato and this, or a soup, or pasta right. type dishes, or yeah. So that's how I'm going to do it. For the weekend, I might cook things with me, or I'll, if I might get takeaway, I'm gonna have something with me. I'll go to places to out eat out or yeah. someone so else. So how long have you? How long have you had this choice? Because this is not what made you as big as you are. Five years, right? Five years. Okay, okay, okay. That's well past the sell by date. So that has no influence on your physical condition. How you got to be so huge and all of that type of stuff. Pause. <laughs> you know what I mean, <laughs> yeah. So okay, so it was eating normal food um, back in the day, yeah? just everything. Chicken, I'd say, well, right? yeah, yeah. I still eat yeah. everything now. It's just that I don't make a habit of eating all this shit meat. Right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah Someone got massive background still. It's breaking up as well. That might be me. I got a. Uh, Anyone jumping on? The way they put it in the These are moving like short, man. Jump on, man. Come check to us, man. As much. Mm. We we'll start to talk about party and the I mean, it's your life. Yeah, there's no there's no puffy news, man. Yeah, other than yeah, the yard raided and all that. Yeah. Who cares? You knew that was gonna happen to you know later. <laughs> what about this? Out. My man, the snitching though, on that one. That, that, that. What's his name? Shaper or something like that. No, Shaper. Oh, the Shaper. faker guy. Shaker, yeah, yeah. Shaker guy, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I've been watching that on the RTM. The little clips. I don't know why man's just doing that, but I saw a compilation with uh, Little Titch and uh, the podcast, and then the interview. I saw what he, he actually said in the police station. And it don't look good for my man. That's what I'm saying. I mean, whatever he's saying now, it sounds like cat. I mean, I definitely, he's definitely along the snitching line. You know what I mean? And he snitched on himself as well. Right. You can't be a witness at the old Bailey for the prosecution. Doesn't make sense. You know what I mean? And say you're not involved and you ain't got nothing to do with it. That's crazy. How you did snitch. You actually you know what, bro? I just, yeah. yeah. I just find, I don't know, man. 
don't know. You know where it is? Like, obviously, uh, I, I just find it really difficult to get into subjects nowadays. Like, it's like my mind's just changed overnight. Do you know what I mean? And it's like, yeah, I do. I do. Yeah, I do. Exactly. You know, like, you know the way I don't care, sniper. It's it's yeah. mad, you know, bro. Literally, like, <laughs> I, 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 I don't care to a point where they, I, before I could not care or pretend that I cared enough to talk about it and then get a good conversation out of it. Now I'm just like, bro, I I don't know. Like, what can, what can I say? What can be? I just don't even know. Nothing has happened in the last year that I, I even give a fuck about. It's not one True. thing. No, like, wait, I'm lying. I think I, I don't know. There's been little things here and there, but we speak about it for like half an hour and then I'm just like, eh, I'm just, I'm done. So, yes. the Israel tunnels, the this, the that, brother polite, like none of it. There's been so much going on, nature boy, so we did a whole series on nature boy in right in a sense yeah a whole now you should know to be fair you it. missed out on the nature boy thing. i'm not gonna lie you know yeah. you missed out I on it right you missed out yeah nah. we was there when he got shift man was going over that for time, we was there man. when we when he no, got you shift. weren't he, i just touched up on it a little bit that was a you could have done a whole Segment on the nature no, boy. But this is a thing. This is a thing. I he think did, from, the, from the beginning. I think I mentioned it about two years ago. From the beginning to now, that yeah, was a no, whole. It definitely, it's definitely a whole. You know, just touch up on it briefly. That, that but these things yeah. run their course, though. Like these things run their course. Yeah, they don't, because I've been this like, was I've a lady divine. Even though developing as a story, I've been elsewhere, and a man can talk about nature boy, and he's getting that one point two people in his fucking one point two thousand in his comments. Yeah, I know. And when you go and check, and when you go and check King World, that's all his content has got. Yeah. And it's like yeah. when he's not yeah, but when he's not, yeah, no, when he, no, listen, when he's not talking about nature boy, it's like I I I hear you, but I'm not I'm not that, I'm not listen, yeah. I'm not like I'm not that kind of personality, like it really don't work for me. I can't sit and, and talk about and make a look in the mirror and feel like my whole thing is based off talking about nature boy, like it would annoy me. I won't even be able to press the live button to go live. You'd be like, "Wow, why are you just getting I don't live? think you should talk about it all for your whole time that you're on the stream. Well, but even like, if, you just... if you want to talk about what he got in terms of views, right. that's because you um King World, that's because he stays so consistent. Consistent, and, yeah, like, he was, yeah. And, and like, yeah. So he doesn't like even me, if I talk about Nature Boy, I'll big him up. I'll big up King World. Because I know that he was one of the most consistent talking about it. <laughs> and um <laughs> and the what the tea or whatever. But so I'm she was, like, yeah. She was like, she basically was someone that was. I don't care what she was. I don't care what she was. What I'm saying is though, when King World was going, I I linked up with him. I went on his channel. I chatted to him. He he came over, looked at the channel, <laughs> rare, rare. But I couldn't bring myself to get involved in the conversations about Nature Boy after the fifth conversation. When he was going live, I'd, sound, watch, yeah. just, I'd watch it a, a little bit, then I'd just be like, raw, like... What's the I point, Ar? Because out of those 1.7 thousand people, he must be getting decent decent donations. He must be out of that 1.4. So, but it's, he doesn't get it all the time. But he's got new followers. And if someone, if people want to find information about the update of him, they, they know where to go. I'm not saying yeah. that you should do a whole show on him. I'm not saying no. that's that's boring. But your followers are not like that. But if you want new people, more loyal people, and, pe and people that are a bit more consistent, some people just want that. They might just want a segment of different different topics. Yeah, you didn't, you didn't sell it to me. Still, never gonna lie. Yeah, it's not. It's your. It's not. But yeah, just a pointer. Just a pointer. But that was two, yeah. that was going back two years now. Now man's in jail. He's facing life. It's, 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 it was a hot. It was a. It was a. It was a good. It would have been a good thing, but there's many other different things, not just nature, boy. But his and his channel, World News channel. They they said they he's had to do so much different channels, because they just they will block it, block it. 
he started a few times as well. Anyway. Nah, I, sorry, Silver said I can't. I, don't, I really can't agree. Uh, what did you I'm say? Just, you're gonna jump on and talk about like if I'm not interested in a subject. That's why. Like, like, yeah, I'm not a jester, isn't it? Like I can't, I'm not. I just can't. There's the, if there's no interest in for me, then one of you lot gonna have to bring it, bring it up and talk about it. I happily go on mute for a while and do something else. I've got other content to create. I've got other things to do, but I can't do a live stream on a subject that has no interest for me. Especially if it's like a day like today, where like you know, there's not a lot. There's not loads of panelists floating around. It's not like ram with bare people that's gonna give their two pence. So I'm gonna end up playing a Dave Courtney fucking video for three hours. I only have three three panelists on, and and only have basically one panelist uh, talking to me about it for, through the majority of the video. That's not entertaining to me. That's that's me sitting in the studio talking about playing the Dave Courtney thing, and it's just dead to me. I I can't. I would rather lock it off and just chat to you, look. Do you know what I mean? If it's I'm getting more interaction with you lot, just talking to you lot, than me playing the video. Do you understand what I'm saying? So like, it, this, this is a type of person I am. I, I work off vibes, so it'd be hard. Like if we use the Nature Boy for example, I know if I'm not feeling the Nature Boy story enough to do a whole segment on it, but I'm now doing a segment on it, bro. You lot are gonna fucking switch off. You're not gonna be like, right, this brother does not want to be here. You know the way I start sounding. <laughs> That sounded like, yo, what's going on? Jens, you're right. I'm like, yeah, man. Like, yeah, so you get me. I'll be looking, I'll see like Kemo. Let's say Kemo's one comment would be there for like 10 minutes. No one else is typed. And I'm like, what am I doing here? Do you like, you know, so what, do you, what do you find more? Like you... I like to interact with people. Yeah. I like to be organic and interact with the people that are here. Like, do you prefer? Like, so, do you prefer? I hate that, man. One thing about so building, prefer, like, you build okay. what's your motivation? Mm -hmm. You build something, yeah. You build a, a listening base of people that yeah. expect one thing, and then once yeah. you don't give them that one thing, then you ain't got no listening base. Mm. So wait, so hang on. Cater, so, even though we were watching this, you, yeah. you can, I can cater to a bag of people that like this and they don't like that. Yeah, they don't. I, we don't like that. None of us yeah. like that. We like this, and I'm like, all right, cool. And I cater to that, and then. When 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 that thing's not there no more, you lot are all gone. Like not you lot, but whoever likes that thing, and it's only the people that like this are left. But because because I was catering to the other group, I ain't got no this stuff. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Like it, it's it. If you cater to a niche, you get caught in a niche. Okay. Does that make sense? That does make sense. But you know, in yeah. terms of the video, yeah. Paul talking in the chats or. People listening and the views are there, or people talking in the chat and there's no, there's not much people watching. What's your, what's your, what do you like? Uh, makes sense. So, from what I saw when we were watching, when we were playing the video, I don't know if I don't know if it was different for me. I could see there was a, just under sixty people watching, but obviously Kemo was the only person typing. But what would you prefer? Like lesser people watching, but more people engaging in the chats. Why does it have to be that? I'm just I just want to know because you, you, I think you stopped the video because people weren't talking in the chat. Yeah, I just I stopped the video because no one on the panel was chatting. Really, I weren't yeah. chatting. The video's been on for about an hour and a half. Yeah. We're halfway through the video. She's talked. <coughs> she said she talked about the thing that I saw the clip on, which is mm -hmm. uh, sex dungeon or whatever. She said mm -hmm. what she and I'm just like, yeah. And then I'm looking at the chats. No one's really engaging. So it seems people have switched off. So yeah, that's why I stopped it. It was like a combination of everything. Okay, okay. You know, now I can see people are slightly chatting and interacting. I can ask them a question and we can talk about anything. I just felt like people weren't engaging after a while. Do you not see that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw it, but then when I looked at the people that were listening, it was like, okay, it's not too bad. But yeah, I could have a hundred people listening. If no one if no one interacting with me, then it's just me talking. I don't do okay. that type of show. Like okay. if I have a so rant, if I ask you, yeah, I have a you rant, if I have interaction. A, if I have a rant, I have a rant. But I've never, whenever I just done a show where I'm, I'm just chatting, just chatting to myself. Mm. 
no interaction, no that. Then I might as well just record a video and upload it. Why am I live streaming that? Mm -hmm. I could just do. Jimmy, you know I mean? if if people want um, to hear me reacting to a video, then mm -hmm. follow me on Instagram and TikTok. Cause I do that all day long, every day. You get me? Yeah. I know. Or Jedi Online. I do reactions on Jedi Online. I watch a whole thing, whole half hour, ten minutes, twenty minutes, an hour long of me or someone, me and someone else watching something, and giving my opinions, and I'll just post it up. But you know, a live stream is a live stream. We're supposed to be live, interacting, talking, yeah, asking yeah, questions that you are. I'm answering you. Just, to me, this is more what I'm about: conversation, yeah, yeah. rather than just like, oh yeah, I've seen this video and I'm just going to play it. And even though no one in the audience is really interacting, I'm just going to keep playing it and playing it and playing it. It's okay. Like, mm. Yeah. Yeah, I, I take it if you was running a channel, you'd rather people watching and not and not chatting. No, no, no. Why did you just say that? No, no, no. Because no, out of the two options, you'd rather the uh, first. If option. I were, I, um, it depends, isn't it? Because sometimes I have like obviously because I'm I'm I class myself as a, as a viewer and I do go on different uh you know I watch different things. Sometimes I don't need to type in it because actually it might be just because I am watching something in it and it sometimes I can see that it. Even though the engagement ain't that great, people are people do have an interest because they actually are watching. They actually are watching because the views are there. But um, but you're saying obviously you you what you want you want a mixture. You you don't mind the views and the interaction. Oh, what, do know, do best? what do you think? What do you think's best? Because like, like it, it, it depends on it depends on what it depends on what the it depends on what's going on. A live stream that everyone's watching but not interacting. Then why are you doing that? Yeah, no, because to me, I feel like their interaction is watching. If you're watching, that means you're interacting still. Doesn't mean you don't have to say mm -hmm. hi. You're still interacting because you're actually you are actually taking yeah. time out of your day to make stream. sure that you're tuning in. That's not a live stream. It's a, and then there'll be no. Yeah, it's like watching telly. There's, no, there's no purpose of having a chat. And that's that's what I that's what what it's just me. I'm a viewer. Who am I? I don't. I don't. I'm not content creator. I'm a viewer. I'm just saying. That's what I'm no, saying. Can, if, 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 I, if I was watching, if I was playing a video and say there's 100 people watching, that means I do have an interest in what I'm showing because there wouldn't be 100 people watching. Well, but if I'm people, watching, if I'm. When, when, okay. are, when 100 people are watching something and they're interested, you know about it. You're going to have okay. a quiet chat. You won't have a quiet chat. But why would there be a hundred people watching them? Why are they just being nosy? It's usually, it's usually, yeah. be, it's usually like password. Or when people are arguing, <laughs> you find that the numbers go through the roof. And it can't be really through the roof. That means some of them are watching quietly. But... You're, no, you're, no, no, you're... no, no. They just appeared from nowhere. Someone told someone. Hmm? People just oh, enjoying yeah. us arguing about um, whether it was a grooming thing. See yeah. interaction, yeah. That's what mm -hmm. was drawing people. It weren't the, it yeah. weren't the fucking Dave Courtney, the chick talking on her own? No, <laughs> I don't think that that's what what have people watching. Okay. It was more the, no, the interaction hairstyle. based on what's on the screen. Yeah, you know, what I mean? you know how we are. We dissect. We dissect oh, things, yeah. but it can only go so far. You're right. Like sometimes it's that's why even me being offline is a good time to like clear out the system because I'm I was running out of content. I can't lie. Yeah. You know I mean, running out of things to like, oh, yeah, let me play this video and do this. And it's like, bros, it even became boring for me. You know what I mean? Boring, man. I keep, time I keep trying to that. tell people, but because like, people don't understand. Like, yeah. pe like, I keep trying to tell people, listen, I press a button yeah. and I invite people on to talk with me. Let's have rare, rare. I'm not here to just, oh, I want to go live and just talk to you lot. There's, there's next man that used to live stream. That's, what, that's the whole thing. Yeah, that's that not that's still, not my yeah. it's never been my thing. It's more sniper's yeah. thing than mine, you could even say. Mm. Sniper's better at it. I'm I'm not on that. I'm just to, to talk, to, to question, to be questioned. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I open up like I start my live streams and talk like, yeah, you lot ask me any question, and then people start mm. asking me questions and we build a conversation off that. Like yeah. I, in, I you know, but I think people think, oh right, as long as I'm watching. And these men are alive, that's enough. Now you got to do more. No, no, for me, I just have to, I'm just saying the viewer. I'm just saying the viewer. You have to interact. I feel, 
I you feel the panelists helped that. Yeah, you have to, back yeah. in the day, to be fair, back in the day, obviously it's changed, but back in the day, if you wasn't subscribed, I think there was a type thing. If you're watching from your TV, you can't interact anyway. So you literally yeah. are watching it from your TV. So, but I'm just saying, as a viewer, if if I was a content creator, which I'm not, and I don't think I'll ever be. If I put something on and a hundred people are watching, for me that's okay. I don't, I don't, either either interaction or watching. I think it's but they both are they both go hand in hand. There's no point in me playing a video and twenty people are just talking to me and twenty people are watching. I probably I prefer the hundred people watching and not interacting because they might nah. be all watching from their TV. That's but it's just nah, it's just because nah, nah, I just rather because then remember you got videos, you know. Um, yeah. Rika. If you want viewers, you got videos, you know, just upload a video. You don't need to go live and sit there live. Oh, you know, yeah. You, you know, someone you might be driving. Someone could be at work. People might be just doing things. They just, they're just literally at that point. Can't let you know that they're, they're around, but they are definitely yeah. listening. Cool, but the internet's a big place. Well, well, say YouTube's a big place, so there's enough people to jump on. If you lot are busy or whatever, cool, be busy, isn't it? I'm trying to... It's a live show. I hear you. You have to interact on the live show. You get me? There has to be an interaction. There has to be a relationship between you and your audience on a live stream. That's the whole point of a live stream. You're reading comments. You're reading donations out. You're 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 letting panelists on. You're you're answering questions. You're like that's an interactive show. If you just if it's just you and whoever's watching, but no one's interacting, that to me is a dead show. Because I'm not okay. here just to like, just to watch a video, and no one chatting. You I know? see. I see. Do you know? I've been on one. I've been on someone's panel, and they've only got one person in the chat talking to the host. So yeah. is that is that something good? So as long no, as that one not. person in the chat's talking to the host for the whole time, is that that's one person? Really, that's not really for me. That's not for me. Oh, no, exactly. Uh, still an interaction though. It is still interaction, exactly. Oh, I don't know. It's just a mixture. It's just, it's just, I'm a viewer in it. I'm not, I'm, who am I? Who is me? No, I feel, I, I do feel that pa panelists have to chip in. You know what I mean? It depends on what type I, I of panelists. Get... Yeah, it depends. You could have a, you could have a bag of panelists on your show mm -hmm. and they're not even saying much. I know, but I'm saying like they've learned now. That if they want to talk about something, you better bring some video or bring a video or send me something on WhatsApp. Yeah. You know what I mean? Then I'll play it. You know what I mean? And you take full responsibility for it as well. <laughs> yeah. This video was given to me by, you get me? It's like, yeah, that's how I work sometimes. You know what I mean? I don't know what's coming up. You know what I mean? My reaction is going to be organic because I don't know what's going on. And sometimes I do. Shit. Yeah. So, an audience in that respect that's when they're being interactive and they're putting links in and did it do it that's what you mean, you know what I, mean? Mm -hmm. I think yeah the, the panelists definitely got a lot to ask for they're asking also the host yeah that, that what we're talking about next when it should really be your panelists oh i saw something this week you know what i mean we should talk yeah. about what do you think about this jets and did it do it well did it do it and that makes it more interesting and more interactive and then we can have debates and discussion over it yeah. what well, i find it's, it's difficult. Yeah. It's difficult. i find oh. people nowadays they kind of more will shut down a subject that yeah. there's, there's room to talk on because mm -hmm. they're not feeling yeah. it or whatever but even they are feeling it just like just shut it down and once it's shut down then you ain't got nothing new to talk about yeah so you told that person basically shush man whatever man shush that's bullshit. and then they've shushed and then it's like, yo, Jeds, what, what do you want to talk about next? I'm like, huh? Do you not think I've got these lists of things to talk about? Sometimes I do, but I find yeah. when I've got content ready for people to to watch or whatever, it's like it's like the, the panelists and the audience are spoiled. Because it's like I, they just I, I, get, I see that as well. It's like you just rip happened. through it. And once you've ripped through that, then you're just waiting for the next thing. Okay, yeah, yeah. And it's like, yo, I don't know. But how do you manoeuvre so you don't have to rely? Because people, as humans, people let people down all the time. They do. And if they don't have the same heart or the same commitment that you have, they don't really care. So how do yeah. you manoeuvre so you don't have to rely on people bringing information or people jumping on? 
Well, to be honest, it's not that I, it's not that I do rely on people jumping on or bringing information. Yeah. It just happens that it's the preferable thing. Jump on, bring some information, bring some information, jump on. That that's that's the preferable thing. But if no one jumps on or whatever, I'll still be I'll still be doing my thing. Hundred percent. You know what I mean? But it's a it's a very it's a very difficult thing to do what Jedi did though. Five days. My style is my style is conversational, and yeah. and I don't think that's really gonna change. I like my style is conversational, so like okay. I don't know who jumped on first, Mag. Mag jumped on, and within two minutes, me and Mag was at, was able to establish a conversation, and that's all I need, really. Yeah. I'll, I, you get me? I'm not chatting to myself. I'll chat to Mag all day long, like yeah, yeah, right, yeah. Right. Come on. But actually, I'm lying. It was Sniper that jumped on. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. I didn't, I didn't jump on first today. So. Yeah, we talked about yeah. loads of stuff before we even yeah. got down to the to the to the to the sister on that. You know, that mean, yeah. just chat about this. Chat. Even this video that came on was an accident based on. Conversation. Yes. I was looking at something. Did it there? Let's you know that was up there. I was like, right, what's this? But some That's people don't run. Some people, but some not uh, everyone. So you ex obviously you're expecting I'm that from expecting everyone anything. that jumps on. I'm not but, expecting anything. That flow of conversation, but not everyone has that flow of conversation that jumps on. Sometimes there is awkward. Some people. Some people do rely on. I'm not talking about myself. I don't think. But some people do rely on external stuff to come up that need to be prompted mm -hmm. but not as organic with conversation yeah some people yeah, but it's, it's based on the same curve stuff you have to you have to see the curve you know what i mean yeah. you either catch it before or you catch it after but yeah. you might catch it and then when, when it's after it's then a choice for you whether it's going to be that interesting because so many people covered it yeah, I mean, it will be a hard conversation. Think, it's not easy running a panel on a channel, trust me. Mm, definitely. Put it out to you. But you know, I mean, if I would I have one, because I've seen, because I've kind of, mm. if I were to have a channel, obviously I would, it wouldn't, it wouldn't, I don't, I never would I'd do a channel. But I probably would go down the style of things like people like uh, World News because I know I don't have to rely on no one. I can literally just, I've got my aim, I know what I'm doing. Either interested, you're not interested. It interested. If you want, if you're interested, jump on, and that's it. If you're not interested, just listen then and type in the chats, rather than me having to feel like I have to rely on awkward people come jumping on or people that do have the ability to have style. After and have after after six or seven, eight, nine years of doing it, what are we saying that? You know what I mean? It's, it's a lot. It's a lot of content, you know what I mean? Even what man has already got is so much. It's, it's a lot. It's like a whole library of stuff, you know what I mean? That's why we say subjects like um, Nature Boy have definitely been covered. I know man could go back to a couple of streams where that was the main topic of conversation for that time to get it. And we got up to man getting arrested and then that was it. A little bit after, you know what I mean? The people on both sides talking, his people, the audience, you know what I mean? Like, all these different yeah. streamers were were streaming, but you know, it just in today gone tomorrow. Yeah, hundred you know I mean? percent. Yeah, and sometimes it's boring to cover the same subject over and over and over and over again. Okay. No, no, no. I hear you. I hear you. It's a bit like Putin right now. Putin with the with the Black Jesus thing. Yeah, mm -hmm. we know people like Black Jesus Minister. <laughs> yeah, you never see no one ever argue about Black Jesus Minister. Hey, your name's wrong, big man. Nah, but we know the truth from a long time. I'm trying to explain it to you guys. And look, some people are only getting it now because Putin's saying it. What's his reasoning? Who knows? But maybe just to appease some African nations. Some you know that video is old, isn't it? What? That when he's showing the that book, the, the announcement thing that he's done. Yeah, I've seen, I seen it at least a couple years ago. Mm. It ain't not new, man. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's nothing new, but it's new for the world because when I yeah. ask other people, they're like, oh my God, have you seen that Putin thing? And I'm like, perhaps. I look on TikTok, that's all they're talking about. You know what I mean? They're going doing videos on it. Well, to, to be fair, it's not it's not verified that that's what he's saying because there's the video I seen of it the other day. Yeah. Is a bit of a reach. And it's right. starting to, because I, I, I know some, I, I need to kind of, yeah, re refer back to 
the original one and see if I can get a yeah. translation in it. Because, he's definitely yeah. saying something, but he's, he's, yeah, he's saying something oh, serious. Okay. He's referring to mm. things, but he's just talking about the artifacts because he's, he's been on this thing about Russian history and what Russia is for the longest time. Right. And, but and when so there was he, black Russians and when there was black yeah, yeah, uh, but like, Germans and black Serbians. He, I don't black... know if he's necessarily talking even about black identity in that thing. He's just talking about the age of the stuff he's got. Well, I'm just saying. Yeah. Uh, just, it's the age we, can, we, we can infer that is because we already know that because there's plenty of stuff about that that again we've been looking into for since before this little video come out. You know well, it's not inferred. It's just said. I think it's, yeah. it's just quite clear what he's trying to say but mm. it's not a super revelation do you get what i'm saying even if you yeah, read true. these religious books you would have got that impression anyway yeah do you get what i'm saying it's only the brainwashing and who's printing these books yeah has added their little spin to it or two pence worth but remember everything they do is in plain sight mm -hmm. so now you can say oh yeah but where's the verse and you can pull the verse for the bible you can pull the verse you know what I mean? They say, oh, his hair was like lamb's wool, skin like burnt bronze, eyes as red as fire in the furnace or whatever. You know what it is, does. Yeah. So for Putin to come now and say and do what while well, we've got the black Madonna in the Vatican mm -hmm. and then the white Madonna upstairs and the black Madonna downstairs. We've seen all these things. I mean, the Pope kissing the feet of the black Madonna and child. Yeah. And this is what I'm saying. They've got different mm. types of these things all over the world. Right. Do you know what I mean? Because there's some, I think, Far East. Yeah, there's the, the Vatican mm, one. It's all stolen stuff. And obviously, the, stolen. then there's the stuff in Africa itself. Right. Like, so pictures. what we're saying, for me, the Putin thing was exposing the robbery, uh, the skullduggery and the fuckery that most mm. of Europe was engaged in. So everybody's going to have bits and pieces. that they're, they're calling relics and yeah. religious artifacts and da 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 that they stole on their crusades and their raids and their whatever they were doing do you get what i'm saying took it home and put it in a in a special place not new vatican did it why couldn't the russians do it uh, the georgians did it you know uh, joined to the orthodox or coptic or whatever church you know what i mean so there's there's different aspects of the thing you can see like through history anyway you know what i mean that all is not unified in this religion thing yeah but one thing that is unified that yeah. a lot of the characters um were, were 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 black they already established it with abraham moses thing and even in some respects uh in the islamic one with adam well adam was a black man that's why we can't be racist in islam well uh, yeah but uh, whatever <laughs> yeah. that's not the religion that's cultural your culture allows you to be racist so when you take on a paradigm it oozes out of you, unfortunately, unless you put it under control. You know what I mean? So that's what it is. So all this uh, talk about, yeah, Jesus is black. As I said, once you have to do that, there's already a problem. Do you know what I'm saying? It's already a problem that you have to change something back to its original thing. And we already know this already. We understand that you're in Europe. You're going to have a European looking Jesus. We understand that. But that is not the same as the text. We we understand that as well from, from a long time ago. It's just those people deeply trenched in religion are not going to see it that way. Do you get it? Okay. You saw what happened last time when I showed that image of the Prophet, peace be upon him, to Khan. Yeah, his first reaction was to say, no way. Like, rah, <laughs> rah. You didn't even let me finish doing what I'm doing, bro. So you, you already say no, it can never be. Well, because he's dark skinned. Look at oh, that doesn't even make sense. It doesn't go with the tribe. Tribe, you understand? There's lots of factors that make what I'm saying true. And some of those tribes can be seen to, di to this day. To this day! Yeah. And they definitely don't look Arab or European. So here's what it is, man. It's like 44 degrees in them type of places there, man. Jerusalem and all of these type of places. Hot, mm. bros. I'm talking hot places, bros. And a couple of thousand years ago, there definitely was minimal Europeans there. You know what I mean? Over those last two uh, millennia or whatever, they, they started to arrive and 
forward to them areas and all of that. It is what it is, man. That's why I always said that the the, the Bible and all of that and them ancient texts is basically African story, man. African Middle East or whatever you want to call it or Sumeria or whatever. It's all the same thing. So, yeah. yeah. But I think because he's doing deals with African countries now, this looks good on the resume. See that? No, no, no. <laughs> yeah, you know yeah, what? Yeah. No, no. Well, some is, African this... leaders are going to say, you know what? Putin's a real one. He's telling the truth out here. Why? Because a lot of them are religiously entrenched already. It's easy to, to, to brainwash an African who already believes in whatever Abrahamic paradigm already. Not their version of it, your version of it. What, what exactly did he say about Jesus, though? Like, you know, like, we don't even know what he's actually said. I think all he really said said was, let's return these artifacts and da da da, and let's take these artifacts from from behind closed doors and put them in our museums and that. Mm -hmm. That but was what you say, yeah, yeah. Yeah, he, he, I don't get the whole thing of him saying all the prophets were black, and uh, I don't think he said any of that. No, I don't but this is the that. thing you see I'm that thing you said about brainwashing, though. Mm. Mm. This is what's scary because you, if you know what Russia's job has been, it's MO for the last for the longest time against this side of the world is, is stirring the pot with ideologies mm. that make it hard for us in the West, let's say, to get along with each other and. This could easily be part of that. Do you know what I mean? He knows where Partly. it be. Do you know what I mean? He knows there's, there's a sizable black population, whether it be in Europe, UK, America, enough to be all riled up and turned up about this. Like I I'm see, saying some he, of us. He's on, he's on our side these times. He's not on mm. our side. He's not on our side. No, this is politics. This is. Thank you. you know what I mean, this is a political. So yeah, because 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 right. when you know their pattern of them showing sort of, showing yeah. sort of dissent amongst western nations a lot of what we're dealing with today is as a result of their ideologies from the past from their communist times that have seeped in through our education system and all these places and in the media and all this type of stuff and then suddenly it's, it's, it's beef in the home between one generation and the next or one wing and the next most of it comes from them thinkers from eastern europe yeah. crazy experiments and ideas that have come from there and Karl Marx and Third Reich and all that type of stuff. It's that section where all this experiment is being done and then they just expand it out and they do it on America and the world. So this is just more of the same in my eyes, isn't it? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> as much as it is alluding to fact, but then this is this is another thing of nowadays, like there's a lot of things that allude to fact. Yeah, listen, be the people the wrote, wrote situation. books on this, on, on, on this subject a long time ago. Do you get what I'm saying? Dr. Mm -hmm. Marashango. Yeah, his book on uh, African Genesis. Yeah, yeah with his, with the image of two black people on the front cover. You know, doing Adam and Eve stuff. Long time, long time. I read that read that book. So the concept of it is always been thing. Even Jordan Maxwell was the first person I ever ever heard say, yeah, that all uh, religions, Abrahamic or otherwise, came out of Egypt. Ex CIA, yeah, mm. yeah. That's one of his first videos way back in the day, like twenty something years ago. It was very normal. So yeah, it took time for other people to catch up and all of that, and did it do, and that's why we got Black Jesus ministers and all sorts now because people have accepted that fact. It's not just today that they've admitted that Adam and Eve were black. Do you get what I'm saying? It wasn't that long ago, so. This is just a continuation of that same skullduggery hiding this and cover, you know what I mean, type of behavior. Don't you think it's very convenient that men are in a religion where you're not supposed to have no images, no images of a prophet or no, no images of any of the prophets? Yeah, that's based on color. No, I'm saying because of the background. You know what I'm saying? Because the truth is the truth. Let's just deal with that. If a man never hold, looked hold at on, hold on, hold on. So you're saying there's people in a religion where you're not supposed to make image, yeah, graven images or anything like that. And you're saying that's because of color. I'm telling you, okay. because the people who write in and are making the books and putting them together definitely had an issue with color. Because if 
I asked why. So you're, so you're saying it's a way of sweeping that? No, I you... asked the scholar. A simple question, right? Are all the prophets related to each other of the Bible? Is it one family bloodline where where or a specific part of a family that we get all these prophets from? And the answer is yes. So if all are related, and you're saying the first one's black, uh, Abraham's black, uh, Moses is definitely black. You can't say no, it's black. Everybody, you know what I mean? How could Jesus be anything else at the time and all of that? Because there's not a lot of these other peoples in that region at that time. If we're talking biblical or whatever, do you get what I'm saying? We don't see Europeans until the New Testament, the Romans. Do you get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's just like, you know, and you name me a white person who died for his people. Is that concept with them? Making me laugh. <laughs> yeah, is that concept with them? I don't know. We've had leaders, dictators, all sorts, kings, and all of that, but we've never had a martyr, proper male, white. I don't know. You know what I mean? We've had female, female martyrs. You know what I mean? Joan of Arc. I was about to say things. that's. Do you know the only ones I could think of was her and that Bodhi. Females, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. The female's gonna take the L. Yeah. Now they would say that guy um, died for his people. They who? The H guy. Guy Fawkes. Can I say the word? Hitler. Wasn't he? I was going to say Guy Fawkes, but yeah. No, he didn't He didn't want to die, though. I said, <laughs> oh, yeah, I suppose. And did he really die? Because we don't even know what happened to him. Yeah. It's a bit weird, you know what I mean? Because they said he, got, he shot himself, and then all you're showing us is a bit of skull. Isn't you know he poisoning himself? That they blew up the room. No, they said they blew up the room, innit? Yeah, nice. It was in a bunker, supposedly. And then they... Threw a grenade in and did it there and then went in and shot him. Whatever. Oh what no! About, what about already... Bra Braveheart died for his people? Yeah. <laughs> no, and then the, the, you see when he gets, you see when he gets to them characters. He does when, he, when he gets to them, mm, yeah, true. That's what the movies are. But you see when he gets to them, them characters, they might not yeah. be white. Yeah. It's true. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean, it gets all weird, man. Past, past a thousand years, we really don't know what the fucking place looked like. Because there's yeah, people exactly. claiming there was wild stuff 200 years ago nowadays. Do you know what I'm yeah. saying? So, it's... And, and I think William Wallace would have been a little bit prejudiced. You know what I mean? Because he's Scottish <laughs> and the British are the ones oppressing you. Right. So there's racism yeah. going on. There's racism. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it's not the same, though. It's not the same. You know what I mean? Even though they treated them wicked and did all sorts of wickedness to the Scottish people and didn't allow them to have weapons to defend themselves and all of that. Yeah, they did much worse than Africans, so I don't know. I don't think it can be um, the same as ours. But yeah, a martyr who supposedly died for everybody since. White. Right, I still wait, and I'll wait until I, uh, <laughs> that information comes across my desk. You know what I mean? It's, yeah, right now, we're scratching, scratching our heads to think of one in history. I mean, that's crazy. But the image of Christ, we understand why he's he's made to look white. We, we, we understand that. You know what I mean? If they worship him in China, trust me, he's going to look Chinese in the imagery. You know what I mean? We understand that. But there's more to it with some people. So, yeah. You know what I mean? They're turning water into wine. I just, I'm not. <laughs> Sounds mandamish. You know what I mean? It's putting your finger in the in the water and turning it into wine. Like, yeah, look what I can do, mandam. Oh, this at a wedding as well. Come on, man. That's mandam too. That's mandam stuff. Yeah, persecuted because he's a he's a he's meant to be king of the Jews and that. You know what I mean? And then the guys who are saying they're Jews who ain't really Jews, they're the ones who arrest you. And take you away and do all sorts of stuff. It's mad. I mean, but some of them disciples as well is definitely black, perhaps. I mean, fishermen and that. They're in that hot Galilee kind of area. Well, yeah, if you're saying based on the region, but then I don't know. Based like, on the see, region and the you time. See, you see this whole set of stories now. Yeah. Is it one? Is it one person? And is it that time frame? So that's a good question. But, um, it's definitely based on an individual who actually existed. 
you know what I mean? Whether he okay. was, his name was Jesus or Cyrus or uh, 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 what's the other one? Uh, I forgot his name, his son's name. But yeah, this is where these stories and concepts, they've always been around kind of. Yeah. yeah the but only this, white this, martyrs they had was in their pagan shit. Yeah. Like Serapis and all of that. These are, are martyrs, people who died for their people. So in their pantheon, when they were pagans, they had this concept of a sayer, a savior, messiah, and somebody who died as a martyr for his people. Do you know what I'm saying? If you go into the Greek uh, pantheon and all that, you'll, you'll see these characters that you could say, oh, that's a good candidate for Jesus. You know what I mean? That kind of thing. <laughs> so that's what they've done with it. Yeah, because that's the thing as well. Like I think a lot of stuff, but just the version of these events that we have, Mm -hmm. A lot of stuff has just been merged and merged into one. Yeah. So it's even crazy to start thinking of the identity of one person. The older the story gets, realistically, yeah. the darker they're going to be in it. But picking hairs about one specific person who was just at the edge of Roman times, it's like, is that even what was going on? Exactly. Uh, I, I mean, in in Roman times, uh, and <clears throat> Romans were the occupier yeah. and the sole controllers of them ends, which was uh, ends filled with people of color. Do you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. we even got it now. You know what I mean? House of Saud and that. They're not Saudi Arabians or whatever. They just got there, stayed there for a little while, and you know, established themselves and then struck oil. And that's all that is. You know what I mean? Now the whole ends is called after them, you know what I mean? They're acting like they were born and raised there from generation to generation. But then that is the clue in it, in a weird way. That is the clue by calling it something else. It's like a rebrand, isn't it? So you're showing that. Yeah. Right. It was just Arabia before. Now it's Thank Saudi you. Arabia. So that like, you've had your little spin on it. But again, you're foreigners. You have to wear big sheets, yeah, in, in that region to cover yeah. yourself protect you from the sun. To be fair, I don't know. I reckon everybody has to still... No, they don't. Well, people walk around like bare, bare I face in that. I know if, Mag, you go out there, you're not putting a sheet on. For what reason? <laughs> not think about it. For what reason? Unless it's really sandy or something, and it helps the sand stop going in your eyes and that. And oh, shit. <laughs> while you're driving around in your Ferrari. Like, it doesn't even make no sense. Bare Ferrari face. minicab. That's what they managed to do. <laughs> yeah. Huh? You got a phantom coming to pick you up and it's a minicab. It's crazy. There's all top cars abandoned on the side of the road in Saudi. You've seen it, man. The man are jumping out the car and skating on their fucking Jesus creepers while the car's moving and that. Tell me you've seen that, mate. What did people jump on the car dancing and shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, obviously they're yeah, living Jesus different. Jesus creepers on that. Like. <laughs> there's a lot of people. Yeah, there's a lot of people living it's different. Yeah, yeah, that runs in Saudi and that. Yeah, but mm. the, the 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 temperature, and obviously in all these places we're saying there is a lot of people. Did you know the the biggest rate of skin cancer is in? Yeah, is it the eye country in it? It's in Israel, man. Yeah. yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. I heard that. Yeah. yeah, that's 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 sad still because that's you it's know when sad. you're still hanging on to something, it's like it's yeah. not good for you. Well, this is this is more answering the question, like, are you really supposed to be there? But this one's be yeah, but like, look how violently these people will hang on to that location. But obviously, mm. I don't want to go too much into it. I think the sun will do that to you if you if it's not doing what it's supposed to do for you. You know, <laughs> maybe, what I mean? there's people, maybe there's people doing it from the cold who ain't been there. <laughs> yeah, well, do you know what I'm the saying? Like, this what I'm saying the is, is, there's a real infectious ideology that's actually got a lot of them man tapped. Because remember, you say like all the madness that happens in the ends, ain't it summer? Yeah, that the madness happens. Mm, yeah, but yeah. that's but that's that's when that's when you've had the lack of sun. So now the sun's True. come out. It's made made you go nuts. Go, when it's sun crazy. all the time, yeah. when it's good yeah. weather all the time. Yeah, you're not gonna do that. Maybe. I don't know because the, oh, the hot countries, the hot, country, hot countries, nah, look at the hot, hot countries. countries, the hot countries, yeah. when it all comes to violence, 
They're yeah, all mad. More violent. Yeah, yeah, thank more you. Violent. Every day, whenever. Yeah. It's crazy, isn't it? They say, oh, the sun will calm you, but it doesn't seem that way. Is it, do you know what? It depends which sun it is, and I feel like there's two sets of people in every location. There's people who are just going to be hot-blooded, and there's people who are just going to be like, just, just I ascend it from the sun. Yes. Do you know what I mean? Like, and, and I think, and I think that is a more natural way of being. Is the if you haven't that. got the melanin absorption, and I've got you just reflect the sunlight. I've got and you want to sunbathe every five minutes. Yeah, it might be a problem. The hotter yeah. the country, yeah, the darker the inhabitants, mm -hmm. the less value for life that that inhabitants is given, and therefore the more extreme the violence. Okay, yeah, that's mm. it, yeah. Obviously, they make black people value their lives or value each other's lives even less. They bring it down to, like, nothing, less than nothing. And then, yeah, you yeah. could just lick down 20 men and it's where it is. Mm. They keep it moving. You know, you could go and rob someone and instead of just robbing them, shoot them 13 times and just murder them like they did to my mum. Yeah. These, these, this is this is how they this is how they move. You know the shoot mm. first thing. Yeah, is just like, yeah, yeah. Fuck, get me. Shoot after, now, back, you back, know the back, shoot after the one. shoot after you got everything you needed and it was yeah, even fine. that one, even <laughs> that one. Like <laughs> yeah. everyone like you've got what you wanted mm. and you just get yeah. man down. Yeah, I've seen, no I've seen, it's not enough of them videos. Life yeah. is just like just Nothing. throw away. I do you know what I, to be fair I'd say there's number of factors that seep into when you think about the countries where we are from now even on this mm. panel there's multiple other factors that have seeped into the psychology of the place oh, the, the collective the people, psychology yeah, yeah, of these yeah. places yeah. whether you want to call it colonialism racism yeah, yeah, yeah. And poverty yeah. all these types of things these things do seep into the land however and, uh, I think the readiness the readiness for a certain type of flip out is where it's hot because as I think I said this the other day it starts from fucking what Italy, and from it goes from there, it don't really stop. Mm. Do you know what I'm yeah, saying? Right down good. to Thailand, the whole. Like, we're talking Europe. about um, Nigeria and Jamaica and stuff. Like yeah, that. it's long fam. We're not going to come out looking good on this one. You know what I mean? <laughs> not serious. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, there was a spot no, where he was killing again, Gary, like Jamaica and that. You see, killing like Gary. you see, like types of killing now. Mm. Again, I think that comes into it. So. There's a level of barbarism that's attached to getting hands on, okay. and there's and there's a lack of barbarism that's attached to like pressing the button or maintaining maintaining a system of letting them all do it to themselves. So, I feel, I feel... so you do you do need to take that into account. But the other thing is, is just the readiness of materials. If people have got machetes, then the people that you've got problems with, mm. they're just going to get clapped with it. Yeah, it's just normal. Behavior, that's yeah. Right. I mean, you've got it was when you've got space and all this type of stuff, that's how you're you're gonna get down in a situation. It doesn't it doesn't mean that like the people are worse or better or anything like that. When you think about it, the, the other one this comes into it is probably like spiritual stuff, torturing and weird yeah. weird stuff and decapitation, all that. Yeah. But then even that's which we're good at <laughs> tell people and our ancestors, Just, yeah, yeah, exactly. That's what I'm saying, like. Gross. There is These not things. one thing we don't excel in. Um, you, oh, I know we would say tennis and stuff, but robbery, kidnapping, <laughs> you know what I mean, murder, all of that. We're the best. Best that ever did it, bro. No matter where you go in the world, like wherever we're situated, we've got this non patent attitude even with each other. And that ain't sun and thing. That is definitely down to the environment, what you're eating, because human and all of that. Because look, mm -hmm. in Jamaica, where you've got best fruit, and all of that, and everything fresh, you know, everything fresh. But man, will chop off your head in a minute. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. This is our and do you know what it is? You see this competitive one-up kind of setting examples to Right. That's that's also again that's something that I'd probably say in both places has made yeah. things worse. Well, I feel instant justice. Do you get what I'm saying? Kind of was meant to calm it down, where it would seem like the whole place was lawless. But it's mm. not really. There was an element of, in the chaos, there was control. So because you would have to be the extreme of that thing. You know what I mean? Like, if you was a robber, uh, uh, a highway robber, you would have to kill your victims. Because you getting caught as a highway robber, you're going to get executed. Right. You know, deaths at their thing. So you can't have no witnesses, 
So if you are out there doing it, you're the worst. Do you get it? Yep. These guys are no, yeah. don't play. Do you get what I'm saying? There's no in between, and there's yeah, some nice guys and did it do because the consequences are still extreme. From now, the start of you, in it, so you might as well be on the mad thing. Right. That's how they see it, and that's yeah. how it's always been. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? So be wary if you get pulled over on the on the roadside back in the day and did it do. And if those guys got caught doing what they were doing. There's no question, there's no talking. Feds are coming along our army and just licking them down, bro. So they have to be a little bit more ruthless, but then that is a kind of a deterrent. So there's less of those type of people, mm-hmm. not more. In our environments like America and England and other places, that's why it's more because the consequences are different. And you know what I mean? Like, because we don't have a relationship with the feds and that, you know what I mean? That's that's why, you know, we have our own system of justice and that. But it doesn't yep. work with the actual system. I mean, they won't have it. So, and you can understand that anyone who goes jail in these other countries, when they go jail in oh. England, they laugh. Because you're Muslim. Mm. No, you yeah. see, it's again like the jail in them places oh, really? is taking years off your life. You know. Yeah. It's fucking with your life expectancy. Them them jail environments. What's what's this man? Airbrush. I don't know what he's doing. He's looking. Yeah, he mad. shouldn't have said that thing. Whatever that thing is, what he said about his nephew wearing whatever. Like, yeah. Since, since, since then, then they've just been spanking the bro. They said me being cancelled. Yeah. Yeah. Nah, this is not. This one I'm saying they decided not to cancel. No, him. Like, you know what it is? Decided to just keep about? raiding him. Do you know what he did last time? I don't, I don't know. Like, it's supposed to be Kane Row, yeah. Mm. And it's like the way the Kane Row just starting. Yeah. At some, like way you know, back. like no, no, no knocking. They don't yeah. knock. They don't the say like, like you know the Ian Bill. <laughs> she just burst in. You, you know, know that. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You must know the Ian Bill. I've got nothing <laughs> left. No, look at look what, what they holding on to, cuz. Yeah, that? That's mad. This no, supposed wait, to be Kane Roll. Ch- Are uh, we China. done, bro? Bro, have you ever seen like Kane Roll just they just yeah. start like bow, yeah. parting, yeah. like nothing, they're parting like yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, my man's rocking the man. fucking the Schman bag. The oh, don't you ever come up with no Schman bag, please, you lot. Please. Yeah. You say crazy things from first of all. I'm just saying. Yeah. You know, I know, no, Rico, if she, saw, if she saw LeBron James with his man bag <laughs> or his purse, and thing, you ain't saying nothing. You even go compliment him on it. You know what I mean? Oh, that's, that's nice. nice. Yeah, I got one of them at home. Nice. Something like yeah. that. Obviously, no, but it's everything, though. Yours. It's the ring. Right. It's the... It's, yeah. it's just wow. everything, fam. Yeah, it's a bit off. Mm. Like, it's totally it's unnecessary as well. It just sat, like, sat, it's just off, right? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who's that? Oh, I've lost it, bro. Fuck it. I've lost it, bro. Lewis is a oh. But yeah, that time with the nephew. But then, bros, yeah. man's going to do some questionable stuff later on anyway. I rated him for what he said about the nephew and yeah, but that's what I'm together. saying. Was it worth it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, it's not, though, because if they're going to pull you into a room and say, Oi, look now, here's what we're going to make you do, and then you're just consistently just getting weirder and weirder. Okay, yeah. fair enough. Do you know what I mean? Like, well, he's more deeply entrenched, and, and definitely the, the zeros in his bank account have gone through the roof. So, you know what I mean? Once you're in, you're in. Remember that Formula One is a rich people team. True that. It's an establishment thing, so mm-hmm. I mean, all these Bernie Ecclestons and all of these man, he's a full Mason. You know what I mean, he's in, bro. You know what I mean, you went into a bougie man sport like cricket or polo, you know what I mean? That's what you're doing when you're doing Formula One. It's like one <laughs> uh, croquet. Wait, do you know what? Yeah, mm. I went to that horse racing thing the other week, you know, in Cheltenham. Oh, yeah. That was one of the wildest fucking places. I've never been to one of these things. You know, like it was, it was shit. It was shit. To be fair, it was very, it was very shit. shit. Uh, at the end of the day, I was like, "Wow, guys, this is this what you brought me to?" No, but yeah, it, was, it was, it was, it exactly. was an experience to see like how people get down. Um, yeah, black people have been having parties at these things for the longest time now, almost a decade worth of, you know, what I mean, going to these events and true. Uh, the, was it the Grand National and all of that and hat day and all of that and then we're having our own black versions where people wearing pure white and they do and they're there in the tent 
at Ascot or wherever it is, you know what I mean, doing their thing. This is crazy, bro. I'm not trying to be like those people, bro. I, don't know. I just feel uncomfortable. You know what I mean? You know it smells of horse shit around there, man. I'm trying to be too bougie and that. Allow it, bro. This is not your thing, bro. I have a plan for my you're all country people, isn't it? It's just country folk. Well, well, the right. interesting thing about that. And also, do you know what, to be fair, it's, like, it's a lot of like gypsy right? type as well. Yeah, criminality. Yeah, yeah def- oh, you definitely. Saw the the criminal- blinders. Well, the criminality right. was high in the air, like it just smelled of coke. Mm. It's them, man, they're taking bets. Those are Thank the guys. No, that's what I'm saying. Like, so, so, like, they make out like it was a posh thing, but it was quite yeah. scummy. Yeah. It's, it's like a scum. massive stag. It was like a massive stag at the bookies. Yeah, it's the scum and the gentry together. Yeah. Together, together, rubbing shoulders right. and just spilling, right. spilling Guinness everywhere. Right. Well, you're walking with the horse, to be honest. While they're drinking pims o'clock and doing whatever they're doing. <laughs> you know what I mean, even the queen's turning up with their own horse. How about that? Yeah, so that's the Ascot one, isn't it? Ascot's the posh one. Yeah, you know so you're turning up Cheltenham's with their own more, horses. Chal- giving more the horse a like, Yeah. Yeah. She's there though. She's got, or well, she she won't be there, or she will have a. Not now. She's dead, bro. She's been dead like. Yeah, years. I know. She'd have a representative bring the horse in, and they'll be like, "Oh, this is the queen's horse, and uh, Lester Pickett's gonna ride this one." You know what I mean? That's what it was mm-hmm. back in the day, right? Frankie de Tory and that. I've got nothing left. Horse. Oh no! What is going? What? It's Playmobil. We know about Playmobil. Oh my days! What is this? Oh no! What in the Rika B is going on here? <laughs> She's made a fake version of you. No, it's a fake version of you. It's mad. And then we'll be out there and we'll be like, "Oh, Rika, man, that girl looks like you." Wait, well, so is this is a free part already? It's a free no. part. It's, look, it's no. one. That's no. bad. Yeah, that's bad. One. Yeah. That's number one. Then there's number two. Yeah. Hold on, hold on, mm. hold on. Dame uh, Courtney's chick, Jelly Bean. She just yeah. was working with though, just the one in it. Yeah, yeah, just the one. Yeah. 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 She just, she's <laughs> like, I'm putting it on the side. I'm putting in the middle. Mm-hmm. No, no. Mm-hmm. no, but she's pulling her hair too no, much. And that's put on it, you you see, before she put that top one on, she looked like a robber. Can't lie. A <laughs> 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 like dude. Yeah, look at that. Uh, <laughs> that on that top one there. Oi. Last one. She yeah, is pulling her yeah, hair way yeah. too much. Yeah. She likes to do it, man. Leave her. Stop judging. I'm gonna go out and rob these niggas. What do you mean? Yeah. But you know, if that if that happened to me, I would have to go turkey though. I wouldn't. I couldn't. I turkey. couldn't go bored like that. Mm. Turkey. I have to no, get I, the I've hair, never the seen a woman do her hairline. Still, I've never. No, that 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 pagey cakey girl done it. Is it lesbian? Yeah, she done it. Good luck to yeah. them. You know what I mean? Because I've seen some things where girls have pulled off their wig or had a fight. You know that those baddies or uh, bad bad yeah uh, baddies and yeah, not the UK one, the American one. And bros, one girl was fighting, she had full red hair, and when mm. the hair came off, if you saw how far back the hairline was, it was like <laughs> right in the middle of the cranium. That is crazy. Yeah. Just like this chick, you know what I mean. It's pulling too much pulling, man. It is. And when they do, when they put the wig on and they glue it to the hair, when they put, right. I think you obviously got to take it off in a certain right. way. They literally just pull in it. <coughs> boil it. You got to boil it, man. Oh, <laughs> just put your head in and off. Uh, head in and off. So like Instagram fully listens hmm. to my conversations. Today I, was, yeah. today I was chatting to Sniper about the founder of the Five Percenters. I've yes, never yes, had a five percent of post come up on my page ever before. Yeah, now I found thirty next yeah. business. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. One twenty yeah, lessons. Wow. Yeah, One twenty lessons. Suggested for you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Out of school. Mad. Suggested Mad. for you. It's crazy, isn't it? Mm. Stop listening to me. <laughs> 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 Money. Yeah. Oh, you want to see listening? Oh, you want to see listening? Yeah. Right? Okay. I want to know which app. It, what? Which app is doing it? Did Oi. we get permission? All of them. Hey, you know what? Horny fat women. 
horny fat chicks. Elliot, thank you, thank you. Beautiful <laughs> women with big breasts and big bumpers. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, beautiful women with big breasts and big bumpers <laughs> and big bank accounts. Mm. Generous women. Women mm. that want to mould me. Want to groom me. Yeah, what it is, you got to speak it into existence, man. Take me away. Mold me. Mold me. <laughs> running after them. Mold me. <laughs> when they're running away. I need to be molded, god damn it. <laughs> Shit. Oh, yeah, for real. <laughs> Shit, get me some molded. Yeah. yeah. I could do some fucking molding, mate. I'm training. Fuck, yeah. Yeah, was a training. I need some training. Yeah. Mate. Apprenticeship. I don't know why my phone's just... My phone's just been doing that, though. It's on... A, it's on, like, hyper-listening now. <coughs> Bro, that conversation... Yeah. Like, normally it takes about a day or something. That conversation... Yeah, was it does take a while. The process. Four hours ago. And it's already on my feed. Like, Money! <laughs> you get me all of a sudden it's not picking up that algorithm you know what I mean sometime ish what kind of sometime ish algorithm yeah do you know what I mean like, don't yeah, algorithm yeah. training hmm? no oh uh, training have you I did you know what do you have a I think two days ago I typed in to see if it like exists um I don't think there is any there is, I think there were some courses, but there is some like not courses, but there is some like guidelines and videos. And you've you not never watched it before. Mm. You've never watched it, Sniper Jedi mm. algorithm videos. No, okay, no, 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 I've never watched it. No, no, no. no. you don't need to get into it, mom. I definitely hold on. What's it for? I don't get it. So, like, basically, you know how to um label your shows or whatever to get algorithms and stuff like that yeah, what, yeah. What words? <clears throat> Clickbait. What words? I, I obviously don't like watching him because he's very gay but so he does pop up sean he's like this gay oh, content creator him. that talks shit. Who's sean? Who's sean? I don't know sean. he's like some american guy oh, is it? i looked on what he puts in the description yeah, but a he lot goes of them are in. Gay. i mean like, uh -huh. like they're a little bit fruity a few of them do. yeah he, just, he, just don't, he gives me a headache i can't take his heart talking but um, yeah. when I looked at what he puts on, like his description, he just he puts a whole heap of shit. Hashtag mm. TikTok, hashtag this, hashtag it. It was just yeah. like fucking hell. I know. Mad. It's a lot. So you can get those numbers and all of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah very, yeah, and the YouTube is different. US YouTube <laughs> to our YouTube is, is a different place. Okay, America is different to UK. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay. Because we're restricted, we've got someone looking out on all the videos that we're okay. allowed to have access to. They have to be screened and go through certain people before they can even, you know what okay. I mean? Even though we're sharing the same platform, it's yeah, weird. yeah, yeah. kind of separated it. And they made us know that a long time ago, still, like when they did it. They were like, You lot on UK YouTube now and US YouTube, that's something different. It's like, what? What are you doing? Man? Okay. I mean, because I got this thing on my um, Chromecast that can change the IP address, so right. I can watch US YouTube, and US, you know what I mean, versions of things that we got. So yeah. That's I know. Yeah. Right. The US YouTube is way different. Like, woo, woo. You know, certain things you, yeah, it wouldn't be allowed in this one. It seems that is just standard over there. So all this puppy thing would be maximized by 150 percent yeah 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 there are people talking smack well uh, it's just the way of the world the way yeah, works. that's the algorithm now puffy yeah 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 i mean yeah. little titch uh all sorts of different stuff going on you know what i mean is little titch coming out soon who knows who knows i don't think so honestly. Well, it depends how long he's been in there. He's been in there quite a bit still. Yeah, it's been time now. Yeah, it's been, it's been, <clears> it's been the whole of my childhood, I think. The whole of my teenage, nearly my, it's, he's, he's been in there for the whole time. Yeah, that's true still. Oh, it's been a long while still. Yeah. Mm -hmm. but it couldn't have been that long because that, that Asian guy doesn't even look that old. I mean, it's like... 
Well, was he younger well, than he, Wasn't he, he a youth, younger. though, when he when all that yeah, he was younger. happened, whatever it was? Well, not a youth, he was 16, but... Oh, really? Okay, okay. Fair. He was yeah, definitely in a gang with one glove. <laughs> you know what I mean? Don't say that about definitely in the game. There's bare use for yeah, with one. definitely in the game. And, and, and the, the whole situation is based talk. supposedly on a diss track that he made. I, I, think, I think I saw like a video that potentially, like a, I didn't watch it, but it came up mm. on my uh, timeline, like a 53 right. minute video about the back and forth between him and Titch, but I just thought... Oh, right, right, I watched it, yeah, yeah. Watched <laughs> oh, it. okay, good. I didn't watch it. Definitely good. And then I watched the RTM little clips. You know, I struggle with RTM now, guy. even though... I struggle with him anyway, but when he's got him and that guy, it's too much, I can't... It's, it's just, just like... Moving, oh. man, it? It's just moving, Yeah, it's just I just don't know what's going on. It's just it's too that's crazy. That's the best combo, man. What's wrong with you? It is, it is, in a sense. It's I think it's more better than program, three, obviously. I did to be I did, fair, like, I did, did you watch I did, the one did, before? Did, there was a guy, yeah. some African guy that went on there. Did you watch that one? No. Well, that recent one, the Congolese geezer. Yeah. You see, he so the, last, the, last, the, last, the last few, the last few, I've only just been in 10 minutes sections in it. I've just seen odd yeah, like, bits, yeah. bits and bobs. That's so what there's a couple I watched the whole one, but they get in like longer and longer. Like, it's three, no, you know three what hours. He premiered the premiers from White Yard geezer from Brum. Like, it's weird. He premieres them on Sunday. Yeah, okay. yeah so Sunday when I'm starting my stream, I usually see it being premiered. I'm like, oh, right, now right. all week we've been waiting for this video, and now you're premiering it in when I'm going live, and that's just like, right, it's not. <laughs> struggle, but that, that Africa one, he kept it, he kept on telling whoever that the co host that he's a madman and he needs to get you need to be sexual. <laughs> yeah, what chronic? Yeah, yeah. fair enough. I mean, there's truth to that, but at the same time, all three of them people in that room need to be <laughs> it's not section, but looked at in it. Looked at, yeah. they're, 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 they're they're wild with it in it. But that's just, I think, that's just the nature of people. Why and to be fair, what, I'm a dry I'm... snitch. Okay, What's, What's that? that? He said he was a dry snitch. Um, spray. Oh, yeah, because he's because he's this? honest about the fact that he's been rapping. Oh, what's going on? I don't know what judges. Is that a matter of no, stop, that, stop that! Stop that! Stop that! Stop that! <laughs> stop that! Stop that! Man. Is that a matter of them? What do you think it is? Is it definitely a brother yeah. trying it? Uh, uh, <laughs> trying it. Oh yeah, my god! Yeah, the whole or something on it. What the fuck is going on there? NASA. You can't wear that with six pack. In that. It's just not. A whole bunch of is that the music as well? Yeah. No, that's mad. Yeah, that's he can. Yeah, that's... All this sassy girl rap, man. Hmm? Girl rap. This sassy girl no, rap. No, but it's, it's not sassy no more. <laughs> I told you, basketballers. Look at the basketball. Look at yeah. basketball fashion. Basketballers fashion. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah. This... Jed, you're training. Oh, the the Is this what the algorithm showed you oh, after you said no. what you said? No, because he's because he's touched one of them now. <laughs> they're going to give it to him. This is that like whole year. <laughs> it's so dead. Yeah. Oh, you were horny. Scary. Yeah. Even Siri wouldn't even do that. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the algorithm. Oh, man, algorithm stop, correctly, stop. man. What is this? Nah, Look, nah. You see? You see? It's not just the uh, skepta. Man. Try to pose. Yeah. What is that? That nigga said, Skepta said, <laughs> Skepta said, um, I, I, don't, I didn't even see nothing wrong with it. You get me? Like wearing a skirt and da, da, da. like, bro, how are you trying to justify this fuckery? He's a fucking weirdo, though. Uh, this, this, brother's like like just... hench, this brother's like a hench chick, like a hench girl. I know. I don't what? get it. Oh, um... no, he's not doing that exercise. Mm -hmm. Yes, bro. Doing? All of them. <laughs> <laughs> He's like a hedge no, girl in the gym. No, no, pause on all no, the Jets, Can you see your screen? Like, allow it, man. I know. <laughs> oh, okay. You don't know what you're showing us. What is this? Nah. Yeah, one rep max. Let's no. go. I've lowered my gaze. No, nah, he's just coming. <laughs> <laughs> long time ago. Long time ago. Didn't even see him squat. Didn't even see him. <laughs> This is me doing my squats. Nah, squat for um. Oh, we hit, had it all. It's rusts now. Leave it no, out, bro. Back. <laughs> I've done the voice. 
I was scared for a minute. I had to look with wide eyes. Was that him really speaking? <laughs> he was speaking. Right, 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 right. <laughs> <laughs> you done it too good. No, no. Be scared. And the thing is, I know mostly girls in the gym to do that exercise. Yeah, I mean, obviously, what I'm saying he's doing pure girl stuff. Like, he's in girls, like, yeah, girl workout and that. Like, that way, bro. Before you see your squats and cleans, you're trying to do all this intricate stuff to carve out your yeah. ass. Yeah. That's just weird. Like, what muscles no, are you trying like, to strengthen again? Donnie's Donnie, Donnie is low key hench. Look at the. You mean low key? Like, like, low key. Like, low key like, fucking wham, bruv. <laughs> like, you know, like, like a gymnast and that. Yeah, no, but like, why is he true, doing true, isolated? Kind of gymnast kind no, no, of no, listen. Why is he doing isolated gay pose? It doesn't like, I just oh bro. This is just no, too much. the thing that, that he, he wears like I don't even know Shorts. if you want to call this a dress or what I don't even know what's going on. Someone was dissing him in the comments, calling him uh, I don't know. I'm gonna call him him and her. I'm gonna call him it's... him and he, he and him. Because I don't know their pronouns, and then he was in the comments. Shim. Yeah, yeah, that's my pronouns. Oh. Yeah, boy. Omega. Why do, uh, the comments, Omega. comments are crazy, but they're trying to. Yeah, he yeah, said, "Listen, he him did not come to play. Forgive me if I got the pronouns wrong." And, <laughs> and then he was like, "Those are my pronouns. Thank you, love." You know, like yeah, they probably love it. Yeah, Lem, you know, you know you're like, um, yes, mate. Yeah, girls endorse it, innit? They endorse that stuff. You know what I mean, Rico? It's mad. You don't need to throw me, the gay guy the away. Huh? They can't do it. it. The gay guy is one of the nah. guys. It's one of the girl guys. You know what I mean? <laughs> the little confidence the booster guy. in that handbag. Yes, yeah, mad. Oh, uh, no, Jada, I'm not doing that with you. I'm not doing it with you. I'm Sorry, not. Has he got no, I'm not doing it with you. What's no. that? What's going on well, and them two said, Yeah, you drive. Yeah, fuck off, man. I'm not he doing it. Like he's that. got yeah. sweet potato. <laughs> <laughs> some kind of root. Some kind of some root. Some sweet potato on his arm. Hey, I am, man. That? I thought he's holding a sweet. Oh, no. He's yeah. I had look like a foot. What is he smoking? No, I don't know. Oh, it's his apparatus. Big him up still. Bikes. Yeah, no, he went and got himself made, and now he's just he's living. He's popping up any ends, like yeah, and what? He's riding on. Look. You thought I was disabled, bitch? Yeah. I know. Look, he's gonna put the wire around his hand and ride around things so he can steer. That's gangster. Mm -hmm, exactly. And then tidy up a bit to his elbow. Hold on, though. What about the? What's he doing to press the brakes? He's oh, free, okay, he's got full. Oh, just oh, the one. Like, Brakes on the bike are on the lever, in it. But they, I was oh, just yeah, 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 yeah. No, but you can slow down with the gears, in it, with, with your foot. True, if it's true. Water, if it's a, uh, depends. Why do Why is he like that? Then, do you think? Obviously, he's born deformed. No, the hand oh, is why? there. It's fully there. Uh, you know what? Uh, you know, I'll be back. I just, I need to go and get some chicken wings for some reason, man. I'm mm. craving. Going to urge. Pick up Jed. <laughs> you, you don't even get so me. You are so <laughs> yeah, I just realized. I just realized. Yeah, I really got him. What <laughs> <laughs> huh? you could think of is Perry Perry. Perry. Morley's. Morley's yeah. arm. Perry Perry. Are you oh, Morley's, Morley's arm. <laughs> Morley's arm. <laughs> <laughs> nah. Do you think this is from inbreeding? Thinking of Morley's and that. That's crazy. Do you do you think it's from inbreeding, Rika? Like, what a mad question, man! You were just like, you like, like that. Do you? No, nah, do you think it's from inbreeding? About really do we? Know the answer that you're yeah. Right. So, about do we think, think it's from inbreeding? Cheek of it. I don't know. I'm just answering the question. Mm. Yeah, what? What? You answer it first. Do you? Yeah, what, what, yeah. What? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> potentially, potentially. So a man slept with well, his parents who were related to each other slept and had him, and then that's why he came out like that. Maybe, yeah. Yeah, if that's incest or outcest, you're not scared. Yeah, boy. Yeah, cyst. 
<laughs> no, that's disgusting. Yeah, that's mad. Because yeah. I couldn't sit down and eat with him. You know what I mean? How's he eating? He must unwrap the thing from his elbow. No, you know he's like, like flicking stuff all over the place. Free. He's just you know looking at it. free. <laughs> he's he's making a mess. Mm. <laughs> full Jurassic Park. You know, full Jurassic Park in it. It's mad. <laughs> looking like a human velociraptor. Why did he tie a wire around the elbow so that arm wouldn't? You know what I mean? Go out and scare people. Maybe you can use the hand. Maybe it's a weapon. It's extendable. Right. Yeah. Cool. Right turn, Gupta, and then slick you with the elbow of it. You're done. On back. <laughs> uh, I could do on back perfectly, bros. Mash you up with elbows and that. <coughs> You look like you have two hands in the one, though, to be fair. No, the, the one was like the the actual claw hand, yeah, was bent back because the elbow was tied. He tied yeah, the elbow. Yeah, what I'm saying. Like, if he unfolds that whole thing, what are we, mm -hmm. what are we dealing with? Because it looked like. You've got a human crane hand. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. It's like yeah, crane. It's like that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But then things that pick up gifts. In the carnival, or, stop it, yeah. stop it, stop it, stop it. Yeah, claw hand is that? Like yeah, you get, the teddy, you get the teddy, get the teddy. Oh, enough, big up goddess. It's funny how goddess turned up. Oh, <laughs> no, because the remember the lady before me, they put this. They had a dungeon like you look. It's mad. She had a chat. Big mm -hmm. up goddess. I wonder if she's been How do I like zoom into Goddess's picture? I've got Goddess's a hot Beyonce picture. Yeah, Goddess is a hot Beyonce. She's what? She's a hot woman, isn't it? She is. I don't, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I played the fish. I the fish. I wouldn't know. Ask Randy. Sitting Randy would say it's um, it's not like the it's Randy's got it. Well, there's another video came up. Oh, shit. What? My DNA was on the strip. Oh. What for the yeah. RTM? Yeah, this guy's just digging himself further and further. And just making it worse and worse and worse. Everything he said has baited him up. Just throw yourself in the bin. So who was who was dry stitching? Who did uh hmm? the guy say was dry stitching? Oh uh, no no uh, that was young spray talking about he was dry snitching. Yeah, what, the, the, the Asian just, guy. The Asian guy is rumored to have snitched. Oh okay, okay, okay. okay. On on on, on the, uh, crazy stitch. Yeah. Yeah, so he was there, he was at the scene of the crime, all sorts. He got shift at the scene, all of these things. You got teeth of danger, must allow that shit, allow that shit right now, bro. Why are you talking? 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 Why are you do not talk to me. Bro, go you sort out your fucking edges, bro. Why are you talking? I can see fucking the fucking crush come out of your edges. Why are you talking, fucking, 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 fucking American you you like, bitch? Go for your eyebrows, then talk to me, oily bitch. Shut the fuck up, bro. And now that you want her teammates, I think you should provide for you. Why are you talking? Why are you talking, bro? Yo, is this live? Go sort out your fucking face shape. Do some face and exercise. No, don't work time. I can't lie. I saw L and I saw E-L-L-E all in the comments. I do not know who's won. But let's see you the comments think. Smiley face L at the bottom with the E or sad face just the letter L. You lot, who is our winner? Let's go. Smiley face L with the E, sad face just the letter L. Who won? How, you, how can you tell who was doing what? Bro, he just like he, he just letting him go. <coughs> I just heard. Oh, your flaky edges, put it there. Your edges, your edges, yeah, yeah, yeah. Edges, your edges. The that, the that's the number one gallon, this, isn't it? Bye, yeah. I love L. Yeah. Bye. Yo, Take it personal. 
Gen Z. Wait, this is only for Gen Z. Like your mother don't have the same resonance. I don't think I've got ears for this. I can't hear what's going on. Thank you for the gifts, guys. Actually, oh, this is it just feels like Japan or something. Yeah, it's definitely. Do you know what I mean? Like, this looks like. Look, watch. Right. I'm gonna predict it. You ready? Three, two, one. Can you can you Hello. First of all, first of all, first of all, so what is that? I so much. I know damn well that is not you. I know damn well that is not you. So change your fucking profile, but you can't even show your face, bro. This is literally off the shot. Why you talking? You little prostitute. Bana, why are you talking with your fucking picture profile? You turn up with a black high vis. You're not even old enough to have a detention yet. Why are you turn up with a black high vis? To buy food and you gotta go to Tesco with those bike calls. What are you waffling about? Let's about not Tesco? Speak, just let's shut not up. Speak, you're you're a little Pinterest whore. warrior. You are a Pinterest warrior. Just shut the fuck up and get off the live. You can't oh, even show your face. Miss, that's not you in your profile pic, is it? There's no I way. I know damn well that is not her. The ear it is. No, it's not, bro. Yeah. I know yeah. damn well yeah, that it is. Judging by your voice. Judging by your voice. That's not your fucking face. She looks like Megan Fox, bro. Ladies and gents, can we have a VAR check on this Megan Fox? Nah, nah, no point of this flipping VAR check. It's not her. It is. It's not. It's like Lana Rose. It isn't. You got it off Pinterest, darling. This is what. You got it off Pinterest. Why are you Why are you talking? You fucking don't have to look at yourself. And your stat is on me. That is me. Why are you talking? Everyone here's saying my name. Not from here, bro. Oh, is it that one? That rapper, K to the B. Did a good thing. 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 It stinks. Brother, that's the voice your fucking mama when he gave birth to you. She was like, Ugh. so just shut the fuck up. First of all, first of all, take a look at yourself. First of all, come Yo, Pinterest goes gone. She's 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 gone. She is gone. Right, what in the man, bias is going on here, man? I couldn't tell anyone who won that. I thought he was rooting. I thought he was rooting for the other one tonight. So I was like, "What did you hear?" I was flabbergasted yeah. when that guy started calling. I'm not going to say it because I'm going to get banned. But like, you get me. Yeah, no, I was flabbergasted. I was like, "Ah!" Oh. No, I knew it was coming. It's bound to. Yeah, this is their this is their version of a of a custom match. Okay. Yo, chat, I'm doing a live restart. We've been live for 30 minutes. Oh. That's basically 45. L, come back. I'll get you in straight away. Yo, chat, listen. Yeah, mm. I'm doing a live restart. Just Chef's in the back. back. Girls in the comments in the, in the side chat. I want to join. And Chef's? Yeah. Yeah, oh, I shit. think so. Sorry, Chef's. Big up, Chef. Big up, Big up, Big up, Big up. Big up. Mm. Is, this, is this a man, woman, woman, man thing in the middle here? What? No, he's just from the horn. What's the what's going on? You oh, the I don't know. It was giving me vibes, innit? It was giving me, you know, the letter <clears> gang <throat> vibes. I am your captain now. Oh, sorry. I don't know if 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 he, he or she is. I don't know if it's a he yeah, or she. I know. I know. So I'm asking, bruv. No, no because funny, man. there's he's a lot of female boys mostly he's talking. Boy, there was a little box there, and before it was the two women arguing. But then it was only one left, and now he's just by himself. So I don't know what's going on. Okay. But if this is how people cuss <laughs> in the millennia, it's dead food, man. Yeah, it's bleak, man. Give someone space. Look at your edges, man. Look at your edges. You're just a fuss Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Look at you, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mag, you actually You're sound waffling. like them. That's You're scary. You're waffling, though, Chef. You're not waffling. What's going on? Yeah. 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 Life has someone ended. Said, someone said someone was. A princess warrior. Like, I, I didn't even know. What is that? What does that mean? It doesn't even. I think he said Pinterest in it. It was Pinterest. Pinterest. Even warrior. still, what does that mean? Yeah. Like, what? <laughs> Do you know what I'm saying? Spark my Pinterest. No, I'm going to stop that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what are we doing here? Man? It's like saying LOL instead of saying, yeah, it's anyway, it's wrong. LOL. First of all. Oh, no. <laughs> You know what I'm saying, like. Big up, brothers. Those are bad guys. Mm. So who else is going, jumping on and getting cussed then? Let's see what we got. Is that what they do? On, it's on, a regular thing that like Donny does. Let me see what his name is. Ezekiel, the first... Wow. I really struggle with the layout of TikTok. It just it just throws me. I don't know if it's, you know, like when our parents used to be like, oh, I don't like technology. That's how it feels mm. for me. I don't yeah. I can't take it. It's just too much going on for me on TikTok. Oh, and your mum's on TikTok. 
Yeah. Yeah. Oh, damn. See what? M to the B. <laughs> Meg. Oh, yeah, man. They lost that, uh, Sarah would say. They lost. How's your evening been then, chefs? It's been very calm. Yeah. Easy. I bet yeah. you guys are like that. I just don't even know. I don't even I, don't, I feel like I'm depressed. Oh, <laughs> Why do you have to go to London? Oh, oh sorry. That's a bit that's too. Yeah, I can't <laughs> bother it. But um, yeah, oh. I, it's raining and it's horrible out there. Do you have to go yeah. London today? Med to, but I can't bother it. But why are you why are you waiting so long for why are you waiting until evening for you to be going to London? I know. <laughs> best thing you do is stay in your yard, yeah. That's the best thing I'd I'd say. Just stay in your yard and in the morning or whenever tomorrow you make your way down because it's not pretty out there and it's mm. been horrible all day. And it's been raining, so yeah, just, just right. keep you, yourself in your yard. Thank you. Yeah. So yeah, I would like to see a good one of that. I think the concept's not too bad, but oh, what, yeah, the you're beef? definitely gonna have. Huh? Yeah, yeah, you're just gonna have the to time to talk because when he listens to it back, you'll see how crap that sounded. It sounded well matched. You know what I mean, yeah, want to hear clear need... cussings? Yeah. You know what I mean, like we do over here. Take turn. Everyone take a time. Take the turn. Maybe you might clash a little bit at the same time, but it should be one after the other. You know what I mean? That's on my favor of are you done? Are you finished? <laughs> yeah. Say your you job, know, get it out. I haven't I've seen something similar Unks, on TikTok where mm. it's like it's the same kind of beef thing. But what they do is they, they give them like a timer, but it's not like a cussing <laughs> match as as what was going on. It is, but it's not. If you know what I mean, so it's not. It's not chaotic. It's like one person would say what they need to say, then the next person responds. But everyone's on mute. Do you know what I mean? I think I think that's the only way it can work on these type of platforms. I mean, in a real yeah. life, it's not so bad. Like, yeah. No, but the wind is moving mad out there, too. Mm. Hello, hello, hello. Hi, Chef. How are you, Mag? I'm good, you know. All right. That's good to hear. So, Phil, we're back. What are you talking about? <laughs> You're back, mix up. What does Silver Side say? Uh, <coughs> oh, he's my God, God he's him. snitching. Is it? About I ain't snitching, but I'm snitching. Little snitch. Hmm? Well, I can't know if it was... Does Victor look like that, guys? Do you know if Victor actually looks like that picture? Victor, Victor Renz. Yeah. That's know. Danny DeVito, yeah. isn't it? I don't, I don't, I don't think it's him. It's oh. Danny DeVito, fam. Yeah, I don't think it's him, love. You know? Probably I, don't know I don't know where it's from, though. No, nobody wants to rate my accent. Oh, where's it from up there? Try again, man. Try I again. Don't fucking no. We weren't, we weren't talking about you, goddess. Jump on. I like goddess. Oh, shit. What do you mean, all right, goddess? Like, goddess has done something. <laughs> I, like no, I like her. I mean, I like her. Oh, I thought you said, all right, goddess. <laughs> like, you were trying to. <laughs> Uh, 
Yeah, you need to jump on to find out. Silverside, you're setting her up for failure, you know. Yeah. Wicked. Wicked and bad man. Oh, what guy? Mm -hmm. So what's the latest, guys? Is there anything trending? I can't even see. The bear thing's trending, man, every single day. Like, to the point where nothing is trending. There was this thing that I watched there, but I don't know how to share. Is it, what's that thing? Let me see if it comes up. I think I can post the link. There you go. <sighs> Sorry, guys. Hold on. What happened? What happened, Rico? I don't. I don't understand what happened there. There's a video, but I need to try and find it. Hang on. I'm trying to find the the blog channels. I don't know <clears> what they're called. Do you know what it's about? It's basically about this boy, and he's talking to his dad. And then the dad basically says to him that you've got too much girls coming in that house. <laughs> Wait, hang on. Let me see if I can find it. Oh, shit. It's an African dad. Tell him. Hello. Hold on a minute. Yo, what happened? Hello, can you? <clears throat> Rick was Yo, in the middle of talking and it just went went silent. I was wondering if it was me or everything. What happened off. to Chevelle? I don't know, actually. Well, Rick is looking for a video of some kind. That's what happened. Well, what was happening? Mm. <sighs> Yo, family, what are you not saying anyway, man? What's happening? I'm looking at what's trending right now still. Can you play this, Jed, if you can? One day I'll know how to, I'll find out how to share video, but you don't have to do it. Promises, promises. I will. I will. Uh, so what, you going to London or what, man? Uh, give me, uh, let me look. I'm going in about five minutes. I just feel really stressed. Mm. And when I feel like this, I can literally just stay in my house. <laughs> I think I need to push myself. Hold on, wait, why are you going to London? Uh, it's like family stuff. Okay, fair enough. It really don't bother me in it because I'm I'm driving. Yeah, it's not like you're bopping from Luton to London. No. no. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so what's this video about? What's what's this I'm playing? So basically, it's obviously it's like a he's, it's a, he's doing a prank on his dad, but it's basically his dad to letting him know that he's got too much girl coming at the house. Basically, oh you're not serious. Why are you keeping bringing a different woman in the house? And you just French it too. No, they're my friends though. You think I'm stupid? I guess take a picture of your girlfriend's shoes. What? That shoes is a woman's shoes, not men's shoes. Wait, you took a picture of one of the f my female friend's shoes? Yeah. How do you know? You do night shifts though. You work night shifts. So how do you know? I bring you females out. I'm stupid. This is my house. I know how things are going on here. Show me the picture of shoes then. Show me the shoes then. Watch me somebody's shoes. Show me the shoes in your... What is this? You actually took a picture of the girl's shoes? Bumbo clad. <laughs> That's a bomb for class. Uh, you know that's a, you know that's a joke already. 
you are single and you are 22. Think about it. You are single and you are 22 years old. Think about it. You have to choose one. What's wrong with you? No, they're just my, um, they're just my friends. They're what my friends. What do you mean your friend? What do you mean friend and you bring the woman to the bedroom and you say it's your friend? Why you don't say in the city room? They're my friends though. But why you bring your friend to your bedroom? Because we're vibing, isn't it? You're in the living room watching your French channel, your Avril channel. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Got him! Got him! <laughs> You're watching your Avril. <laughs> Nobody wants to watch that, what you lot are on, isn't it? Nobody wants to watch that. Let's go upstairs, play a game or something. Like, yeah, yeah, it don't matter if you're single on twenty. If you're single on twenty two, it don't matter. Do you get it? It don't matter. I got female. Do you have female friends? You got female friends, innit? Yeah, I don't have a female friend. If I get female friend, is my girlfriend? It's not good. You're not serious. That telling him how it Why is. Why you keep him bringing a different woman in the house? And you just twenty two. No, they're my friends though. You think I'm no, that's it, that's it. Okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. Uh, that's funny. Do you think that's jealous? <laughs> no, that's got girl, girl, that's got female friends himself. That's what they said at the end. You do your oh. own female. Yeah, you got your own female. I said, yeah, but they're my friends. That that's on the same crud. Oh, that's funny, that's funny. Bumba clots. Who's this footballer guy? What's what's this? Huh? Oh, What's he done? Is this the same guy who's, who's doing the show? No, nah, this is Rika's. This is Rika's man. Oh, is it? Oh, whatever. You might. You might too. <laughs> Where's he from? The loo. <laughs> <laughs> the loo. The loo. Being looted. Forgive me. I don't know about that. that. No, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> who are who are me dear Rika and all of that crazy yeah so you get me you played this video and, and um yeah what happened nah I think it was uh, Rico was talking to Mag. Yeah, played the video yeah. on that. Mag didn't really say nothing. I was laughing about the video, but what? Do you, what? Do you, hold on. What do you want me to say? Yeah. The geezer's twenty-two. He's single, and yeah. he's bringing girls home. Be my friend. So he's, are, you, interesting he's lying. Meal. To be fair, he's, I reckon he's lying in it in terms of there is friends like he's bringing girls back. But can you have female friends? Yeah. Yeah. Ish, because remember, every male uh, friend is 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 a dick in a glass bottle. No What's that mean? Smashing case of emergency. <laughs> That's what it means. Yeah. All right, so you lot, are, you lot are so cruddy. Yeah, but you're the ones <laughs> are doing it. You're, you're the, the ones doing, doing it. it. How are we cruddy? If you're doing it. it. No, look at. All, the, no, all jokes are aside, are I do. I've got two male best friends. I never yeah. ever. Tried it. On this planet, never has it has it gone past that. That was literally when I haven't spoken to him for a while up. actually, but we have met be meeting. We don't go past inappropriateness. Okay, yeah, when we meet up, we just up. literally talk about life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah, talk about like, like, yeah, this, is, this is what's known as waiting in the wings. Yeah. We want to ruin it. And I hope you haven't told. Them. I would say that. I would say yeah. I Very would put it out there. There was one time we went raving, yeah. and after the rain, one of them became inappropriate, and I. Shout out! It was me. What the? What are you doing? Mm -hmm. I had I called like my female friends. Me, guess what? He did it. But he, he was snitched. drunk. And you fucking snitched as well. You are a shit wow. friend, and this is what. This of course, what you're because doing. he knows he's like he's my brother. What are you, what are you doing? Yeah, he sees, he's my brother. He's, you don't, he, I don't. He, I don't he, see he like that. Wait a good, he got to wait a good twenty five before he tries that again. The other dude, he still got his chance in it, but he's just he's just waiting until you're at the right time. And, <laughs> You know what I mean? Your little moment of weakness. Nah, he was yeah. drunk, innit? He was drunk, innit? You, wanna, you probably want to phone one to complain yeah, he, about the hey, next I'm, time. I'm the wrong yeah, person. that's the time to strike. Predator. I am the wrong person. I like that. I do. I know about boundaries, innit? Once we're friends, we're friends. It's not no. Yeah. I don't see you like that. If I saw yeah, you like you that, could, it would have be been a long groomed. time. You could be getting groomed all now. No, no way. Wow. You know, they can't, can't groom me. No, no, no. I just, he. 
they are literally my friends. They're my friends. Yeah, so that's how I see them as. We talk. We it's talk. all the groomed, the groomees sound. Really? Yeah, they're just my friends, man. Yeah. No, it could never. It would never get. You could never get past that stage. I've got boundaries. Oh, it's like a brother to me. Like a brother to me. I know it's like a brother to me. Don't do that. Why are you trying to stick your tongue down my mouth? No. <laughs> You know, like, brothers, brothers don't do that. Yeah, brothers don't do that. You know what I mean? I don't know what. Yes, <laughs> to be fair, do. I mean, at some point, when you feel, you can feel proper low. And I, I've never felt like I had to reach out to them. Why would I reach out to him? They are my brethren, like my yeah, brother brethren. Yeah, yeah, I got you. Uh-huh. No, I don't show them. I don't cry on their shoulder like that. Mm, we have, we just, we just meet up. You're not using the brethren. It's for. Capacity in that, you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> like water down bridges and that, but that's all bridges and stuff. So, you do you feel like men and females could not be friends like that, that capacity at all? No, they can. I'm, I'm not saying it. it's, it's something I'm running. Do you know what I'm saying? If it hadn't happened, you're breaking up. You're breaking up, is it me? No. no oh. Sniper was breaking up a second ago, to be fair. Okay. So what do you think, Mag? Do you think, like, that? it, it can't... I think, I think, no, I think of... in reality, mature people, you can have male or female friends. That's oh, thank totally you. normal. However, I've, however, though, I don't feel like I'm as close to my female friends as I am to my male friends. And I'm not and either. Also... Like, I don't talk to, talk to them every day. Yeah, I don't see I don't talk to most of my friends every day, but like there's brethren, I'll text them for semi no reason. Listen, you yeah. ain't texting your girlfriends while you're in a relationship. That's this the other you see what I'm saying? So I'm not texting you for no no reason, in it like it's, it's kind of got to have a reason. Yeah. If we if we meet up like your man's gotta be involved or it's like it is business, like I don't then okay. again, no, no, because there's you know what it is as well. It's like I think they're from stages of life as well, because it's like again. I don't feel myself looking for more female friends. No, you should have had Yeah, like, yeah, they're old. I know them, yeah. I've known them yeah. from like coming up to double figures now. <laughs> but, yeah, but literally, when we meet up, we meet up at a restaurant. There's definitely acquaintances. Huh? And, there's, definite, there's definite acquaintances and people that are very close in different ways, but it's, yes. Yeah, I'm saying, if you, if you uh, put out the suggestion, yeah, amongst your male friends and see what the answer would be if you, mm. you know, was like, yeah, listen, I'm single and do this, what are you saying, me and you? You know, just as a tester, it's not that it's true, but I'm just mm-hmm. saying. Just one, one dip, in it? Just one dip. Answer. Yeah, this a Litmus one test. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can just put the tip in. Exactly. <laughs> see what colour it goes. If it's the right colour, then we, we can smash yeah, it. Yeah, we can continue. We can continue. <laughs> no, I can, no, I feel, I feel guilty doing that. No, no. Nah. Like I said, we meet up. We go oh, to a restaurant. We can I don't. chat all night in the restaurant. We literally was get to the restaurant, and the bed, like the restaurant's closed, and we're still chatting. They Whoa. may go out and do so their little just, party. You're there, just so. out here, blue balls in and that. I know it's terrible. Yeah, they may go out and party after. Um, if I, if depends on how I feel, but like, no, no, no. I do restaurant over home. dinner. You're huh? savage. Man. You're blue balls in <laughs> over dinner. You're savage. Do you pay for your food? <laughs> Yeah, we seem to be split three ways. Okay, fair enough, fair enough, fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. Split. Oh, yeah. This is a friendship, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> just asking them. I'm not judging. We all might have been. Now, it's better if they split, split three ways. Yeah. yeah like he's there, cha- he's there chatting, 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 chatting. We chat. We literally will just chat, yeah. chat, laugh, laugh, because we haven't seen each other for whatever time, so we can literally yeah, chat, laugh. <laughs> But then they want to go. Oh, they like to do their little raving thing because they're still like young or whatever. Not well, yeah. same age, but they just you know they still want to party. Are there hugs and sometimes involved? I don't want to go. So if I don't want to go, are there hugs uh? involved? Are there hugs involved? You know, like at the beginning, oh, I see you for ages. Big hugs. No, like, yeah. in the beginning, like a little, like not not like intimate hugs. Just like a little side hug. Like, oh, yeah. that's it. Yeah. No kiss on no the cheek or nothing. nothing. No way. Uh, Right, it's no normal. It's approaches, man. Like, it's not even, it's not even a thing. Like, go France. Like. No, like, it's leaking. I don't kiss myself. I don't kiss myself. 
<laughs> just put, put one side, one side, in it. I don't know how they do it, whether it's two or three or just licked you, you know I mean? like a cat. No, we don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Not a hug, a bear hug, nothing. Dead. I don't know what type of friends. It's just like a little, it's a greet, a greet. Like I don't even know how to describe it. Yeah, it's a hug. It's a little short hug. Like if I could. Mm. <laughs> Did you have a picture up by your crotch to put you over his shoulder? Right. Are we even? Are we even sit. We even sit certain positions so we so people don't get the idea that we're like it's not that just yeah it's wow. not that. Right, wow. he is. So, yeah. when you're trying to hide stuff, yeah. that's a bit booky yeah. still. It does sound booky still. Yeah. <laughs> That sound the like the chemistry methods. is on. The chemistry is yeah, on the one prevention one. methods. All <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you have to do, do pillow wall. The only reason you why sleep, I have to, because I used to go raiding with them. And then have to do pillow wall and shit. Go, I know. The fortress. I used to go raiding with them, yeah, but I stopped. I stopped. I stopped. What they used to do is when they used to go off to the bar, when they used to go off to the bar to get their drinks, people used to come and approach me, and I used to be like, why do you keep not keep on leaving me on my own? Like, because obviously people keep on approaching. So I used to feel really safe, unsafe with them when I used to go out with them. So I don't really like to go out with them. Sorry, sorry. Uh, sorry. They never protected you. They never came over. Oh, I yeah, didn't feel yeah, like they did. They just leave you on their road to buy and get a drink. Yeah, I didn't. I, I but they don't really road that. They don't really understand. So hold on, what could happen to yeah, you exactly. in the for somebody going to get a drink? What type of clubs I don't are these? people to approach me. Like, I just yeah, feel approach, like... I just feel like if 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 like if they were like like proper, people wouldn't feel like they could come over to me when you go to the bar, like because people don't. Yeah, I just don't. I just didn't like it. So. No, I don't. I don't, I don't get what you're saying. You know, man. I don't know what you're. You have to go raving with bad man. That's why. You know what I mean? Real guys. Yeah, basically, no yeah. matter gets it. <laughs> no, I don't. I'm, I'm this confused. This is what I'm trying to say. If you're my friend, you know my needs also. So you ain't just gonna reach. Yeah. And like. They were getting out and did it do. You're gonna bring a few gal there, right? You're gonna bring some of your closest bestie girlfriends and did it do. And maybe something can run. You supposed to put me up, man. Like if yeah. I'm not getting none from you, I want some from your friend or something. Put yeah. me up. True that, true that. That's a good friend. Oh shit. So are you like are you like the Epstein? A cousin. You know, like the cousin and that. <laughs> what is that? Oh, thing? I heard about you. I've heard so much about you. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, she speaks well of you. She speaks, yeah, man. Yeah. But see that time when you had the other cousin on top? Yeah, that was mad. That was mad. <laughs> you was moving mad still. But nice to meet you anyway. Yeah. <laughs> Can I get your number? <laughs> <laughs> Can I get your number? Yeah, straight. <laughs> That's what girlfriends do. They definitely hook up their, their guys. And they, they say <laughs> stuff like, Oh, I've got a nice friend for you. You know what I mean? Like, I've got a really nice girlfriend. She's really good. She's single at the moment. Da -da 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 -da. You know, I'll give you the SP, the, the whole application for. You get me? How's her aces? She's, she's got seven kids and two wow. baby fathers. And, you know, all that type of stuff. Like, yeah, it's all good. Enough. She just needs a good guy. Yeah, that's what she's saying. Like you. Yeah, like that's you. when you know you're fully in the friend zone. <laughs> No, oh, I, shit. No, I, don't, no, I don't like to get involved. I don't do that. Because you no. know why I don't want to do that? Because when shit hits the fan, I don't want to be the middle person and I'm like be. the agony aunt. It's not my business. No, you shouldn't be. Your thing, just like my thing, even with my friends, yeah. is the yeah. introduction. Once I've done the introduction, I'm out. It's good to do with me. Oh. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, no, do, you, do you know what it is, though? Snipe? Now, Snipes is different with girls because girls, like, it's, mm. if, if that thing don't go to plan... Dynamics yeah. or a motherfucker in female friendship groups. Yeah, I know it's happened. Like, like, like man, then we just not, we can laugh it off and that yeah, even like yeah. you know what I'm saying. Like, there's there's this thing you're not laughing off, like because as, as well, like you could have introduced someone to a monster and when it's girls. No, your happened. friend got banged and, and and like it didn't work out the way she wanted or whatever. Yeah. That has now there's a rift thing to do with me. Yeah, it's a rift. There's a rift now. There's no rift. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, seriously. When you're in my no, prison, to be, to be fair, I, Snipe, I think that. you're more mature as well in this scenario. Mm, I've like been I feel like it. No, no, I'm just, I'm saying like how people are in it. I'm not saying like yeah. this is me, but I'm saying definitely how people are. Yeah, all the introduction yeah. stuff is high risk because of when it gets mash up and that people move weird. Okay. The whole friendship group, you gotta have two new group chats and yeah. No, 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 no. It's not that deep, bro. I'm telling you. 
It's happened so many times. Yeah. But some of the girls will end up complaining to another of your girlfriends about it. That's mm-hmm. as far as it can go. It's not going to reach me. Yeah, it's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is again. I think that's because you're in the male position in this. I feel no. I'm just saying, like, say, for example, let me use Jed as an example. Yeah, he's his own man. Once I've made the introduction, that Mm. is all I need to do. He's Mm. got his own game, his own Mac, his own whatever. I just leave them to it. Do you get what I'm saying? His own man. He kind of knows that as well. Female vocabulary. Hmm? Yeah, yeah, yeah. no, 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 no. But they catch feelings. (laughs) <laughs> so he might have made no he might have made an arrangement with her where it's just you know yeah this is what's happening and do yeah. we're just going to enjoy it for the moment and do it and then they catch feelings and then mm-hmm. you you're breaking the terms of the contract so you know what i mean and you know women are habitual contract uh breakers so you know Full, fully in breach in it yeah, <laughs> tell you. yeah. You know. emotions get involved i said mm-hmm. you see you see you already fucked up there when he was saying it, like, yeah, this is only a thing, and like, it's not a proper relationship thing. Yeah, 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 no problem. Right? You didn't read the small print, that's it. Yeah, no more, no more, what's it called? Cocktail brunches and that. Right. And now, again, what did that have to do with me? Because while you was doing that with the person, my name was not involved. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's chilling it's for you as chilling. the matchmaker. If Rika's the matchmaker, there's shit yeah. going down. Hold on, yeah, what's that picture? Just... I don't know. She's alive in that picture. Is it the press donut? Is it the press donut from Thing? I don't know. It just looks a bit. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Gambian, Gambian sweet. Yeah, I would say, I don't know, but. The friend, the bad and friend thing. I don't, I don't, I don't see a problem with it. To be fair, because I know who I am. But yet, mm. I know that no one can't really. You can't move to me. No, you can't. Well, I'm just saying. No. If I, if I've got a friend, yeah, one of my boys. Yeah. And he said to me, "Oh, hey, that we could be." You get me? And I say, "Yeah, look, that's so so sister." Da, 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 right? She's being so. Don't mess her about. But yeah, do your thing, bros. I, I, I've got no control. Yeah. I, as long as I said my piece. To try and protect you in that type of sense, because I don't know what capacity you lot want to do a thing, or even if you're interested. Yeah, um, do you know what I'm saying? I can't really get involved more than introduction. Yeah, I know this girl. Blah blah blah. Come to my yard. I know I'm going to be try and bring the best of my friends. I can bring some scumbags if you want. <laughs> I mean, but that's really more for your cousin than that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> your cousin's getting scumbags. She's getting the scumbag guy. You know what I mean? She's asking you. She's like, oh, who's that guy? Who's that? He's Bridget. Like, yeah, man, that's fire right there. Danger. See all this? This is yeah. trafficking nowadays. Huh? Trafficking? What? <laughs> no, it's semi-grooming, maybe. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Like, <laughs> oh, yeah. Are you going to bring friends? Yeah, yeah. Which friends? Uh, what do you want? Scumbags? Yeah, scumbag. <laughs> and, yes, dirty woke. What, what dirty <laughs> RGB niggas, which one? <laughs> yeah, I got some Darby Ikes if you want. Like, mm, name, name your thing, Rasta. You get me? Everything. Rasta. Yeah, that's the number. Like, yeah, Rasta far right. You get me? Oh. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, you have to help your friends, man. Because we used to call it. You know what? Like, I do. They're not like, yeah. We used to call hype. They were bridging. Yeah, we used to call it hype in the set. Huh? Yeah, we hype in the set. Your bridging would hype your set, meaning he would speak on your behalf because you'd be like, you meet the girl you really, really like, and all of a sudden you turn yeah. dumb and shy and all of this type of stuff. And your bridging jumps in and goes to speak to her. Oh, excuse me, my bridging wants to talk to you. Da, 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 all of that. Sometimes he's like, oh, why didn't he yeah. come and talk to himself? Then he waves you over. And then once he's made the introduction, he's gone. Now, that can backfire because sometimes the girl can say, yeah. you came up to me, yeah, and you had that confidence, I like you. But a man will generally come back and say to you, yeah, perhaps, yeah, yeah, she likes me. It's like, all right, all right, cool, 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 cool. <clears throat> Go true. You know what I mean? Like, we have each other set. You know what I mean? Even though we've got some bad mind brethren who are not on that. But that was the general rule. 
Yeah. He's talking yeah. there for half hour and still ain't waved. He ain't even looked back at you. He just yeah, yeah. Move on, move on, in it. Yeah, yeah. You're back as well. And you ain't done nothing because you're there waiting to be brought into that. You yeah, could have done yeah. a mad, all kinds I've of different things. Happen. But you're just staring at that corner and you're chatting to the all three of them. The girl said, said to me, yeah, I like you, though. Oh, wow. Well. And I'm like, oh, shit. Oh shit. But no, my bridging though, my bridging. I really tried to you get me, but she's like, now what are you saying? Like, oh shit. <laughs> but it always works that way because it's not you. So you always got that bit more confidence, but it's not you. You're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. My bridge. You had the big one with the locks. Yeah, 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 yeah. What? Say something. <laughs> yeah, he wants your number and all of that, but you know what I mean. Say so guys, my friend died and back. Right. <coughs> big up shares, man. Mm. Welcome back. Big up shares. Yeah, but after a while, I can't lie, um, man, them stopped doing it. I don't know what happened, but yeah, yeah. some of the men, yeah, what are we funny. talking about? You know, like setting up your bedroom for with a girl or vice versa, and all of that. Yeah, my brother tried to get me to do that to set him up with an English girl, but I don't know, I don't listen. Mm. You know, when people want want for reach, want for reach at England, yeah, yeah. Oh, them ones say, oh, shit. Yeah. Awful, you're not on the look of friend. You're not on the look of friend. You can yeah. introduce me. Oh, when my dad, I remember one time problem. my dad was like, my dad was like, you're not on the look of friend, friend, job. You're not on a girlfriend. I was like, dad, I don't really know. I don't have girlfriends. No, I don't. Right. If it's not, do you know what I mean? Like, it's I didn't. Funny. I, I've never like, had that. I've never had like a circle of like girlfriends yeah. or do you know what I mean, Unks? I've just never yeah, I've never I mean, had that though. It's not a good look though. That's just what I'm saying. It's just like yeah. you, you need what like a circle of friends. You listen, I feel if you had that in your circumstances, because you've got so many brothers and cousins who bruffs, you can't even put if she's not nailed down, <laughs> that girl's gone. she's gone, cuz. You get what I'm saying? So I can understand, yeah, not doing it thing. But me, who's got sister, and sisters, should I say? Yeah. My, and because my brother and sister, there's a year between them. It's not, I'm like, what, six years older than my sister. So her, her friends, more time, I could have moved to, but weren't really my interests. Yeah, but but but, but, brother, neither, but but neither could my brothers, though. Listen, that, um, my brother when you look at friends, the age gaps. Mm -mm. Yeah, yeah. So you go my on. brother and his friends. That that was where most of the thing. My sister's thing was: if you move to one of the mandem, don't come check me. Yeah, me and you are not friends again. You're friends with the mandem now. You're the mandem. Oh shit! Chick, so, yeah, she was cool. Oh, shit! I'm just like, nah, that's cool. If man. you, but if you move to one of the mandem, but if the mandem <laughs> moved to her, then what's what's up? She's not no, allowed to. Okay. Yeah, she, she, so even if the mandem moved to you, which is more likely. Yeah, mm. it's gonna be like, yeah, she's like, yeah, just don't come pretending like you're coming to check me. Okay, you know, I, feel you, I feel you, I feel you, I feel you, I feel you. You've got two sets of brothers, you've got the older brother, uh, you know what I mean, and his friends that you lot can just, oh, oh my god, oh my god, it's my man, it's my man, but you know nothing now, right? But with the brother just a year older than you, you get me, a lot of his friends are your brothers too. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. For my sister, for example. So she yeah. was seven little down. But for the friends, nah, they're going to be, you know what I mean? They're going to be in her ear like, oh my God, um, that's so-and-so and blah, blah, blah. What's he saying? And da, 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 and do you get what I'm saying? The man them, She's like, nope. Yeah. Nah. She's not a helper. Uh, I'll put it down. <laughs> So yeah, her brethren, her brethren can't expect her to bring nobody. No, but he, he's also supposed to be understanding that there's beer man them in the house, and not I can't I can't say one of my friends is ugly. You know what I mean? I can't say like other stuff as well, but I can't say they're ugly. It's not one that's ugly. It's gonna be to someone's taste, and obviously these are well-known men in the ends. Do you get what I'm saying? So. Guys, I know they've got that reputation in them, you know what I mean? But I am just so confused. Oh. Yeah, but bear girls, yeah, bear girls got, um, yeah. My sister's friends, uh, not my sister's friends now, boy. They mm. What's that? Mm. Uh, yeah, boy. 
But I think I traveled one or two from my sister's phone. About that. You've yeah, traveled but... one or two. Mm-hmm. Was that after she was friends with them? Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. But it's not a relationship. It's not that. You get me? It's just a quickie. Whatever. Mm, and it's yeah. time, so we both keep it the secret. A quickie. Oh, my okay. sister find out. Finished, boss. <laughs> both of you. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Chef, do you like, think she can't really tell me nothing? Said. But at the end of the day, she knows what it is. What was your question, Rico? Rico? You think men and women can be friends without there being like, no. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you now. Hello? Um, <clears throat> oh, yeah. yeah, I think it's possible. Do you think men and women can be friends without there being nothing? Yeah. Yeah. You just got, you just got to set boundaries. That boundary has to be yeah, set. Thank you. You're not funny. But yeah, it also it also it also it also depends uh, on yeah. where and it also depends on where and how you met that person. I'm not gonna lie to you. For instance, for instance, for instance, for instance, for instance, the man that the man them with like with Trill, like for instance, with Jedi Maku, I met through family. Mm. So mm. I wouldn't make moves to any of them. Right. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. But um, well, shut up, man. Shut the hell up, man. Sure, I'm I'm I wouldn't move, move to you. I- I clap them cheeks anytime I want. Oh, wow, sure, wow, sure. wow, wham, <laughs> wham, wham, wham. <laughs> Tell your cousin, hold my drink, hold my oh, drink, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you mean, man. Sure. Yeah. I'm taking that. You know, my friend that did set the bad, I just set the bad juice. He called me the next day and he apologized. Mm. He did. Was he? Was he drunk? He yeah, he's dry. He's acting. I don't know. I just me and that. But I have a friend just laughing till we were crying. I was thinking, what the fuck? What are you doing? It's I probably because he, he was saying. It's probably like it's probably because he's been acting for a long time, or he thought he he's could, trying to kiss me. I was like, what? He's trying to kiss me. Okay, you're getting okay. too close up in my personal space. Come the steps. Mm-hmm. Go back a bit. And then we just exactly. and then we have. They're like, like they're like, like yeah, we can. You know, it's a long time away. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We yeah, just see that try we are talking my time, you know, but we can't wait no more, girl. Come here. You understand? I hear apologize that it's saying that. Don't introduce man and woman if you want to try edit how they interact. That's some charge. It's true. It's true. I don't believe that. Yeah. Women do that though. Why? Well, because for me, the women be mind. women be telling their friends uh-huh. that you're off 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 bounds, even though there's not a one. Even though, them. even though, yeah, even though it's yeah. not for them, man. Yeah. No, mm-hmm. no, forget that. Even though nothing is gone between you and them, they will yeah. tell That's them. That's what I'm friends, saying. That's what I'm saying. I've, even though it has, I've been, they have no. I've a, mm. a try and hint like something has gone in the mm-hmm. past, which will mm-hmm. put off some friends, or just yeah. downright tell them. Just mm. don't go there. Mm. Like what? I've had yeah girls like, well, has anything gone on with you and so and so? Like, no. Mm. Why? Uh, like, basically, mm-hmm. do they know that? Like, what do you mean? Do mm. they know that? Do you know what I mean? Because I don't know. Maybe she might have some feelings for you. Nah, man, that's my brethren. What are you talking mm. about? Yeah. Oh, I don't know, man. Mm. I don't know. Get me. I remember there was one time there was like a bag of girls got together. <laughs> well, no, a a big group of people got together. And then the girls ended up going, when they were going home, they ended up going together on a on a journey. And it's like from that one, from that one journey, it's like there was bare susu going on. Yeah. And that like earmarking and that girl was pissing <laughs> on. You get me? So yeah, that one, I want that one. Yeah, that one, mm-hmm. man. I like this one. <clears throat> well, I think you two and that one. And man, you don't shut the hell up, man. I know, man. Shut the hell up. Yeah. You know, and then you get the wicked. Contankerous women trying to mm-hmm. put other women off the scent, so acting yeah. like they don't like this one, but they like this one, acting like they don't like that one, and man, they're lying. Girl are too sneaky, mm-hmm. too fucking sneaky, man. Trying to double and guess who their friend likes, and yeah. they're not like the same person, but they really do like that person, and they're rare. Then they're gonna ask you, "Why well, go out for you and this person?" It's just some some little games thing women get into. If you catch a man moving like this, you have to call him about it, man. Still. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely, definitely a female thing, you get me? Mm. Definitely a female thing, man. All that. The, the, the only, only okay, yeah, the only time, time the only time you are right yeah. because I, huh? did, I had a big, sorry, go on. No, what did you say? Oh, I was, was going to say something. 
you know, I, when yeah. I was younger, I had this big crush on this guy. Big, everyone knew, and that, that was my guy. And everyone used to say, "Oh, he's ugly. He's ugly. He's ugly." Anyway, the person went to jail for a very long time, and obviously things move on. I did it. We didn't end up doing nothing. Just like normal people. Why? What's your gang? <laughs> what's your gang, what's your gang what's thing? You tell me a love story, and then my man's a serial killer. She's been on the gangster what team from birth, James. Well, I'm telling you, you don't know this gangster we got out here, bro. Now every st- every I'm story. Did I say? Did I say this? Yeah, it's but it's more, it's, it's more entertaining what I was saying. But yeah, so basically, <laughs> the girl that was telling me, I did you should have a picnic for him. She had, a, and everyone, know, even when, even the people that I, I had it spoken to for years, I guess, guess who was, uh, I was had a baby for. She goes, what, you It's me, yeah, right? That, yeah, that, he, yeah, can't believe it. Pick me a whole picnic for him. And she was All saying right, that, she was saying she's ugly. She, she won. I'm over, over it. it. Yeah. <laughs> do you, like, do yes. you know what? Like, something similar happened to me, but I was in, I was in college, and like my background with Mandem was non-existent. I had no experience with boyfriend, none yeah. of that. So I liked off this. You, I had a brethren. Obviously, I was telling her, yeah, I like him. After da, 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 da. months are going by, whatever. She's like, mm, yeah, yeah, you can da 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 because I'm not really interested. I don't know who asked her, but cool. Anyways, about months later, I found out I said them two are sleeping around and that she's told the guy no that, I, that I've been feeling him from, like, the get. All of this came out. I was like, yeah, you lot are just... Both of you are pagans. Like, both of you. Bad Obviously, I can't really blame the man that much, but me and him also had a friendship, relationship, whatever, what, what was going on. And yeah, yeah, but I was just like, yeah, man, I just cut off both of them at the same time. I said, no, this is crazy. To be fair, the person didn't. The person didn't know that I like. I did. I never made it clear to him that I liked him. Never, ever, ever. Yeah, never, never, the, I didn't have to try to tell Donnie that I was feeling him because my I girl went yeah. and told him. Do you know what I mean? And they Shut still up. went ahead and did it. Mad thing. Like, After yeah, you're not too. fucking. She's pillow talking. No, that's bad. Pillow. Oh. After you had sex with somebody, yeah. you're like, yeah, yeah you know, so and so fancies you. Is yeah. That, at this at yeah. this point, though, me and I was best friends, so it was Wait, like. So, did you say so and so or so so? So was oh no, so, 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 so. I don't need no bumpy face, yeah. <laughs> <It's so sad. laughs> face bumpy. Face bumpy. Yeah. With this. Is never mind. Is? Never mind. <laughs> got so sad. But yeah, man. Some girl, bruv. You they're just, I don't know. Yeah, I don't they know. are they like, are because they are at the beginning, if she had said to me, oh, yeah, I'm feeling him too, skin, my yeah. eyes would have been more open to realise, okay, they might have more of a connection in that way than me and him. And I would have let it yeah. go, but she did. She she was doing up, oh, yeah, yeah, I'm not really a fan of his, da 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 da, da. But these times, you're doing up bits. Mm. Do you not that's what, so I'm about. that's what I've don't tell don't tell people your business. That's what one thing I've learned over life. No, don't, don't tell, tell no one your business. Girls, don't you women don't tell oh, okay. your, friends, your other friends or your yeah, females. Yeah, don't tell your friends, you so, yeah, I can't yeah, lie. No, after that after that unks, I never I never it was I, a long time before you, like, like I had a girlfriend. You know, like my I'm brother was back home at that point. So I just left it. You not snitch too much, just the thing. You what do you do? You, you, no, women be snitching, man. Be just snitching yeah. about what's going on. Yeah. They chat like they don't know what's wrong with yeah. them. They can't control themselves. Nine out of ten times. Yeah, I've, nine I've, out of I've, ten I've learned that. You just can't yeah, tell. Can't can't yeah, same reason. And when you tell a girl, and when you tell a girl, or when you tell a woman, mm. like yo, like just hold it down. She's there, there trying to make it out, like seem like you're trying to keep her some secret for your reasons. It's like, nah, you're gonna fuck up a good thing. They don't mm. listen. You know what mm. I mean? This chap, man, always got that one friend don't say nothing but, and then they act like they ain't said nothing but. Your, the friend's moving different now. She's baited, mm-hmm. she baited you up. Yeah. You get me? Yeah. Your friend doesn't never ask questions when we're left alone in a room. So you've not mm. been chatting. Your friend mm. don't even say, oh, well, where? no, your friend just knows the coup instant. Yeah. That means you've chatted. <laughs> yeah. yeah, but because I know what I'm trying to, you get me? I ain't gonna, yeah. I ain't gonna bait up that I know you. Why is mm. this chick pretty and hench at the same What? Women oh, stop no. being man. This mm. is enough. Pretty and hench at the same time. Scaring <laughs> <laughs> me. It's a genuine question. Now, mm. well, hold on. This is a whole nigga bit. Yeah, boy. No. Nah. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, man. That term, that term shouldn't be used, but... 
Yeah. You see me call the other black man a nigga before, bro. No, no like that sometimes. Oh. Oh, oh yeah. shit. Wow. That, that exactly. Oh shit. That's a nigga bitch. Is that exactly? Is that, oh, yeah, oh, don't repeat it, me. man. Don't repeat it. Man. Don't repeat it. It's too much. No, this is too much. Definitely at the shoulders and the um but Do you know how many so more defined. reps that is though? Do you know like the, the, you see your shoulders getting I've quite nice shape already. and then you so. kept doing more reps? Yeah, she should have left it. Yeah. At like, you know what? I'm loading this one up scary. next time. I'm loading this. Fuck, load up the rack. You finish, you finish with your I'm... set. You finish with your set. No, no, no. I've got <laughs> 10 <laughs> more to do. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Exactly. In it, in it. Hugging, I've, got some, I've, um, I've got a video of some of your cousins on that. Oh, definitely. Oh, God, why are you doing that? Oh, no. Nah, Jedi. Oh, is this Whose cousins are they meant to be? Mine. Is I'm not, I'm not. Jedi. Hey. Jedi, you answer hey. the question. I want to hey. know whose cousins they are. Hey. Oh, they swim, of course. Oh, no, swimming. Oh, no, no that's mad. That's mad. <laughs> mad. <laughs> hey, I reckon... I can't lie. I wouldn't want her to save me, you know. Yeah, you would still. Well, you no, I wouldn't want her to try and save me from no right. water. She could just get me. <laughs> I'd, <laughs> start, I'd start swimming away from her. I don't. I don't want to be saved by you. I want to be saved by you. He's scary. He's a mermaid. No, Jedi. But why are you so wicked, though? I don't. <laughs> Let me show you, look, Saturn. Yeah. If, if yeah. any of you got your Instagram to hand, yeah, let me show you lots of. Um, okay. If you got Instagram on your phone, pick up your phone. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Go to your settings on Instagram. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Scroll down to where it says suggested content. Oh yeah, I've done that already. Yeah. What have you done? Um, is it the politics something something and you have to turn it on you spend too Wait much second. time on the internet my girl yeah but so do you so do you you must spend the same amount no, of time no, no 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 the difference is i've done it already so you've been on, you've just spent time i've just been informed like the old man that i am oh okay yeah. yeah i saw oh. this like i saw this like a week ago a week ago exactly exactly yeah. So hold on, I want I need to see more sensitive content in it. Is that's what I'm trying no, to pick? Um, well, yeah, I've all yeah, I've got the sensitive content thing on more, and then I've What's got the, and then I've got the the political thing set to don't limit political yeah. content from people that that you don't follow. Yeah, but after you go to settings, well someone explains to, to, to me. I think you go to privacy, know. like general and privacy that area. Rika, you got, you got a to... problem following instructions, you know. <laughs> Don't ever ask well, me directions because yeah. I know you're just gonna forget. And them. then you go to content. <laughs> Once you find content, then you could um, take off the limiting the limitation. Sorry. But yes, man. Oh shit, I muted people and all sorts. Yeah. I, I couldn't see it, but I'll look at it a bit later. <laughs> You're going to forget, man. Yeah. yeah, she will, wouldn't, isn't she? Yeah. What is it you couldn't see? Go to suggested, you couldn't see suggested content. It's just in settings, it's not settings. in privacy. You just, you just scroll down uh, to about the middle. And it goes. Yeah. And, yeah. Hang on. Yeah. I go back again. Okay. Settings, and then what do I do? So I'm saying I must be a, a suggestive like, content. Myself. Suggested must, content, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Go on then. Yeah. Yeah. And then what do I do next? You go to political content. Okay. 
Then you change the setting to don't limit. Okay. Okay. Mm. They go to the sensitive one as well, or not? Um, it's up, up to you, you Reva. If you're, if you can handle sensitive stuff. Oh, so it's gonna be like dirty behavior. Could be. Possibly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Like Which is definitely, possi definitely possibly definitely. some dirtiness, possibly some violence. You know. Possibly some judge. Possibly, you know what I'm saying, Unc. Mm. Mm -hmm. Now, did you not? Did you not see the guy on the train um, knifing up the next? Yeah. Yeah, I did see that. Actually. Daylight, you know. Daylight. Yeah. Daylight. Yeah. Where? I hear people saying things like, "Oh, why didn't anybody try and help?" Da, 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 da. But I'm not being funny. But when somebody has a knife like that. And they're doing what they're doing to someone. You think they're not going to use it on someone else? Okay. Do you think they're going to use it on you because you're filming them? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not. I'm not saying it's right to film, though, Unks. Do you know what I mean? No, I'm, no, just, I'm saying, just saying. Like, things that you get me more danger. That's what I'm thinking about. No, hundred percent, hundred percent. I get it, but I also get the so other side. Women, Maybe it's because right. I'm a woman, but you know, as a woman, I'm not trying to get myself involved in anything like that. Do you get me? Maybe after. You get me, go over there, try to press down on the wounds and that, but I ain't really trying to, like, in the middle of the madness. Oh, you see this guy, though? Did he stab the person? Well, yeah. Jesus Christ. The person was airlifted. Bloody hell. What was that? He was on a train, didn't it? No, it was. It looked like a southeast no. so I, I, I'm presuming it was. What did they say? Bad dream was. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. bad dream was block off, and then apparently some air ambulance had to go down there as well. I don't know what. what was that Saturday? Was that Saturday just gone last uh, week? Monday, Monday, Monday. Okay, no. Monday. Oh, I think there was a. Was there a crash? There was a crash. Was a crash. I remember that was causing traffic. I think that was yeah, on the Saturday. Was that was on the Saturday, yeah. I remember hearing that I was in North at the time. Mm. Mad. Mad. I think that's been every day, man. We jump in the, the train tracks, all sorts of methods. It's not Bro, unusual. did you see the man driving his his car on the train track? <laughs> no. <laughs> Police was chasing this study. The study said, yeah, I'm going to turn right. No, it was left. I'm going to turn left onto the train tracks. Man, turn left. It was, yeah, was driving on the train tracks. You got you got different types of, you know, different viewpoints. So you got someone on the on the actual fucking platform filming. And then you got the CCTV filming it going around the corner. And it's getting on the tracks. I don't understand people. I don't understand people at all. What's that, Rika, that you put in the side there Rika you hear me sorry did I it's share sorry. it he doesn't like sharing it feels like it's an extra job for him let me see if <laughs> oh dear wait what You see it? No, 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 no. Oh, no, shit. No. no. Oh. No. no, no, no. So what, is he Is he married to both of them? Yeah. Go on. Is he married to one or married to both of them, Rika? Both of them, I think, it says. Well, I'm sure you can only marry one. Um, Rika, that, that's not my... You haven't answered... Okay. Oh. okay. Oi, top comment. Okay. Every man's it's dream, isn't it? I mean, naturally, you'd have to marry both of them. But all he's but all he's really getting is two faces. Where are you going with that, Rika? About all he's really getting? It's two, two faces. faces. What yeah. do you mean? He's married <laughs> two women. <laughs> Mag, why you sound so hurt? Because nah, she's telling you the facts. She's going with the, like all he's really getting thing. Like it's kind of odd. Mm. Like, there's nothing additional. But what two what faces? Do you mean two it's faces. Odd? No. Okay. So what do you want him to be getting? Do you think like there should be like? More of everything else. Sorry, I don't want to laugh. 
Like what? <laughs> I don't like, know. We, we, we've already created two people, and then you're like, you're trying to minimize it. It's how does, deep how does that? Wait, how does that there? work though? Like, I just want to know how that how all that works works out because what's both that? of them must be feeling something when something's going on. Wait, did them two argue? Can one argue? Maybe just one person feeling like, it. I don't know. Yeah, but one more and um, two, two wives is nothing. I don't know what's going on. It's not about it's two wives. wives. Have you seen? Oh. The, have you seen oh. the the thing? Aunt? They're conjoined. Oh no! Oh, oh. Conjo- oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you know when the penny drops? Oh yeah, no! Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Like, what's wrong with two wives? What's wrong? Yeah, with yeah like, well, what's going on? Yeah, oh, okay. It's not really two wives. It's one wife. Yeah, and a sharing. So they're sleeping in the same bed, but like if one's not on it. The other. Yeah, I've seen that video. Before, I guess, That's a big up for him I... now, because he took that that's... on. Yeah, that's nice of him. I can't lie. It's nice of him what? to do. What do you mean it's nice of him? I'm saying, I'm just saying that he... Hold on. Hold on. Wait, wait, wait. Are you saying huh? one man with conjoined twins married both of them? Is that what you're saying? Yeah. Oh, my days. <laughs> Obviously, if he's going to marry one, what... he's going to marry two, isn't it? Yeah, that, I need you someone can't to marry one without one. Right one. Right. Right. Because he can get... Married one, man. And... He married one. Married one. No, you can't marry one. That's that's, that's out of order. But legally, now how done legally? I swear you, can, you can't marry you can, two. I've seen he's bigging me. Yeah. He's bigging me to marry most. It does women. say it does not. I think he married one of them. He's, it says, Abby Henzel privately marries an army veteran. You see, there's no. Right. So, what, so what happens? Says, what happens to twin that Abby Henzel. What? So I hold on. The one so they're they're, they're both the looking up at him. Oh, they're both looking up at him like you and know. Both, they, um, and there's only one. There's only one private part. So what? She, what they get? Shit. Right, this is a freak team. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Let's see, freak But then it's not. Now. It's not as. Pri- it's, it's not as private as they said it would be. Otherwise, it wouldn't be a fucking shade. Right. Fucking mm. right. <laughs> it's a private. It says privately married, isn't it? Oh, so it's private. Yeah. So hold on, hold on. So that means. Can a man give his girl foot her shoulder? <laughs> hmm? I can't do it exactly. I can't. <laughs> and hold Jedi. on, are both of them feeling Why does your serious? face look like that, Jed's man? <laughs> he looks disgusting, man. Right? I don't know what he's seeing. One's trying, to, <laughs> one's trying to sleep and one's trying to enjoy this. No, nah, it's a madness. Wait, they're expecting, apparently they're expecting a baby. What? Oh, is this oh, what you're looking at? But hold on, it's the one pump, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> <It's the> one... <laughs> this is what I'm saying. There's only Two one heads. of one until you know you get up to the shoulders, past the shoulders. Past the and shoulders. And you got two now. Surprise! Yeah. Right. <laughs> Mag, shut up. <laughs> but hold on, that means no no no. That means one controls one side of the body, no? Maybe the left hand. I don't know. I don't know. You're just guessing. No, I don't make no sense. Really and Judy, you're just guessing. You're making. I know I'm guessing, but I'm just saying it don't make no sense. (laughs) One could have one could have no say in nothing and just be there. Uh, Yeah, just there, looking at, staring, while the other sisters getting walked out. And and the other thing could be that they're just constantly like overriding. And this is what do you mean? Picking up that? I'm picking up this, and they're just dropping stuff. Do you know what I mean? No, I think, I think they should say single. I think they should say single because you should no, have they're that. They're never going to be. They're never going to be. No, that, they because you're taking why should what? So when someone's getting hit foot punch shoulder, the other one's got to be what? Listen, stop it, Dave. Hey. <laughs> no, I think they're both getting it. I think at, at that point they're both. Yeah, they're it. both feeling it. You know what I'm saying? Whether the other one's sleeping or not. This is the thing, yeah. This is. The thing, yeah. <laughs> this is... This is the thing, yeah. They could have separate separate husband, but then both husband is going the same tone tone. I can, I can, so it's crazy. I can, I can. Why you gotta spell it out for chefs? Listen, yeah, I can you have intercourse and great at the same time. Like, what is that? No, oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> <Stop it. laughs> I'm sure she'd have to turn to her sister and be like, sis. We are about to get down. What are you saying? Again, you okay with this, this or not? Time today, man. What what am I gonna do? Wait. 
unless there's four breasts. If it was like a little further down, that there was. Oh dear. <laughs> no, my, that would my be God. a trip. <laughs> what's that? Uh, 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 what's what? going on here? No, oh, wait, is this I dancing? Oh. oh, no. Wait, <laughs> hold on. I'm trying to see the leg. Man. Does this go under the sensitive part of um, Instagram? <laughs> no. <laughs> nah, I don't think that's sensitive. Dead, it's just a piece dead. of metal. I think it's you've got, you've got no a... sense in that. Oh. You couldn't the foot... see the full no, video properly, but was yeah, big up. the foot gripped around the pole? I don't know. That's it. No, look, man, <laughs> it's, 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 like, like, like the, the bottom part gripped the pole. Like, look yeah, at it. Just wedged. Yeah, it's, it's just man. kind of wedged, man. Yeah. It's oh, crazy. blood. It's crazy. You see oh. what I'm saying? Like, these people, remember, I watched one um, BBC documentary on this girl and her mum who... Uh, are like toddlers basically they're not even like little people or midgets or anything like that they're actually yeah. she looks like a baby you know what i mean mm -mm. and then she grew up a little bit and then in the next series of it she had a six foot plus boyfriend i said this guy is wrong <laughs> he's so wrong which one had the six foot the daughter the daughter finally oh. came of age and had a boyfriend Right, okay. and then they were filming it and all of that. And I was just thinking, when they were walking hand in hand, and his hand was low, this man's six foot something, you know, tall, <laughs> slender white guy. Like, nah, I knew what he was doing at night time. Yeah, he's, he's a wrong one though. He's a wrong one. Straight wrong one. Oh shit, Mag, what have you put in the chat now? Them two are teaching a class. The teachers or something, man. This is this is quite cool. To the teachers fair. as well. See, yeah. you're getting bare yeah. knowledge. You get knowledge for free. Two brains are two. Okay. What do you say? Two heads are better than one. No, Last thing, stop it. You lot are funny, you know. I can't even. I don't have it to see. Mike, they're teachers, Mike. Yeah. Mike, you went and you went and, and you see the graduation hat. They're Mike, both wearing graduation hats. Is, is that no, the Is that the barrier? I didn't barrier because I didn't watch it that far. No, I turned it off as soon as I saw it. Is, it, is that the married twin? <laughs> what you mean, turned off as soon as you... Why are you lying? Yeah, Rico. Yeah, you just left the conjoined out. Of they were that's, that's the whole point. <laughs> once, uh, you, once you make the <laughs> conjoined now, it has a whole new connotation. <laughs> and then when they only can conjoined from the shoulders, like it's a whole separate person from the shoulders. Nah, that's, that's a mess. A complete mess. I mean... One has to fully see what the other one's on. Can't even put the, you know, the mask. You know, like when you were on the airplane and you put that thing over your eyes to block out any light and that. You know what I mean? Because you're still going to feel it. Though, it. There's different types. No, you can't sleep if somebody, I, I, I'm not a woman, but I'm just saying, you know what I mean? How is she going to sleep when the other one's <laughs> on it with her partner? Doesn't make sense. It's a lot. I thought at this stage, both of you have said I do in it, so you might as well just yeah, take it. Well. I, think, yeah, I think, yeah, I think you, need to, you need to marry both of them. Because okay. no, they, they might have the from... audacity to have taste and say, no, nah, I don't really fancy my man. <laughs> I mean, they have, they kind of have no choice, though, um, yeah, you know what I mean? Saying. But to work with each other. Yeah, so one has to be that. like, listen, sis, you know? Yeah. yeah. Da, 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 da. I uh, for the team. Hi. this is what I like. I'll be up. You're not talking about the twin twins. You wouldn't yeah. really want to know. You, I yeah. don't really want to know. How, 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 <laughs> how can one of them be married to a person? It doesn't even No, there's one called Two Girls, One Body, One Hot Summer. Wait, uh, what? Uh, what? <laughs> Oh, oh, Mike, where are you finding these things? I worry just from the first link on YouTube. Oh, you're talking YouTube, about YouTube, threesomes. There's bare it's stuff about right. these two people, to be no. fair. Like, and I'm, well, just, I'm actually yeah, super definitely. interested because it's like, how do you if, integrate um, a conjoined twin um, with one lower body? They're doing they volleyball, the all sorts. Yeah, swimming. They're only conjoined from the shoulders. That that that's a that's a bit of a mess. What's that jet ski? You know what I mean. They're doing. Like they've done more stuff than me at this point. And you're oh, right, wow. Chips. 
the other one should have just consented, like, we are getting married. Because so, yeah. hold on. Yeah, so, so, it's a co joined twin with one private part or two private parts? One. Mm, so, you like, care about, man, it's fucked. I'm just saying, <laughs> no, 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 no. It's not that all that we care about. We're concerned. Oh God, that's conjoined. all you want to care about, man, it's no, fucked. Usually, co joined <laughs> twins are joined at the head. And they have separate bodies, so like, yeah, that's even a problem. But that that uh, is workable still. But you're saying two heads on one body? No, nah, I'm out, man. Yeah. That is a madness. And then one's not consenting. So what are you doing? <laughs> you're just having uh, so a wedding night. So yeah. I'm just back from Nigeria. Oh wow! Woo! Yeah, just come back. <laughs> Hold on, did they say that there? Yeah, there's quite a few videos that I've already started uploading, but I've got loads more to put up. But um, yeah, it was brilliant, and Where I can't wait stay? to go back again. Huh? Where did you stay? Benin. Well, Lagos and Benin. So we flew in, stayed in a hotel in Lagos, and then we drove down to Benin, and we stayed in Benin. Yeah, that's a lot. So it was good. Brilliant. Did you say? Did you stay with his family, or did you not have your own like little place? We Sorry, stayed. Are with... you saying Benin, as in the country next door? Or Benin? No, Benin, Nigeria, where the where the the uh, Obas Palace is. In um, in the south, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Not the kingdom. Yeah, you but can't the, stop the... me, Maku. I told you, I ain't frightened the fuck all. You can't it's stop bright. me. Yeah, people, so people, dudes. Yeah, people where did you stay? You gone to my ends, man. That's me. Me and hold um, on, Unks. Hold on, Unks. Did you stay with his family or did you lot have your own like Airbnb or something? No, we didn't have an Airbnb, so we had very close Hector's got connections, we've got connections. So oh, okay. yeah, so we stayed in a very nice house, mm. very lovely house. Yeah. So, well, that's good. That's interesting. Yeah, it was beautiful. Yeah, it was good. They were going to kill a goat for me and I wouldn't let them. <laughs> mm -mm. I wouldn't let them. So they said, all right, well, when you go, it's it. when you go back, it's Easter. We're going to kill it then. Mm. Apparently, they've already called up Hector. They're preparing the goat and going to kill it now. So, nice. They're waiting for me to go to kill it because I didn't want to see it die. But yeah, good it was really, yeah. really, really good. Mm. I mean, I've been before, yeah. But this time, we went out and about more and had a good look around. And mm -hmm. do you know, I was more engaged in wanting to know the history and stuff. You know, the first time it was a bit, get let's get in, get out kind of thing. But um, wow. but this time, no, it was good. We went around all over the place. Yeah, I went shopping. See a lot of things. Got called a yimbo. If I did this, yeah, yimbo, yimbo. <laughs> but I'll tell you something. Mm. If it, it means white, doesn't it? If yeah. if we were in England, those people no, would no, be no, done no, no. for sorry, racism. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. It means it means actually a white person. Yeah, white That's person. Because the word for white is fufu. Oh God! Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so it was, in, it was really, doo -doo. really, really good. Well, doo -doo is black, so we don't call, call anyone doo -doo, or we don't call anyone yeah. black. So, yeah. but fufu, yeah, we don't call anyone fufu either. We just say weibo, which more describes a particular type of people, like an English person or you know, what I mean? yeah, a white person, fully European. But yeah, no, it was nice. Yeah. It was yeah, nice. man. Of course, and they always treat you with the, the utmost respect. You, you get that. Yeah. yeah so we were so we were in Edo State. That's where we stayed in Benin. Yeah. Edo State. Yeah. Um, That's round the corner from my ends, kind of. Yeah. Well, it's all my ends in it. Well, my mom and that side of the family. Yeah. That's so where, why did you reject the royalty? Comes from. Huh? Mm -hmm. So they're like the the Oba is my grandma's junior brother's son. Do you get it? 
Your grandma asked you and your brother's son. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's her nephew, basically. Yeah, because there's there's quite a few families, isn't there? And they go it, it changes from <coughs> family to the next each. Well, yeah. yeah, of the same bloodline. Yeah, yeah same bloodline, yeah. but it sort of goes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if, if there's if the king dies, yeah, I I shouldn't be around, for example, because they come looking for everybody who's written in a book. If they all know where we are all over the planet. You know what I mean? It's, it's deep. But if we're in the country. That's when it becomes a, a, a serious thing. Where during the, that period, yeah, people, everybody stays in their house and all that, that type of stuff. Because there's some rituals and ceremonies that's going on. And they're looking for a new uh, uh, monarch from the bloodline. So they, they know all the people in the bloodline. So, yeah, it's just who's available and who's more closely related to the. To the to the previous uh, king or whatever, you know what I mean. I think it. So, I think it's something to do with um, the way that they've sorted it out to make it fair. That they make sure that each. Well, it's not it, fair because each now it takes changed. its turn or something. It's, yeah, but yeah. it's male orientated now. Because by rights, my mum and my grandma should have been uh, monarchs, but out of just sheer. You know, things have changed. That is become <clears> more uh, uh, a patriarchal. Is it patriarchal, matriarchal, or matri I don't even know which one's which. But yeah, one of them. Yeah, it's changed in the that system yeah. of having a king and a queen. Yes, you've got princesses and all of that. Da -da -da -da, but now the main focus is on every male born. Do you get it? Uh huh. Yeah. So it's 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 a bit thing, but they're never disenfranchised. Don't get it twisted. You know what I mean? These princesses and all of that, they get their own villages and all of that. You know what I mean? So their son or their thing will grow up to be the chief of that village. And that's like a connection to the king. All the mm -hmm. chiefs are in the king's court. You know what I mean? So it's, it's a system that's <coughs> as old as, 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 as time still. You know what I mean? We've always yeah. had an organized system of... Uh, rulership and thing and we've made mistakes along the way but that's why certain things are put in place now like a son must be far away from his father so the king son will not live or grow up with the king or in the king's court because they don't want like rivalry or you know because these things have happened in the past where you know the monarch the, the son wants to the monarch wants to kill the son or the son wants to kill the father and all of that so they worked out from a long time ago that yeah look this is a better way of doing it keeping them apart until the son's time to rule you'll have the best education you'll probably live in a palace not too far from where the king is you know what i mean mm -hmm. like with his mother and his other siblings and that. <clears throat> that's why the king has multiple wives and, and that, you know what I mean? makes more sense right yeah, there's quite a few people there though that have multiple wives and stuff. Yeah, like like that's my, because... my, my granddad, he, he wasn't a prince or he wasn't well on my dad's side, I'm talking about, but he was the, the chief of the whole town. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah of Ife. Yeah, and that's in the north, kind of. Yeah, not really, but yeah, that's the home of the Yorubas, right? So on that side, he's the chief of that particular town which is known for its all the literary works and libraries and universities are in that town and basically the history of a particular tribe do you go what i'm saying mm -hmm. yeah so yeah that that tribe yeah and then obviously he has royal lineage because to be a chief in the old days you had to be of the royal court do you get what i'm saying because uh, a chief is only an administrator of that of that particular town or village or whatever do you get it he's the yeah. administrator for the king so that's why he's always when the king uh has a function all the chiefs turn up because they're all on his land they're all his relatives it works out well but it's gone even worse than that now because these people are also <coughs> politicians and that do you know what i'm saying which is another system 
do you get what I'm saying? So it's like, oh yeah, a politician, but this politician is a prince. Do you get what I'm saying? Of a, of, of uh, the son of a king of a particular part of uh, a particular city in Nigeria, like the king of Lagos. There's a king of Lagos and there's multiple kings in that, in, in Lagos, because there are different regions and different parts and different areas. But it is one overall king of Lagos, full stop. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like on Banana Island, on the island where my where my dad stays, he's a runaway king because he's from a place in the north. Yeah, not far from where my uh, my uh, my my dad's uh, uh, place is. Family is, yeah. yeah, he's meant to be. He's meant to be a ruler, but he doesn't want to do it because he's Muslim, and uh, some of the rituals he'd have to do go against his his faith. And that, you know what I mean? I think yeah. I would have fucking done it. I would have done it, perhaps. I don't know what you're doing, mate? <laughs> it's yeah. really weird because where the where the Battle of Benin statue is is meant to be mm -hmm. where the actual fight took place, and it's smack bang right in the middle of the city. Right, well, and that's what I'm saying. That 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 individual and that king of that time is my great 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 grandfather. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, so he was the one fighting against Queen Victoria in that situation. It's <laughs> mm, a madness. It's a madness. Sorry. Right. Um. Let me, Air Chevelle, this is where we stayed. This is the inside of where we stayed. Let me show you. But we also went and visited family as well. We've got loads of yeah. videos on that. But but you see how they live, though? They live, like, in, like, compounds and stuff. Yeah, that looks I nice. Think so. I think that's mm. one thing That's one thing I like about it is because mm. it's community-based. Like, everyone's together. So you said this is where you stayed, yeah? Yeah, yeah. That's so the is, inside. Is, so all those people around, do they also live around that area? In that so area? so the people that are in my videos are either family yeah. or um uh, no, there are, there is a there is a gate man that you might see in the background. But yeah. um yeah, they're either and his family. Um but no, but most of them that are driving around with me are either family or st there's a couple that are security because we had that we knew yeah. like close friends. Um, I don't know how to how to explain it. Um, Hector's got connections, so mm. there are people that step forward to make sure that we're sort of like in a okay protected. Yeah, but there's. It's like whenever we go out, there's a group of us, if you know what I mean. Okay, that's nice. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Can so I share a screen? Oh, yay. Yeah. Jed, my oh, wants to share screen. Screen. Oh, screen. Thank you. Screen, you know, I don't know what's wrong with me. So. Can you do it, Mags? Let me see. Jed, Jed has to allow him to. Okay. To accept the screen share. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so it was good. It was really, really interesting. Really good. Right. You know. Yeah, so you said you learned some of the history. Was that in Lagos or in Benin? But that's in Benin. That's okay. in Benin. Oh, here we are. Look. Hey. I actually um, filmed the drive from Lagos to Benin okay. so that oh. you could see the differences from every zone. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But you know what people outside of Nigeria imagine it to be, it's completely different. Of course it's not. I wouldn't, I wouldn't know know they of course there. it's not what they perpetrate and put out there. Of course. Mm. Just stay out, innit? No, I, 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 I say continue. Yeah, once I went once, but it was years ago. I mean it's changed a sure. lot since then. Yeah, yeah, I was gonna ask yeah. like, have you seen a lot of change? Kind of, but yeah, 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 it's changed a lot. But there's still the two worlds going on at the same time. But you know what? This time around, because I went out and about and I spoke to people, yeah, I kind of, 
I don't know if people are going to understand this. I want the people that are out there not to live in the poverty that they're in. But the lifestyle they've made within the poverty kind of is what makes Africa. And what I mean by that is when you see all the little shade places that they make, you know, the structures they make with the little roofs and just so that they can sell apples or bananas or, you know, whatever they, whatever they feel that they need to sell. Mm. Um, <laughs> no, no, seriously, that is kind of no, the no, heart no, of... I was laughing at Maku, but I get what you're saying as well. Yeah, yeah. You're on about yeah. the makeshift yeah. stuff that people have when they're in poverty. Yeah, yeah. It kind of defines the place. And do you know what? Yeah, it's a shame that that has to be a defining feature. But one thing that seems to happen is when you when anybody tries to clean up or sweep up or improve anything like that, it's like they take all the soul away from everything. Yes, so now that's sending, kind of so what now, I'm trying so to say. now they're sending fake yeah. veg, do you know what I mean? With, mm. with sprayers coming from the ceiling and all sorts of different stuff. And it's just like, can you why, remove, can you... You remove your um, cursor, please? It's sorry, bothering sorry. me. Thanks. Yeah. So this I'll is the old this. museum, um, but they're building a new one <laughs> right next door for the Benin bronzes. So okay. unfortunately, the old one isn't open no more because obviously they've shut it while they're building. There's the new one in the background being built. What's that? So have they have they taken down the old one though? No, it's still there. This is the old one. The round structure is the old one, uh -huh. and the one in the background is what they're building for the new one. Um, this is the cenotaph of the fallen soldier that they do do a poppy day on. Believe it or not. Yeah. They do a lot of stuff you would need. Yeah, so, <laughs> so there's the new one that they're building. You can see their aims and their goals there. Mm. They're building that because they've been given back the Benin bronzes, haven't they? So mm. they want to house it in sort of like... Well, back. Yeah, no, no. Has, but, it been, has um, it been given back or has it been loaned back? I'm not sure, but no, I know that Britain. Cambridge Britain is given, given back. back. I know Germany is given back. I know... Um, oh, I know. okay, Olive. other countries. Olive. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, Tony Jollofson. Where's Tony Jollofson? Or Netherlands, sorry. The Netherlands gave back this big bronze uh, peacock horse. I mean, uh, yeah, the other day, not too long ago, about a year or two ago. I mean, I'm you can see all the stuff. cars there as well, you know. Mm -hmm. People have got good cars and that. Of course, huh? But, I mean, obviously, there is abject poverty as well. You see the people that get up at sort of like four o'clock in the morning to mm. walk miles just so that they can carry bottled water on their head, you know, on the motorway. But I, I don't know. There's such a – there's an enchantment about it all. I, I, I don't know how to explain it. Yeah. You have to really feel it and see it mm. to – Imagine that was the you, only thing you need – imagine you that was the only thing you needed to do. It's a worthy journey, isn't it? Do you know yeah. what it is? Um, um, all it is is that these people are just living the lives that they've known to be their life all their life. Like, right. I know it's, it's it's a lot of life stuff, but yeah, I think it's just people being in their natural state, mm -hmm. having to do what they have to do, and obviously there is a, there's a difference when you come over here because hard to things that they have to do back home. You don't have to do here, in it. It's all given to you to some degree. It's all there. Yeah. So, I I just think that's the difference. But really and truly, they're just getting on with life. You get me? But because you don't see it a lot, it can be kind of like, oh look. Yeah. No, I, I, I feel that the environment that she's in as well that she's going into. It crosses. Hey, between, look at Uncle Hector. You know, rural and um, city. So you've got city parts, Benin is a city, but there's very lots of rural areas. It's very rich in, you know, trees and forest and all of these type of things. Okay. And there's rivers and all that, all of that. Put it up large if you can, so that people can see it a bit better. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what it is? It's because it's the um. Been again. I don't even know what's going on. I don't know if maybe because I'm screen sharing or something. But if I put it on full screen, that's as big as it. Because remember, you got it on portrait view. Yeah. Yeah. So like it's not really that's as high as it goes. On the screen. <laughs> it's, <awful. laughs> it's a shame, isn't it? But I mean you can see no, the sorry. differences um here. And as you go along, as you come out of the cities, <laughs> you know, you start to see the way that they I mean it's amazing. You go later. down our motorways, right? And all you see for miles is like road signs and 
all right, the roads are good, but you see road signs and crash barriers, right, and maybe fields in the background. You go down Nigeria's road, main road from Lagos to Benin, and you will literally see that the the the, the heart of the country. You will see the different mm -hmm. cultures and different tribal people because they they actually come out onto the motorway to work. So you'll oh, yeah. see the ha the houses and the actual civilization sort of like right yeah because they'll, they'll set up the... shop they'll set up shop on the highway because they yeah. know that's where more people are going to be on so they, you know if someone's going someone's going home for instance and they need to buy yam for instance do you know what i mean they know they don't have to go to a store there's yeah. there's most likely a I yam seller on the side road understand how packed the motorway can get even on the freeway that goes on yeah. the island there's so much people actually like saying it's it's like that you could be stuck there, in traffic. You can see we're going into a, a more this polar kind of reminds part. me of Jamaica though. Yeah, it's, it's real. In, in Kingston. There's parallels still. There's parallels. Still. It's definitely parallels, um, Mac, for sure. Yeah, man. Anyone who's like, been to Jamaica we... and been um Nigeria says Nigeria. So even do you know what it is? It's the red dirt as well on top of everything. Yes, yes, yes Mac. Mm. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Soil, isn't it? Yes, yeah. right. Architecture's a bit... Mm, yeah, yeah. It, it looks... Vary, I can't lie. Vary. I can't lie, yeah. This is you exactly see, how Jamaica look more times, like is that, You know, it's them concrete problem. arch things. Yeah, but yeah. No, what you're saying... <laughs> it's like you're doing you off, like, gothic something, but then it's just all Most concrete. of these buildings are not people's homes. You don't get it. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, we, we know. With the, oh, aren't they right. businesses and stuff most right, of more time? Right, right, Public buildings yeah. yeah so like or shops i don't or i don't think it would i don't yeah. think it would be safe to have your home on front street though nah do you know what i mean Unx? No, do you know what i mean Unx? yeah it wouldn't be safe for you to like on the motorway, no, 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 no. The motorway. no that ain't but safe what will happen is the entrance to where you live will be on the motorway yeah Makes yeah sense, yeah right? Yeah, 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 yeah. So, like a left, state. so like you take the left and then you have to take right. a right and then you're in you just see yeah. a big gate, you'll see a big yeah. gate in one of in between these buildings or whatever, and you can see like a big mansion in the background or something, mm -hmm. or a big uh, hotel. But no matter what you want, you know, they, yeah. they, they'll find it if you, you can no find, matter. yeah, 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 yeah for yeah. sure. Yeah. It's it's really funny because nothing works, but everything works, they make it yeah. work. It's weird, yeah, 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 yeah. It's really. like. We, it's the we art wanted, of survival, Jupiter. Yeah, we wanted to get money and exchange it, right? This will make you laugh. Mm. I really wish I'd filmed it, but I didn't want to do it because I didn't want to film the man in comes to the UK or anywhere in Europe later on and mm. recognise him. But they they have what you call human ATMs. Mm -hmm. So there's men that you are so, so you go to a you go to a Donny with British pounds and he'd he'd sell you back. <laughs> yeah, yes. like, yeah, you know, yeah, the wickedest exactly. thing Absolutely. is like he'll, he'll be posted and up outside the bank. If you looked at him, you would not know that he's got all this cash on him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. You wouldn't he's know. Smart, and, smart. I mean, in in Britain, that would be a liability. That you know, I know. we don't have get... things like that. We don't have like. Yeah, Two imagine some trampy guy next to the bank, like world. offering you what the bank does. Yeah. Where you'll die. Well, every time you see where it says POS, it means it's somebody that actually carries them. Like, there's you can change your money there. But okay. it's got to the stage um, um, thing in some parts, like in Lagos. That guy's got a shop now. He's got a little okay. like, in front. He yeah, 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 yeah. And yeah, but you've got, got mobile there. ones. You've got them on the motorway as well. Yeah, mobile. Yeah, yeah. It's amazing. I'm not buying for no mobile one. I'm, but I'm gonna go to a kind of shop. <laughs> I can't <laughs> lie. The, the, mo no, the this, mobile this. ones, the mobile ones. I can't lie. The rate might be a little bit more higher in it. Yeah. So just no, no say Yeah. Is, yeah. Well, no, if the mobile guy gets a shot, the same thing. Do you yeah, it's the same thing. Yeah. Sorry. You know what I mean? You just got a little shop front now. Well, this Audi is popular, like, you know. I like that Audi as well. Because the mobile one, what do you need? The mobile, the mobile one will count, count to 500 and then spin the notes around and count 500 again. Until and, then count, yeah. <laughs> 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 and then count, yeah, and then count them again. Right, <laughs> like, yes, this is 1000. 1000. Oh, my friend, you don't, you, you don't, you don't, you don't need to, one for me, you don't need to, one for me, one for you. Yeah. One, two for me, two for you. One, two, two for you, Matty. Like, yeah, you be trying. Matty. 
But take, by the I time you look half your money still, gone, I saw a video of a man doing that still. In, yeah, that's why yeah. a little bit of a shop and out of the way yeah. doesn't mean you can't get jacked or whatever because they've got pickpockets and all sorts. I remember I played that video. He does the mad technique. Played the video. He does the mad technique. And the man was like, street robbers, they don't have. You know and, the, and, and the video it's, was it's like, very I, dangerous for the street robber. You know, yeah, yeah, I played the video. Yeah, I've and seen people mm -hmm. with some kind of scam. No, you can't made. hear me by now. No, yeah, no I can hear you, Jen. But I don't know how this is talking. Like people counting it on the road. I don't think Stafford can hear. This is England still. This is be a bad thing. Yeah, go on, Jen. <laughs> <laughs> I know why when you see. Uh, Just still going. Hello, aunt. Maku, can you not hear Jedi? You don't want that instant justice. Either. Hello, Maku. Oh, yeah. I don't think he can hear any of us. Teeth, teeth. That's it. Your life's done. The one's just talking. The one's just talking. Oh, we can't hear us. I'll tap it in the back. That uh, nah, is cool, man. It's calm. It's calm. No, but he needs to know. Definitely. <laughs> How long did it take you? So the drive from Lagos, drive from Lagos to Benin is uh, three hours. Yeah. And the roads, they're not as bad as what I expected because the first they time don't we keep went, freezing all the time, that's why. No, but the first time we went, you know, it was real the road some of the roads were real shit. And don't get me wrong, there are still some that are shit. Mm. But for the major highways and that, they're not that bad anymore. They're getting worse here and better. Yo, the even UK these too. bushes, it's giving me nostalgia, bro. Even these little bush bush on the side that there. This is, looks like mosquito central. I love I love the little put put the grass on the far side. You can stand next to that for two yeah. minutes. Yeah, your legs are yeah, 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 yeah. You're getting well, right I took, up. I took yeah. Ali yeah. Malaria. Yeah. 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 It's, it's not true. Now. It's, not true it's, saying, uh, it's proper cloudy. If there's a gully, if there's a gully near there, yeah. Oh yeah, you're fucked, man. That's when you get the dengue fever and all that. The little put puts, they're they're good. Yeah. And especially in the big city, you don't want to see a river or any type of mm. estuary <laughs> or Olympic props. You don't want to smell one there. either. Tesco's right, trolley. It, it might look cloudy, but you won't believe how hot it was there. On that. Yeah, definitely humid. Definitely yeah. humidity, man. That's that, that's that 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 well. you, can tell, you can tell by the speed that people are walking. Let me tell you. So, so Arms, when, when are you taking me to Nigeria? In it? I'm thinking of going there in December still. Is it you going in December? Yeah, man. Where are you? You didn't find the mail. Where's the mail? And you can't survive if you've got a car that doesn't have a horn. That horn is necessary. <laughs> That's how they speak to one another, Jupiter. Yeah. Beep. Beep, beep. Yeah. <laughs> and a full blown conversation. I just don't want to get too many other people as I'm trying to move it away and just I don't think it's fair to do what close somebody see. Yeah. Sorry, I didn't this is part 19, you know. Rotted. Well, that's what I saw. <laughs> We've only seen three, I think. I know. Going, going with the suggestions. I don't want to bait up your whole page, but yeah, this is sick, actually. This is dope. It is. I'm trying to see if I can spot anyone I know, but you're going a bit fast. Yeah. Oh, I, do, I wouldn't do it. Mag, Mag, are you okay? Mag said anybody that I know. <laughs> you're not just going to see anybody that you know on the road side, Mag. <laughs> oh, but you know, I, 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 I don't know what he's pointing out there. Like he's he's pointing out something. Now, there was some kind of monument looking thing, North Korea ish looking. No, you're mad. <laughs> <laughs> It was man, it looked like a big spider or something. Watch. But the thing is, it's good to it might seem boring that you've just recorded this, but in a hundred years it's all gonna change, you know, and people are Yeah, that's play. true, that's true. Look at how it used to look years. to what it looks now, you know. Years. That's the thing, it's not it's not every day you see look. What? I still can't see what man was pointing at. Um is there right something up? there, yeah. There's two big arms and then like a middle bit. I don't know what it is. I don't know. If, if you turn it up, he's probably telling you. Theme park. Okay. Isn't that you on that video there? 
Oh, Unibem. University. Oh, okay. Unibem, that's it. I'd actually love to go. I'd actually really love to go. I tell you what, if you go, you'll love it. I'm going back. I, I know. I think I know. I know. I would. You know. Like, without without a doubt. And I don't. I don't want to be doing like, all the excursions. I want to live like this. I want to go meet the people. Yeah. I think we'll go. I would like to go to the river now. Meet the people. Uh, listen, the once you leave your estate, listen, in, even in the bougie side where I live, right? Yeah. Um, it's still, it's still, it's more conducive. The only reason it's more conducive, yeah, if you're coming from Europe, right, is mm -hmm. it's like the equivalent of Kensington and Chelsea. Okay. Kind of Do you get what I'm saying? I don't like, want to be Ken I don't want to be around no, Kensington and Chelsea though. Aunt. That's listen. where we we already live in here. I want to yeah, be but I'm saying once you leave your estate because you know your estate's pretty Yeah, you were like, private, "Hey, that's what I want to go and see the real and blah, 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 people blah, blah, blah. and I loved it." Once you come out of your estate, you're going to see yeah. real Everything is out there. Food, everything. Well, you know, this is the thing. Once I'm with you, Aunt, I'm good in it. No problem. Mm -hmm. It's okay. But yeah, yeah I, I jump in a free wheeler, jump on a motorbike. You get me? On the motorbike? Who are you? <laughs> What's it taking you? <laughs> mm -hmm. I wouldn't, mm -hmm. no, I wouldn't experience that motorbike thing. I don't know if it can hold me, but know, still, I want to experience really, it. I'm not though. really a fan because I'm not trying to grab onto man. I heard saying, that. You know what? I heard that for you. I don't mind holding onto like, man. I'm cool. You feel like you have to go to Nigeria to try a bike or something? No, yeah, no, no, no. Not necessarily. It's just a different. It's just a different experience, isn't it? You get to see different things that you wouldn't see. It's, yeah, it's not that like, close. You don't. You really want to be in a car still, right? No, no. Yeah. I have, listen, I have not. You see, whatever you told me to do, I'm happy to do because you know, you know your no, country, right? Try. It's good it's good to like try. mold me, yeah, mold me. Oh, right, shut up, the... you, Mike. <laughs> when I went Lagos, when I went Lagos, one time. Um, shut yeah. your friend. <laughs> We took public transport. <laughs> oh, nah, Mike, you're free serious, wheelers. bro. I've been in them three wheelers just to go up the road and that. Yeah, man. Uh, you know, this bit must be dusty walking. as hell, though. It's proper dusty. Yeah, yeah, yeah you got to wind up the window. You know, I just, I just feel like coughing. I'm just looking at a filter cough, like. I won't be coughing. It's hot and it's humid. That's mm -hmm. First time you don't have the window open, you have the AC on. Yeah, the AC. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's better on that way because I don't know about this traveling without AC in that country yeah. <clears throat> and having leather seats or something. Mm. You can do it, to... but you'd have to have the windows wide open. Nah, but it's and that, in some no areas, it's though. just not good having the window open. Yeah, every can grab in. your phone. That's we thank you. It's just oh, you see when you see when it's a certain type of temperature Nigeria. and it's been like that for weeks and or we months. Yeah. America, All you're gonna get is hot air coming through. Um, yeah, you you don't have aircon. No, it's, it's peak. Yeah. I had a big, massive bag of Skittles fully melted because we didn't have AC. <laughs> Skittles, you know, you don't even know they can melt until you take them somewhere like this. Exactly. Do so do you, know, do you go to restaurants and stuff where you're at here where you can't trust them? Yeah. They ain't just, got restaurants. Yeah. Oh, we did. I went, I went to places, yeah. Oh, and I went. Oh, I went to the local. The we got chicken places. joints. We got all sorts, bro. Yeah, exactly. You'd be surprised. You'd be surprised. Exactly. Like, what? What are they getting? All phone shops, everything. Um, uh, hairdressers. In, Mate, like, to be honest, yeah. I, what? I, what? From what I see, it's like they got everything and more. Everything. Okay. And more, Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's just the yeah, now, they, China's, they, now they, China's they, lurking got around got as well. A like, situation. We they'll find so a way to resolve it. You'll see them on the on the motorway, you know, a lorry's broken down. They've actually got the big engine out on the motorway and there's about 10 people <coughs> there trying to sort it Listen, out to get it going again. As long as you've got a roof over your head and you can, eat, you can eat food and food is not expensive. You know what I mean? There's plenty of food and fruit always. Fruit, it'll be fruit, bread, oh. You know what I mean? Yeah, so like, this is the road <laughs> where the Benin bronzes, where they used to have the traditional oh, houses. Man, and um, you still see some of the traditional houses. 
Um, yeah, and yeah, but some man, of them still make the bronzes there. People, you can see them there. These people are probably sons and daughters of the original people. Yeah, they just cast uh, uh, some of the original yeah, people. Yeah, Remember the king? No, I, I was palace. asking Hector questions. You should play it and listen because he's explaining oh, I it. I bet some of these are expensive, yeah. aren't they? Most time, the where they do it is behind the house. Yes. Marley pictures as well. We got. <laughs> so, what kind of budget have we got, Hector? For to buy one. Yeah, according to you, we'll just pick any small. Yeah, one thing, yeah, that, no, yeah, yeah. Huh. Yeah, don't be trying to buy one of these. This is business. Yeah, I got three. I got three Benin bronzes. I brought up. Oh my god. Yeah. Something like that. When you can go to the British Museum and see all of them, the majority. No, where did you my wall? I want three. I want a fucking three of my own. Yeah, not the not the originals. They put they've been great yeah, for selling. You know, my grandma, my grandma said to me, they were only cast. Yeah. What they were only casts? Yeah. Uh, oh, so there's more. So there's more. It's a bronze cast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The casting thing, the metal they use is bronze to mm -hmm. cast other metals. So right, but don't, you, don't you think it's sad, right? That Sorry. this is the street that all the bronzes were made in. Okay. And rather than putting money into this and helping the people here so that they can keep their structures good and stuff, they've just allowed it to decay. It's quite sad. But put, turn it up because Hector points out know. the traditional it's housing business. and stuff. Like business, yeah, I've never told you. No, we'll drive no down to the bottom the when they come back halfway up. We're not going to. This is people's businesses, look at chairs and all that. That's how it goes. That place is going to be yeah, full we'll come of coming. I like that one there that has all the wall plants. Yeah. The big one or the small one? You see all these tires that they got lurking around to burn people. <laughs> yeah. We'll just show all the rest of them. <laughs> right. Anyone put a foot wrong, you just get wrapped in them tires and set wrapped quickly. Yeah, yeah, okay. Wow, so it's a really long road then. Yeah, it's a very long road. You just really are you listening to Tupac as well? <laughs> no. Yeah. Listen. This is where all of the people that yeah, you maybe not maybe you don't maybe you don't want to hear it too bad. Oh he's a big bit too. Yeah. Oh, is there two pack in the back? I yeah. can't hear that. It's a bit, um, Oh, sorry, you have to, because you have to move. It's just really against the world, it. baby. Nah, that's mad. It's how do you want it? <laughs> Get stuck with a nigga in the best lane. Down this heart, it's just having shots. Well, in her case, N word. So uh, how does it feel? Yeah. <laughs> 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 Yeah, you do all the way, yeah. So um how long did it take you to drive out of uh, Lagos? Where was you in Lagos? Three, three hours, three hours. Hello. Yeah. Drive. But this this isn't part of that. This is the day we went to look at the bron the, the where they make the bronzes and stuff. See oh, that so statue inside. there? Yeah, that was inside massive still. Yeah, really. was a bit and there's hard. another one coming up in a minute. You see. Did you go to the palace? Yeah, but you're not allowed to go in there at the moment. I mean some they do yeah. open it up occasionally, but you can't really yeah. go inside. Yeah, that's so good. I've got one yeah. to upload that's got that was on Hector's phone. Where we drove all around the outside of it and explained it and stuff and all the and and in the center of Benin, you know, all the statues. The way what's happening the there? Who is that man? So this is the Benin bronze that they've carved. Oh, it's, yeah. The, 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 I mean, some of the carvings you can't see how beautiful and clever and uh, you know how wonderful it is. See that one in the background there? Look, another one. So what was it? What was it? Is that a statue for sale? No, 
Well, probably would be for the right statues. price. <laughs> Sometimes they've got statues there. Oh, in different locations as well, town squares, okay. roundabouts. You know what I mean? There's a statue there or something. It's a, a monarch or something. If you want to buy a fan. But this is in the city. A lot of the stuff that, like the palace that was rebuilt after was in another part that's not in the city, basically. This is not far from no. the palace, this road. Because of it, yeah, the original palace, but it's not. It's yeah, not, yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's it's a lot smaller than it used to be. They love these Audis, bro. But this is what we would consider like a. It's not a major city, but it's like it's, you know, it was a big kingdom back in the day, and it's got lots of parts of it. But yeah, Benin itself is not up to date, not even to Lagos standards. Therefore, you know what I mean. Yeah. yeah. The wealthiest people got money there, like the king and that. And all that I don't people. know. I like Benin better. Yeah, no, definitely. It's more cultural. It's more. Yeah, rural, it's more cultural. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But Lagos is to... bustling. It's like. Yeah, New Lagos York. is just too crowded. New it's York, it's like yeah. mental. It's got different parts. Have you got any Lagos videos, actually? Uh, yeah, I think I have, but I'm not sure if I've uploaded them yet. Sure, sure. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. You could have gone and seen some aerial stickers on the car handle. Then you would have known that you was just somewhere else in home. taking the wrong turn. Bare electricals. His own great grandfather's um house was along this road. So he, sh he takes us, he shows us his own great grandparents. Since it is that own great grandparents were uh, bronze, you know, made the made the bronzes. So he shows us the place. But um, see, to some people, they'd look at this and they go, "Oh, it's really messy. Look how poor it is." Actually, I know this is going to sound nuts, but it's the chaotic organisation that actually makes it so beautiful you can't understand just how charming it is unless you're actually standing there and it's like i just love there. this seriously right, it I just because it's it. like it's not like india like, where it stinks <laughs> <laughs> yeah. oh god no it's just these are facts though you know i've had indians tell me this like people who've gone to india but i said to hector while we like, were there yeah, india? Um, like you must smell like jasmine and all these sweet things Jedi. And i said no i'm like Jedi, so the, it's always you come gone. off the plane, I was gonna you can speak smell doo-doo. Yeah, like, oh, Jed, you there? Yeah, yeah. 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 So we were staying in, in the Edo part, and you said you came from Edo, didn't you? No, me. Um, no, 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 Jedi. So I, I was saying to Hector, I think this is where Jedi comes Jedi. from. He said, is yeah. it? And no. I said, yeah. No, it's and, not. Um, no, it's so not. it's not? Oh, okay. Where are your grandparents? So you did you so what part do you come from? What's that for? Okay. Which is not far, but it's on the coast, isn't it? Of here, of the same area. So. Okay. It's What's Benin, this man? Uh, of Lagos. Benin is massive. Because I said to I said to Hector, I don't know if Jedi was joking. Major cities and that. But he said that well, he won't be able to go yo, back yo, yeah, because yo, 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 you know people might look for him. And Hector said, Never forget that. He wants really to go awesome. back, he can come and we'll, we'll <coughs> put him up. We'll show him. Yeah. That's nice. That's nice. Big like Uncle Hector, man. Mm. You know. He said he never he never realized that you were Nigerian. <laughs> mm. I laughed. No, I laughed. He said, I'm serious. I said, are you joking me? There's no way you can be joking. We've had conversations. We've had yeah. battles in we've had battles in Pigeon English. There's no way that he's gonna <laughs> no. <laughs> like, what just, you yeah. I said that's like, what I said Uncle to him. Hector, Uncle Hector's losing his memory. Mm. Uh, do you know we've what he might be, you know? He's losing his memory for him to say that. Yeah. yeah, that's what I said to him. I said, how can you not know? He said, I don't know. But to be honest, he probably don't, just didn't space. hold on to it because he doesn't unless yeah. it's yeah, important. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> but um, yeah. but uh, he said, oh, no, I never knew that. He said, that if he wants to go back, he said, we'll find a way of getting him back there and, and he'll be protected. 
He said, not that he needs much protection. That's what Hector said himself. <laughs> but he said, you're lovely. He said, we'll take Jedi oh. out there. He won't want to come back. How long, how long was you How long was you gone for? Not long? Ten, ten days. Oh, you had longer, right? <laughs> yeah, defo. You have to be at least at least out there, Mom. We're we're going back again, now. We're going back mm. again. I'm not going to say when, but it won't it won't be long. We are. No, going I'm not back spending again. all that money to stay two ten days. No, no way. Yeah, well, we had we had we had uh, an occasion that we had to go back for. So okay, okay. Yeah. Mm. But no, next time we will stay longer. Yeah. Yeah, my brother did that actually. Yeah, he just came for ten days and that. I was like, what are you doing, bro? I've been here two weeks already, man. I'm enjoying, bro. <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I didn't want to come home. I didn't. I got. I got tearful when I had to leave. He was there yeah. one day and found studio and gym. No oh, way. It's better. Do you know what it is, though? You see, when you go somewhere like this, and you're like, oh, is there a recording studio somewhere? No, it's just like, bruv, it's just people are going to start asking brother. around. Oh, is there a gym? What gym? You're looking for gym? Like, people's everyone's like, you're going to have free gyms by the end of the day. To bro, choose the man from. was super hint already. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean, don't Everyone get it wrong. You get you get bandits and that and stuff, but in the main, the actual normal people, you know, the citizens, yeah. they're just so polite and helpful. <clears throat> Do you know what I mean? Everybody mm. and it, respect is a big thing out there, you know. It's it, they're, they're all respectful to everybody, to each other. It's just it nice. sounds good still. Yeah. yeah, especially if you have some like affiliation, because that one time my my uncle passed away, and my sister went with my cousins, and um, because her uncle was governor of Lagos, yeah, they got mm -hmm. a motorcade and all sorts military escort yeah yeah, yeah 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 you will have yeah they was well, all looking back and confused like what the hell's going on here yeah, yeah well you wouldn't you wouldn't my... you wouldn't see who we've got with us facially but we had um we had somebody from the military that was with us and we had other people that were mm, let me put it area boys yeah yeah um Oh, so that knew their way around and stuff and connections and yeah. stuff. But, um, you know, it's good to have connections at a high level, but also at a low level if you're going to go so about. You you're going to go about. Especially in that, that area. You're going to find real area, but it's like real militia. Yeah. Get me pipeline buses. But, yes. um... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's, just yeah. carnage. that's just carnage, bro. You get a few barrels for yourself. Yeah, as, a as, uh, ski mask. Yeah, it's mad. But we 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 loved it. We loved it. I loved it anyway. Really loved it. Mm -hmm. I mean, for Hector, it was a bit more normal because used to it all. But I was like, every corner, I was like, "Wow, look, look over there, look what's happening." Oh, you're that person. Yeah, I was I like, "Oh hold it, God, I hold look. it down for ten minutes." Tourist. <laughs> everything, everything was a photo <laughs> to me. I was like, "Oh, look at this. It's beautiful." Mm -hmm. Did you point out this geezer's shirt? No, I did not. <laughs> that's why I paused. That's why I paused it here. I had to rewind it. I was like, "Is that mm. a goose shirt? Is it a goose or geese?" Yeah, geese big him up still. Swaggy. What is that? A duck. It looks like a duck. some kind of duck outfit. Yeah, it looks cold, man. It looks super, yeah. super like comedic. Mad. <laughs> Probably kill you in a minute. <laughs> this is what I'm saying. This is what I'm saying. <laughs> man can rock this and like just be like took serious. You don't have power sterling. Yeah, any. Take it. No, they're polite. Once they see a white person, they they, they definitely be like. When you come out you though at the, at the main airport in um, mm. Lagos, Lagos, when you touch yeah, down, yeah. Yeah, yeah. oh my yeah. god, those immigration officers are scary, aren't they? Yeah. Really. Yeah. Oh yeah, I was good immigration, still. the cheek of it. No, yeah, yeah no, and oh mean. my god, their their uniform as well. It's yeah, so man. um. There's military there. Everyone's at the airport. Yeah, they're all there waiting with their AK forty sevens. So you get off, and the first thing they say to you is Nigerian or international. And if you're not Nigerian, they go over there. Go and fill the form. You have to fill this little form in. Do you know what it reminds me of? The soldiers back home 
when I just when I just used to see them randomly carrying hey, AKs in, 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 in town. Did you see that? Yeah. No, that is you know when they yeah, I just saw guy, well I just saw the guy was who was he? Some security. No, the guy that was holding the gun. Who was that guy that walked past? No, it's just some. Like, What's that? Yeah, no, What's that? Yeah, the guy yeah, was yeah, holding. Yeah, yeah, he was security. Yeah, security. Yeah. Okay. Security can have AKs too. That's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, because I saw a guy walk past like like it's nothing. Like, AK is like toothpick. Where we're coming from, like. <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Look at how he's AK. holding it, though. Is yeah, that is that a gun? Got it's not the right footwear for a big strap like that. Saying, that's like, not that's yeah. not a gun though. I don't think that's a gun. How are you gonna blow? It looks like it is, but it's not. It might not be actually that bloke. It might not. Yeah. God, it got me all excited. There's no, there's no doubt about no, it. No, but he was holding it like he was on job though. Do you know what yeah, I mean? So naturally, you're gonna him. think. Look at him. But the thing is, it's them slippers, isn't it? Because you can't blast yourself out your own shoes. Well, on the, on the in some of the videos, about. but I can't remember which ones they are. The, we stop. We show all the checkpoint stops as well, and they, they've got guns. I tell you what, in Nigeria they do it right. I tell you right, they want your car to stop. They want to slow down the traffic. What they do is they just throw great big logs on the fucking road. Fucking right? hell! Right, so you've got to drive over these like logs. It, yeah, we got similar ones, but they call it speed humps. They just make them on the ground. Yeah, but yeah, their think way is more effective. It's more effective. Yeah, if we yeah, had it's logs more effective around, to mash up your car. Standstill right now in London, like with, with logs on the road to be. It's more you know, effective to mash up your car wheel. That's what you yeah. want. Yeah. You know that you could have taken plane there. So, um, Huh? You how many airports? You have, how many you airports is in Nigeria? You can drive there, and you can. There's loads. Um, yeah, we wanted to drive though. I wanted to yeah, drive. Yeah, you wanted to drive. Yeah, no, that's. What yeah, I'm yeah, saying. yeah. Because you know I wanted to film as well. Yeah. It would have been boring, yeah. but 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 you're right. By plane, it's about forty five minutes. You could be yeah. straight from Lagos. Okay. To okay. I can't lie. I'd rather the the car ride like you did. Yeah, um, it, yeah. It's just, in a place like this, you have to, innit? it? Yeah, you have to, you man. Have it's to. exciting, man. Uh, love I'll be, I'll be like Uncle Hector, Uncle one. Hector. <laughs> I need some. I want some fruit. Where can I get that? They'll stop Everywhere. by. The, they'll stop by the stall off. Be like, yeah. hey, yeah. how much? And, 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 and Chef, the rain Christmas when the rain Chef. comes down, oh, right? It's really weird because you see a place full of people, and then next minute, nobody they're all just disappearing. Yeah, yeah. And you yeah. see all these yeah. little stalls. The, umbre the umbrella comes down. They're sitting under a tiny little space underneath it. But everything's collected underneath it until it stops raining. And then the umbrella goes back off again. Yeah. It's really cute. And how long did it take you to drive to Billion? Uh, oh, she asked this, you know, earlier. Yeah. She said three hours. Oh, three hours. Okay. Three hours. See, there's the umbrellas and that. But this is a long road. This was all the road which used to have people... Bare zinc top, zinc top, mad thing. ...doing the bronzes, yeah, and now look it. at it. It's just been left to... But it's weird because the old side has actually sort of, like, gone downhill, and the other side has come up. Whereas when I went there years ago, it was the reverse. The other okay. side was better, and, but now it's, it's changed. It's, it's weird. I suppose the bandits run them out to the other side and now, you know, won't be long. Do they have motorways there? As in, like, motorway, motorway. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what we drove on to get down to Benin. That's right. I'm saying proper motorway. And that on that proper motorway of about, I don't know, four or five lanes each, yeah, on both sides, proper tarmac as well. And toll Because it like, over the years, when I was a youth, they used to have one in, they never had one, sorry, in Jamaica, in it. Mm. And then over the years, they've got a couple they've now. Got yeah, yeah, no, like, yeah, they've got a couple highways now, yeah. Right, we had to go thing. We got flyovers. Insisted also. on not using it. Mm. And it just took the piss to get there. No, they got totals on the to thing. The like crew, oh. It? oh, look, there it is. Another one. Yeah, imagine the time it took to do But that. why they got rubbish around it, though, man? What's that, rubbish because or tyres? Tyres and rubbish, yeah. because... I don't know. I suppose they might have a, a, a refuge collection, but it wouldn't be like what we've got. And that was a beautiful one. Mm -hmm. And they don't ever, um, 
even though they throw throw away things, most of the time things are reused. So it can stay there for ages, and all of a sudden they go, oh, I know, that tyre could be used as else. No, but you have to mm. keep it tidy because they've got uh, Environmental Day, which is Thursday. Yeah, like you do have clean. to be, see the gutters there, clean open up. gutters. Yeah. yeah. They spent the first couple of hours till about 3 o'clock cleaning. Even if it's a market that's made of mud, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, yeah like I know, it's mental, it's isn't it? Like, it makes you laugh. I think it's gangster. It's like better than yes, it is still. It is. Yeah, because that's what you put at your. No, rubbish, because to be fair, yeah. you see all this stuff that we're looking at. Yeah, it, without yeah. proper management, it can get out of hand. And some countries are like it that. Been this is quite. If you think about it, Nigeria is quite. This populated. is very clean. Mm. This is very clean. Quite populated. No, so all this, all this hoarding, everything you know, you can use it for something. It can get right. out of hand, man. So imagine up to Wednesday, yeah, you could have it messy, tires out, all sorts. Come Thursday. The first five hours of your business is not open. It's just about everybody cleaning, whether you live in a mm. mansion. Imagine we had yeah, that Yeah, they're here. constantly cleaning, constantly. Right, they're cleaning. Everyone and you see them with their brooms. You know they have their brooms different, yeah, don't they? It's mainly sticks. sticks. Yeah. Cleaning the motorway and, and mm. you just think, and, and they'd be dodging the traffic as it's going as well. Yeah. It's really weird. Environmental day. Every little helps, man. What's going yeah. But then it, it made sense because you don't have refuse collection like that. It has to be a day where everybody yeah, cleans together, basically. Yeah, that, yeah, that makes sense. So you got to look after the area that you're selling in, innit? Yeah, well, I, prefer, being... I prefer that, you know. So, so yeah, Thursday, man, that's lit. Yeah. Has, have any of you ever had a bin strike in your area? Yeah. 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 It's it's there you go, it? Yeah. Yeah, it don't last so long, though. That, that was years ago. Why are they even having no, a we had, one, like, we, had one for like, we had one for like six weeks, and it was only a couple of years ago. Mm. So when they <coughs> when they did need to go and um, pick up the rubbish, were they doing that two by two thing? To meet to you, to meet to you. What do you mean two? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's so like only picking up two two bags of rubbish because yeah. you know. No, it's the outside of your premises. You see that um, that hut or uh, that place where they're making the bronzes. Yeah. That person cleans outside all the way to the road. Makes no, I hear that. No, I was I was talking about my my situation with the building stuff. I was trying to figure out all them all them weeks that six weeks of rubbish. Did they actually pick it up? All of it. Yeah, man. Nah, they never. Um, the first one, the third one, I can't even remember. You mm. know, it's not still there. Yeah, it was fucked, though. though. It was fucked yeah. during that time because it was summer and it was just nasty around. Yeah. Here. So, luckily, yeah. luckily, because you know what it is. My house is split in four in it. For some, like so somehow we worked it out. The so people were using the refuse place yeah. and stuff like that. But yeah, it was it was manky around NC. It weren't as bad as it could have been though. Because the, the I had it in Birmingham for long, like right, last year. Okay. Next yeah. to the one with the umbrella. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, how much? Yeah. Yeah, no, we're talking about which ones we want. I wanted mm. one of the bigger ones, but it wouldn't have fitted in, in our suitcase with all the stuff we had. Mm. So we had to sort of renegotiate. We had to keep fiddling around with it. And also the money as well. Oh, so yeah, people yeah. thought you can get yes. a better view. Hopefully we're going to be able to get. Um, oh, super, oh, do, you know, do you know how to zoom in? I want the real one. Yeah, I I'm terrible. I should have done, shouldn't I? Yeah. <clears throat> Next time is okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> There's more footage anyway, lots more footage that Hector's got on his phones and stuff. I've got to collate together. Plus all his friends and that, because his friends took videos and that for me. Oh, I had loads of people doing it for me. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it was nice. Yeah, it was I'm going to find another one still. One sec. And hold the phone sideways. And all these complaints. <laughs> right, which one's good? Because we've done Lagos to thing. 
Uh, there's loads of different parts in the in the the, the 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 Lagos journey. It all depends what you're looking for. Should we do a nighttime one? Yeah. You could look at that, I suppose. You suppose? Did you yeah. go out? You said you went out. We did, yeah, but that's all on Hector's phone. We went. <laughs> we went to an eatery. Um, yeah. That was good. That was down in the, the sort See, of. Mag like, eatery, eatery. Yeah. What's that? Eatery. <laughs> <laughs> I was joking, man. They must have everything. This um, what I'm we saying, also like, went. We also yeah, went to. Uh, Matt Ice, they had Matt what? Ice. What's that? It's called Matt Ice. So you go there and you can get ice cream. You can, it's a bit like. Oh, here we go. What's that? What's that one? Yeah, Fucking we got ice cream. Man. Don't tell me it's a Devon house. Huh? No, you can get ice cream there, but you can also get takeaways. Um, there was another place that we went to where you had all Chinese, different Chinese foods there, as well as different African foods there. Um, but I preferred the little places that were off road. Yeah, do you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah, Where you can see the things. real, the real culture. Yeah. So the Alice the Crab Lady. Did you not hear about Alice the Crab Lady? No, okay. No, no. Alice the what? The one that in Jamaica, like the shitting, that she shitting, shitting the the food. No, oh yeah, I think I heard the story. Yeah, I don't know what you're doing this week, but yeah, yeah, we're focusing on Nigeria right now. Right, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I think this one is probably more conversation. <laughs> look how dark it is at night time. This is night time driving yeah, around. Look how dark it is. Why well, are these people smiles? <laughs> yeah. but it's just dark, dark, dark. And when the lights go out, when, wow. the, when the electricity goes, oh, yeah. I've never seen blackness like it. Mental. Well, it takes minutes for your eyes to adjust. But no yeah, and then the generator go, kicks in and goes on. But it even happens at the airport. <laughs> <laughs> I never heard of that. Heard of that. <laughs> um, when we were coming back, waiting at the airport, that is twice crazy. the lights kicked out and the generator, the generator had to take it. Yeah, yeah. this, this country yeah, is boiling. I know, in oil. Um, this is this is this is the maddest thing about it. it's like some of the things we're seeing here like it's Jamaica level but it's boiling in comparison. Yeah, it's boiling. No, but you like, go around the corner and then see a bad shit or some bad club. That, oh, that you're just switching off back to the airport. You're a dickhead for that, you know. Do you know how much oil you're seeing? <laughs> that, that is bad still. But like. you know what they're doing out there now? If you want to be part of anything, you have to register and you have to get your national insurance. It's like a Nino number. Okay. Yeah, stop trying to do both, bro. Yeah. Sort out the dust on the road before you start making us all log into everything. How about that? Do you know what I mean? Like, <clears throat> but I'll say the same here, to be fair. They're not just scratching off us for us to be fucking. <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna go. There are other videos if you want to look at them, but um, um, I'll try and come on one day when the heck when I put the other videos out that Hector's got, and Hector will come on and speak and that as well. Yeah, I'll try and do that. So I think it'll be more enjoyable with him on here explaining yeah. stuff. He yeah. is funny though. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, it was crazy coming out coming. Coming into the airport and you suddenly met with these people in uniform and AK forty sevens and mm -hmm. you know, yeah, it was mad. But they love a bit of military. Every yeah. every single state has got its own sort of like troopers, if you know what I mean. The different Definitely. way they dress and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <coughs> yeah. Even All right, guys. Like I'll speak I'll to you later. Care. Take yeah, care. Yeah. Bye, bye, bye. Take care. Do you, not, do you not have seasides in that? Uh? Do you not have seasides? Of course, of course, beaches. You mean? Yeah. We've got beaches, loads of beaches. What? Mm. No, that is the, yeah, man. Especially in Lagos and that. Yeah, loads that? of beaches. Or on the island where I am. We can't do that. Like, was that a genuine question? Me? Yeah. Yeah, because she doesn't know. Yeah, if no, she no, 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 geography of where we are actually makes sense to her but if she saw where we were on the coast of the yeah. Atlantic 
yeah we got we got big beaches man good sand as well proper thing but that was, that's like my idea like holiday i don't want to drive around i don't that'll just yeah I'll just be sick i'll be vomiting everywhere no, the problem is though that that atlantic there is super strong so it's not one you can go swimming in just look at the sand i mean just, oh, yeah, you can just, sunbathe you just if you want and burn yeah. yourself but Okay. Yeah, yeah. You lot must have some nice that. rivers, though. Some nice secluded yeah. rivers. Oh, more in the, yeah. The, the the river Niger runs through the whole country. Okay. Basically, you know what I mean. Yeah. And in yeah, that region, that. in in Benin now, that's where it all comes to a head, and you know, starts splits up into different rivers and creeks and all of these types. Oh, okay, of okay, you know okay, I mean? okay. So that's okay. why I said it's more foresty and more. Humans, okay. Yeah, and rural down there. Yeah. You know what I mean? You have so that's, where all the produce, that's where all the produce comes from. Do you get what I'm saying? That type of area. So they're going to have uh, wealthy uh, people there, but it's based yeah. on, you know what I mean, natural resources and stuff. And even these oil pipelines that are, Shell are trying to run through man's land. This is a problem. And this is why there's been beef and all of that. It's like, but yeah, we're getting there, man. Naji's getting there, man. Yeah, that's good, man. Definitely that's a good. place to go to. Yeah, I recommend it. I mean, to the brothers and sisters and that. Yeah, These Europeans need to stay out, but they know the secret, so they just go I there secretly and don't tell no one. I mean, yeah. Mm, in the deep of the stuff. Definitely, hundred percent. Mm. So it's the same. You you hear that? Oh yeah, I went to Jamaica. It was, it was fantastic. You know, I enjoyed it. Oh fuck's sake! Yeah, I went <laughs> Dan's, Dan. Is it called Dan's River? Like you see, like, you're just yeah. enjoying while the rest of us are working hard and slogging. Yeah, exactly. You know, you know, I'm only dreaming of going back. Like yeah, yeah. I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna go there. I'm gonna go there soon. You know what I mean? There's no. I definitely like want to home. travel more. Though. I definitely need to. I, I keep on saying it, but I definitely do need to travel more. Mm. Definitely. Yeah, Africa is not what you think was. You know what I mean? That's just Nigeria. I'm just saying, like, the whole thing is just not yeah. what I expected, bros. It's just, like, raw. No, they, they lied to me, man. That's disrespect, bro. You know what I mean? Told me about boning nose and all sorts, but didn't tell me the other stuff. Yeah, 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 100%. Yeah, like you said, like, motorways and big uh, skyscraper buildings and industry and uptown and downtown and you know proper things like everything is there like, it's weird but the contrast because of culture yeah because our culture is the thing that's older than any of this system that we're trying to integrate that's what keeps us in good stead i suppose and the multiple cultures you know what i mean so many different tribes and all of that and traditions and regions and you know ruled by mm -hmm religious people but religious are not it's not really that important as it is in other parts of the world to get it yeah they're definitely into whatever they're into you know what i mean if it's a good christianity or good islam or good thing they're on it jehovah witness you name it they're on it you know what i mean they say that africans are definitely super religious and that's why the whole country is still standing because we're on the coast of the Atlantic, all it takes is one like tsunami, and yeah, yeah, there's no Lagos again, at least anyway. Yeah, and all these coastal places like Benin and that, that's all gone. But we've never had that. You got me touch wood. You know what I mean? Because um, pause as well. Yeah, because uh, yeah, they say that the people are so religious in the country. But when that's you're good. there, you don't really see it. People right, it's not pushing day to day. Day. Yeah, people do their day to day, and on their day, whether it's Friday or Saturday or Sunday, then you see people in their Sunday best going church. You know what I mean? They could be poor as hell, but on Sunday they look they're trashy. You know what I mean? Bright colours and all sorts. Of yeah, you know? yeah. Whatever they're doing, they're doing. You know what I mean, you wouldn't even know. You know what I mean? It's that's how that's how it's in the country to make it as well. They're, yeah. That's yeah they're doing. Yeah, I'm the best. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. I grew up in our household is like, yeah, my, my stepdad or my dad who married my mom and gave me brothers and sisters and that. 
Yeah, he um, he's Muslim, isn't it? So I, I, he's the one who raised me and all of that. But he's a very moderate Muslim. Can't like during the day he's wearing the latest outfits, garms and yeah. shorts and that old man cheese cut hat. You know what I mean? But he's when it comes to the evening, then he dons his Muslim garbs, goes in his bedroom and reads his Quran in English. You know what I'm saying? And okay. does his prayers and keeps it moving. But other than during the day, you would never know. What is it important? It's not important. In the day, he's a person who's an architect who builds houses and mansions and all of that. So, yeah. <coughs> yeah, boy. It's good stuff. But yeah, Nigeria is lovely. Though. Yeah, hopefully you never know. I still got, I, I got to go to Jamaica though. Do you know what? I need to go to Jamaica myself. Yeah, I, need to go to Jamaica. <laughs> I need to go there myself. Yeah. Yeah. But you know, if I was to go to Jamaica, I'd, I know people don't like it, but I was going there as a tourist. I, I ain't got time to do it. I can't. Yeah, I ain't got time to go to Bambi. You know, come with the envelope, man. I'm not really. I want to enjoy it. I want to enjoy the country, it. It's not the country anymore. I don't know. It's not the same. Yeah, from what because I've got, I got family in Stony Hill. Yeah, I go there and live the good life and and imagine Jamaica's just like this. Do you get what I'm saying? Yeah. No, in full world, it's not. You know what I mean? But no one wants that experience. But that's a good base. I like yeah. <laughs> well, leave out of Stony well, Hill every day and go and uh, 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 explore Jamaica. Yeah, of course. Yeah. You yeah, you know what I mean. Yeah, and when I, I went there, to... when I went there, and like, okay, I went there when I was fifteen, but I went mm -hmm. like on my grandma's side of the family. Yeah, that's the only person that I would really trust. But she's no longer here. Right. I don't know if I really want to go out there like that like, to family that like, you don't even really to know. Mm. Nah, I don't even. There's family, there's family all over the place, but it's just like because they still treat you like a foreigner, regardless. You get well, me? I, don't feel, you? I feel that family, the family I've got, is like yeah. They've been back in and forth in. So yeah. we've been entertaining them for many years and they're coming over and yeah. taking them out shopping and doing whatever. And you get what I'm saying? So, okay, so you've got that return, relationship. Yeah. And then some of the other people are quite elderly. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Like my auntie Monica, she, she's moved to Jamaica maybe a decade ago while her husband mm -hmm. moved to Ghana. Right. You know yeah, Jamarcus. You know I mean, he moved to Ghana. So yeah, one's in Jamaica, one's in Ghana. So and then uh, my big brother Scaffy, uh, yeah. uh, eldest son, he's he got deported back to Jamaica. So right. just going to Auntie Monica's, I know I'll get hooked up because once she was here living and all of that, I used to go to her house. He used to look after me from primary school to you know certain yeah. age. You know what I mean? So I grew up in their household and all of that. So, and then I've got my in-laws. You know yeah. what I'm saying? As in uh, the the B moms and her family, who've been back in and forth in. Yeah. For many years. I don't know. Man. I just feel like it's just different. It's just different. Yeah, I know what you mean, though. But you can't trust yeah. everyone. But I know it's what I'm saying. We've got some of the family still over here. You are right, then, yeah. Time. Yeah, and then when they go home and whatever, and. They, the ones that have gone home already and settled and set up and still yeah. living because you know like some people get problems when they go back home because some people got kids that are grown and yeah. have grandkids and all sorts and they feel disenfranchised so some people have those problems you know what i mean but not everybody you know what i mean so yeah, not everybody. yeah. and then my my business partner yeah he's, he built he's been building his house in ochi so I've got, okay. I can go Ochi, I can go, you get me? I can go Kingston, I can Ooh, go, yeah. there's a few places I can go, you know what I mean? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, I do want to, I do want to, I do need to go back there as well. Mm. But the only thing is they sold my grandma's house, which I think, big disrespect. Um, so Who's her they? house is gone. Her mm. children. Oh, fair enough. Okay. Yeah. So, obviously, so I don't know, but like I said, if I, if I, I, would, I definitely would stay yes. in a hotel. 
Yeah. Go back and forth. Yeah. Back and forth. You can stay Airbnb though. Airbnb, yeah, apparently Airbnb is meant to be the cut, like the kind of the big thing out there. Yeah, yeah. you can get Beanie Man's house or something. <laughs> <Really? Yeah. laughs> get to rent out Beanie Man's house for a week. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, Diddy lives here. It's a really oh, nice Diddy house. Diddy turns up. Diddy's knocking. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> King Dong. Hey man. man, Beanie Man, you want a party? <laughs> <laughs> It's just mad still, you know. It's, it's really like doing it. Oh, it's mad. Yaka, yo. I said, Yaka, yo. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> we got a towel. We got it. Sugar. Yeah. yeah, he travels a lot, though, Beanie Man. He, but the thing is, yeah. even though he lives wherever he lives, he still, he still stays in hotels as well. I think he's like, got he multiple was, houses. He'll just go, yeah, but he, sometimes he'll just stay in a resort just for a little break. Yeah. yeah, no, but a lot of Jamaicans do that though. A lot of Jamaicans yeah, yeah, yeah. do that to um, do that, the other side of the island. Basically, some of them are not even allowed off the island. To, to be, let's be honest, mm -hmm. you know, they fucked their, their shit up. I mean, they made some batty man tune or something. Or, you know what I mean? One by a one by mm -hmm. thing. And nowadays, it's not permitted. Yeah, you you look got stamped under the Queen. See when it mm -hmm. turns to William, it's going to be a different story. I mean, Spraga, all of them are going to be allowed to come in. <laughs> Megan asked for them. So, I don't even know. <laughs> Megan asked for them. They're not even going to Oh, they are. Oh, they got them for that. You know, they did it there, yeah. Right. Yeah, but I did, I did, I did, when I was out there, I did enjoy it, though, and I did cry when I had to come back. Right. I did, I liked it, I did like it out there. Should have tear, yeah. Yeah, because it's lucky because you've I've built all these like obviously relationships with family and that, yeah. and even if they were like not well off, mm. and like their struggle, their struggle was it was good, man. It was good. It was a nice. It was a nice experience. Good, good. Was a nice experience. At least you didn't take your dirty cousin with you. Nah, but I found out when I went out there. I found out a family secret from her side of the family. I was like, oh, oh my god. Yeah. Oh, shit. She's, she was doing the most. She was, no, she was just almost, yeah, she used to stress me out. Mm. She used to stress me out because I had, like, I didn't get her because I didn't understand, because I'm not like that naturally. I just didn't understand why she used to do certain things, but she just used to do it. I just think it's just, yeah, like you said, it's just in her, mm. um, for whatever reason. Um, not again. But she's not like that. I don't think she's like that now, obviously, but... The only thing is, but I tried to meet up with her the other day to celebrate her birthday or whatever, but yeah. when we went out, like her boyfriend's not, like her husband, well, I don't know what he's a long-term relationship guy, he stopped talking to her because she went out, so I think he, the way that he controls her is oh. by her not going, not going anywhere. <laughs> so, um, that's what I was going to ask, I was going to ask if a leopard can change its spots. That's what I'm thinking. Mm. I don't know, maybe. Well, I think they can suppress the spots or something. <laughs> You go over it with dye or something, you know what I mean? <laughs> One coat, all of a sudden you look like a panther. It's like, yeah, but I don't know. I don't know. A leopard can't really change its spots. No, sir. But yeah, she just, that's, yeah, she just, she, she just, just held the drink down. You know, you have to hold it down for a little bit. You realize it's not beneficial. But once you've yeah. got a, a brother hooked and had a couple of kids for him, that, that's it. You know what I mean? You can go back to your ways and that. Trust me, yeah. can't make a whole housewife this thing, but it's true. it seems like you can on the surface, but see how that works out in the long run. You know, we ain't wishing bad on anyone. But, you know, no, 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 no. At least, at least he's found uh, someone to wife here. He's, yeah, I mean, yeah, so whether, yeah, whether it's good standards or not, he's still, he's still been by our side. Um, now we have to rate the simps out now, man. <laughs> and sometimes you can become a simp unbeknownst. You know what I mean? It's true. So, if, you don't, if he hasn't done the research on it, you know what I mean? it's supposed to be the yeah. research. Bro. You know what I'm saying? Get the paperwork. Like, oh, she's from this end, yeah? Let me talk to my people from that end yeah. and see if they know her. Even yeah, if poor, he just said poor, you no. Know. Poor CRB check. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Straight up. Oh, you know, gents. Oh, shit. 
You know what I mean? That's what I'm most like. <laughs> I might still move there, but it's just that. Right, you know Jets? Oh, <laughs> See. Back to back to this Definitely. Oh, oh, yeah, I know him. Do you yeah. do you know him? Oh, mm-hmm. a little bit. I kind of seen him, him about. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Like <laughs> seen him about. He's, a, he's like a friend of a friend. But yeah, how did you meet him? Oh, well, I know like Christ. Christ. Oh, yeah, same. Like okay. <laughs> you know the ones there. <laughs> yeah. Trust me, man. I deny all knowledge of my virgin. Straight Judas Iscariot business. Thirty pieces of silver in there. Yeah, deny you quick. I don't know. What? It's not, nah, I mean, like, it's my bridges bridging, really, isn't it? Like, <laughs> I don't mean, I don't even chat to them, man. They're too tough. I don't really, yeah, that's yeah man. You know what? I just keep myself to myself. Yeah. <laughs> 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 uh, meanwhile, he's te- texting, man. If you get <laughs> off, if you not yeah, really, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're uh, disgusting, is it? Yeah. Yeah, Why don't you not just chill out, innit? I mean, we have to do all this stuff. No, but I'm saying, like, your cousin, because she's she's a bad bee, man. She's a bad bee. I know. Yeah, exactly. So, would you think it's fair to hook, to, for her to hook up with a man like me or Jedi? Like, it wouldn't make no sense. It wouldn't make no I don't think she would last. Right. She would have to have, like, somebody who's, like, I don't know, more uh, in his uh, feelings in so love or something. I don't even know. What is it? Be so to somebody who, like, you know... Uh, <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I'm not one of them. Full, 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 uh, <laughs> now you're gonna have to finish that. Sorry, you, at, least, at least finish that one and then behave yourself. After oh, that. Okay. <laughs> um, so, when I at the hat, there was a reason because there was an emergency. Um, I so we all went around as a family, and and he was sitting on the floor because obviously, I don't know, obviously, you know that because obviously, he's quite busy in the house. And when he sat down, the back of the bottom of his socks, his white socks were black, shiny. <laughs> And I like for me, like I, I don't I don't know really, I don't know man that I, I don't know man that will put up with them type of things. And like there was like fruit flies and anyway. She got a man anyway. Well, so basically what you're saying is she's not that domestic. None of them, both of them are not. Mm. But, but yes, but the thing at the at the end of the day, she's found someone that's with her, and it is what it is. So this sounds like a mad thing. I don't know. Shiny black. <laughs> <laughs> so I assume the socks is white, yeah. Yeah, the socks are white. Well, they're supposed to be. So the floor is dirty. Yeah. Yeah, but even the socks, that sounds a bit ingrained. Well, this happens, he, well. he, he's all right with it. Like, he could they just like, you know, like they're smoking weed and they're smoking weed? Like, they smoke weed. What are you trying to say? Oh, they smoke weed, weed. Weed, weed, yeah. Like, yeah, they smoke, but okay, yeah. You know, you know, when that, that, that effect of weed, weed. Yeah. They just don't give a shit. Okay. Yeah, they just don't give a shit. The dungeon before the kitchen kind of weed. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Bless you, that one, one bridge's yard that we used to all chill at, and to be honest, it's surprising no, no one caught nothing from that yard. It was so nasty. Like, well, no, the yard was bad, but the but the my bridge's room that he shared yeah. with his brother, and practically all the man them was a, was just a mad thing. Okay. It was like, didn't even have proper bed sheets. And they'd just wow. conk out and just find a corner on their bed and conk out, and they'd, and they'd probably be two, three other man them in the room, bunning, chilling, like just cotching out there, man. Yeah. yeah. Man's doing man's doing top to tell with jeans and trainers on that. Like, in you know that like, is crazy yeah. in there. Them kind of yards, and we spent so much time in there, and I was like, how did we spend all that time in this place? We tidied it up for him, like on about three, four occasions. Yeah. Decorated, yeah. You know, the, uh, you know when you got the bridging, the bridging that was allowed to graffiti on his wall. Yep. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 right. that, that, yeah, that, that yard, that yard. 
I just thought I was like, it was I his parents' job as well. Yes, 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 it was his yes. mom's job. Yes. Love her. These yes. friends are golden. <laughs> mom's job, <laughs> it was up. smart. I couldn't even travel it. If you can oh, say you're at your friend's house and be at a mad team. It needs to be like a clean and a dirty. I don't know, it needs to be somewhere to balance. You can't be both living like, I don't know. I think when you live in a certain way, you just can't even see it. You, don't even know. Well, you just get turned blind to it, man. Kind of. But I think you do, you do see it because when when someone new comes in like me and my eyes yeah. stare and all that, I do that staring thing. <laughs> and um, <clears throat> you, you start trying to straighten up. Well, you don't really know it. And you obviously know. Something's all right. But yeah, it is what it is. Anyway. I don't know, I was listening as I was rolling up here, but the, yeah. the chat's on a quiet thing. The chat's on vacation, man. I know. Mm -hmm. Starstruck by the uh, by Sniper. The return off the back. Oh. Uh, Jamaica is a lovely place, but I don't know. I don't have nowhere to go. I do have places to go. I'm telling a lie, but I just feel like ugh. I want to vacation. I want to vacation. Oh, let's go vacation. Let's go vacation. Yeah. I don't know what you're saying. Oh, like, oh, oh, oh. What's, what's the actual problem with the place? Like, the place was obviously my grand from my mom's side. She's not there no more. Um, so yeah, it's just like yeah, but there's the whole country, the environment. Yeah, that's what I would want to go to see. It's top tier. Hundred percent. Hundred percent. Yeah, man. I, I, you know, on top of my list of like just yeah. urban places to go, just normal, you know, outside of rainforest and magical valleys and shit. Yeah. Um, would be like, yeah, the Caribbean and, the, and America. I'd okay. love to go there. I'm, I'm, I'm done with Europe. So yeah. the other English, English speaking places are, you know, the Caribbean. A bit further out. And that. Uh, yeah, it needs to be going on them long haul, them long, long flats. Long haul flats. Mm. Uh, yeah, them long haul long flats. The longest I've flown was about seven, eight hours. Yeah. Seven's the limit, really, I think. Yeah, I think it was I like think seven, it seven, is quite I like it was seven to Nigeria and nine back or something. I got a flight yeah, on the yeah, nine yeah. for some reason or some shit like well, that. Right, right. Mm -hmm. Would you go back to Nigeria, do you think? Yeah, why not? Why not? Hmm? Yeah, that's what I was Yeah, bro. Yeah. yeah, I got to Jamaica. But like I said, I would like to, if I went to Jamaica, I would like to be somewhere that's got air con and blah, blah, blah. So I feel everywhere like if I've got like a long flight. Got that yeah. going on. Huh? Everywhere's got that. You can go shit hotel, you got air con. I don't want to go to a shit hotel. I don't to travel with how many yeah, hours. You're saying if, you, if, if air con's what you need, you can even go to a shit hotel and still have air con. I, I, would, I would like to go to a hotel that's got a beachfront. Right. There's, there's bare doors as well. It's not. Yeah. There's a beachfront hotel that I'm cool. Yeah. And yeah, I don't mind. Like, I don't mind going to see the hustle and bustle, but I'd also want to sleep in a little bit of comfort. Yeah. 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 That's and a buffet. Cool, and maybe a breakfast buffet. Huh? It's not even impossible at all. We'll fuck it. Hundred yeah, percent. You, you know, some people yeah. want to go. They want to. They will go back to Jamaica or go back home, and they want to live in the in the hustle and bustle. I'm not. I, I don't travel that. You get me? <laughs> I want to like. I want someone to be able to like spread my bed and stuff, and I don't want to have wow. to worry about that. I'm just saying because it's a holiday. Yeah, so, I, so I find that all annoying. To be fair. I don't know, I just, it's a holiday. I'm treating yeah, it like I'm, any other holiday. Like I don't feel like. Certain aspects, like, yeah, but this bed, this bed thing is like it's quite annoying. Why? Because it's like stay out of it. Like literally stay out of it. Like 
No, but sometimes I, I don't mind myself just coming, just sort out, just that's the least of my worries. I don't want to feel like I need to like tidy up certain things when I'm on, on holiday. But obviously, if you're not living, uh, staying with like family and that, you can't be dirty. <laughs> True. You know what I mean? True that. No, I think there's a there's a, I think there's an added element of being at people's mercy sometimes. Not even in a bad way, just in a like yeah. you have to eat when they eat, do this when they do things. You might end up having to go to church and all this, like that aspect of staying with family. Yeah. But in terms of like staying in the in the real zones, I don't know. It just depends what's convenient for what you want to do activity wise, isn't it? Like, it's yeah. not that bad. As if you got your people with you in that. Yeah. Yeah. You take twenty hour flight. I could not do a twenty hour flight, boy. I don't even like the air like that. I actually don't like the air like that. Where's twenty hour flight? Is that Somalia? No. Jesus. I've been on a long flight. How far is fucking? So you look. I'm scared toilet. Yeah. So I didn't need to tell you, but you might wonder where I am. Okay. <laughs> wow, 20 29 hours that's too long and you know what i don't like i can't do stop stop flights it has to be direct it's not doing a stop stop flight for me is that to go to somalia no 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 it's 20 hours to get there no don't fuck about if not the maps are lies you you literally would have to stay there for a couple months out there you could not try to do no 10 days that's half of your flight. have they even got an airport <laughs> I don't know. No, I'm not Somalia. Where's where's the twenty hour flight, Sam? Like Argentina or something. It depends if you're landing in Somalia or Somali land. Whatever. Make some excuse like that. Yeah, boy. But yeah. Definitely got to fly about a bit more. Can't stay this dead, dead up country. But one of my work colleagues, they went to Egypt. So they had a good time though. This time just come back. Well, I don't know if I want to go to Egypt though. It doesn't really entice me. Oh, Japan. I don't know if I want to go to Japan though. Not, those are not really my country, like, yeah. <laughs> that will be the funniest video ever. <laughs> you just lost in Japan. <laughs> They're not just staring. Yeah, buzzing. Is that true, Maki? What's that? What, what's in the thread? That Nigerian Airways charge you mid-flight? I don't know if I'd want to go to Somalia. There's a lot of countries. <laughs> what makes you say that? Man. I don't know. I just don't feel like I want. I don't feel I've got any interest in those type of places. No, Do you know what? It's an environment that I'd really want to see still and step foot in. Really? Yeah, no, but it's just like the idea of being like stuck there consistently, but maybe I don't know, maybe it's not that deep. Okay. Yeah. I'm reckless like this though. I am a foodie, so I would like to go to a country where I can eat. Yeah, I mean like sitting down on the floor and just tearing into it and that. Yeah, go on. Why not? <laughs> <laughs> Why not, bro? Yeah, I have to be able to eat, trust me. Uh, I have to, yeah, that's not really my place. Do you know what? I think the shit is food is damn. Do you know what? I did want to go to Dam at one point. I do because I haven't been. I know everyone probably has been and it's like, oh, dead. But I do want to go when they do like their little festivals. I think they do like, uh, not festivals, but you know when they got their little like night raves? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. What type of food they got over there? It's just like obviously they must have nice food, 
But if you're out and about in Amsterdam, it's like shit Chinese, shit Indian. Oh. Yeah, weird microwave burger that they got in the wall. Um, McDonald's and then chips, really nice chips with mayonnaise. So how is a wet like you obviously you're buzzing or whatever? What are you eating? Bear, 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 no, and then they got bear, these waffle shops, like with all these different different okay. covered coated iced waffles, cakes. Do you know what I mean? They're just bright as hell, obviously, when you're buzzing. Yeah, it's good though. It is good, but it's just the food is just don't go for food, in it? Okay. It's just like a kebab chips, it's like it's bare different fast foods. And, yeah, all, yeah, yeah, yeah. and obviously some of them are nice obviously you enjoy fast food how you enjoy fast food but then it's like more than three days you're kidding it yeah you're, you're feeling funny now yeah, yeah. yeah you got... <laughs> <laughs> that's probably the shittest food place okay. I've been. everywhere else I've quite enjoyed it to be fair it's always the, the, I suppose the change in it okay but then during the course of a holiday you might reach a clangor you know something that's just dead you're like oh why did you come here yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really? Now, I'm going to Turkey in, uh, in the summer. Sick. I've never been to Turkey before. Oh, okay. see. We'll see. We'll see. I've never done it all inclusive, so we'll see. Hopefully, it's a decent. It's decent. It's like being in some kind of luxury jail. Is that what it is? <laughs> Wait till it's food time and everyone's just marching in the same direction. You're like, oh shit. <laughs> no, but I think it's like five different, I think it was five or four different restaurants. Yeah, yeah, that's what they'll have there. And like, it's, yeah, still it's still busy. It's still busy because everybody goes, isn't it? It is sick though, like, because it's just a totally different environment. You proper have a chill out, like. If you've got attractions and all kind of little stuff there and things going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's not for the faint-hearted because you... Like me, I, I get bored in that environment, innit? Yeah. You have to step out. You have to come out. I'm definitely going to have to come out. Step but out. I think all, the, all the times I've been out, like, I haven't done that. So I thought, let me see what it's like because my other friend I said, yeah, every time because of how much children she's got, it just works out to be better for her to go on it all-inclusive. Um... So let me just try it this time. I don't have to have that stress. But yeah, I'm definitely going to step out now. Definitely will. Yeah, it goes. Oh, big up. Is that you, Khan, or someone else? <laughs> oh, God. Yeah. Oh, God. Got to yeah, but yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't mind a turkey, a turkey food. Turkey can't go wrong. Yeah, can't go wrong. Nah, it's me. It's, was it you, Khan? Oh. Khan, you've got too much names. Mm. Yeah. Where's your next holiday then? I don't even know yet, you know. I need to really work that out soonish. Because summer's approaching. Yeah. yeah. Fuck knows. I bought this holiday in January. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, isn't it a good time? Because I have just the sales and that. Yeah, I just thought, you know what? I thought, yeah. you know, when after like the Christmas period when, and I just thought, you know, I'm. Just, I am not gonna do this again next year. The next year's gonna come, and I haven't got anything in that plan. So I just right, need to do yeah, this. yeah. Do you know what, though? To be fair, a few times we just looked when we're ready. We just look at the time in it and think. Like, but then last year I went away a lot still, so I'm still recovering. <laughs> I do want to go a bit further though, like with Jensen. I do want to come out a bit further. Um, America, I don't know what part of America I would want to go to, though. I, I do want to try the other islands of in the Caribbean, though. I do want to try. See what that's like. Yeah, but it's not. Snap, have you got any holidays booked? Right. No. I'm thinking about it now. I don't know why. Other than Nigeria. 
Yeah. Yeah, boy. Yeah, we do have to go back. We do. I do have to go back to drink. I feel like quite disrespectful that I haven't been. I haven't yeah. been where, sorry? Like Jamaica, I haven't been for like, yeah, oh, yeah. 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 Like, I remember something about my like, older cousins say, don't wait till your bones get cold, man. It's true. I don't even know if they're cold yet. It's <laughs> one of them spots you have to check in, man. Yeah, I check in. Check in. Well, is it expensive nowadays? It, you just have to go certain types of the time of the year. And I think September's a good time. Like, you know, like, mm. obviously... Not just that though, it's expensive when you're there. When you're there, yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Right, it's um it's not the same 100%. as it was back in the day at all. That's why people more will go and like stay in like whatever hotel and then obviously they're yeah. being paid for. It's very it's unlikely just, that your food's gonna mm, be rubbish. Kind of nice. I think you still get more from what I did last time, because last time that was that was like the first time I went and did it all inclusive and that. And yeah. from what I experienced then. No, nah, it's better if you just go and wing it. You go out and eat? Yeah. I can do that. Depending on how close you are to where you eat, though, as well. Like, if you've got stuff around you and choice. Yeah. I have liked, I did like that before. I would have done it in the past. But I then, do you know what, it, then, you see, the main thing, though, is, like, it's nice when you're in a hotel or whatever, your breakfast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you've got <laughs> breakfast, <laughs> but, like, dinner, I don't really want to be tied to this establishment. I gotta see, because I will definitely go. I'm definitely gonna come out. I think there's times where I've been on holidays or like, and we haven't gone out to travel or whatever. We're just chilling a little piece, and during that time, maybe if I had a little package, the kids could have just took advantage of it for a little while to get us ready for the evening or whatever it is. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. But um, we'll see. What's the Columbia Island? Apparently Scotland's meant to be quite decent. What's that? Scotland. Scotland's meant yeah, to be see, I've never, I've never been there, but it's, it's true. I need uh, to do it. Might as well. But it's just like, well, you know the idea, well. the fact that it's like colder than here and not that yeah. different. Just don't appeal. Wells is meant to be nice as well. I think in terms of like the freshness of water and stuff, greenery. Yeah. All of that, man. I've been Wales to be fair. You've been Wales. Been Wales. How is it? It's nice actually. Like in terms of like landscape and scenery and all that. And it is if you go to the rural parts, it's quite different. It's like a different okay. type of it's villagey in it, and they got their own language and all this type of shit. Right. So you got that, but it's like it's just England, isn't it, really? Yeah. Did you, you drove there, yeah? I've driven like... there and I've, I've been on the coach because we went a few times when I was a kid. But I've okay. driven there twice, to be fair. Yeah, I've heard like some people got there, I've taken the kids up there. But I haven't been. It's like far. Like last time I drove there, I'd say it was about five hours. Okay. Yeah. Maybe four, I don't know, but it was four. But I want to go North Wales now. You know, they got snowed in and that. Yeah. Okay. Let me climb that. In fact, I'm sure we were on about that here as well. Was it? Uh, one time anyway, yeah, yeah. But yeah, we sick to do that. I'm climbing Sugar Love Mountain. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, you prefer Turkey than Cyprus? Okay. Uh, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. Kids will like it anyway. They like they like traveling. So I've never been on a holiday on my own, and I think I need to do that at some point. <laughs> I've never been on a holiday on my own. I've never done that still, to be fair, yeah. And some people say when they go on holiday, oh, they actually have a good time. Like, they say like, that's one of the best holidays they've had. I suppose had. it doesn't even depend where you go, but yeah, it just depends what you're like as a person. I don't know if I could do that, though. It wouldn't be that weird to the people in the country that you're in, though. Yeah. 
<laughs> that's, that's why it's just fucking no, because I like obviously like when I've been away, I've been out on my own, isn't it? And it's All the right. same type, it's the same type of experience, you're just, just yeah. out for the day, doing it, whatever. Germany. I don't know if I'd want to go to Germany. I've hmm. been Austria. For real. Germany. I went with school, but I can't really remember nothing. Yeah, I went with school as well. It's just strange. And Czech Republic as well. That was sick. Okay. Yeah, boy. Well, it's like it's one of it's, it's like more of a lad country now. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Have you done a lad's holiday before? Uh yeah, I have actually, but it weren't really super laddy. Why? Well, like, I don't know, we just weren't we're not like I don't know, it weren't like what's what's the laddie place? I don't even know. What do you, what do you lot do well, on holiday? Like, do you just like get drunk and be silly? Well, this is no, this is what I'm saying. So it was more different. It was more like we went go karting. Yeah. We went on a boat. It was for a stag do, wasn't it? And Where was right. it? And we went to a, it went to a gig. Uh -huh. Where was it? Marseille. Marseille, France, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, but yeah, we was yeah. To be fair, we did drink quite a lot. There was other stuff involved as well. It was just like, a big laugh though. Like I've just I've, I've known I known these men since I was a youth, innit? So uh, other stuff. Yeah. Like cannabis. What are we playing that man? What are we doing? <laughs> are we having a conversation or what, bro? Other stuff like you don't know. We want to know. <laughs> Ah. Yeah, there was definitely cannabis and mushrooms involved. Uh, was there any, okay. packets open? any packets open? No, no, no packets still. Oh. What's, a, what's a packet? <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a, you know, like weed comes in a bag? Yeah. Yeah, yeah Coke, Coke comes in a packet. Oh, okay, okay. You know what I mean? Packet free still. <laughs> Always been, yeah. um, but yeah, it was good still. It was a, that was a good it was test. Good. It, was it was wholesome, yeah. innit? It was. I feel like it was wholesome for a for a stag do. What's stag do? Yeah, because yeah, like, I've been, seeing, I've been, I've been seeing all kinds of stuff like man's naked upside down. Yeah, it was not. It was not that. Tape to a lamppost. None with, of that. You get yeah. me? All sorts yeah. Of shit. Have you done that? Is, that's, is that what you did, Jen? I've never been on a stag. I've never been on a stag do still. Oh, okay, okay. Never been on one. Yeah. Mm. None of that, luckily. Just quite normal. Just exploring, get the eating food. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, Larry at points. That's not right. Well, no, one of my persons that I work with said that he would never allow his woman to go on a girl's trip, which I didn't understand. But he said he would, he would never allow her to go on a girl's trip. Can we see your arm? I was just thinking, maybe. Is that possible? Is that possible? Can your arm? Is it long? Are you making it out now? Yeah, I can hear him, man. Oh. Uh, Be nice to, to look at it while we chat. Oh, one sec. I like Marseille. Well, it's gritty. Did you find it gritty? Well, kind of, but like, okay, this is the thing. It's the south of France, isn't it? So yeah. Yeah, when you think of south of France, this area like Provence, you're thinking like it's quite, it's like nice, picturesque, and it does have that side to it. It's like the second city in the country. But um, it's also the most dangerous city in Europe, statistically. Really? Yeah, and so basically it's a port city, so it's got all the different people that come to France. It's, it's their city, isn't it? It's very un-French. South London. <laughs> <laughs> okay. There were the, like, British people there, 
or like mm. immigrants? No, like sort of Congolese, North African. Oh, okay, 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 okay. okay. Um, all these, and then what, Morocco and what else? Arabic countries, yeah. All of that lot. But yeah, it's good vibes, man. I've, 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 I enjoyed it. I ain't, I ain't have no problems. What are you drawing? I couldn't explain. Can you see what it is? Can see hands? Is that hands? Yeah. Is that, a, is that a lobster claw? It's got quite a clawish hand in it. Is it there's a hand and a claw, right? There's no claw. No, okay. You know that stairway thing, yeah? Stairway. That's the stairway, yeah, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So on either side of that stairway, mm -hmm. it looks like a claw. If you understand, you see? The, it's like an L shape, the whole grey thing, the whole thing that goes down. Oh, shit, yeah, 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 you see yeah, it now, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. It's a claw or so. A lobster. That's definitely, is that definitely a face at the top? Yeah. Okay. Well, it's all just so like the face and then the arm goes down this line. That's probably the lobster claw in it. It comes around and then like that. But yeah. So it's gradually bringing it a charcoal in it, charcoal and a bit of chalk. Yeah, charcoal's nice still. It is, isn't it? I use it for time. I'm just seeing if I can use it completely and what so happens in it. Everything I've ever done with these type of things, the paper around it is multicolored. You know, like where I've been leaning on it and this and that. Yeah, and yeah that's exactly. It. That's what. That's kind of what's going on here. Yeah, and then at the end, you you clean it with bread. Right. Exactly. Yeah. You can, yeah. I use a sponge in it. You can sponge okay. it. Okay. But yeah, bread spread. Bread will do the trick. I can't draw but even even hair. the stuff that's made a mess, like I'll work out a way to integrate a lot of it. I'll just work out from the middle. What was that, Rika? I can't draw to save my life. Yeah, that's this is one of the lies that people tell. Yeah, yeah. Actually, I can't. I've tried. I just can't do yeah. it. I, I do classes can't. still. What what area do you live in? Now. Yeah. Luton. Oh, well, you fucked it then. You're not coming. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. That part of my brain is not. It's not active. Not active. Lifestyle. It's a case of choosing to get it active, though. Really? Yeah. Like, I, know, I know how to like. I know what colors go together, and I can style things. Like I can see. If, yeah, I could do all that, but like. I can't do that. I've never like practiced practice to be fair. Yeah. Sometimes it's finding the thing that's for you and what you want to say in it. Yeah. That's often how it you have to look at it. Cause yeah, there's loads of different ways of making stuff. Interesting. People using cameras and this and that. Pain, whatever. Super talented, calling you super talented. Do you have a website? Yeah, I do actually. I'll put it in the in the chat. You should. Why don't you put it underneath your name? Because I don't need to advertise what I'm doing all the time in that way. Okay. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. Rika needs to learn how about the artist them, you know. Funny people. Where No, do you know do you know what it is? It's like I'm not gonna jump on the panel. I know exactly what you mean. I know exactly what you mean. But I'm saying well, to Rika, Rika, Rika I'd, rather, I'd rather I'd rather I'd rather show line, some art some, I'd rather show some art sometimes or or help to educate people on the yeah. artistic element of whatever we're chatting about, in it. Yeah, yeah. Rika's, Rika's got business mind. She's like, Yo, yeah, just exactly. Put your website up at all times. Just yeah. have it up. Like, if you got a website, display it. Let people know. And and that's true. But as as you as your artist, <coughs> you don't want to do that. <laughs> you don't it's do because, that. Like, you're like, what's that word called? Oh, what's that? I can't find the word. 
Like you're not, you're not braggy. You're not braggy. Uh, oh, do you know the for, for me? Yeah, it's humble. Like a, thanks, Dad. Yeah, for me, it's like a time and a place thing. Like for this is leisure in it. Like, and I do tell people about what I'm on, what I do, and the whole thing. You get me? But then I just don't need to make it about that every time I'm on panel. Oh, yeah. oh, there's a mad thing. I did send it to you before. Do you know I was in paper? Is it? Yeah, mad. <laughs> send it, send it in. The, well, my work was in the paper still. Oh, well, oh. Um, was it? Was it for? Was it for your gallery thing? No, no, no. Oh, so okay. basically, don't worry. You show, show me. Unless I don't know. It's a bit funny online sometimes, isn't it? You don't know. <laughs> You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean, isn't it? I now know. watch this. Watch this thing. <laughs> what? Uh. How many hours do you uh, do this for? What do you mean? <laughs> like it can be up to eight. I've I've spent on stuff. You get me. Definitely. You're resting on the work, man. You get this, it's pissing yeah, me this off. is this dust. It's <laughs> mine. As long as I don't, as long as I don't, I'm, I'm, I'm getting pissed off because you're gonna smudge it, bro. Like, right oh, I, do you know? Let's get off it, man. As long as I don't move, it's fine. Just take Let your arm just... off the fucking thing, bro. It's fine. <laughs> it's only gonna be enhanced, bro. I can't stand things like this. I <laughs> you know, and he's doing it. He's doing it. Just move your arm, man. Yeah, hey. You know, it's just one simple just to lift. Yeah, check that link in it. Because that, that link is a mad thing. <sighs> oh shit. <laughs> Don't lie. Don't lie. What that's yours. You yeah. did it. Can I oh, can we, oh, are you gonna share it or is it private? Can you share it? Oh, oh. I bro, I've, you know I've seen this story and everything. I, yeah. I was part of it. Like, how dumb is this, man? But fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Um oi. It's a hilarious joke thing, isn't it? You know the thing? <laughs> oi, it's a wild thing. Hey, <laughs> because you, this you, like you, for you me, take yeah. A picture of it when you did it, and that. Like, What's that? Have you taken a full-on picture of it? Like, have you got? Is it on your website? Yeah, it's on. It's on my Insta, definitely. I got a little video, and I got all the photos mm -hmm. of it. Bro, I'm not gonna lie to you. I think you're not doing the right thing about this right now. Why? <laughs> because <laughs> you're. Mm, but without giving it away, you're in the news, bro. Yeah, I know. Right. Not oh. not just on this little, on this, like, <coughs> it's, it's been in other, because I saw it on somewhere else. On the, it's all so over, I know it's all over the place, bro. Yeah. And it was like the outrage of, um, no, it said, uh, blah, 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 owner vows to do, yeah, <laughs> he vows to do, because he's got something above the, the, the satin as well that they, if they have taken down, isn't it? Yeah, that was his old one. So that's why he got me to do it. He's like, yeah, they're fuckers, yeah. They tried to take me this. You know what I'm going to do, yeah? I tell you what. Yeah, I was like, cool, no worries. It can be done, isn't it? So that was like a, a just a little quick Can you job. imagine? It's what a weird country it is, though. Anyway, hmm. that's deep. And you know what you it is? You, obviously, you see this thing, like, unless it was sports, pie and mash, or this, I wouldn't have took it. Uh, uh, unfortunately, uh, your <laughs> your your art has become national news, bro. And I don't yeah. think you're doing the right thing to that. Like it's you, you need to. It's not your best work. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. It's not your best work. Matter, yeah, it's not your best work. But still, it's yours. Mm -hmm. You did that shit, man, and it's become Thank iconic. You. No, this to be it, fair, there's there's one there's one with me. There's what there's a story with me in that. 
Is it? Yeah, but I was I was like I sent this one so that it didn't get shared. But if you people yeah. can search and find T shirts. It's not, it's not a secret who I am, and yeah, I know, bro. Okay. It's, it's, it's in it's all in the thing. It's all in this the should work. be a t this needs to be a t shirt. Yeah. Start a campaign, hand out t shirts and start a campaign and like you get me. For dead man though, in it, it's just too weird. And cash in, it's fucking weird. <laughs> it's for dead man, that's why it's when you weird. when you do your interview, please say that you don't want your picture in. <laughs> no, okay. This is the thing of the story. Obviously, I've painted it. So yeah. when this thing popped off, I just started getting a couple notifications on Facebook, and because I was, I'm using this different computer. I start hearing clunk clunk when I'm watching something. I was like, oh shit! I've gone to see the thing, and I've seen these comments. I was like, this don't make sense. What are they even talking about? And then, uh... have you posted it on your Insta? Yeah, yeah, it's been, it's been on my Insta. No, it's not on that. You see the one that you follow? It's not on there. It's on the graffiti. You, you send, send it to me, please. Yeah, yeah. yeah well. Um. So I start seeing these little notifications coming up and that. I was like, what are you... What? So, I, so I looked into it. I realised the things on GB News. Uh, you said it now. We might as well fucking show it now. Yeah, yeah, put it. No, it's just fine. It's not a secret. That's what I'm saying. I put the one that you, that you can share if you want to share. Okay. I realise it's on GB News. I'm like, no. Sorry, had you lot in suspense for so long. That was actually very <laughs> no. mean. That was very mean of us. But, you know, security clearance. And that, <laughs> you know, I'm not fast like some people. That's a good thing. So I was just crack. Imagine I just, um, it's a Sunday evening, me and the missus trying to watch something. And I'm just hearing, yeah. clung, clung, clung. I say, hold on one sec. So here yeah. we go. He goes, award winning fish and chip shop ordered to remove Great British Union flag mural by local council. Don't know if, the, is this the story here? Yeah. yeah. London's best fish and chip shop has been ordered to remove a union flag by council officials. The Golden Chippy in Greenwich, that's in South London, has been asked to remove its mural depicting the Union flag being held by a humanoid fish. You can see it there. It's a bit of fun, isn't it? It made me laugh. In any case, uh, the slogan saying, a great British meal, uh, because it's been deemed inappropriate for the area. Joining me now is GB News national reporter Theo Chacomba to explain exactly why it inappropriate. Theo, love to see you that. with hopefully well, a nice bag Theo. of fish and chips there. <laughs> Yeah, well, when it comes to fish and chips, we all know they're a part of a British tradition and the golden chippy. No, hold on. That flat top is like engineering precise. <laughs> like what? Is, 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 is high top. It's like <laughs> engineered. He must have went to Germany to get that done. <laughs> <laughs> it's the only explanation. It's either German or Swiss. Get me yeah. <laughs> made by Rolex. It's <laughs> <laughs> an award winning no, but uh, these restaurant. Are, obviously, and... yeah, CGB News. Yeah. These are the ones of us that will, they'll get for some reason. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And, they may, and it's like they want to make us do this whole nasty thing that we're doing. Because we do it. What's that black woman that they're always on there just trying ah, to. Ah, stop. Do you know stop. what I mean? Yeah. For yeah. years, they've been serving the community here Nana? in Greenwich. Yeah. And even today, on a Sunday, they are fully packed today. But this is the issue. So our boy here we've got a Mag did this. Our boy Mag on the panel is responsible for this art. Round of applause for, for Mag. Yay! This art made it in the news. Oh, yeah, my <laughs> mural and which says a great British meal. Did and you scribble a little magic next to it? No, you didn't. I did still. This has been Oh, I see it. Uh, called, um, uh, it's been an issue for residents who live in this area who've complained uh, to Greenwich Council who say it's inappropriate <laughs> uh, considering it's in a conservation area. But Con is it really area. inappropriate? Here's what some of the local people we've been speaking to had to say. I only probably got the uncles and the flag, and they were like, what's wrong with it? It looks all right, doesn't it? Do you know what I mean? Look at some of the other feet you've got around in Greenwich. They don't want to take Bro, that they down. They are like, literal tramp. Like, half day, <laughs> 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 man's, got, man's got, like, fucking straw in his head. Like, what the fuck? That's what I was staring at. What is it, paint? 
That's straw or some stuff, I think. I don't know. It might be paid. But I just, like, they literally found a homeless man. Oh, yeah. Oh, well. Fantastic artwork. Come on. I really like it. Reminds me of Banksy. Come on. So hey. if, it, if it was a Banksy oh, oh. there, they wouldn't complain. No. And so why can't other artists who do fantastic work like that also have an opportunity blah, blah, blah. to lighten up the streets blah, joyfully? Blah. <laughs> Well, those are the views here from people who live in this local area. But I'm kindly joined by Chris, the owner. Thank you so much for your time this afternoon. You've been here for 20 years now. Um, tell, tell me how this issue has come up. This my, my. issue has come up. Uh, I've got so many international uh, people that come here from different, different places, tourists. And they like taking pictures, selfies, blah, blah, blah. So they come and stand against this wall here. They take pictures. It's only been up for about a month. And uh, it's been very, very popular. I don't want to believe that any of the locals are uh, complaining that this is uh, too loud or anything like that. Do you know this it's just, uh, uh, they say it's, it needs planning permission. How a little thing like this needs planning permission, I don't know. But this is not Greenwich Council, this is Royal Borough of Greenwich now. So they're uh, cracking up a little bit. And just finally, how, how did this come about? Are you working with an artist in this local area? I've got a local uh, guy that yeah, that's uh, me still. does uh, murals. So he said, uh, would you like me to do something for you? I said, yes, why not? So I gave him 250 pounds and I said, make oh, sure you leave a bit on, of space man. for You're people to stand there things. so they can uh, <laughs> take some selfies or pictures or whatever they want to do from Walden Chippy. And it's been extremely popular. And not one person has come to me and said, that looks terrible. So I cannot imagine the person that complained about this. I think it's just cancelled. Well, Chris, thank you so much for thank your time. You. In terms of popularity, though, we've seen people come here uh, as family members coming together to take picture here. Um, and they see they say it's not an issue. Uh, but at the moment, it's still here for now. And the council will uh, be providing further information whether or not this is definitely going to go away. Theo, that's that's ridiculous. I one of one of the, the lovely ladies you interviewed there, she said if it was a Banksy, no one would be complaining, would they? I bet the council wouldn't be getting a knickers in a twist if it was a Banksy, would they? I mean that, that it, it it looks great, it makes people smile. Plus it's good for business. Yeah. Well, you know what's mad? Yeah. Yeah, so absolutely. And basically the day after this story broke, because that was like Sunday night or something or Sunday. Yeah. Yeah. Then Banksy did that big green thing. You see yeah, that? I ain't even seen it, but I heard that he's done a, a, was it a tree? Basically, you know where they cut the trees so much that there's just stumps Yeah, in the air. So behind one of those, he just fire, you know, with the fire extinguisher, he just blasted the wall with green paint. And then there's a little, you know, stencil figure in the corner kind of thing. That's basically what it is. But now every day they keep covering it with more stuff and it's like coming, becoming ridiculous kind of thing. Covering it with what? Like, first they put, so basically, I think somebody a few days later dashed a little bit of white paint on it. Then they yeah. went and put Perspex over the top. Now they're building, like, a whole structure. Around it. Yeah, yeah, it's all mad. It's mad. So who, who lives at 62A? Yeah, I don't know about that. I think it's the shop still. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think it just goes to the shop. Why would you be pissed if that was outside your, your yard? Because that could be the person that could <laughs> I don't know, I'm just saying. Yeah, but it's the geezer's building that he fucking owns. Good shit, man. It must be, yeah, it must be his building. Well, yeah, it's funny, man, because, like, obviously this whole thing's going on and then all these people are angry, like, yeah, it's these Muslims, da 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 da, da taking over the country and we can't, we can't even have the flag. These times, like, I've painted it, and the geezer who shop it is is Muslim. He's Muslim, yeah. Like it, yeah. <laughs> exactly. And look how black you are. Thank you. How long did that take you to do that, Mag? A couple hours. Okay. How fucking black you are. Fucking black. Well done, though. You could have. You should have said from before. So when was it Sunday? Nah, this was like a week ago or something, maybe. You should have seen it today, and Jed could have done a reaction video. <laughs> like a 
Look, to be honest, when it all happened, I, I kind of didn't know what to do about it. And I just sat on it for a day. And then I just started taking the piss online. No, did he? Now, I've, it's just, it's blown over in it. It's kind of weird to keep spanking it. But then, yeah. I mean, I just, I just, it's basically... It's basically just got to cash in on that crowd, isn't it? That yeah, you crowd. do. Like, yeah, as soon as it. That's, that's, and then there's, yeah. yeah, there's a couple of people I'm talking to, a couple of things about. Uh, but then, yeah. Well, Matt, listen, my brother, I'm not going to lie. Exploit it. Take the, this. Hope you got this little news clip up. Yeah. You should be up. You get me? And mm -hmm. it's, yeah. And run it. Send me the post on that, man. Let me share this. Uh, yeah, definitely, man. This is the thing. Nah, you lot, you the... lot are too, you lot are so humble to tell you turn into, I don't know, you turn to a circle. Just sort yourself and you lot out, right? You should just, yeah. It's good. Who's you lot? I'm just saying you. <laughs> yeah, don't be too know. humble. It's not even that, like, do you know what I'm doing, like, every single day? Yeah. It's, not, um, it's not humble at all. So who's that? Who's that guy that said this? Yeah, like, who, who, who are these? Yeah, who are these people? I don't know. It's just people who chatted to the camera or something, isn't it? Oh, uh, I think this might be stuff. Yeah, but I don't. You got to take every yeah, true. <laughs> You don't need some. Do you do you have media training? Is there something called media training? There must be something called media training. What do I need media training for? Do I don't get it? I don't know. I'm not saying that. Golden chip is a tiny little thing, man. And it? it's a chip shop, isn't it? No, nah, not, not. I don't mean the shop. I mean the mm. fucking. Oh yeah, it's small man. Yeah, it's like it's calm, man. It's not a big deal at all. Yeah, yeah. It's Greenwich, though, isn't it? You know, it's like main, main Greenwich, where the cutty sark and all that shit is. <laughs> so, uh, and they say they their, own flag, flag, their, their own flag. Their own flag doesn't suit the the area. Yeah, this is where man, you launched your whole, your, your whole, your whole, like, your whole nasty your operation. Is mad, is fucking in your face and violent. That's why it's not a very aesthetic. Aesthetically pleasing flag. <laughs> yeah, but this I mean? is where the whole operation was started. Do you get it? It's Greenwich, isn't it? Mad. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. So there's no point covering it up. Yeah, that's sick, though. Yeah. That's sick. Because I, I saw that independently. Somewhere else, I was like, Well, I've seen it twice actually. Mm. It's been doing the round still, obviously, people outraged or whatnot. Yeah, <clears throat> yeah, t shirts that need to get made. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, man, emotions all yeah. in. <laughs> <laughs> so need to get made. Mm -hmm. Let me. I'll rock that on the t-shirt or on a hoodie and that it'll look mad. <laughs> yeah, be like, what the fuck is there? That's on oh, no, a on a on a bomber jacket. Be like, what the fuck is that? Cause like, what is that? You just assume that's a super expensive jacket. Yeah, that could be that actually could look mm -hmm. sick. The right colour, like the right colour jacket. You need the black bomber jacket, Hello. isn't it? Yeah, with that on. Yeah, you're looking super racist. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy, let's have ya. <laughs> yeah, they like that still. So, what was you talking about with the media training and that, Rika? I think. Yeah, have you...